What's up, fellas? Cheers, cheers, cheers. Boys, it's time to break shit, man. Uh, we came on a little early today just so that we could break shit. I got a lead from Shirley Sirius, and basically he said we got to break shit today. And I said, I'm all about that kind of life. Uh, yeah, so we're on a little early. We got DFC later, boys. Uh, DFC is going to be a little later. But right now, we're going to try to take advantage of what's going on. Y'all see this right here down in the corner? Y'all see this shit? That could be broken. I'm really hoping it's a thing, man. I'm really hoping it's a thing. I, I think this Black Friday sale right here, I hope they keep this thing. I, I honestly think you should be able to break gambling in this game. With how rare uh, uh, certain items are and certain attributes, you should be able to break gambling. Bre gambling should be cheaper anyway. Uh, they, they didn't break it, they fixed it, as far as I'm concerned. So we're gonna we're gonna try to take advantage of that today, boys. And I'm just I'm gonna I'm gonna jump in because I think I think we've got a real shot at uh, at finding something today. And I haven't been on this gold find bar in a long time, uh, in a very long time. So uh, let's friggin' go, man. Let's friggin' go. And then later on we got a sick card, man. But we'll we'll get there. We'll get there. We got a sick card, uh, but we'll get there. By the way, what's up, guys? What's up, Primo? Just on the level guide grind, trying to get the BBC to 95. GG, man. I guess God and Goddess have a purpose to hunt pubs for the next 24 hours for that goal. God damn, I didn't even think of that. Why did I get on the gold find, Barb? I should have. I should be on the other account. God, yeah, that's that's huge. That's a good point. Game with 50 circlets and I'm a million down. Oh my God, bro. It, what level are you? What, what level are you doing that? That's so crazy. That's so crazy. How much? Oh, I started up with a full grip, too. We got a full grip. Oh, oh, it's going to be a day. Oh, we got a full grip of gold. Oh, my God. Let's just dive into it, man. Holy shit. I, I'm so excited for this. I've never been more excited to actually play this game. Just gambling on circlets, huh? All right, so 35K. Oh my God, dude, they, they're so cheap. Dude, look at this. Look at this, Coronets, 34K. We can get ones like this and sell them for 35K. Oh my God, dude. Oh my God, yeah, it's time, man. It's time, let's, let's fucking do this. Boys, what are we gonna get? I'll do this all day. DFC, what is, what's that? Yeah, I, I might, I might actually, after the DFC, boys, if this is actually infinite, you might actually see me do my first ever 24-hour stream, and all I will be doing is just doing this right here. Like, just gold finding and doing this. We won't have to gold find much, but oh my god, dude, this is so crazy. This is so nuts. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, this this is huge. This is like the best holiday discount or best holiday thing they've done so far. Uh, this is a 220 helm. We're off to a good start. It's got strength and min damage, but unfortunately, it needs something else. We're on non-ladder. Oh my god, I'm so pumped about this, boys. How are you guys doing? How are you guys doing today? Uh, Daniel, let's get your money back. Yeah, these are 12,000. These are 12,000 gold, bro. They certainly will. Like, we could, we could see. Yeah, like, they most certainly, there's a very good chance they will. There's a very good chance. Oh my god. Yeah, like we lost 30k gold and just got eight am eight amulets. Whoops. Oh my god, bros. Oh my god. This is this is quite possibly the coolest thing I've ever seen in my life in this game, dude. This is this is quite possibly the coolest thing. 
Uh, no, you can't gamble at 220, but you can gamble some pretty sick stuff. Uh, what's up, dog? What's up, dude? Uh, by the way, and speaking of which, I've got vodka and green tea mixed up for this, but I've got some Jim Beam thanks to the generous donation of Insomnia for after this, uh, Insomniac after this. This is the kind of MF and I can get behind, boys. I can have a drink in one hand, theoretically. And if I get this keyboard close enough, if I get this keyboard close enough, I might actually be able to control click. I might even be able to control click one handed. Might be, able, might be able to pull this off. Hold on, where's my mouse? That's gonna be tough, I'm not gonna lie. Wow, boys. This is the kind of this is the kind of MF and I can get behind. This actually ain't bad, right? Damage reduced by four. Nah, we need something else. We need higher life. This is non-ladder. There's no room for fucking around. This is non-ladder. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, it's gonna be sweet. All right, I'm going back to coronets and circlets because uh, this is probably where it's at. Like, this is there's a very good chance that these sell back for a lot uh, amulets are good but there's a there's a chance they don't sell back for a lot there's a very good chance we're gonna make money on these and just infinite gamble which is exactly what we're looking for today like that is exactly what we want to do we want to just gamble our life away we have all of these life savings we built this gold fine barb for exactly this purpose like to gamble right uh, and then one day they just gave it to us on a silver platter. Like, it's most certainly, this is what we want to be doing. Yeah, yeah, bro, make room and stash. It will take you life uh, before gold empty. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's probably that's probably a good point. Yeah, we'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. I'm, I'm also very picky, though. I'm also extremely picky. Uh, this needs cast on it. Otherwise, that's actually kind of cool. But uh, needs cast. Yeah, I'm extremely picky, and this is non-ladder, so uh, we may have plenty of room. You never really know, dude. We have literally lost barely any gold, dude. Uh, boys, I'm so fucking happy. This is the best Christmas present Blizzard has ever given us, boys. I hope you're abusing this like I am. I hope you boys log on right now and abuse this. Get your gold fine barb, deck him out with all of the edge and all of the. Geeds, y'all best be breaking this shit. Y'all best be breaking this shit. Oh my god, we gotta we gotta keep track of how long we're doing this, cause uh, I'm actually very curious. But fuck it, we'll just look after. I'll do a breakdown of it. Uh, it, today is the day, man. Today is the day. They're uh, online. They're doing. Uh, they're doing 50% Black Friday sales on all vendors. All of the all of the uh, vendor prices are half off. So that's how we're able to like perpetually gamble this stuff. Well, not not perpetually, but this is this is extremely good. This is like exactly how D2R should be. Like these are, these prices should stay forever. Price for 23020 just dropped, I bet. I hope it did. Make them more affordable. Dude, this is honestly the way to fix that. Like, when, when we talk about fixing things and fixing stats or whatnot and fixing the rarity of certain items, this is exactly how to do that. Like, just make gambling a lot cheaper, just like this. Like, this is certainly the way to do it. Oh my god, this is so cool. Boys, boys, I, 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 I can't even tell you. This is the most excited I've been to actually, like, M MF, I guess, if you can call it that in a very long time like this this is so cool a shout out to shirley serious for giving me the heads up on this as soon as it swapped as soon as it flopped over oh my god like single-handedly the reason that we started streaming early today there's no fucking way we're missing this if dfc gets boring and people start lates and in fights i'm probably just gonna go back and do this like because at this point today when people start fucking around in pvp you're wasting my goddamn time I've got 24 hours where I can gamble the most savage circlets in the world ever to exist. I could, it could happen today. The odds are still super low. We might have to gamble a billion, maybe two billion circlets, 
but it's possible to do. And I can smell it, boys. We're going to get there today. Dude, it, it's 50% off all, all vendors. Yeah, yeah. This is, this is so crazy. This is so crazy, man. That's why uh, this is, this is a gold find today. I, I, this is, I'm so happy. I wonder how people who just play single player now are feeling. I wonder how the single player folks are feeling. Anybody just single, like single player only? You feeling a little snubbed? You feeling like you should have played on Battle.net? Man. It feels good to be a Battle.net player today, boys. Yeah, yeah. I'm so glad we built this gold fine barb. I mean, you could probably just run Trav. Uh, you don't need much gold. The whole stash pool will last you forever, dude. Like, this stash pool will last you forever. So if you've got gold, just, just gamble with it, bro. Just let it fly. My god, dude. I can't even tell you how good this feels. We've been gambling off this one stash of gold for... How long have we been streaming? Dude, this has been 10 minutes. This has been 10 straight minutes. Of just, bam, bam. We ain't even close to ex exhausting this stash of gold either. We ain't even close. We barely put a dent in it. 20% down. This is how to fix D2R. Say, I wish I had a gold fine barb now. Yeah, dude, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. It's a good day to actually have a gold fine barb. You could sell gold, like, probably, like, mad on JSP right now. But we're going to be gambling. Selling gold ain't fun. Selling gold for forum gold ain't fun. Ooh. We're getting there. If that would have been two socket, ooh, that would have been a keep. Wow, I'm so excited for this. Oh, dude, we don't even need it. We don't even need it. Like, it'll take maybe three or four runs to, like, completely fill up a stash. And we're, we've gambled for, like, ten minutes off of this one stash of gold. No way. I don't even need gold donations. Don't even need them. Like, this is going to be a day, boys. This is, this is gold find heaven. Like, this, bar this barb has died and has gone to heaven. There will never be a greater day in the life of this gold fine bar. Never. Never at all. There will never be a greater day. This is what he's waited his entire life for. But even with this, man, even with this, people that say you can do the perpetual gamble thing, like, I doubt it. Yeah, you won't be able to do it at adequate levels because this guy is the, the absolute lowest level you can possibly be if you want to be gambling on, like, circlets and, and uh, amulets, and he can't technically perpetually gamble. You would have to get extremely lucky uh, to be able to perpetually do it. Yeah, yeah, it, it's, it's technically possible. But you would have to be extremely lucky. You'd have to get all of these to roll 35k just like this. Like, I technically made money off that exchange. And off that one. <laughs> but you need that to happen all the time. Wow. I hope I don't accidentally piss through and, like, junk a circlet that was good. That has totally happened to me in history. But we're gonna have to we're gonna have to take it easy. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to not get overly zealous, overly excited about such junk savagery. This is the best thing Blizzard has ever done for us, boys. We have to live every moment of this. We could get our our uh, paladin circlet today with DR. We could finally get that. We we actually got one, but uh, like Stadium PK gave me one for uh, for free. He paid 50 forum gold for it, I think. We took it to Larzuk, socketed it, got one socket. I was so pissed. Interesting. This needs something else. Just not quite good enough. It needs something else. Yeah. Oh my gosh. 
This is so cool, man. We could technically gamble at Griffins, too. Like, that's entirely possible doing this. We could gamble some sick LLD stuff, although that's not necessarily probable at level 93, which is what I'm gambling at here. It's not probable uh, because most of these will roll pretty high, and there's a good chance that some of them are going to be, uh, they're going to roll over to Coronets, and then those are the lowest level you can get with that is 39. So, yeah. But this is, this is certainly a step in the right direction. Oh, no, I'm fine, dude. I'm, I'm actually fine with that. I'm kind of fine with how this is how this is like sure Yeah, we have to like swap over every once in a while, but that's fine It would probably take more time for when we finally do have to get gold to put stuff back in the inventory and all of this stuff It's not really that big of a pain in the ass And it, it also forces me to just look at two at once so that you don't overwhelm your brain. You know what I mean? You're not like You're actually looking for stuff you know, and you're not missing it. Also, also, you guys know how I feel about the RNG of of uh, D2R. Uh, I think the randomness, it's actually better if you uh, gamble slowly. Like, and let whatever random number generation just change throughout the seconds, throughout the minutes. Like, instead of gambling so much stuff all at once. Wow, this is insane. I feel like a barb running around is like the people behind the live news reporters. Hi, Bob. Yeah, yeah, it's basically. Nah, bro, we're gonna be gold fighting with this guy. This guy, look, he knows what he's doing. He, he fucking knows what he's doing, guys. Just trust this barb. He wants to keep his arms and his, his charms in his inventory. Let him fucking do it, okay? This is what he's lived for. It's the greatest day of his life. The greatest day of his life. You let him have his day, okay? If this makes him happy, you let him do it. I'm not gonna judge him. He's doing great. He's doing great. We also, oh my god, dude, we also could get a savage gold fine helm. I'm thinking of all the things that we possibly could get, but let's be serious. I will do a 24-hour stream and keep no circlets. That, that is also more likely the case that that will actually happen than getting anything good. That's with these discounted vendor prices. That's with this, you know, possibility of having perpetual gambling. That, that's actually the case. That can actually happen. This is so nuts. But I feel like we've run out of rares. Like, it's not... It just stopped giving us rares. It just doesn't give a fuck about us anymore. Wow. We're now going on, uh, we're now going on about 13, almost 15 minutes. And we've still got gold. <laughs> it's just straight gambling. Gambling how it was intended to be, boys. Yeah, you should certainly do that. People will almost understand today. Maybe you'll join the game, hostile them, and then they'll just drop their gold and be like, here, don't waste my time, I won't waste yours. It's one of those days they might actually understand, man. Yeah, that's true. Everybody should be, they should really be in town. I don't know why anybody would be doing 
terror zones or anything else right now. The whole, all of Battle.net should be gold find, running Trav and, and running, uh, you know, running Trav and running gold find uh, or uh, running gambling. Oh man, this was close. We, we rolled an LLD helm, but this just needs so much more. It's unfortunate, but it's true. It's true. We don't keep trash around here, boys. That's one thing we vowed not to do. Just because it's a, a free gambling day doesn't mean we keep subpar shit still. We don't... Look, the difference between me and everybody else that makes Diablo content is I don't need to have a highlight video, okay? I don't need to stretch. You're like, this is good if you do it with this and there's some build that like this could be good on, but nobody nobody uses it. Maybe I'll build it. Maybe I'll put it together. No, fuck that noise. We don't do that around here, okay? We keep good shit. We keep good shit that's desirable, that if someday we decide we're sick of it taking up space in our stash, we sell it. Like that's what we wanna do. Just buying armors to buy and sell back and forth might be faster than running Trav even, really? Uh, I doubt it because the most you could sell an armor for is 35k So and it won't sell for more than it You can't buy it for more. I don't know. We could try it We could actually we could probably try it with one of these right Hold on Okay, so I sell this hold on I sell it for 19k. Oh My god Oh my god. You need some gold boys? This is how you do it. This is how you do it right here. D2R the way it was intended to be. Boys, look at this. You don't you don't need yourself a gold fine barb today. You got this covered. Oh my god, boys. This, you just, you got it. You just got to be a savage. This is gold finding 2022. Woo! Happy New Year. Merry Christmas, motherfuckers. Look at this. You want a gold find barb? It's this simple right here. You don't even have to leave the trade window. You don't have to leave the trade screen. Oh my God, boys. Oh, this gold find barb. Wow, he's quick today. This guy is quick. Woo! Man, we making uh, it's like 10k per. Oh my god, you would have to find something ideally that sells for exactly 35k or close to it. Just under 35k, and this shit gets insane. Oh my god, we've doubled our gold here in a few minutes, boys. I still actually think gold finding might be faster, but uh, this is this is crazy. So if we sell that. We buy that back. This is like 8K per. Oh my God, boys. Gold fine barb. Oh man, that's cool. Oh man. What a day. What a day. This is exactly the way this game was intended to be. This is the way D2R was intended to be. I don't want to hear nothing about it. Don't nobody go say anything, file any reports to Blizzard like this was bad. You shouldn't have done it. Woo! Woo! We'll keep this one right here, boys. We'll keep this one. It's a good start. It's a good start. We're off to a great start. Yeah, no snitching. Don't tell nobody. Yeah, theoretically, if you if you want to be a lazy gold find barb today, that's how you could do it. You don't actually don't have to go to Traving Call. You could just you could just keep selling a circlet back. You would want to find one that sells for almost exactly like just under 35k, but almost exactly 35k. That's I've done the math. I've done the math. Just trust me, it was quick, but I did the math. That's technically the best that you could possibly get. That's that's the best and fastest way. So like this one would be a, a decent one. 
But we're gonna go for higher. We're gonna go for higher. It can't be exactly 35k, because that means it's probably worth more, and the vendor will sell it back for way more. We need it to be very, very close. But not quite there. That one's close. That one's close. <laughs> so now... So right there we make what? We make... I don't know, I guess it's still... Yeah, it's about 20k per. Whoops. I'm pretty sure we still made money off that. Oh my god. Oh my god. Maybe this is faster than gold finding. Oh my god, boys. And now we have it there, so we can always go back. We don't even need to hold on to it. I love this game. I love this game again. I love this game again. Hold on, I've been gambling for 20 minutes straight. Oh, we ain't even... We're, we're about half halfway gone with our gold, boys. Yeah, shit, it's like, oh man, we need some gold. We need some gold, just keep bouncing back and forth. That's that's fine. Whoops. Yeah, we don't want to be doing that. Or do we? <laughs> we just make money. It's like impossible to lose money. Wow, boys. This is so fucking crazy. This is so nuts. This is so nuts. Hold on, hold on. I, I gotta catch up now, because we're gonna be... This is gonna be a day. Uh, that, that will... This will certainly be in the Xmas special right here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, this... I can't even tell you. Some people would be like, oh, this game... That's broken. You shouldn't do that. This game isn't even fun. Ask me. Ask me for a second if I'm having fun. Just ask me. Anybody. I fucking dare you. Ask me. Ask me if, I, ask me if this is fun. Yeah, I'm not sleeping at all, boys. This might actually be my first ever 24-hour stream. I'll stream this for 24 hours. I'll be. I'll sit here dead. I will be dead, and I will be gambling and and you know and telling them no, don't ever quit. Don't ever stop it. Let this go forever. Like, I'll just, I'll just be doing it. I, I, I will do it. This might actually be the day. Cooley has never done a 24-hour stream in his life, but this may actually be the day. Like, it, it might happen. Oh, my God. I'm going to get super tired, though, and then end up, like, canning circlets that were really good. We go till that happens. Then we quit. We don't quit. We don't ever quit. We don't ever give up. Oh my god, boys. Yeah, it might be, but it's not like slow. It's not like too slow. I mean, it isn't like I'm. It's like my. You know what? Now that we actually don't have to gold find, I think this barb has decided to um give up his charms. I think he has made that conscious decision. On his own didn't have anything to do with what with you guys telling him to he made it this decision on his own and he's feeling it because if he needs gold this is what he does he just goes here we can probably make a lot of money off of anything right this doesn't really even matter we just need some gold this is what we do all right yeah, this is great. We're gonna have some gold. It's gonna be a good day. <laughs> what a great game. What a great choice. This was... Was are you ready for... Like, I, I will do this until I die tonight. Like we're gonna we're gonna do DFC, but I, 
after DFC, I'm gonna do this until we die. <laughs> I love this game. Uh, I thought we were almost out of gold, boys, but this is gonna be this is gonna be a while. This is gonna be a while. Yeah, this is this is what I'll say. I'll just go until we run out of gold and have to go back to Trav and call. I'll just go till we run out of gold, boys. Till we have to go back to Trav and call. Postpone DFC. We might have to. <laughs> this is this is too broken. Not to not to do something with. Oh my god. DFC rain check. Yeah, this is certainly the better way to do it. Oh man, if that would have been plus two. Ooh. Now, I still don't think legacy graphics is worth it for me. Like, I'm not, I, I, I ain't so set back by this that I need to, I need to strain my eyes with those types of graphics, okay? We fast enough. Like, do you really need to be faster than that? Like, I just filled up this inventory in a second. Do, you re do I really, do we need to be faster than that? Oh, shit, facts. What about this? Is this good? Do I keep this? I feel like I don't get rid of it. Like, this actually, this is pretty good, right? Like, it's not trash. It would be really good if it was, uh, if it was, like, plus two to skills. Oh, my fucking God, I'm gonna love this day. Uh, yeah, I think it probably helps if you have the bow. It, it definitely makes it so you can abuse it. I, I haven't tested it, nor do I want to at this point. I just want to gamble my life away, boys. You see, I know some of you might have been like, oh, we need to, we need to dial it back a little bit, play less D2R. Well, first of all, that was never going to happen in the first place. But second of all, on a day like this, it will certainly never happen. I'm, I'm literally doing this after DFC, like, I, I'm doing this all night. My brain is happy. It's getting like a whole bunch of serotonin and shit. Oh my god. I feel so... I, I just want to know. I just want some... I, I want to know how the streamers that just play single player and they've never made anything on Battle.net, how they feel. Like, and I know they're going to be like, oh, don't, don't phase me none. But it's like, oh, this has got to this has gotta be one of the best feelings ever. Ever. They missing out. I guess I guess y'all should y'all should have played Battle.net. Why are why the hell wouldn't you play Battle.net if you're playing D2R? You're playing Diablo 2. I don't single players. Don't play single player, boys. I don't care if you play hardcore on on Battle.net. I don't care if you play you know softcore or whatever your thing is. You're wasting your time on single player. Oh, for fuck's sake. Look, I still, I still got time to ban these peeps from chat right here. I still, I still got time. Ban. Don't, don't think I'm too good. For, don't think that, don't think that because vendors are giving us a 50% day, that bots can come in here and try to fuck things for us. No, that's not how it works. Woo. Oh my gosh. Boys, there's just, there's so many good magic circlets we could get to. Anyone got anything good so far? <laughs> oh, is that a good one? Oh, it's a, it's a good one, huh? Shouldn't have banned that bot. Seemed, seemed good. Maybe I should have checked that out. I appreciate that bot just letting me know where all the hot singles are in my area. Because I, there's not at Walmart which is where I've been checking for all my discounts. I've been going there and I'm like, look, any bitch who shops at Walmart, like she, that's the, a girl after my own heart right there. Because, you know, she's she's on a budget too. You know, it's, it's after my own heart, but they, 
Ain't seen a lot of them, dude. If I'm being real. Ain't seen a lot of them. Just gambled a plus two, 10, 19 all res amulet. Oh my God, you did? Jesus, dude. Oh, this was close. Look at this. Two to barb skills, a lot of gold find. It just unfortunately needs something else. That was close. That was very close. Oh, y'all can't see. Let me get, let me, uh, let me go over here. Cause now that I'm filling this inventory up, it's probably more entertaining. If y'all can see what we gamble at the end, not at the beginning. Dude, I'm so stoked for this. Like, if we get bored of this, we'll just swap to amulets, right? Like, there's there's no getting bored of this, really. But, like, like if we wanted to do that, how, how good would that be? This just feels good, boys. It just feels good. All right, I should pick up this circlet on the ground though before it poofs, because it was it was kind of a decent one for LLD. It was kind of decent. Oh my god, yeah. Now I just want to do now I just want to do amulets, man. Oh my god. Oh my god, what a good day. What a good day, boys. The DFC is closed. <laughs> DFC closed today, boys. Oh no. So so many LLD items will enter the market from this. Dude, no they won't. Because people have no idea what to keep for LLD. And then even the ones that like keep them because of the level requirement, they like have no idea what they're worth they have no idea what they have like it, it's not nearly as many will enter the market as you think this this is a great opportunity actually maybe we will gamble some amulets because there's some good there's like amulets that i certainly need i need an lld amulet i need a few lld amulets and is there really a better day is there really, honestly, a better day than this? Like, this might be the best day on the planet. We need some gold. Hold on. It's gold time, boys. We need some of that precious gold. Time to time to gold find. <laughs> time, to, time to stock up. We should actually make a point of this we should find these circlets find the good ones and the ones that are worth almost 34k we'll chuck them on the ground so that we can do this repetitively this is the best this is the best session of magic finding this is like this is certainly the most going to be the most unique session of magic finding in all of my 20 years of playing this game like th this will certainly be the most unique i've never done anything like this and it like will never happen again I wish they would keep this for all 22 days. There's no, there's nothing better. You can't get better than this. There's no gift they could give us better than this. At all. D2R dead. Just found two pally, 18 strength, all res 10, light res ammy. Nice job, Primo. That's a decent smiter amulet. Are you sure it was uh, kind of decent? Are you sure it wasn't trash? Yeah, most of these are trash. Most of these are trash. All of them. We could get a DR amulet. Uh, oh my gosh, there's just, there's so many things. Uh, Fax was telling me Masteries is actually better for LLD, so I'm gonna keep that in mind. Oh my God. I suppose we could do the same thing for amulets that are worth almost 34K. We're almost 35k. How many of them are popping up though?
we'll set that aside. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We'll set that aside. We're just waiting on the plus two skillers, basically, right? Those are going to be the ones. Ooh, attack rating, life, stamina, DR. I've seen worse LLD amulets for Zons. It's not great, but I've seen worse. Yeah, and we're gonna we're gonna hold on to these and sell those in regular in regular trade. So we can just farm gold. Let's see how that works for us actually. Let's go take care of this one. Second the motion for claws, that's probably a good one too. Yeah, but the thing is, the only thing you're aiming for with that is like the only thing you can really get is plus six or plus five claws, right? Like, we're not gonna find, we're not gonna get, uh, well, no, actually, we're not gonna get, like, ethereal ones, we're not gonna get ghost claws, we're not, there's, like, certain ones you're just not gonna get. So, like, we buy this for 20k, we sell them collectively for, collectively for 50, yeah, this is the way to go. So, this is 30k a pop between these two. That's certainly how to do it. So we want to find amulets that are worth about 30,000 gold. And then we could perpetually gold find just like that. That's theoretically the best thing to do. Wow. What a day. What a day this is going to be. Uh, yeah, that's almost 30k, but we'll wait. We'll find a closer one. Wow, two to traps, dual leech, min damage. It's actually kind of a cool amulet. I wish it would have spawned with like any different skills, like some paladin combat skills. This would have been kind of cool. Uh, gloves. And you were gonna go run Trav, right? What was I thinking? What, what was I thinking, man? Damn would do such a thing why would we why would we do that all right this is a good one good one to sell to start farming that gold so then we take this and we just sell it here boom Use your highest level, why? Things cost more at, at a higher level, and this guy is adequate enough. He's at the lowest possible level that you can be uh, to get everything you need um, without things costing too much. It seems like 93 may be the perfect level for this. That's just my guess. I think 93 is the perfect level. Oh, look at this. No level requirement on this one. Isn't that key out? Isn't it just key out? We're getting, we're going to see a whole bunch of key out amulets today. Key out jewelries and circlets. Shit, let's sell this so then if we just do this if we just buy all these off that little run okay so we start at four uh 464 k and we end at oh my god it's like 100k doing this with these five amulets it's like 100k this is so sweet Feels good. Oh my god. Woo! Let's be careful not to sell my Annihilus charm. That would suck. That could happen if I do a 24 hour stream. Like, miss collect, boom, 2020 Annie down. Oh! Oh, that doesn't feel good. Ed, Ed, you gotta go. You just gotta log on and you gotta check what the daily thing is today, bro. That's all I'm saying. Just
Just log on and check the daily thing today. What the what the daily blessing is today. And and then you can roll in gold. You can roll in gold. I don't even think you need a gold find barb today, really. I don't think you need one at all. Yeah, I probably should, right? Then we might not be able to use some of this stuff, though. Here. This is really what I should do. Um, uh, yeah. Hide the expensive shit. Like, this is a really good geeds for what we're doing. So we hide it behind a shit charm, and we hide it behind a shit torch. Or a shittier torch. That way, if we do misclick, it's not devastating. Like, oh shit, yeah, I lost the 1918 bar torch. Better than losing a 2020 Annihilus. Yes, top secret nailed it. Farming without farming is exactly what I love the most. You could not have said truer words. There has never been truer words that have been stated about me. I love I love farming without farming and putting the fucks to the man. And I feel like today we're doing both of those things. We're doing both today. Cuz today is is certainly a blessing. Certainly a blessing. All right, I'm actually kind of curious about this amulet. I want to sell it. It's it sells for 35k. I'm curious as to what it buys back for. Let's let's see. So, bam, 25k. So it's only we only get 10k from it. I'm actually gonna sell that. It's not it's not netting us our needed 20k per run here. Per 20k average per amulet. It's bringing our average down. We can't be having that. All right, back to it. Oh, did you really, Eddie? Yeah, this will this is certainly a good break, bro. I I I have actually considered doing a 24-hour stream in light of this. Like I, I'm it it's seriously something I'm considering right now. This is really good, 32k. That'll be awesome. This is 31k. That's good. Be sale value, boys. This actually isn't bad for level 9. There could be better stuff. We ain't keeping trash. This is non-ladder. We're not keeping trash. This is really good for level 18. Needs cast. Otherwise sick, though. Do it on ladder. I mean, we could, but my only... I have a 96 on ladder and a 91. So we don't have the ideal levels. And honestly, if we find something good, probably the people that are actually going to pay for it are not the PVM players on ladder. Like, things are actually more expensive right now on non-ladder. So I think, honestly, that's where we should be gambling. Like, because if we do find something good, it's worth more. Theoretically, non-ladder, way to go. Theoretically. But I'm actually glad you said that, because you forced me to think about this for a second. And that's what we need to do. We need to be thinking, always, how to absolutely put the fucks to the man with this. And I believe this is the best way. I believe this is the best way. I believe we're annihilating it right now. And we got more fodder.
What a good day. Yeah, I'm certainly gonna have carpal tunnel after this one. That's all right. If there was certain, there's certain events in life that are worth it, boys, and this is one. You also have to ask yourself when you sit down at the computer and you're about to get carpal tunnel, is this worth it? The answer to that question today is yes. Because I feel like I will come out a better man because of today. Like I will certainly be a better man at the end of today. Or, or I should say at the end of tomorrow. <laughs> at the end of fucking three o'clock tomorrow. I'll be a better man. I'll be like, people will be like, Cooley, do you regret it? I'll be like, Yeah, dude, I don't know, man. They banning people, though. They banning people for that shit. Did you guys see that, uh, you guys see that, uh, regular schmuck got banned again? Makes me wonder, boys. Makes me wonder what the fuck's going on with that. Because... Th there, I have a couple of theories. I have a couple of theories behind why he might have got banned again. A, he's actually cheating or botting. Number one. B, number two. The program that people run, like the one that Sweet Phil runs and the one that uh, that regular schmuck runs, that count runs for you, and these little macros that they use to swap the game, they press a button and then, then they, you know, it leaves that game and creates another one, is flagging them. Yes, yes, Fayez, 100%. I have, I just dumped shit tons of gold on the ground and didn't have to go back to Trav and had a maniacal laugh. I would say to myself, but it was actually live. It was actually live. Maniacal laugh, live. Like, this is, this is quite possibly one of the highlights. You are seeing one of the highlights of my entire Diablo career. Like, this is... This is going to be fun. Oh, oh, I see what you're saying. I'm reading between the lines, top secret. I'm reading between the lines. Really? Okay. Okay, then. Well, then that just makes me think that Blizzard is far better than I might have given them credit for at, at ganking people. Because what he said in his video is that he did like 600 other runs. He did like 600 runs. And, uh, you know, for bail or something like that and then got banned. Uh, I don't know, man. Well, here's the other thing. If they really did ban him for behavior again, question number one, why the fuck would you do that again? Like, if they banned you for it and it was, and it took so much to get, like, unbanned, why would you do it again? Like, don't think that because they unbanned you that you still won't get flagged. Bro, I just had 100 bills. Hope I don't get banned. <laughs> No, nah, dude, he did like 600, I guess, in the course of two days, maybe three or, I don't know, two or three days, something. I don't know, I shouldn't say days because I was wrong in my video. He let me know. It was actually like four days that he did, uh, that, he, that he did that over. But still, that's like a thousand runs a day of Pindle. So, yeah, I don't know. This is a good one to sell. Yeah, I, I, I don't think you will. Yeah, this is why, like, even some of the PvP players, they run that mod that changes the color of their cursor. And although they've gotten away with it, I don't dare do it. Like, I actually can say this, boy, I wouldn't lie to you. I, I don't use any mods for D2R. Nothing running in the background, nothing. Like, that way for certain if they ever choose to ban me like i i personally can't give blizzard any reason to ban me because the what the, the first time they have one they're gonna take it like let's be serious they're gonna be like oh oh dude you see this weird program running in the background for cool let's just ban him and he'll figure it out like that's that's how it will go so like i certainly don't run anything
Reported it. <laughs> Reported it. Uh, maybe he's just a, maybe he's just a five head creator and riding the hype wave that those videos brought. Yeah, I don't know, maybe. But dude, he gets so excited. Like, who knows? But I, I have never been more convinced that there may actually be something that he's doing. I don't think it's the run numbers. No, they don't tell you though, Cody. They don't actually tell you. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Dude, I certainly do want to get a level 99 of every class. I hit level 96 today earlier, boys. I, I logged on this morning, did some runs, hit level 96 on Santiana. It felt so good. It's now by far my highest level character on D2R. And it just feels good. And I'm like, it's, it's addicting. That little ding and then seeing you have like an absolutely astronomically high level feels so good. Like, it makes me want to get a level 99 of every class. I mean, and, and I duel a lot, so, like, why wouldn't I? Like, it, it, it's actually good to have a level 99 of each class. Oh, we're running out of gold, boys. I guess we got to do some gold finding. Hang tight, boys. Just do a gold find in here. This is good. I actually like this. It's a little bit slower pace, but allows us to kind of sit back, smoke, take a little break, catch up on the chat. Uh, they were probably watching him really close after that unban. Uh, either that or they just don't like him. Yeah, it could be. It could be, dude. Like, it, it's certainly something. Like, especially after all... They knew. They knew that people were watching him after that. So the fact that they banned him... After knowing that there was a lot of people watching... And there was a lot of people that would be interested in such a thing... Tells me that there really was a reason. Remember back in 1.8, 1.9, everyone was running Cow Sorceress and everybody was 99. Yeah, oh yeah. Those were way back in the days, dude. His channel got more momentum than D4. <laughs> Maybe that's it. Yeah, oh, for sure, dude. For sure. I think it was certainly good for his channel. Yeah, it was really good for his channel. But, I mean, you got to kind of take that as take that in stride and be like, okay... This was really good for the channel. Now, I, now, don't fuck this up. Like, don't do that again. Or, you know, perhaps don't use any programs at all. Like, I'm not sure if it was... Like, he, I mean, he was talking about ideas that it could have been. Like, you know, talking about things that he was using. Like, if that was me, I, I would have stopped all that bullshit, dude. I would, I'd have been like, yeah, I think it might have been this. In fact, hell, I used to do that back in the day, dude. Like, you know, I used to run programs. In fact, you guys want to know a funny story? You guys want to know something? This is, this is funny because it's true. It's probably not funny to some of you, but I honestly don't give a fuck. <laughs> when I first made my first ever D2 video and uploaded it to YouTube, you might have noticed it was like, a month or two before I uploaded another one and oh my gosh this was so close and there was a reason for that you want to know the reason because I got a three-week realm down for botting like I, I got a three-week realm down I was running six bots how do you guys think we did how do you guys think we did Uber Tristram runs out the ass for fucking hours every week? Do you think I do you think I bought those keys? Oh my god, no. I that's that's why we set aside one day where we just plowed through all of the keys that my bots found all week. Like, but after that first video, I got a I got a three week realm down. It was literally like you would try to make a game and it was like position in line eight million or whatever. 
and you noticed it was counting down by the second. And I did the math, and I was like, that's three weeks. Like, I just got a three-week ROM down. Yeah, so... That was why. But, to this guy's defense, right? I didn't stop botting. I didn't stop doing it. The only time I stopped botting was when I signed on with Matt, the Max Roll team. They made they made you sign a thing that says if you get caught for botting, you have to pay a fine. And I was like, "Are you serious?" So I was like, "Well, I got two options. I could not get caught or not do it." And at that point, I had accounts full of keys. I had so much stuff. I had I had kind of a following at that point. So if I needed keys, I'm sure I could ask people to like farm them and help me and they'd be happy to, you know. So I was like, maybe I can leverage that. So I actually stopped botting when I signed on with Max Roll. Never ran a bot again after that. And then D2R got launched and I didn't dare bot in D2R. I had plenty of people reach out to me. I had plenty of people be like, oh, I got this bot, dude, you should do this. You wanna you wanna sell stuff that I'm botting? Like, and I didn't get involved at all. I just didn't dare to. I was like, I know I'm gonna put so much time into this that like, I don't want to lose all of what I'm gonna work for. Like, I, I don't I don't wanna give Blizzard a reason. We need gold. Do we need gold, boys? Done. They used to bought 5x at a time for two years straight on LLD. Melted my GPU. It was Christmas every morning. Yeah, dude, I'm telling you. Like, it was cool, man. I, I actually liked it. You want to know the reason why I bought it, though? If, if I, I'll be honest with you. The reason I bought it back in the day was because getting to level 99 was impossible on my schedule. Like, I had a, I had a, re, I had a job, like... I was like, I could no life this and get to level 99, but I was like, I want to do PvP content, and I gotta have like a 99 of each level of each class, you know, like. So I was like, I just, I don't even care about the items. It was about the leveling. I was like, I, I want to get to level 99 with these characters, and I don't want to actually sit through three months of bail runs, like. You know, so uh, literally, if we would have gone that route and done it legit, we'd still be leveling those characters to 99 right now. So, like, that was why I did it. But now, there's really no reason to in D2R. First of all, other people do it, and they drive the price of items down. So, great, you benefit from other people botting, because they're driving the price of items down. Great, that's awesome. Now I can afford the things that I need. And then they implemented Terror Zone which now gives me a ton of experience, way more than I would have gotten in LOD for running the same areas, or not not the same areas, but like for choosing a terror zone, just going into the terror zone. So like there's almost no reason to do it. 96, truth be told, is the highest level I've ever gotten to legitimately. Like, you know, and we've done that on D2R. The, before that it was 95 on hardcore. And I only remember it because it was hardcore. I had a uh, level 94 that I legitimately got to before that. But, uh, it, yeah, like, and it feels good. It feels really good. I, I don't care that the terror zones are making things easier. I don't care that other people are botting and risking their accounts to drive prices of items down for me. I think that the state of the D2R economy is great right now. And the state of D2R leveling is is great as well. Could it be better? Maybe, but I will not at all complain. I think the changes for that have been so amazing. Some of the best changes to this game ever. Uh, second only to this change today. Uh, this is actually the single greatest change that has ever existed in this game. It's not even close, boys. It's not even close. Notice how many amulets we've gambled? I'm not sure if you're keeping count, but we're on six trillion and seven. 
Uh, that, that's what we're up to right now. Six trillion and seven. That's how many ambulances we've gambled. None are good. Like, this is why even doing this is like, it's cool and all, but like, how much will this really help? This is, this is crazy. We need some gold. We need to do some gold finding. For Christ's sake, I gotta get faster at that. Maybe it's faster to right click those. Shit, hold on, we gotta sell these back before we forget. This is our source. This is our source of gold finding. We can't be crapping out on this. We gotta we gotta we gotta do this right. Okay, so if I do this, it's technically faster. It is not faster at all. Not faster at all. Myth. Increase your chance to sell your Annie. That's exactly what I'm worried about. I gambled a perfect Mara on non ladder a while ago when I was crafting. No shit, Chaz. Dude, uh, I best I gambled in all of D2R so far. I gambled a 25 Maras. I was pretty happy with it. it. Feels so good to gamble a Maras, doesn't it? Oh, this is a good one. 33, 34k that's gonna sell for? That's exactly what we want. Apparently those Hydra charges, boys. Ooh. Masteries, max damage, strength, life. We shall keep that, actually. That is good for LLD. Combat skills, eight strength, mana, magic res. So that's like uh, eight, that's like eight uh, enhanced damage. Yeah, we'll keep that too, fuck it. That'll be good on the charger. Got mana on it too. Very, very nice. A very, very nice. Okay, so let's uh, let's bring these to this. Let's let's clean this up a little bit. That's getting kept. That's getting kept. These are getting sold. Let's put these in the stash. Check Discord, GG. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hold on, I gotta. Sh is this ladder or is this non? Hold on, I can check. Yeah, that's non ladder. Oh, I, I gotta share this. I gotta share this with you guys. This is what Ed just sent me on Discord. Apparently, this is a thing. Apparently, this exists. This is, this is goals today, boys. This is our fucking goal today. This is what we're gonna get. This is our goal today. We're gonna find 12 of these. Holy shit. What are the bids on this? 32K, you gambled it? Did he say thank you everyone who's commenting? I still can't believe I got this thing. Current offer is 40k. 60k. This is this is 150k. Easy. 60k is a low ball. I might just put 70k in just to be like, okay. <laughs> like, if I get it for that, I'll find the forum goals. <laughs> I'll find it. That's the best, that's the best druid helm on Battle.net. Show me a better one and I'll show you a liar. I'll show you a faker. Uh, Druid needs it uh, in certain matchups in PvP. Uh, you want to walk around like when you're dueling a Necro. There's certain times where you actually want to run and walk. Uh, same thing with a Hammered In. Um, it, it can help you sometimes with a Hammered In, but usually versus a Necro. 
Uh, any class that in some that sometimes needs to walk or run uh, against their opponent, that's why that stat is good. And it happens on far more classes than you think. So yeah, that's that's why that thing is so good. Yeah, that's GG, man. Holy shit. Right, we stacking them up, boys. We getting there. We getting we getting some. I'm I'm keeping that one based on what facts told me. That that masteries is better in LLD than than plus one to barb skills. All right, we need some gold. So let's get some gold. Yeah, technically this is faster than. Uh, yeah, we just got half a million gold right there. All right, we started at 400k. Let's see how much we get. This is technically faster than gold finding. Yes, yeah, so we get 200,000. Like theoretically, we can do one one gold find run and get a, a million plus, but that's very rare. I think this is technically way faster, especially if we get a lot of Amis, we can do this too. If we just keep keep keeping these 34k amulets that we find with hydra charges on them or with hydra stuff on them this is so cool man uh, we're like full again full stash don't worry boys we're gonna stream today till we run out of gold uh not sure thelron honestly i'm not sure but it certainly makes it faster like it certainly makes the abuse a little faster Makes it a little more efficient. Hmm. Zero good amulet so far. It's absolute zero. Like, this super GG amulet. But like we've kept some because we don't really have any better options as of yet. Yeah, zero loading screens too. That's the other thing. That's that's really what I was thinking, honestly, Alexander. Like you, you don't have to you don't have to wait for the loading screen. You don't have to like switch axe like that. All of that shit, man. That's a good one. That's worth 33, almost 34k. Yeah, that that's clutch. Doing good so far. We haven't erroneously sold any charms. We haven't, we haven't fooked anything up yet. Not bad. It seems like it's LLD. It's not bad, but there, it could be better. I think you really need cast on a Sork amulet. I think. I'm not. I'm not entirely sure, but even if you didn't, you, you could have got more life and mana. PLR is even good because there's a lot of cheesy poison builds. God, there's so many good things we can get. We, I mean, we haven't gotten any of them. But there's so many good things we could get. I'm, I'm super excited. I think we need some more gold, boys. We're running low. Yeah, I think we figured out the fastest min-max way to do this, boys. Just, I'll be right here. I'll be right here for the next 24 hours. If you guys want to know how to do this the right way, just tune right in. Fully knows the most efficient way to put the fucks to the man. He's been doing this his whole life. Mom should have named him Jimmy McGill the second. Because this is what we've been doing, boys, my entire life. I've always been the little guy. I've always had to figure out creative ways to put the fucks to the man, and you're seeing it live. 
just what we do. Yeah, let's just, let's do this. Let's make some money. Let's fill up the stash. We're getting a little low. I think it's time to gold find. Got to gold find a little bit. Gold find barb is sick, dude. I don't even think we could PK people this this fast and get all of this. I don't think we could PK and get gold this fast, man. This is sweet. It's to the point where like we do this two or three times and fill up our wallet. Yeah, I think tomorrow at 3 p.m. Eastern is when this resets, right? Is when this stops and goes on to something else. I don't know how they're going to top this, though. This is the most solid thing I've ever seen in my life. All right, now our gold is maxed in the stash, too. Uh, okay, so that's 2 p.m. 2 p.m. Eastern. Okay. Good to know. Good to know, boys. I'll be streaming for another uh, 19 hours. Y'all are strapped in. We'll be streaming a while. I'll sell that. Another good one to sell. Minimum damage? No, okay. Yeah, dude, the gold find buff from yesterday, I almost logged on and streamed to be sarcastic of how shitty that was. Like, the 50% the extra gold find, I'm like, do they even know what they're doing? And then I saw the one from today, and my answer was, they certainly don't. And... <laughs> and I've never been more happy. I've never been more happy playing this game. This is, gosh, my God, dude. Oh, this could have been, this could have been good. Higher gold find and even plus one to barb skills there would have been, would have been dope. But we can't be keeping trash. We ain't keeping trash today. This ain't a trash day. Dude, I seriously hope they do it. I hope they do it. I will do another 24 hour stream if they do that. Most certainly. Most certainly. Uh, I'll get my two level, two or three level 99s. We'll do it. We could get gold fine Emmys, teleport Emmys, LLD Emmys. There's so many things on the, on the, in the realm of possibility today, boys. We may actually need to do some more gold finding here in a sec. We're getting close. This is a really good one though, sells for 34k. Man, we're getting close. It just feels so good. The sound of selling so many amulets consecutively like this. Yeah, it's like almost good. Yeah, I would so do that, Thalron. If they go back to back, 
the blizzard might actually see me die. If they, they might be trying to kill me. All they've got to do is just do this for 24 hours and then 50% EXP. We're gonna be having a day. <laughs> we're gonna be we're gonna be having a day, boys. Oh yeah, we could get DR mana amulets. Oh, this is a good one. We could get DR uh, mana amulet, or yeah, DR mana amulets for our immortal sorceress. A lot of good things. We're gonna be keeping our eyes, well, like literally, our eyes are peeled for literally anything. And this is more fodder for this. Gold finding made easy. <laughs> oh my god. This is so great. Yeah, that's true. That's true, Top Secret. I could do that. I could have the harmony on the other side. God, you're so right. That or we could just gamble a 230-22 open socket, 80 gold fine circlet. Let's go. 230-22 open socket, 80 gold fine. It'd be, it would be single-handedly the best amulet to ever exist for, or best circlet to ever exist for a gold fine barb. And then we'll put that on. That's what we're going to be aiming for. I think we got to switch it up. These these amulets are pissing me off, dude. We don't get anything. The only thing we've gotten is gold fodder. All this gold fodder right here. I think, I think we'll, we'll go a few more, but it might be time to switch this up, start doing circlets. It's like, ah, oh, getting bored of these amulets. I suppose I'll infinite gamble circlets. <laughs> Oh my god, what a great day it is to be alive. I almost feel like we should farm, you know, you remember the seed theory that I was talking about? I feel like this would also be the stream to to put that to the test. Because I've noticed something in gambling all of these amulets. Notice, how many have we gambled now? Seven trillion, eight trillion amulets? They've all been shit. Every single one of them. The gold find rolls low. The MF rolls low. The certain charges don't roll right. Uh, there's very few rare plus two ones, you know, that roll with other S tier mods. Perhaps we should farm a game where we believe the seed is good. Do we want to take some time and do that? I feel like we, I shouldn't fuck around too much because then we got DFC boys. Yeah, it should should switch games. Yeah, let's let's just do that. Uh, I'm actually gonna do that. I'm gonna I'm gonna mess around and see if we can find a better game, because as it stands right now, I'm pretty sure that's the case. Like, this is just a horrible seed. So let's do it. It would be we need a non ladder character uh, and one that can actually test things very quickly. Uh, let's do it with. Let's do it with Ali. Yep, for science. And then, because, dude, like, this is this is where we put all of this junk fuckery that we've ever thought of to the test, is on a day like this, where we try to farm what we believe is a good seed. We're going to be looking for... We're just going to be looking for superior items to drop with something. Like, it, it, give us a hint. Give us a hint as to what the seed looks like. 
Oh, we lost our girl. Alright, whoops, we don't need that. Uh, we need superior items to drop. Perhaps we go to cows. Or maybe we go to chaos, actually. Maybe that's the way to go. Okay. All right. Yeah, we'll we'll go, we'll just go to chaos. Oh, this actually spawned really well. This didn't though. I'm actually gonna hold on to that. It's not a bad jewel, but crafting jewels are good. But this is good. It spawned maximum nine strength and almost maximum res on this. And two abilities. I feel like that's also something to pay attention to. So alright, let's chaos it. Let's take this let's take this boy to chaos. Whoops. some superior items to drop tell us about this seed we'll go we'll probably go a couple games until we get an actual good one it, it takes a while remember I mean you guys remember seeds are the seeds are just inherently bad most seeds are just inherently bad there's a there's probably a 95% chance your seeds gonna be bad uh, oh yeah so we have this theory we have this theory that we're testing and the theory is that the RNG in this game, I mean, we've known this for a while, is not completely random. But we've, uh, my theory is that it could be based on what are called seeds in the game, that all the games are created with. Um, and that that could dictate how certain abilities on items roll. Like, the, you know, if they roll from a certain tier, uh, if they uh, roll high or low. Um, all of this is dictated by the, the random seed that gets generated when you make a game. Uh, so the way we've been testing that is to look at, like, superior items. And, like, superior items or items that spawn with skills on them. And we look for a couple of things. Like, we look for if an item spawns with skills on it, how did they roll? Did it roll three skills? Like, you know, three different types of skills? Did How did they roll? Did they roll plus one, plus two? Did they roll plus three? Superior items, did they roll mid or low on the superior, like ED, uh, or did they roll max? Like, we, you know, so this one rolled plus one to skill, it's low on the ED. You know, we collect a few of them, we look for a few superior items to make our judgment, because it doesn't mean that all items in the game will be good or will be bad. They just have a propensity to be on a better seed, is what we think. It, that's the theory. So that's what we're doing here. It's like we're just gonna try to farm a game that uh, the seed is actually good. So these are rolling from a good class, but we're not basing it on, we can't get too complicated with it. We gotta base it on superior items and items that spawn with skills. Like that's, that's the name of the game. And that we use that to basically judge whether or not the game is good, whether or not the seed is good. And we didn't, we barely saw any superior items here in this game, barely any. So we'll go to the next game. Yeah, there's also a way to manipulate the seed. Um, there's a way to manipulate the seed in single player to make it so that all of your chests always drop the certain, like certain runes, mal runes, or what have you. Uh, there's certain ways to do that. Uh, you can just, you can actually pick the seed. You can pick the seed in single player that your that your game spawns on, and if you know. Uh, what that seed corresponds to. You can have a great day at uh, Lower Kurost or, you know, other Super MF chests. We just looking for them soups. 
looking for some soups. Did it not go? Looking for soups. All right, this could have skills on it, right? So this will tell us something. No skills on it, which I suppose we can derive something from that. In 25. I hope if this if there is a good seed, I hope it's not in this game. Ping is so terrible. It's probably because everybody is like, yep, let's do this. Okay, this spawned three sockets and a and a perfect superior mod. Gnarled staff has skills on it, spawned plus one. The superior mod that we saw on that was not great. It was the AR one, and it only spawned with one of them, which may suggest it's not a great seed. some scrolls boys oh my god infused item drop sign me up dude just like the old just like the old school days dude you know what you know what you know what I'm talking about you seen you seen the video possibly those were the days man I think they should just allow it like I, I think there should be a random weird like tiny chance that any item that drops just infuses like infuses and becomes some other random unique. I think that would be awesome. But it's just super rare, like one in a trillion that it happens. Maybe, maybe more. Hundred and thirty K yeah, I figured as much, dude. I told you that's a hundred and those are easy a hundred and fifty K. Like easy, Ed. It's not even, it's not even close. Like, that, that's, that's probably a understatement. Another high ping on this game, dude. Everybody's online right now, dude. Everybody is abusing this shit. Ain't nobody trying to miss out on this. Yeah, we didn't find any superior items there either. That was weird in that last game. can roll with a certain mod on it, but I don't think you count that, especially on rares. You really need skill items or superiors. That's what we're looking for. That's what we need. That's what we need. We ain't getting any, though. They didn't even give us what we need to tell the seed. Or to, to guess if this seed is even good. Come on, skill items, superior items. Here's a skill item. Plus one to skills, terrible. Oh, superior. Uh, plus eight, not good, mid roll. Whirlwind correctly, bud. Go. Superior crystal sword. Here we go. 
Here we go. Come on now. All right, 11-3. It's still kind of mid. It's not good. You don't need gold find. You just need edge. Yeah, pretty much. Edge geeds charms and sell a lem to vendor and trade for profit and buy it back to fill up gold max and gamble. Be sure. So lem runes are the best right now. Uh, pretty much anything that sells for close to 35k or exactly 35k like if you can sell it back to a vendor for that that's that's ideal right now we're just looking for a good seed because apparently you can just stay in that one game and that was exactly what we were trying to do the other day when we found a good seed we just capped that game and was like yep let's go we MF'd in it. We had a blast. And now we're really going to have a blast. I know it takes a little bit of time to do this, but it, I think it's going to be worth it. If my theory is correct, this will most certainly be worth it. Like, we will be fucking getting circlets, amulets out the ass. And it will be a very good test because you just, you saw we didn't get shit. We, we just gambled for an hour, maybe? Didn't get shit. So, like, all we have to do is just get better than shit for, like, you know, a, a few consecutive a few consecutive rolls, and we're looking good. All right, don't die, baby. Let's go. Let's go. We can't be having you die. Yeah, and that, that, will, that will essentially, this will allow us to test this theory pretty well, too, man. I'm pretty excited about it. trying to kill Sharon they're, they're trying to kill Sharon double tellies the ping is so bad because there's a million people playing this game right now I can't blame them all right checking out this superior this rolled 12 which is technically better than men that rolled uh, a superior not a superior but a high-end stat uh, yeah, we'll, we'll get it. We'll get it. Let's get it. Superior items. Come on, superior or skill items. Tell us something about this seed. I suppose if we also just jam a high rune, too, that's probably a pretty good... Like, just bear runes drop or some shit like that. It's probably, like, that's exactly what you're waiting on. Like, those are the games. What's up, Shirley? It's going good, man. We're, uh, we're looking for a good seed right now. Long story. I'll explain later. Because hopefully we're going to stay on this seed for a very long time tonight. After DFC. Greetings. We need a quick, quicker way to do this. Quicker way to check the seed. But we have to find superior or skill items. And I would love to get a game that doesn't have shit ping. This is a good way. He wipes out all of the minions around, which can give us a good idea. Can, can dump a whole bunch of items at once. There's a superior mace. Uh, mid roll. I don't think they did, dude. Did they? There's no way they did. Well, you haven't been kicked out yet, so there's no way. I hope they didn't. We're just we're just trying to put some more fucks to this, honestly. I guess another way, if we get sick of looking for a seed, because it's very rare that you actually do get a good seed in the game, we could just gamble, and if we go a couple rounds and don't find shit, we just go to the next game. It's also another way to do it. But I would like to know for certain that there's a good seed. All right, Superior War Scepter. Tell us good news. 
Plus one to meditation. What was the superior mod? Rolled mid. I feel like we can't, we're not seeing enough information from this. Ah, boys, it's tough. This is some tough shit. All right, chaos it is. Chaos is just the best. Why is my ping so high? Am I on the wrong server? No, I'm on America's. Holy shit. There's so many people playing. All right, so we have a, th I have a theory. Someone just asked about this. I have a theory about RNG in this game that it's not entirely random. As with really anything, it's not, like, RNG is never really random. But I believe it's based on the seed of the game. Like, how well your web, your items roll. Like, literally, from, from right down from rares to the runes that roll, like, you know, on, on drop rates. And I think it has something to do, uh, like, uh, you know, the skills that roll on items like this. You see how it's plus one? I think that has something to do with the seed. So what we're doing is we're farming for to look for either superior items, because we're basing the theory off of that, or items that drop with skills on them. We got two superiors right here. If they spawn with like plus 15 or even plus 14 in another mod, that usually that that is how we guess that the seed might be okay. It might be an adequate seed to MF on. Or like your your rolls from that seed tend to fall higher on the scale. You know, it, it's just like farming the same rune over and over again in single player, picking the right seed. Uh, so we got a couple of rolls here. We got a plus three. We got three skills that spawned on this. Two on the last one. Three skills, and one of them was plus three. So that's, that's good. This one spawned two superior mods on it. Both shit. This one spawned one superior mod perfectly. So seed is not horrible so far. We may actually go to this game. We may actually do this here. We may actually see what we got. We may we may roll with this one. Because it seems like it could be okay. And then 14 life, that's of those mods that can spawn at LLD like that. That was almost perfect. It matches sort of what we've seen so far in the other pieces of, of the, you know, of what we're gauging the seed on. That sort of makes sense that that's almost perfect. Let's see if we can get some more. Let's see if we can get some more rando superiors. Yeah, check the superior items and items that spawn with class skills on them. That's how we gauge. How did the class skills spawn? Did it spawn with three of them? Or did it spawn with one or two? And even if it even if they did, how did they roll? Did they roll plus one? Did they roll plus three? Like, you just kind of gauge that. Like, even if their shit rolls on the skills or whatever, it doesn't matter. Just how well did the skills roll? And that will tell us the propensity that that seed has when it generates random numbers. Does it generate them high? Does it generate them low? Like, you know, what's going on? Okay, so here's another data point that I like about this game. I may stay in this game. It rolled a uh, a mod that's eye level 90 plus on this charm. That's exactly what we're looking for. This is an eye level 90 plus mod that rolled on that charm. Matches everything we've seen so far. Uh, this rolled two superior mods. It rolled a decent mid roll on the base mod. So we can't really tell much from that, but it doesn't hurt this seed any, right? Like we're not, we're not unhappy to see that. And that's what we're basing our logic on. So what we'll do is we'll probably come back to this game. This, this has skills that roll on it or can roll on it plus one. So this is like a, this isn't a horrible seed. It doesn't seem like a great one either. But it's very rare, just so you know, it's extremely rare to find like the golden seed where everything seems to be rolling perfectly. All right, so this is Jack two. Yeah, I think so too. It's certainly better than the other seed that we were on. And that's what we have to, that's that's kind of where I'm at. It was. It's certainly better than the other seed we were on. What do you need? Let's fucking go, boys. The only thing that we did lose is we should have grabbed all of those amulets. Now I kind of feel bad. 
all of those amulets that we were using to farm gold. Oops. We just lost them. That's all right. We'll get them back. We aim for 33, 32k or more. If they sell for 32k, we drop them on the ground and use them to farm gold. First, we look for quality, and then we look for price. I suppose, like, that's good enough for now to help us farm. Same with that. Good enough. Good enough. We'll take 29k at this point. We need to rebuild. Uh, no. 25 DR is perfect, surely. And 120. Yeah, 120 mana, 25 is perfect. Yep. And I, I love what you're saying, Chick Shots. This has big gambler energy written all over it. Already, I'm liking what I'm seeing from this game. I'm liking the mods that are spawning. I mean, they're not perfect. But, like, they're certainly better than what the other ones were. We're getting a lot of plus two skills amulets. This is really good. It's almost good for LLD. Hey, we got a unique amulet, boys. No Kazan relic. We're so lucky. But hey, at least we got a unique, right? That it tells me that. Look, I'm telling you, this is this seed logic has something to do with it. We gambled a unique. We gambled seven trillion amulets in the last game, and we didn't get a single set or unique. It was just all rare, everything, dude. I'm telling you, I think this seed has something to do with it, and it makes sense because the seed wasn't great, but it wasn't bad. It got a unique amulet that just wasn't great. Like, it, it totally makes sense with this seed. Everything is making sense, but it tells me that we, we could get some good luck here. Like, it's possible. This game wants to give us luck. It, it doesn't, it, it isn't out to get us. Like, it isn't out to absolutely bone us with luck. Which, hey, we'll take it. This is an interesting amulet. Two twenty trap helm, brah. Just got a two twenty LLD druid helm. Oh my god, dude! Are you gambling with your level forty five, or are you going? Uh, are you picking a high level? Yeah, forty five. Damn. Damn. Oh, this is a good LLD amulet. Decent. this over here like it could be better but could be worse I suppose if there's any LLD sorceress builds that don't need cast hey boys I'm telling you I do, do I ever lie to you boys see now we got a unique and a set back to back seed logic seed logic boys seed logic it's actually a sun version of Angelix. I think we'll keep that. All right, we're gonna sell some of these amulets here. We don't have all of them that we need, but we have some. Let's let's clean up this ground a little bit. Uh, okay, so we're putting this. This is gonna be over here. We're gonna keep this, and we're gonna sell the rest of these. And we'll put these in the stash. Yeah, we gotta we gotta build back up our gold finding stash that we had before. Uh, I mean, there's benefits to both, honestly. There's just there's infinite possibilities right now with the things that we're gambling. There's like literally infinite possibilities. There's so many good things. I mean, you almost just can't miss. Just like pick one of the good things and go with it. I don't like how the extra gold rolled on that. That's too bad. We're getting a lot of rares. Getting a lot of rares. I like that.
That's sweet, Shirley. Yeah, I'll check them out. Uh, best way, I think, is to just get an edge bow and a 15% geeds and go to town, man. Uh, and then what we've been doing, I'll show you in a second. We have to kind of rebuild our stash, the, the, what we were using before, uh, to farm gold. But we're, we're using certain amulets to farm gold. Um, and we're doing it. I'll, I'll give you a little rundown here in a sec. You want to look for amulets that are not 35,000, but that are close to it. Hydra, Hydra Chance procs are like the best amulets to find. But you want to be close to 35k on your amulet, but not quite there. Because that ensures that you're selling it for the maximum that you can possibly get for it, and which dictates how much it can be bought back for as well. So you want it to be, you want to sell for maximum profit and buy back for minimum. So then we go down and we do this. And we buy all these and we sell them back and it actually nets us gold. So you, you don't need to, you don't need to gold find. You can practically pick just about any item and make money, but this is the fastest way to do it. There we go, we net money, and we just keep it going, man. Simple as that. Simple as that. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Note how they did the event. First they gave extra gold fine, and after that they gave unlimited gambling. Yeah, it's brilliant, dude. We're hoping to get rich. Hoping to get absolutely rich. We're gonna see. We're gonna see. War cries extra gold, damn. Nothing that even sells for an adequate amount. Ideally, what we would do is flood that vendor with a ton of amulets that are worth 34k. And then it makes it so that our we can gamble back a lot quicker. We can gamble back our gold in like one or two rundowns. Like this one's okay, 30k, sure. Close, man. Get the Hydra proc. I'm just gonna flood them with like Plus two to skills amulets. It, it just makes things quicker. Oh, there's a good one. 33k. 32k. Ooh. That was almost really good. Oh, Shirley, are you having fun with this, bro? Because I certainly am. <laughs> I've never wanted to play this game for 24 hours straight more than I do right now. Never have I ever wanted to play it more. Stash this. Ah, uh, no, fuck it. Let's just do it again. Let's go. Only 20 hours and 15 minutes to go. Let's fucking go, man. 15 geeds are more expensive than 20, 220s right now. Oh my god. Oh my god. People are losing their shit right now. Woo. Good. It's the way the game was intended to be played right here, boys. If you don't believe that, you're wrong. You're just, you're just simply wrong. I'm sorry. Wish we could agree, but we, this is just the best, the best <laughs> way to play this game. Whoo! Let's make some FGs. Or let, I'm just really more excited to just get items for my characters for once, like potentially.
Oh, dude, I bet. I bet there will be. By then it will be too late. Nobody can't do it anymore. They'll probably never bring it back. Too bad, really. This is, like, this is so fun. That's another good one. People will, people will have like that, they're gonna have mixed feelings about any videos about this because the people that didn't know about it are gonna be like, oh, damn it. Like, you know what I mean? They're just gonna feel so bad. And, and it will, it isn't like it will ever happen again. They're never doing this again, dude. They're never doing this again. Like this is it. You don't. Don't get used to it, boys. They they done fucked up. They done fucked up. <laughs> it's so expensive right now. No shit. Is it really? I ought to do like in-game gold. One million. Ten. A hundred forum gold. There's no way they thought about this right here. I cannot wait to see what happens. Like, yeah, there's gotta be, Max. There's gotta be something that comes down the pipe. Like, are they just gonna allow this? Are they gonna allow this for 24? I hope they do. I honestly don't think there's anything wrong with it. Like, I think this is fun. I think this is great, but I'm not sure if they'll allow, I'm not sure if they'll agree. You guys, you guys know by now, they don't always agree with everything Cooley says. That's, they don't, they don't think that the, our version of fun is the right version of fun a lot of times, which is really unfortunate because Blizzard is actually just wrong. You know, I hate to say it, but they just are. You know, we know how to have fun on this stream and in general, man. Uh, and this is certainly the way to do it. Absolutely, man. This is there's no greater feeling. I don't know why people are buying gold right now. You could literally have no gold and you could build your way up. All you need is like technically just enough to buy like a couple amulets or really anything. You could just all you need is a lem rune. Like there's so many options right now. So many ways to make money. I don't know why people, we might as well just sell our gold. <laughs> people are paying a ridiculous amount for it. Well, we'll make it back. <laughs> Is it technically abusing the game though? They did it. They did it. They, they said, hey, everything's 50% off. I'm assuming this was planned, and this is exactly what they wanted me to do. I'm assuming this is exactly what they wanted me to do. Forty form gold? Yeah, that's almost double what it usually sells for. In before Blizz bans Cooley. Could happen. Nah, no shot they ban for sh for something like this, though. No shot. Like, everybody's doing it. You'd have to ban everybody that plays D2 right now. But also, I'm pretty sure this is exactly what they wanted. Like, this is, right? You wouldn't do such a thing. Otherwise, it would kind of just be dumb. Like, they had to have thought of gambling when they did this. Yeah, this is the goal. This is exactly what we're doing. We're playing this game as intended. We're playing this holiday blessing as intended. I I do not I honestly at the at my core I do not believe this is abusing the game. This is as intended. 
Like you don't you don't do something like this without like without thinking about gambling. You think they just did that and they were like, "Oh yeah, gambling. Oh, we totally forgot about that." Nah, dude, they knew it. They knew. They knew what was up. Yeah, I saw that, dude. I saw that. We were talking about that earlier, Rod. Yeah, exactly. Just like the charm working. Like, now, if there was anything where I actually thought I might get banned, it was when Max and, and our whole team figured out how to actually break that first day glitch and get tons of Sunder Charms. I was like, okay. They may ban me for this. Like, they, they may actually ban all of us. Because I was like, if nobody else knows this trick, and this is the only... We didn't we weren't watching streams. We weren't seeing anybody else. But, like, we figured that out on our own in that game. That was all us. Like, we figured, we figured it out by ourselves. I'm sure we're not, like, the finders of it. But, like, I'm sure other people might have figured it out. But we certainly figured it out without any help. So I thought for sure, I was like, okay, we might actually get banned for this. Like, this is certainly not as intended... Uh, you know, we're, we're, we probably shouldn't be doing this. But I was like, if they don't ban me, then that tells me this stuff is okay. So something like this, certainly okay. Oh, this is a good one for 34k. Help us farm back some gold. Gold finding is easy, boys. Yeah, oh, certainly something went wrong. Yeah, this is why Blizzard bans you for those macros that do the auto clicks. Can you imagine how how 200 IQ those guys feel right now? Oh, this is kind of cool. Rep life amulet with plus three skills. So That's not bad. Perfect or we trash. Perfect or trash? And it could have been more perfect or so. We're gonna trash it. Yeah, that's crazy, dude. I think we we horked that night until all of us got like 17 Sunder Charms. Yeah, Max says you only get banned for doing 650 bail runs. Exactly. That's what you get banned for, boys. Not gambling 6 trillion amulets. No way, Amir. Nice job, dude. That is sweet. GG. I want to switch back to circlets now. I'm getting sick of fucking amulets. It's ridiculous. I never noticed how absolutely shit all of these amulets are like literally every amulet ever like we've, we haven't kept really anything good like we've seen a lot of stuff but nothing has been really good like in all seriousness without exaggerating I'm gonna say we've probably gambled What would you say? Three or four thousand amulets? Like, legitimately? Like, not... Not exaggerating. Like, three or four thousand. Zerk is where it's at. Yeah, you're probably right. I don't know, dude. We keep getting a lot of rares with these. I'm liking the RNG in this game. 
it's just hard to get anything. It's good. Keep selling that one back though. We already have more than enough, but. Yeah, here's the thing though with rings, right? Like, this is why I probably won't gamble rings. Because in order to get a, a ring that was worth your time, it almost certainly needs to be five or six points. And you see how hard it is to get even a five point amulet with how we're gambling right here. Like, that's just the current state of rings in D2R. Everybody has too many of them because everybody keeps a ring. Like, here's the difference between, like, rings and LLD items, let's say, right? Like, when someone finds a ring, if it's semi-good, they keep it. You know what I mean? And everyone's like, well, I don't know. I don't know how to price rings, so they just keep shit rings. So there's, like, a plethora of rings that just exist. Most of them are shit. But... It's very unlikely that someone got a good ring and trashed it. On the other hand, it's almost certain that someone has found a good low-level dueling item, top-tier 20-30k item, and char the fucking thing. So, like, you have to think about your use of time and what you actually get for value out of it. With rings, I don't think you're going to get a lot of value, because you have to get an extremely good ring. With amulets, I could just get a nice LLD amulet that no one knows to keep. You know, or I could get a sweet six, five or six point amulet for HLD. The same te technically could be said for rings, but SOJ is greater than 95% of rings in LLD for any build. So like, there's also that, but amulets are necessary. Like, good amulets are necessary. So my thought is that your value is actually better gambling amulets or circlets right now. Not rings. Like, long-term value. Did you get something else, dude? No way. No way. Wow. Are we going to have to switch to the level 45? Get me some LLD shit. Yeah, I mean, that's not bad. That's not bad. But for something like this, I'm trying to completely get the max value that I possibly can out of this. So, like, while Ist is nice, I'm sure that ring was also pretty nice. Like, Ist isn't great because, you know, when you think about what other rings are going for, like, the value of rings can be through the roof, dude. But they ha the, reason, the reason that they are is because they're super good and the competition on rings is huge. Like, there's just, it's like I said, everybody keeps rings. Like, it could be like, oh, this one has eight life leech on it. Let me keep it. And then it also has 10 cast, 20 strength, 11 all res, and mana. But they're like, oh, I like that this has cast and life leech. And they kept it. You know what I mean? Like, and then someone, they try to sell it someday, and someone pays them, like, you know, ohm for it or something. And then that ring stays in existence. And here we are. You know, it's just, it's how it is. But that shit doesn't happen with certain amulets. Like, it doesn't happen with certain amulets or sort, certain circlets. Might have to do some gold finding here. Yeah, yeah, it's tough, dude. Absolutely, dude. It is certainly tough. I mean, it's certainly tough to find the cream of the crop with anything, right? But, like, the the mid-rolls on rings are just not worth it. Good gold find session. <laughs> K 
God damn. That was a fun gold find session. Let's do it again, shall we? God, this is a great... Keep talking yourself out of rings. No, I'm pretty sure we have to be super bored to go after rings today. I just don't think that's the where the real value is at. I mean, granted, you could get lucky. You could get lucky and get a good ring. And then you can be like, see, Cooley, I got a good ring. I'm right. But it doesn't necessarily mean you're right. It just means you got lucky. You were like one of the 0.0001% that would have ever done that. The rest of the rings are going to be worthless. Yeah, it's possible. Very rare, but it's possible. All right, see, I like this. These are spawning with plus three skills on them. Yeah, we ought to be gambling these. We're getting diadem conversions. Good tea. Plus two skills, plus three, another plus three. Look at that, a high roll on enhanced damage for an LLD helm. A 230 helm, see this is what I mean boys. This seed, this seed is certainly something. This seed is certainly something. I think, I think we landed on an all right one. Amulets are just hard. Amulets are just, they have that weird range, man. This what this spawned artisans plus another, plus another mod. That's what we want to see. Good seed. This seed has potential. We gonna stay on it. We gonna stay on it. Despite the ping. I hope they do, man. Although, like, D-Clone has been spawned so much in, like, the last, like, ever since, well, this is the whole ladder season, really. It's been spawned so much. So, like, at this point, there's, there's clone locks where people are like, meh, I'll, I'll catch the next one. There will be another one in a few hours. Oh, here we go. That's not a bad one, boys. Plus two barb skills, 14 dex, PLR, and extra gold find. Almost perfect roll. It's not great. It's not the best. But it's certainly not bad. It's certainly keepable. Oh, she's got two bows equipped on that sorceress? GG, dude. I think the best thing we've got so far has actually been one of these circlets or coronets too. It's been plus three lightning skills, 20 cast. That's technically the best thing we've gambled. And it gets even better if we take it to Larzuk and he gives us two sockets. We would only use it for our BM Immortal Sorceress setup though. That's truthfully my plan for that. Close. Oh, two Zon. Look at this one. This was so close, too. Two Amazon, 25 enhanced damage. Life all res. Damn. I'm loving this seed. I think I think it's giving us some good abilities, dude. I'm, I'm certainly not upset. But this tells me that we should be gambling circlets. Because we've, we've already seen, like, way better rolls from these. See, like, another jeweler's mod. We love seeing that shit. Our plus three skills. Exactly what we're going after. Wait, do we have to do some gold finding? We got, we got, we got enough for now. Nah, fuck it. We we should do it. We should stay max so we don't have to keep going back to the stash. Uh, I thought of doing a hike first, but in the morning it's like nighttime here. Guess I'll be hiking diadems. <laughs> Fucking right, my dude. 
sometimes you you just have to do what you have to do like you gotta tell you know if anybody was planning on being your hiking partner you gotta just gotta tell them look i really regret that i'm gonna have to back out on this one because uh you know it's a long story but blizzard entertainment has been very kind to me recently and has given me a once in a lifetime opportunity and I have to take advantage of that and I truly do mean it when I say take advantage gold finding is so easy I used to I used to get anxiety about gold finding not no more boys <laughs> not no more oh what a, what a life it is I just love how many rares we're getting. It's seed. Adam, what's up, dude? Yeah, and a one-handed crystal sword. Can you imagine how good a barb would be at that point? Oh my god. Can you imagine if edges were ladder only still? Can you imagine how expensive those would be on Lawn Ladder? Woo! Those would be, oh, look at that, boys. We'll keep that, we'll keep that. Not bad, it's not great, but it's not bad. Probably fetch you a good 100 forum gold or so. Not horrible, not horrible. We want to see some two socket rare helms. That's what we want to see. That's what we after. We after that good, good. We after that good, good, boys. This was close to being something good, but no cigar. Good to see you too, dude. We are, uh, we're absolute. We're in the middle right now of absolutely punishing Battle.net for its Christmas spirit right now. I can imagine a lot of other people are too. Another jeweler's mod spawn. This is what we want. See, look, this is the, these are the, even though this is curses and it's shit. I love that the seed has given us this stuff, man. We got to be thankful to the seed. I'm, I'm so happy we took like five, ten minutes to find a better seed because we've already matched the luck that we've had in the other game. Like, far more. Far more. Far greater luck we've had so far. Like, granted, we haven't found any home runs, but you can just tell things are spawning better. Look, perfect roll on life everlasting. We, we just It's almost like we knew it would be. You know, we would have a propensity to roll some better stats like this. Oh yeah, that's we we've been we've been in the same game gambling for months now. Months. Yeah, we are absolutely putting the putting the F's to the man with it. And seeing what we can get. Oh shit, DFC has started. Hold on, I should join up. Uh, I should join up. Let me let me pop into the Discord. Nice screenshots, dude. Llama messaged me and asked me if I was free. Could be on around 7 p.m. Maddie's gonna duel around 7 p.m. Him and I are gonna duel. <laughs> he was gonna tell me about the infinite money. Just making sure. <laughs> I fucking love Llama. He's like, just wanted to make sure you're doing the infinite money gambling. Like, just want to make sure you're awake and aware of this. 
All right, continue. <laughs> good fucking dude, man. What a good dude. I love that guy. Yeah, we're all gambling right now. Who is not gambling right now? But like, you should message your friends if they're off like magic finding or something. Tell them like, just fucking tell them, look, you don't know how to play this game. Let me give you the best advice. Uh, just go gamble. <laughs> this is gonna be nuts. This is gonna be nuts. We should we should do a trophy room just for gambling. Let's see what people got from all of the gambling. I'm gonna pop into the join the stream just in case. Just in case anybody wants to join the stream and do, do some DFC. If if nobody wanted to duel and everybody wanted to like just do this all fucking night, I wouldn't be upset. Boys. I can feel it. Today's gonna be the day. Yeah, you were, Shirley. Yeah, as soon as I saw your message, I decided I was going to stream early. I started shifting everything over, started getting ready. You are single-handedly the reason. You are single. You, you might be the reason for my first ever 24-hour stream. Shirley Sirius's message. This is close to being good. But it could be more, it could be mo perfecter. It could be a 180, not a 179. We ain't got room for trash. We ain't got room for trash. Oh yeah, oh Tava, just seeing your message. Um on circlets, it's it's more of like a combination of things that you look for, right? Like it's so hard to articulate all of the different combinations that you would look for, but in a very basic sense, right? The two biggest things that should make you stop and look are 20 cast and 30 faster run lock. If you see those, stop and look. Does it have like Plus two to skills, plus three to skills. Oh, another thing that should make you stop and look is two sockets on a rare or three sockets on a magic. Like when you get a lot of sockets on it, stop and look at the other ones and like, I'll be here. I'll probably be jamming all night. So just feel free to pop on and ask. But if you see those and they have like decent skills, other decent stats that, you know, if you know it well enough now you can recognize like, okay, those are decent, it's got a lot of strength. It's got those and a lot of strength and skills and you know, all of this. There's a ton of different things that could be on it. So it's hard to like lock it down to like, yep, this is exactly what we're looking for. There's also like level 30 items that could be good. Like ideally you could find one of these with 20% faster run walk and 30 ED. And the level requirement would be level 16 and that thing would be sick. Oh, we might need to do some gold finding here, boys. See, like this right here. Oh, no, I thought that was enhanced damage for a second. I was like, this would be a good example of something that could slow you down that doesn't have skills. But you see, I noticed 30 faster run walk right away, and I'm like, what else does it have? Right, let's do some gold finding. Dude, that really means a lot. I'm like super happy that Llama messaged me and was just like making sure. Just like, yeah, hey buddy, just making sure that you, you're you not missing this. He goes, I can't wait to see your trophy room video after this. He's a good guy. What a, what a good dude. What a good dude. Uh, I say we gold find a little bit more. Stash pull. Keep our pockets lined with gold. The name of the game.
gold finding, boys. God, it feels good. Woo! My God, it feels good. Oh. Oh. 24 hour stream incoming. Didn't need a gold boost to drop my 25 spot. Oh, no way. No way. You just got one? Bullshit. That's crazy. Everybody's dream. That's like one of the most expensive common charms. Common in quotes. Like commonly understood. The thing is so expensive. Like, you know what I mean? There's charms that people don't understand that they're good. Oh, is this worth something? It's like 313 poison. That's got to be good, right? No, it's not worth shit. It's good, but it's not worth shit. 2011s, people know those are good, but 25s is where it's at, man. People paying the premiums. Shame that didn't roll plus three. Real shame. Real shame here. They see propensity to roll perfect, boys. This is why we farmed this seed. You knew it was up. Oh my god, yeah, jewels and charms? Holy shit. Th there would be nothing left. There'd be no there'd be nothing left on Battle.net. Everything would be found today. This is insane. You know why I bet Llama reached out to me? Because I bet he was also thinking, what if I get banned for this? I better make sure Cooley's doing it so that they would have to ban all of the D2 content creators. Probably message Dabrunsky too. He's like, I don't have to worry about Schmuck anymore. They already got him. But just in case, but it's like, it's like uh, ban insurance. Would you like to ban all of the D2 content creators? Make sure, make sure Ginger Gaming Mentor is doing it. You can make sure everybody's doing it. Someone call up Dabrunsky and tell him get on this shit. Tell him, look, there's a big opportunity. Your, your fans, they want to, they want to see you get banned. Nah, I'm pretty sure they won't. But it's certainly good if everybody does it. If everybody does it, that's that's the boat you want to be in. You think so? I don't know, man. I, he doesn't play much on online, but I, I bet he would. Here's the thing with Phil. It's easy to recognize. I, I would hate to see some of the stuff that he would throw out. Like, I, I like that guy, but I don't, I don't have any faith in his rare item keeping ability. Uh, someone ought to like just kick around that game and just be like just drop the ones that you don't like Just, just drop them if you get a rare and you're just not sure about it Just go ahead and drop it on the ground. You'd probably get rich that way You'd probably get rich there, there, to be fair though. There's a lot of people regular schmuck too. also he, he openly admits he has no idea how to Gauge rings. He's kept some shitty ones in his vids. I mean, it's hard. It's kind of like a skill in and of itself, gauging jewelry and good items. It's a skill. Oh, man. God damn, if this had two sockets. GG. Uh, basically, there's a discount on Battle.net right now, Greg, where you can... Uh, it's like part of the holiday tw tw uh, 22 Nights of Terror. And it cuts vendor prices so much to the point where you can infinite gamble. Which is sweet. So every everybody and their mother is doing it. So like we gotta do some gold finding. So this is how we gold find today. We just buy stuff. And we sell it back. And gold finding made easy.
We might have to postpone the DFC till tomorrow. We're gonna get snowed in up here tomorrow too. Like we're gonna get we're gonna get snowed in. Uh tomorrow in the northeast like we're we're, ca we're catching mad snow until like sunday might be a good day to just hang it up do, do some dfc instead well i'll keep an eye on the discord i don't i see shirley in here but no, nobody else also down to gamble not gonna lie yep same let's duel tomorrow <laughs> let's duel tomorrow after 2 p.m Maddie says, also down to gamble. Yeah, dude. I don't even want a DFC tonight. DFC, I might have to change the title of this video. Change the thumbnail. This is just 24 hours stream. Cooley streams for 20, 24 hours, putting the absolute fucks to BNet. Getting rich for 24 hours straight. That's gonna be the new name. Oh, am I gonna unmute? Yeah, I might. I might. Hold up. Hold up. Fuck's good, Shirley Sirs. Oh, there he is. What's up? What's going on, man? Dude, how you how you doing? Uh, doing great. Glad that I got off work and managed to get on here. <laughs> oh my god, dude, this is so insane. This is so insane. Yeah, I so I saw somebody in Discord had posted, oh, vendor prices are 50% off. And in my mind, I initially went, there's no way. There's no way they broke this. There's, there, they definitely had to think this through. And then just logged in and looked, and I was like, nope, nope, they nope, fucked it they up. They did not, they did not think this through. Yeah, 100%, they fucked this up. And so I sent you a message, and I was like, it's, it's over, bro, it's over. This it's is, over, this is yeah, like, this DFC is canceled. <laughs> DFC cancel. <laughs> if there ever was something to cancel DFC, it's when. Oh, look at this. This is nice, dude. Blizzard look at this. breaks their this? own game. Yeah, it's when Blizzard breaks their own fucking game. This, that's oh, something. Nice. Yeah, this isn't bad. It, it needs cast. Trash. Not perfect. Not not one three twenty. Trash. How this do you like that one thirty twenty that I sent you? I know, dude. That's so dope. <laughs> You have to go five for three minutes and gamble for ten. Yeah, exactly. Who, who wouldn't want to do this? Like, you don't even need a gold find, Barb. You don't need a gold find character. You literally need an edge bow. Yeah, it's so ridiculous, dude. It's so ridiculous. What a great yeah. day to be alive. Yeah, I, I can't believe they did it. But at the same time, with what they've shown, they know. Like I did, I can't believe they did this. Yeah, I totally could believe it. Like, because they're like, oh, there's like someone can sell an item, and then the vendor will just sell it back for the same price the person sold it. There's no way to exploit this. We're good to go. Go ahead and send it to live. Yeah. And then, dude. oh, there's actually items that reduce vendor prices, which you didn't account for. Or I, I really don't think they accounted for people just buying and selling shit back. Is is like really what I don't think they accounted for. Like. Well, because that, that was my first thought was what item can I buy and then sell it back? And it's like, well, the vendor always automatically sells it for twice what you can sell it for. So like, if they reduce it 50%, you can sell an item to a vendor and then they'll buy it back for the same price. Like, just go back and forth, easy. But the way we're breaking this is because we have the reduced vendor prices. Right. Yeah, this is insane. This is so good. What a genius idea from Blizzard. Yeah, and then I'm yeah, gambling. Yeah, it's percent XP day. <laughs> What? Oh, he said he says they're waiting on an XP day. Can you imagine if they do this with XP? I almost feel no. like they they don't know what they're doing to the point where like they they know they believe that would be broken, but they couldn't fathom that this would be broken. Right. You know what I mean? We're talking about Blizzard who just yesterday thought it would be like equally as cool to give us 50% extra gold find. Like, you know, and now we have like we go from 50% extra gold find, which is a very insignificant thing, to yeah, because your gold find bar breaking, has... like you know, this is completely broken. Right, because your gold yeah. find barb has 6,000 extra gold. It's like right. who cares about 50%? I have 6,000. Right, like exactly. I'm good. They thought you'd gold find yesterday and then gamble all that today. <laughs> yeah, exactly, dude. This is this was the reason. This was the reason they yeah. gave it to it. Maybe they did know. Maybe they were like, all right, you know what? 
we're gonna make them think we're dumb and then we're gonna let them break the game. And we're gonna set it up and we're gonna add some flavor to this and let them know we're letting them break it. Maybe it was purposeful. Maybe it was well designed, well thought out. I doubt it. Yeah. I doubt it. I, I, doubt it. It, I imagine it was. <laughs> I imagine it was a. Okay, what do the people do to play the game? Well, people gamble. People do terror zones. People do cows. People do gold fighting. Okay, cool. Let's give buffs to all of those things. Right. And just call it a terror day for buffs to all of those things. Not realizing if you reduce vendor prices fifty percent, you're you're breaking the game. I mean, someone got gold drunk over there already. at Blizzard, and I say cheers to that, boys. Cheers to the drunkards at Blizzard. All right, well, my gold is maxed out on this character again. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, dude, I got gold like, on the ground. It was funny. Oh, yeah. The start of the stream, people were like, people were like, someone get him all the gold. I was like, don't worry about oh, it. We're good. <laughs> don't I got worry. it. We're good. Yeah, I got, I got it. <laughs> we got this covered. No problem at all. Anyone else constantly dropping from games? Nope. I can't carry No. I'm constantly dropping gold, bruh. Constantly making it rain. If that's what you mean. I... The devs have a good heart, albeit sometimes a little misinformed, I would say. Yes, 100%. I believe the devs that are currently in charge of D2R have a good uh, a good appreciation for the game and a genuine love for it. Uh, I also believe that their understanding of the game stops at noob level. Agreed. Like, it's it stops at noob level. Like, it is not like the understanding of people that have been actually playing the game for like eh, five to ten years. Like, you know, consistently. Like, you know, but put it this way. Most people that duel tend to know, they seem like they know a bit more about the mechanics of the game. It doesn't well, seem like- you have to. Yeah, you've got to. I mean, you learn it because like, people kick your ass and they tell you about it. Yeah, it's the faster cast rate breakpoints. Like, no, there's nothing in the manual or anything that tells you what is a cast rate breakpoint and how you hit them and like any of that stuff. That's all like, you gotta learn it or you gotta research it on your own. So if you're just playing through the game, you're never gonna find that stuff. Right. And so knowing that, oh, if you're going to PvP with a Necro, you have to hit 125. Like, no one's ever going to figure that out on your own. I mean, obviously people did, but it's going to take a long, long time. Yeah. And a lot of testing. Yeah, dude. And, you know, feel the casuals up in here. I'm also, so I found, I found a plus one barb amulet with minimum damage on it. But it's LLD. Yeah, how much minimum damage? Five. That's perfect. Does it have any other good stats? Uh, rep life and uh, six Keep all it. res. Keep it. Pretty good. It felt decent. The yeah, minimum damage stood out and I was like, ah, I don't see that very often. Yeah, that's a good one. Good find. I mean, basically, if I find anything that's even remotely good in LLD, I'll keep it because you got to figure most people don't. Like, most people just don't find good stuff and, or, or they don't know what to look for. Yeah. Yeah, because, like, the, the helm that I sent you, the Necro one, people would see that and go, oh, it's a 130-20. Damn, too bad it's not 230-20. And then they would just get rid of it. Right. They would see that like, MF video that I put out. They'd be like, they would, they'd be like, they see a 130-22 open socket level 27, they're just like, not 220, 230-20, trash. And <laughs> they're oh Cooley my trash. God. It did not, not perfect, trash. This is what Cooley would do, trash. And then Cooley secretly crying watching that shit. <laughs> oh my gosh, no. Well, dude, I actually had some comments on that YouTube video. You remember the, you remember the LLD shield that I found? Yeah. Oh, look at this, boys. This is a keeper. You remember that LLD shield that I found? Uh, someone, a couple people were asking. They're like, I, I assume you're trolling about the shield, right? No. I'm like, no, I have a 10,000 forum gold offer on it. That's how much I'm trolling you about that being one of the best LLD shields. 10,000 forum gold on it. No, it was, a, it, was, it was a two combat with 30, 20, and two sockets, right? Yeah, it was two... It just 230, 20, two socket, all res, uh, and life. All res and life, okay, yeah. Even yeah. without all res and life, it's still really good. 
Yeah, it's extremely good. I feel like the other char screen stat sheet should show frames. Like, instead of just saying how much FCR you have, true. Oh, yeah, the advanced sheet should show the actual breakpoints. Yeah, or, or just like, yeah. Yeah, that'd be good. That would be sweet. It'd be cool if they, if, like, there was some way to see how much your MF actually mattered in the game, too, but that's kind of complicated. <laughs> like, uh, you, you know it's just zero, right? It just doesn't matter? <laughs> yeah, practically. <laughs> it's, I, I, wasn't, I wasn't kidding about that in the video, either. Your MF doesn't fucking matter. Like, oh, man, I got this character. How many videos have you seen that's like, I got this character, and I got 600 MF. Let's go. And then they're just like, Look at these train gloves I found. I found a Shaco. <laughs> it's like, okay. Like, right, but then you find a Burr rune or a Bear rune and instantly, okay, that's worth 40 Shakos. So, yeah, and yeah exactly. MF isn't affected by rune, or rune drops aren't affected by MF. So, like, your character yeah. with 100 MF is just slower than the other characters. Or, like, at the, doing the same thing. Yeah, exactly. Or, like, the ones where, like, the, the highlights of their videos are the runes that they dropped. And like, they have tons of MF. Yeah, like it just doesn't matter. Like it, it's doesn't help you at all. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's a good one, Jason. That's a good one. I would keep that. Three cold skills, twenty cast. Yeah, take that to Larzuk. Oh see what yeah. You get. Yeah, that's a really good one. That's certainly a keeper. I would certainly keep it. Yeah, that I would be plane. one of those ones. I have a plain 220 Necro one that I took to Larzik and got two sockets. And it's like, yeah, it's not a 230, 20, whatever, but like at some point I'll probably wind up throwing a couple Burr in there and just having a budget version of a cast helm. Yeah, you know? I, with those cast helms, I particularly look for the plus three to skills. Cause like, and I think a lot of people do too, because the reason you would be using uh, one like that is because of those those reasons, right? You're trying to maximize your damage and also do something else, like stack up bear runes in there for DR, or you know, in those very specific circumstances in PvP, or like my uh, like my 320 on my on my necro. It's a plus three, plus three, and 20 cast with two sockets with two bear runes in it, because yeah. I know that's my and it's my NVD setup, you know, and I try to teeth the shit out of them, and you need DR, but like you probably wouldn't want anything else besides plus three to skills on that, right? Like even a rare probably couldn't come close. Like you just want damage and DR, that's it. Yeah. But don't worry, I got shit on in the trophy room for posting a 220, uh, two open socket one. Somebody's like, oh, it's magic, it can't be good. And I was like, oh yeah, don't worry, magic items can't be perfect. No worries about that, bro. Yeah, I mean, to, to be fair, though, it is hard to get a magic item, like, trophy-worthy. I mean, I all I'm going to say is the first magic item I ever posted in the trophy room was a legit trophy. That was certainly trophy, dude. <laughs> and, and I think the timing of it matters, too. Yeah, Because, like, now, I mean, if someone posted a J-Mod in the trophy room, there's no, which, no shot we're talking yeah. about it. Right, yeah, exactly. Somebody posted one last week, and everyone's like, "Yeah, it's not, it's not a trophy. Like, don't worry about it." Like, well, it's a, it's certainly a trophy, but it, it's like you got to figure. Right. I don't like the trophy videos. I don't do them just to be like, "All right, these are the best finds of the month." I try to make videos that like have a point behind them. So like, when you see that video, you can learn something about these items and why they're trophies. So that's like the new approach with it. Is like I'm trying to make trophy videos that you that are new. Like, you know, like you might see items that you never knew why they were good. So it's like kind of a dual purpose. And you can't do that if you just keep showing the same items. I got a, I got a high standard on the YouTube channel these days, man. High standard. No fucking around on the main channel. On this one, though, probably a lot of fucking around. I'm not going to lie. There's, there's going to be a lot of fucking around. We're gonna do 24-hour streams of fucking gambling. <laughs> Welcome to it. Oh, why couldn't this have barb skills on it or cast or something? This would be good. Oh yeah, I found a plain 3020 helm earlier with no skills, and I was like, oh man. No. If this just... Oh. 
Man, there's so many options. My, this, like, secretly, I'm kind of hoping I find a nasty gold find helm. Because as it stands right now, I just have a 100% perfect IK, IK helm. And yes, that's 100% perfect. Defense and everything. But, I want something better. Oh, look at this, Max. There's like no use for this, right, Max? Three martial arts, 20 cast. Like, even if this got two sockets, there's zero use for this ever. Gambling is bad, kids, just not this kind. Well said. <laughs> well said. This is the healthiest form of gambling, actually. You come out richer because of your efforts. It's like it's like video poker. You're playing with fake money, and you're... I mean, the house isn't going to win this time. Yeah, house is certainly fucking losing. The house is burning down, dude. You can tell from the ping in this game, which just seemingly keeps getting worse. Like, literally, people might actually have set blizzard headquarters ablaze i wouldn't be surprised if they rolled if they did a, a mini patch and reduced it but again it's only 24 hours and we're already what five hours into it so like you know would they do a hot fix for this i don't know i, I doubt it why would they just let people do it man it brought so many people back to this game all right max i'm keeping it just because you said that yeah the like the thing is if you have a gamble bot like oh this is, is insane like well, if you had a gamble, you should bot. not be botting at all. But we talked about this start a stream. We, I actually talked about all the botting that I used to do back in LOD, and just said I wouldn't dare do it in D2R. Oh, I wouldn't either. I would not fucking dare do it. Like, People oh sent me God. bots. I've I've been sent like four or five different links for bots. Yeah. And they're like, yeah, here's a gamble bot, here's a pinball bot, all this. And I'm like, yeah. no, I'm like, I have invested too much in this. Yeah, To dude. get banned for this. No, exactly. No, That's how I feel, man. My goal is to get a level 99 of every class on this account. And like the last thing I want is to get banned. Like I, I was just telling people, I don't even dare run those little things where like some people run the macros. You see Sweet Phil, uh, Top Secret also apparently runs them. Um, the what macros. macros? You hit a macro and it will like exit the game and go click on hell and start a new game for you with the click of a button. So Ooh, like if you're that's farming, that's not a good idea. Not a good idea. Really? That's not a good idea, bro. You're you're getting. It doesn't matter. You're using a third party program to do stuff in game. Oh man, I, mean, I wouldn't. That's... I wouldn't do it. But uh, it breaks appear, terms top... of service. Yeah, it, no, it breaks okay. terms of service. Okay. Like Didn't you're know that, but... like you can't use a third party program. That's a third party program that's doing something. Doesn't matter if it's a cool. macro; it's part of your computer. Like it's yeah, still it's doing it. Yeah, it's not you playing the game. It's a, it's something else. They'll ding you for it. Ding ding, like, baby. No ding ding. You can't ding this account because I ain't gonna do shit, bro. Like I said, I don't dare do shit. Even even Toshank. You see how? Uh, I shouldn't mention names. There's some people out there that that do the PVP. I don't think it's Toshank. Maybe he does. Maybe cursor. he does it. I don't. Yeah, know. I have the gold cursor. But yeah, the gold, yeah, the gold, the gold cursor. cursor gold cursor dude i don't even dare do that it's like, just, that is just an image over top of yeah the but technically one. technically it breaks terms of service right if you're using it to make it so that you can see your cursor better because it stands out more than it should technically at a very you know very intricate level that's also an advantage it's an advantage but it does not play the game for you that's the difference that I'm talking about. Is like, if you're doing a macro, it's doing things for you. This is just changing the color. This is like changing your graphics settings, like changing it to be higher um, gamma or whatever, so you could see the ground better. Like, I used to blow my gamma out like crazy in LOD, so that like the shadows basically didn't matter, so that I could actually see the projectiles and stuff on the ground. Like, so what you're saying is it's increasing that game gamma for you on a certain part of the screen. Nah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man. But put it this way. I, I completely agree with you. I think that of all of the mods, I think that should be allowed, right? Like, something like that, it isn't really... Like, I don't think it's a big deal. However, I'm just saying I wouldn't dare do it. Like, because even still, I'm just like, yeah, I don't, I don't dare. Like, I, I would just much rather not, not do that and not get banned. Like, it's, that's just where I'm at. Also, I totally zoned out in that conversation with you, and now I have just a pile of gold around my character on the ground. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Don't worry. I did, too. <laughs> I, did, I, I got it, too. We all just jamming and slamming. Oh, no. Like, 
Like, here, I'll send you the screenshot of Geed that was around my character. <laughs> why am I not, uh, why am I losing gold over time? Not, uh... Cause you're, cause you're being dumb. <laughs> no, no, it's, so, Joby, let me, let me show you, bro. So this is, this That's is how we, you actually do have to farm a little bit. So like, are you watching, you watching my screen right now? Yeah, I did. Okay, so what I did was when I was gambling amulets, I found ones, let me show you. I'm going to buy these real quick just to show you. Like, this is how we gold find today, right? So I'm going down. Let me buy some of these. And I want to show you something very specific about the amulets that I bought. So I just bought a ton of amulets. And as I was gambling, I kept all the amulets that sold for about 30K. So you see the sell value on all of these? How it's around like 30K? Yeah. I sell those for 30K and I bought all of these back for about 10 to 12K. So you make 20K per amulet. Okay, so you max out really quick. Yeah, so you just like, you just sell all these and before you know it, you're raining gold on the ground and that's how you get your gold up. So, okay, so uh, gamble amulets first, right? Yeah, amulets, anything really works, but just amulets are super small. They only take up one space. So it's easy to buy them back and sell them very quickly. Like you can just do it all in one run. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair enough. But yeah, you can practically do it with any item. Yeah, I was doing it with circlets, but my inventory was filling way too quickly, and so I farmed up some amulets and. Yeah. Oh, Top Secret says I don't run it. A few people asked me to run it uh, this counter on my vids, but I'm always too lazy to set it up. Dude, same here. I actually had thought about setting it up for some MF vids, but then I was just like, yeah, nah. Like. In my honest opinion, really top secret, nobody cares about what run you found something on. Like, you can just say approximately how many runs you did. And if, you know what I mean? Like, don't lie about it, but like, if you did 9,980 runs and you said you did 10,000 runs, I don't think anyone's really gonna care. Like, don't care. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, it, it, it's just like, you kind of know how much you did uh, approximately. Um, yeah, and it, or, but also, the... but most importantly, no one cares what run something was found on. Yeah, but like as as my grandpa used to say, never let the truth get in the way of a good story. So like, exactly, if you don't if you don't remember, you did like you were drunk as a skunk and you did five hundred runs one night and you found a bunch of shit and you're like, I have no idea where I found any of this stuff. I know it was all Mephisto runs because I did five hundred. But right. I don't remember what. Just make it up, cause like it doesn't right. actually matter. It doesn't actually matter at all. Like don't <laughs> don't let the truth of what run that was get in the way of a good story. Right. To some degree, yeah. I agree with that. Like some yeah, of it. Yeah, cause you could say matter. you could say like, oh look, I found these on back to back runs. No one's gonna know the difference. It's right. just the fact that you did the runs and you didn't cheat the items in. Like like oh I did 500 single single player runs and I found 17 griffins. Ah, really. <laughs> <laughs> Motosexual, if you figure out how to do that, let me know. I'm totally down. He, he's talking about the IRL infinite money trick. Sign me up. Sign me up. Yeah. If, if this had two sockets, we'd totally keep this. It's a sweet home. It's d d d <laughs> there, The infinite money trick reminds me of uh, Abbott and Costello bit, where he's, he's like, here, give me two tens for a five. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, sign me up. God damn. There was an infinite money trick, but unfortunately, Sam Bankman Freed was the one that figured it out. Now that's been patched. Uh, unfortunate, but he nailed it. I wonder what the outcome of that's going to be. He just got arrested. I I'm wondering what the outcome is, is like, if he's going to have to pay anything back. Like, is that 57 the, the young guy? Give him the 57 curious? Holy shit. Is that UC the guy time? that... Is that the guy that did the uh, the whatever, the fake crypto thing with the NFL players and all that? Yeah. Gotcha. The yeah, it was one. the, I don't know, it was just it, all crypto currently. I think the current state, don't take this the wrong way, but what I'm saying is the current state of crypto, all of it's a scam. Because the, oh yeah, like it, it's, the point of crypto is to have, like it's very, it's a very good idea. Like, but the point of it is to have a deregulated, like some sort of unregulated currency that people can't fuck with. It works if there's one or two of them. It falls apart if there's a lot more than one or two of them. It just falls apart. 
People are like, oh, no, man, I made a ton of money with crypto. Well, yeah, you probably did because you can still make money with doing fucking a lot of shit that is just wrong. You know what I mean? Like, it, it just doesn't make any sense. There's plenty of ways to do that in life. But crypto would be a lot better off if there was only, like, Ethereum and Bitcoin. And those were the only cryptos. It would be a lot better off. But the fact that anybody in their mother can create a crypto and just be like, yeah, man, we're going to use it for this. And then people get fired up about use cases and stuff. Oh, it's got a use case. And, and you know, and they'll, they'll get fired up because the price will spike 20% in a day. And they're like, see what I mean, man? Crypto is way the future. But really, it's like, yeah, you're making money. But the point of crypto is to have an unregulated currency that is a good place and a trustworthy place to stash your your money, basically, to hide your money. It, the, the point of it should be very dark. The crypto is a, has very dark intentions to it. Uh, people used to buy sh shit illegally on the dark web with it. That's a good use for it. That's a great use case. It doesn't work when there's a thousand different cryptos out there you can switch between. Like, you know, so the it's, it's great if you're making money off of it. That's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. But the actual point of crypto... Oh, this is really a shame. God damn, this is a shame. Look at this fucking thing. God oh, damn course. it. Maddie, did you leave town when I left the game? Oh, man. I just yeah. left, bro. Did you it's leave town so when better. I left the game? No, I did not, no. Because all my amulets got reset. So now I gotta start over. Get right. God, God damn it, Maddie. Look at this, dude. These two. These two things just came right in the same run. Not, uh, not totally disappointing, but slightly disappointing. God damn, dude. That could have been so much better. If this would have spawned on a Coronet or a Tiara or something, we would be in the money, boys. Oh, that's a shame. Trash, boys. Damn. I've only ever gambled on one of those my entire life, and I, accident yeah. I, I accidentally canned it. I actually, it was when I was a noob. I remember it. It was when I came back to PvP after taking a many year break from Diablo 2. It was just before I started streaming. Gamble yeah, born. Retired. And it, I was like, oh, this has three sockets. And I was like, oh, that's too bad. That's faster run walk and not cast. Trashed it. Sold it right back to the vendor. What a noob. I was a noob. Do you find it odd that, that uh, did you see that circlet 30 faster run while Jude circlet on uh, on JSP and it went up for trade? Did yeah. you see that one? Yeah, I saw that, dude. Oh, oh I find God. it odd it was posted today with this thing going on. Oh, yeah, for sure. But wouldn't you? Like, if you found something like that, knowing that literally everybody in their mother is gambling? Yeah, that guy clearly gambled it like that. Oh, yeah, I bet he did. That, that or he had it and then he fig like I, I would also sell it if I, I I guess I would probably sell if I if I had one of those two that was worth a lot and I figured out that there was a glitch like let's say you had you were privy to some information you had like uh, you know early D2R so you had like 40 bear runes and then you figured out there's a dupe that just came out wouldn't you try to pitch those bear runes as fast as you could just like the Sunder Charms right Yep, that's exactly what we did with our Sunder Charms. <laughs> I fucking pitched them immediately. Uh, right now, I'm drinking on uh, green tea and vodka, but I also have some Jim Beam waiting, thanks to the kind donation of uh, Insomniac. Insomniac donated $100 on the Twitch stream earlier this week, and he told me to buy myself some whiskey, so I'm going to do some rounds. We started out with Jim Beam. I have actually haven't had Jim Beam in years. Last time I had Jim Beam, I got absolutely smashed off it. Pretty sure I almost died. Uh, I was actually 22 at the time, and um, I think I actually almost died. Uh, but I've taken a liking to whiskey in recent history, and we've switched back. We're giving it another shot. It's not so bad. Yeah, Sag, for sure. Yeah, it was really cool, but man, he's such a good guy. Like, oh my gosh, he always does that. He'll always send, like, some money. He's like, get yourself some whiskey, man. Yeah, just keep it flowing. And I'm just like... Good dude. This guy doesn't send me shit. <laughs> Look, we got a thing going, me and Insomniac. We always talk about uh, what I like about him too is we'll talk in Discord about putting the fucks to the man, dude. Oh, well, like, we're doing it right now. Yeah, exactly. Like, how can we put the fucks to the man? We'll have like deep intellectual conversations about this shit. 
like retiring early, putting the fucks to the man, getting money for free. Like, you know, these are just the things. I think if you're not talking about those things and they're not on your mind, they're not something you at least think about, you gotta reconsider that. Reconsider your life. Like, honestly, I mean, it should be something that if you ever run into someone at a party and they start talking about, like, money for nothing, like, free money, if your immediate response is to not listen and to be like, eh, fuck this guy. Pause for a minute. Hear what they're saying. Then decide. Like, that should always be something that piques your interest, right? Like, yeah, man, uh, I actually, like, if I, I go to a party, I'm like, yeah, man, I actually figured out a way to do an infinite money glitch IRL. Like, if your immediate response is, well, that's stupid, we shouldn't be doing that. <laughs> no, I should be like, all right, dude, what are you uh, talking about? Like, uh, like, what's your car that you're driving? Oh, okay, you got a fucking Lamborghini Gallardo and this is fucking Maine? All right, dude, I'll listen to what you have to say. Uh, tell me more about this, but make sure nobody else hears. And uh, how much do I got to pay you to shut the fuck up and not tell anybody else? Uh, that's, the, that's the... That's 40%. how you should think. <laughs> <laughs> Market strategies and where it's at, exactly. Although I say market strategies, I was doing so good in the stock market, and then I got, ah, oh, man. Then you got high. I just, I know, yeah, then we got this week, then we got this week. Well, I'm not doing bad, but like, it, it just sucks when you get weeks like this where you have a report from the Fed, and then everything just tanks. Like, that's exactly what happened. This was so close to being good, too. But like, we get a report from the Fed about, I don't know, it just said something bad. I don't, I honestly don't even care what they say anymore. I just watch what it does to the market. And I'm like, okay, must have been bad. Like, you know, but I unfortunately forgot there was gonna be a FOMC meeting, sold some puts at like, you know, it, it, it reasonable puts, but like, it's gonna hurt. I'm probably gonna get put some stuff. But luckily, I just got full control of my 403B and they just wrote it to me. They're just like, yeah, here you go. I didn't even know you could do this, but they like gave me, they gave me it all. I'm waiting to see if there's any taxes involved in it, but I think I Jimmy McGilled it where I, I don't have to pay any taxes, but we'll see. Now I'm just selling calls and puts with my retirement money. I'm pretty happy about it. If I Jimmy out, McGilled it. What's that? Jimmy Gimmel. Jimmy. Yeah, Jimmy McGill, dude. If I, if, depending on how it goes this tax season, talk to me after like April and I'll tell you how, how well I did. But I think I might have figured out a way to Jimmy McGill your retirement plan, boys. More on this as the story develops, but I might have been able to Jimmy McGill it. Not sure if you saw my previous message, but can you make an intro of your YouTube video with piles of gold instead of one all over, or you probably won't see another opportunity like this? Yeah, that might actually be a good idea. Yeah, I didn't see that. Sorry about that, bro. That's probably not a horrible idea. I think we should certainly do that. <laughs> let's. Hell, we got 20 hours. Let's just get some. Let's fill up some space, shall we? 20 hours remaining? Uh, I, I don't know. What do we got? Uh, I don't know. Probably 19 hours remaining, something like that. God damn. This also could have, this had the potential to be an insanely good circlet. Look at this shit, dude. If this was plus two barb or plus two paladin skills, that's certainly a keep. 22 strength, enhanced damage, fizzo mod. Bitch. Yeah, fresh. For the kids. What up, what up? You getting in on this juck fuckery too, or what? I'm like, gambling. Who isn't? Who isn't? <laughs> is, is anybody in this join the stream channel to actually duel, or, or are we just all gambling? <laughs> I'm just gambling, bro. Yeah, Maddie cool. even stole stole my edge bow, borrowed, and, and then proceeded to break my game because he left hey. town and refreshed my vendor, which then got rid of all my amulets. Oh no! Oh no! I did the, I did the same thing accidentally to myself earlier when I was looking for a better seed. That is a yeah. jerk. Yeah. <laughs> Dumb. Dummy. Big dummy. 
Maddie, I need you to bring me some amulets that cost like 34,000 gold, please. And thank you. Can we gamble in the same game? You can, but you'll get server errors. Yeah, it, it's not ideal to gamble in the same game. Okay. You technically it'll, can, yeah. You can, but it'll just like, you'll just get weird errors and it says I can't complete that request. Yeah, can't like, complete someone this else request. Is, is yeah, stupid. someone else is requesting the same thing from the server. Hey Tempest, uh, do you want to knock these out right now? Uh, what, are you gonna gamble? Up to you. Or gonna just duel? our duels. I'm oh, duels? Gambling. We can knock them out if you want. Uh, Dude, I'm down. If you guys, if you guys want a duel, we'll pop, we'll pop in and watch it. I just feel like everybody is putting the absolute f's to the man right now with, uh, with this we gamble can... glitch, and it totally makes sense. But yeah, I'll, I'll watch. I'll certainly be there. Maybe I'll go to Cooley's game and steal all his amulets. He's farmed up. <laughs> no, don't do that. I mean, I'm, I can guess about three. You use one of about three passwords. Just save some gold. We literally, it took us one pass to get all of that am, those amulets. One pass. Yeah, I can't. Like, I'm not gambling them with high enough levels and stuff. Oh, I guess maybe I could gamble with a high level. Gear. Yeah, just get a high level, dude. Ah, you can still Maddie get can, LLD can... helms with your high level, dude. And the fact that they're converting level 45s now too, to the fact that you so that you can buy coronets at level 45 is stupid. Like, no point in gambling at level 45 anymore. You might as well just gamble with a high level and hope you get an LLD helm. You think? Yeah. Let's try yeah. to do a little bit later, Polly. Hey man, that works I... for me. I I'm about my, to uh, I have to get dinner right now. That's why I was telling you the text message. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, just let me know whenever you get back. I'll be here. Sure. Right, I'm just gambling, gambling away. <laughs> yeah, we'll just be gambling. Just let us know. Just give us the heads up. Like, hey, all right, yeah, we're dueling, and we'll pop over and check it out. Okie dokie. Uh, yeah, yeah, no worries. No worries, boys. We all, sure. we all got some stuff to do tonight. Yeah, we only get our two twenty thirty two sockets. Exactly. <laughs> Exactly. 23022 sockets, boys. Here we go. I'm halfway there. I got a 13020. No sockets. <laughs> Eight people in the game from the same vendor, DDoS Geed, and he starts popping SOJs. Oh my god, can you imagine? Hey, look at this. Artisan's TR of life. This could have been so good, dude. Another close one. This could have rolled 25 DR and this would have actually be insane. But it did. Unfortunately. Right. Cool, are you doing the 24 hour gamble? Gamble dude, I, stream? I might actually do. <laughs> do I, I do? legit might actually do it. Like, I, I literally have no intention of stopping. Like, absolutely <laughs> no intention of stopping gambling. Like, it, until they, they've got to issue a hot fix or kick me off this server. <laughs> Like, this is the one time in D2 history we're going to be able to do this. Yeah, sign me up. We should just, we should yeah, all be doing this. Like, yeah. yeah, I'm certainly addicted to gambling at this point. It's fair to say. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you, 50% XP night, dude. 24 hour T zone trip. Yeah, if they do 50% XP after this, dude, I might actually die. Like, I would, I'd probably stay up and do it again. I don't know. I, I would consider it. Well, I'll just donate two more whiskey. They do just keep it going, dude. <laughs> that fucking right. All right, cool, cool. Yeah, we we, we could we could figure something out. We'll we'll do rings. I'll, I'll do a round of rings. If I do a round of rings, will it make you feel better, Sean? I'll do a round of rings. Here we go. Round of rings. Let's let's fill up the let's fill it up. Fill up, let's fill up the stash or fill up the wallet. And I'll show you exactly why rings suck. I mean, obviously, we're not gonna get anything good anyway. It's like so rare that we even get anything good. I've already told you why they suck. We'll just do it. Put it this way if I get a six point ring right off the bat, I'll take everything I said back. We'll do rings for the rest of the night. Six point ring, we'll do rings for the rest of the night. Or SOJ. That's fair. What if you what if you pull a BK? BK is not an SOJ. Plus one skill ring, still counts. Uh, 
I'm still here stirring the pot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you quit when you get so drunk, you, <laughs> you have to open one eye to... Yeah, exactly. Exactly. We gotta pace ourselves appropriately. Oh, look at this. We didn't even get a rare. Even this game seed hates... hates rings. lose a lot with them too because none of them sell for over 10k well I should say very very few of them do you only got one chance in 24 hours to rush and gamble uh, gold exactly dude it's one 24 hour period that will likely never happen again in the course of D2R ever ever again Ten cast, eighty mana, fire res, level twenty nine. Guess you could also get some LLD rings. I guess you could, dude. Who's got the echo? Who's fucking echoing in this channel? I mean, you think I like hearing my own voice? Uh, yeah. Ban everyone. <laughs> It's Tempest! Maddie, can you park in my game for me? Uh, I don't really want to leave this one now. Yeah, but I have a good seat, though. <laughs> yeah, I think that was off the TV. Oh, was it? Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> I was like, yeah, that's usually what it is. The stream is playing and, and like over some sort of speakers and the microphone picks it up. You can set your, uh, I just figured out you can do this in Discord. You can set your sensitivity to like and turn it up a little bit. So background noise, it cuts out. I had no idea you could do that up until recently. All right, I gotta figure that one out. <clears throat> this is actually surprisingly good uh, for a magic ring. I might actually keep this. Yes. No bueno. 13 to min damage. How is this against those low defense oh. casters? This is That's so bad. All right, yeah, you're, you're right. Like a jewel. <laughs> I'm not going to let Joby talk me out of keeping perfection. Get rid of it. It's not Crash. perfect, to be fair. Crash. Crash. Yeah, yeah, to be 15 perfect. Rest. 15 rest. 15 oh, rest. Man, Come on, look at this. Man. Min damage, life leech, dex, mana, all res. Crash. I don't know, boys. That's so good. That's so good. This is what. This is probably also why I'm not doing rings. No. For fuck's sake, because I'm fucking keeping everything. Everything but looks eight, good to me. Hey, that eight min damage with Dex is not bad for an Amazon. Just gonna I don't, say that. I don't think so. so I, this is why I don't. Keep rings. This is why. This is why we don't ring. Well, I have to plus one energy. Shit. You just skipped it. Plus one to energy. You're not keeping that one. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Joey. <laughs> it's Maddie. <laughs> oh, that, oh, that Maddie's Oh, it's Joey. <laughs> All right, one more round of rings. One more round of rings. Mm. Well, I mean, that's why I can't do rings. Rings is so purdy. I get so I get so flustered with all these rings. This is why we can't do them, and they're all shit. I keep them, and I, they wouldn't sell for shit. They're just cool. I'm like, I'll put this. I'll put this on something someday. Oh, you gotta ask yourself. Here. When you, you say that, yourself, would I ever use this? Like, in what situation would I ever use this? If the answer is none, then you should get rid of it. Right. Like, if you can't fathom a build that could possibly use that ring or a situation or a scenario, you should exactly. probably sell it. Because you're, like, in the rare event somebody might want it, they're not going to pay much for it. You know what? God damn it. You talked me into it. Saying goodbye to this 13 min ring. No, it's GG. For a song? I think the real question is, you should ask yourself, is would I buy this ring? That's a bad if you I would totally buy this for 10,000 forum goals. Does anybody want this <laughs> ring? Oh, I'll cut out you guys a deal. I would buy it for 10K. Easy 1K, just selling it for cheap, boys, if anybody wants it. Did you find any uh, keepable uh, circuit so far or no? I did. <laughs> yeah, I found, I I found some okay ones. I got one into a thing. I found four good ones already. I found some okay ones. 
I got uh, I got a 320, three lightning skills. Let me, let me uh, swap over so people can see. I got a 320. I got a LLD one with uh, one sorceress, 20 cast, seven dexed, and 66 mana. Uh, and then I got a 220 paladin helm with all res, DR, and AR. You can show them the ones that I found. <laughs> they're not super GG, but they're like... LLD ones? Yeah, I found the 220 Druid and the 220 uh, oh Trapper. And on. then the, the 130 20 Necro one. Llama just sent me one. Llama just sent me some too. You want to check these out? Oh my god. Dude. Oh my fucking god. He's just like sending me. He's just sending me shit right now. You want to see what Llama's got? I'm sorry, but these actually put yours to shame. I hate to say it, bro. I know mine aren't great. Oh my god, what the fuck is he doing? How the fuck, dude? Is it him or his community, you know? That's true. Did you find all these? What the fuck, man? Alright, boys, you gotta see this. I'll flash it on screen. You can also just right click the image and say open image in new tab or something or copy copy link if you don't want right, to open up here's the chat with that. Here's the worst one he found. 320. 320 fire. That's the worst one. Here's the second worst. I have one of those. 220, 28 strength, <laughs> DR, and all res 17. Okay. I'm immediately trashing my paladin helm. As soon as I get back. In game, trashing it. Llama's kicking our ass, boys. That's that's the second worst. Here's the third worst. 220, 25 strength, 50 life sorcerers. And here's what I think is the best. 210 cast, 60, 57 life, two socket necro helm. Woo! Boys. Yeah, I think this ah. is his best one. Yeah, I mean, that's nice. It's rough, though. You can't use a raven with that. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. Just jam a chain. We're close. We're close from being the perfect Char NVN circuit. Charcy. Yeah, it's, it's trash. Not 20. Trash. Oh, my yeah. God. Dude. Oh, yeah. Big time trash. Yeah, no one's going to beat this. Though. No one's faster gonna... run block. No one's beating this one. Though. I got pretty decent. Oh, no. you can show off. I mean, I feel like my LLD ones are not bad. <laughs> Thanks. Basic. Basic. The basic bitch. Llamas, llamas put me shame. Yeah, I don't know that he's actually gambling all those, though. But Shirley's got this. Now this is something. Now that, if only now I rolled that, two sockets. Now that is something. All right, what? I don't know what we're looking at. Shirley's got this. This is the best screenshot Shirley has submitted. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's the best one. That's the best one. This, this is another one. Basic. It's a basic bitch. Level 30, but it's a basic. Yeah, it's just a 220 with some fire res for Pray. little druid. <laughs> it's a 220 basic. Pray. Yeah, and then uh, the trap and the druid one I found like back to back in the same gamble window. I thought this was, this one's okay. I wish this, if this rolled plus two, this would be so good. Oh, so yeah, or if it had two sockets. I sent yeah. you my best plane so far. Oh. Is it a two socket breastplate? No, no, a circlet. Oh, that's a good one. That's good. Look at that. Look at, look at that. Joby just, yeah, I'm trashing mine. mine you just recalled the end of that, Joby? Yeah. You dick. All right, circlets <laughs> it is, dude. Circlets it is. This is just what we gotta do. We gotta we gotta gamble the circlets because now llamas gamble in circlets and we gotta find better ones than llama. For Christ's sake, if llama puts okay. out a better. I found better shit than Cooley video. Question, Cooley. What? 
one combat, 10 cast, 31 life and mana on an 18, level 18 amulet. All right, tell Friend. me one more time. It's a level 18 amulet. It's one combat, 10 faster cast, and then 31 life mana. Yeah, I'd keep it. Trash. <laughs> Trash. I would not keep it. Then again, Joby's the one that's keeping, what, a non-perfect 3 open socket breastplate? Love is on privileged servers again. I'm not sure if he's doing single player or no, no, he he can't be doing single player because this is online only. Oh my god, that's like online shit. No, it's dude. not. Oh my god. Oh, you can have it offline, just not classic. Yeah, just not classic. You can do this. Oh offline. really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Dude, I accidentally literally... sold my perfect geeds when I was selling amulets. I had gambled. No, 100% perfect. It was at 4015. Oh, that's a shame. Wait, we're keeping your torch and any that in your inventory? I can't do that. I removed oh, them no. just in case. Yeah, oh, yeah. I, I, I shielded mine. I have a perfect Annie and a very well rolled Yeeds for gold finding anyway. And I protected them with other things right there with a shit torch and a. Okay, there's shit. Torch. Yeah, but I'm, I'm probably going to be going for 24 hours straight, so I still very well could sell that torch. I can see it happening. You just get rid of it. There's no point to have it. Well, yeah, I do this. I mean, like, put it in the stash. Yeah, there is. I got to have it because I can't hold all my stuff. Well, then put it... No, no, no. Put it to the... I don't know, in column nine, and put the uh, the small charm right next to it, or the medium charm right next to it. We got it. Oh, no. All right, fine. Jam Slam Alabam, as a wise man once said. Someone really you? wise came up with that. Not sure who it was, but. Is that wise man you? I don't know. It could have been. I remember. Might have been. <laughs> <laughs> It's actually one of the stupidest sayings anyone could possibly make up, but it sounded good once when I, I think I went and had a party in the room, and it stuck. And, and now we say it all the time, among me and some friends. I'm already to the point where, like, can, under these shades, I'm, like, holding one eye open. I'm, like, I'm like, just kind of looking, like, ugh. Uh, my eyes killing me. We can't quit. Gotta stay got... strong. Yeah, we gotta stay strong. Get your, strong. Get your shit together. Yeah. What? The... Gotta wake up. You got like three more hours. Yeah. Make <laughs> some coffee. coffee. Yes. Yeah, oh, <laughs> yeah, I, I shouldn't be. I shouldn't be drinking. I don't know. I got whiskey. That's pretty. That's close enough, right? Close enough. Oh, dang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, go with the name, man. There's, there's no need for a two sin amulet with twenty strength, right? Crash. With, nice. with no cast. Cat, you absolutely need. Well, I don't know. If it has tons of stats, like 30 strength, 20 dex, you could use it on a ghost. No. But, like, and, you know, life and stuff like that. It does not. Crash. It just has some res on it. You could use it on a Storm Shield build with uh, 102, you know. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, we got some Jim Beam that we're pouring up today, man. Courtesy of Insomniac, man. Good dude. Dude, we gotta just keep jamming. I bet Llama's probably got people feeding him gold. He probably, do you think so, or do you think he's actually farming his own gold? Yeah, people are gonna be feeding it. They're gonna be doing the, the glitch, but he's gonna be just using their gold. Yep, no, makes he's sense. He's got his whole T-Zone team helping him. He's got what? And so he's got his whole T-Zone team helping him with the gold. <laughs> so we're doing things the right way. Well, I think Llama, we're seeing, Llama is cheating. <laughs> We're doing yeah. things the right way. Yeah, they won't roll it back because Lama's doing it, you know? Oh, yeah, exactly. I'm, I'm actually happy. I was saying, Llama reached out to me and asked me if I was doing it. I said, but he's doing that to make sure <laughs> make sure all the content creators are doing it so that he doesn't get so he doesn't get banned. <laughs> all right, I'm out, boys. Have fun gambling. We'll be back later. All right, GG, bro. We'll be doing the same thing. We'll be right here all night. I'm going till I die.
Like, you guys are wondering how long this stream is gonna last until I die. That's how long you're gonna be streaming until I die. We have all the DFC team. That's true. I, I mean, it doesn't really matter that much because it's like, I mean, it's only a little bit of time that it takes really to be completely honest. It's not really that bad. It's honestly like a nice break. Ooh, okay, okay. We got a one pally, two socket. Keep bringing those, man. There's two sockets. Ooh, we got to keep bringing those. That's what we need. Yeah, two socket is the dream. Yep, two socket is the dream. Like, that's really the best stat we're hoping for. Like, all the other stuff, I feel like people just overlook helms unless they're two sockets. They have to be insanely good stats or just two sockets. You can get there. Yeah, me too, actually. If I get banned, I'm going to be like, uh, I don't think this is appropriate because your streamer that you featured told me to go ahead and do it. So I thought he worked for Blizzard and I thought you said it was okay. That's just what I'm going to say. You're like, does he work for you guys? Oh, he don't? All right. Well, you could, you now you're confusing me too, so now it's your fault. There's zero chance anybody gets banned for this. This is as intended. Uh, worst case scenario, I'm ready to take this gamble. Uh, yeah, exactly. Like this is the funnest I've had MFing, quote unquote, MFing in this game in years. They would have to ban like half of the server, half of the people of the server. Maybe they will, because they'll be like, well, whatever, man, we got D4 coming up. Are we breaking the terms of service? No. Nope. They fucked up, they must pay for it. Well, yeah, point somewhere in the thing that we're breaking terms of service. Uh, I hate having to trash that one right there, but we're gonna have to do it. It was a Jewelers of Magic Damage Reduction. Didn't roll perfect, though. If it rolled perfect, I probably would have capped it, but. Oh my God, this is so fun. US has an advantage because just because of the time. Yeah, it did happen at, what was it? Like when they started this, what was it? The three, what time was it at your time, Shirley? 11. 11, so it was 2 p.m. here. Yeah, and I got that message at like 11.20 that this was going on and I was instantly like, no way, there's no way. And Basic yep. 220, trash. Yeah, so 2 p.m., we go till 2 p.m. tomorrow. Let's fucking go. Once in a lifetime opportunity. It's like Eminem once said, you only get, get one, one shot. shot. Do not get miss a chance to gamble. So as opportunity, when opportunity comes, it's once in a lifetime. Minutes. Once in a lifetime gambling opportunity, you gotta take it. You can't be passing up gambling. I think one of the lyrics he says, when battle net fucks up, you gotta. Uh, Battle.net didn't fuck up. Yeah, it's in the song. Our devs did. Yep. It wasn't Battle.net, that's for sure. When the devs fuck up, you gotta jam it. Second verse, I believe, is where they say that. It's true. So it's the one just... right after he talks about mom's spaghetti on his... Yeah, mom's spaghetti devs fucking up already jam them G gamble something like that you look yeah, it up dude i mean it's close right? it's not exactly what he says but it's somewhere something along those lines Mark yeah sounds, sounds legit these weak stash is heavy yes yes see that's <laughs> what that's what it was there it is nailed okay. it i knew somebody would remember it Justin remembers the song. That's exactly what it was. You see, I told you, dude. I knew, I knew somebody would look it up and tell us what they really say. Thanks, Justin. Che cheers to you, man. Jim Beam, cheers to you. Stash is heavy. Yep. <laughs> These weak stash is heavy. My pockets is heavy with all of this gold. This is insane. There's so much. 
No, dude, literally, like even a even a plus two helm with like twenty five dr, I'm keeping it, dude. There's so many options. I just gotta get quicker. Stash is heavy. Uh, the gate is ready. I mean, it's there. It's there. You just gotta you just gotta find it. Yeah, I'm actually gonna. That's actually a great idea, Alexandria. I'm actually gonna announce that. Uh, I'm gonna announce that in Discord. Like, yeah, we're just gonna do DFC tomorrow. In light of the fuck up, <laughs> we're gonna push this God, to tomorrow. Dude. You're crushing. In light of Blizzard's excellent develop skills. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm just gonna. We're gonna announce it. Due to unfors. Due to. At everyone, due to unforeseen junk fuckery, due to unforeseen junk fuckery, allowing us to abuse Battle.net, allowing us to abuse online gambling, we will be doing DFC tomorrow. Enjoy your circlets and amulets and rings. Don't forget to post them in the trophy room. There's gonna be so much shit posted now. <laughs> Whatever, there's already so much shit. It's already, it's already looks like fucking trash in there. You know how hard it was to make the last trophy room video? There was yeah, because so you got so, so much, much shit. shit. There was fucking okay. trash everywhere. And uh, you know who I blame? Is I blame Fax. Because Dude, Fax he, he lights people on fire. No, no, no. Like, the reason I blame him is not because of, like, his quality of responses or anything. Because originally he started by giving people a little trophy icon as a participation trophy. And he would say, here's yeah. your participation trophy. And he would give them the emoji. He doesn't say that anymore. So now he just puts a trophy on it and people think it's a trophy. <laughs> oh, my it's God, more garbage. Dude. oh my God. <laughs> and so it's a hundred percent. I think it's a hundred percent his fault of like, he was doing a meme and giving a participation <laughs> trophies and they misunderstood. <laughs> and so now it's just full of garbage. <laughs> I blame Cooley. He told us not to delete shit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It, it just... Well, here's the thing, too, is, like... Sometimes... We delete things, too, that we shouldn't. Like, you know what I mean? There's... Yeah. So, like, that, it happens. It's just human error. So, like, I would honestly just rather encourage people... Like, and, and when you delete something, I got so many messages from people being like, Oh, what the fuck, man? They deleted their shit. And it's just, like, instead, if I just never talk about it and nobody ever deletes it they don't feel all fired up yeah i can see that you know what i mean like if it just doesn't get talked about or it doesn't get mentioned it's like oh sorry man there was so much better stuff than your fucking blue wand that had plus one to poison skills and three to bone spear on it like <laughs> you know <laughs> like what are you talking about i know what that's worth no low balls <laughs> just wait for the trophy room tomorrow just oh. wait for it oh we, we'll keep this dude this is this is ain't we'll we'll keep it we ain't gonna trash this one, but we ain't gonna get too excited about it either. But we'll keep this one. We'll keep this one. Are we it's still good. are we still selling uh, in-game gold for money? Because I might just do that. <laughs> Dude, yeah. This is probably... way faster than gold farming. This is way faster. Yeah. Like I'm not sure. People, I guess they were paying uh, 10, 10 mil was forty forum gold or something like that. Which is. Dude, you. Dude, you can get ten mil in three minutes. Not, yeah, not even, dude. Like, when people figure out that it's not really that hard to, to do, they're going to be all about it. All right, I need to actually make room because I can already tell I'm going to find shit and I'm going to want to keep it and I'm not going to want to ask questions. And I got to make some fucking room, boys. I, gotta, I just got to do it. The, the time for fucking around is done. Uh, actually, someone want to hold? What? Someone want to keep this game up? Hold on. Need to find a mule. Someone want to just friends join my game real quick? To keep it active. It's a good seed. Oh, did I just lose my amulets? Oh, I fucking hope I didn't. Come on, tell me I didn't lose them. No. It shouldn't be as long as you don't leave town. You left the game. Yeah. God damn it. <laughs> 
Yeah, it happened to me too, because Maddie. Yeah, I blame it on Maddie. Wow. What an asshole. the French guy. Damn it. right now. I mean, it didn't happen when I was by myself, and then Maddie's like, hey, can I steal your edge bow? I said, yeah, sure, use this one. Don't leave the game, though, and fucking dickhead leaves you town. You never said that part. Yeah, you never said to that dickhead. I Maddie literally said, don't leave. Everybody. You guys are bullies. <laughs> hey, give me that edge bow back. Hey, Come dude, Joy made that same mistake. Whatever, dude. It's like, we'll get him back. We'll get him, we'll get him back. We'll get them back. Time to gamble some amulets. This is good. This is when we'll gamble amulets is when we fuck up and leave the game. And then we keep all the 30k ones. And then maybe we get an insanely good amulet. You never know. All right, first we look for quality. And then we look for price. I wish I had my Geeds, but it's on a different account. I can't get my second client launch right now. I was trying to not let Maddie screw me over again, but I can't. Right, now we look for price. Right, these will get sold. We need like 32 of them, so this will be on ambulance for a little bit. Sorry, we needed a break. We needed a break from the from the circlets. This is why Llama is ahead. God damn it. God damn it, duelers. Well, he hasn't found any good he hasn't found good amulets, right? I didn't see a goddamn good amulet from Llama. Not as good as mine. Not as good as my two sorceress amulet. Don't you? I can fucking hear you laughing from over here. Shut, shut the fuck up. We're gonna get all of this back. And I don't want to hear nothing about it. What? Right? What is the closest vendor to the stash? Sorry. What's the closest gambling vendor to the stash? Jamella. That milk okay, Yeah. No, I don't think so. Yeah. Geed is closer than that. She's pretty. She's on the opposite side of town. She's close yeah, to the spawn, but, but not the distance. It's like a small town. I feel like it depends what kind of character, too. I don't know. If you have a sorceress, you can TK the stash. That's true. I guess I don't really need to go to the stash now because I've got the full gold. Like my entire stash is a full. Yeah, I was gonna say. I, I was actually thinking about replenishing the gold through my stash and then, yeah, I don't know. It sucks. I gotta remember, before you leave a game, buy all the amulets on your dude. Gosh, program yeah. that in my head. It's so, it's so rare that we ever have to do something like this though. Like this will never happen again in our lives. Uh, yeah, but if you just get that exact stat, though, and nothing else, though, Joy, it sells for, like, 34. It's really perfect. If you get a magic one that sells for exactly, it'll sell, like, it'll sell perfectly if it just has the Hydra one. But if you have, if you have it in conjunction to something else, yeah, then it really sucks. Like, if you have it on, like, a rare with that mod, yeah, it gets super expensive. You ideally want to aim for, like, uh, 34k. That's what you want. I just sold my fucking geese. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! God damn it! Want to sell one? Geese? <laughs> you need another one, Joby? No, no, it's okay. I don't give a shit. No, I got one. That's fine. I'm pretty sure I have one in my shared stash right now. If your friends join me, make sure to buy your amulets. I'll charge you too. Oh my god! No, that's fine, dude. I got more. It was meant to happen at some point. Me All right, we're keeping this. This is a pretty good one for LLD. One barb, 16 life, uh, 10 replenish, mana, fire res, half restoration. It's, it's doable. I'll have to make sure to hold on, to hold on to that one. 
not fucking trashy. Oh, Warcry's 10 cast teleport gold find. Oh, shit! This one. Yeah, that's, that's nice. Sweet, dude. It's pretty. It's pretty oh, that's cool. that's really good. They got teleport and cast. And <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's actually not. And horrible. gold find. Wow. Yeah. Post in the trophy room. Let everybody tell you why it's such a terrible amulet. <laughs> uh, maybe I will. All right, kids. Let's uh, let's pick these up. And start selling them. Start farming gold. This will actually be enough so that we should start being able to farm some gold. All right, some of these we need to keep. Which ones? We need to keep this. The good ones. Here we go. And we sell. That's we're like halfway there, just after a few runs. Then we're gonna go put these in the stash. Sell while I look at them. I have to program my brain to do that because I, don't, I have done it before and I don't want to like erroneously sell something that's good. That's the other problem. I could be like a perfect geek. I bet perfect geeks are going for so much right now because people are trashing them, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Left and right, they're getting trashed. Oh my God. Yeah, if if you have any them. extra 15% vendor price geeds that just don't have any other good stats, now might be a really good time to sell those. Might be an extremely good time to sell those, boys. I haven't canned my torch yet, so that's a good... Dude, I don't think I'll, I'll ever be able to regular gamble again, dude, if I'm being honest. Like, will I ever be able to regular gamble again? I don't know if it'll ever be the same for me. Like, this kind of feels weird. Like, it's gonna be like, oh man, now I gotta go find gold. Fuck it, I quit. I quit. We're going, we're going uh, magic finding now. Fuck, fuck gold finding. All right, Max in this stash out again for a good reference point. You want it, Joby? Come to the stash, bro. I'm gonna drop it. I'll fucking charcy it. Now, guess what? I forgot to buy a bag before leaving my game. Oh no! I fucking told you. I knew. Holy I was, shit! I, I was like, hey, don't forget this. Dude, I'm getting wrecked. Holy shit. You're getting wrecked hard, bro. You're getting wrecked hard. Now you're going to be gambling amulets. You're going to charcy that fucking geese. I'm going to cover it with the garbage. Just to see. <laughs> and I'll put cool easier around it. All right. All right. Yeah, those are pretty easily found. You should be able to replace that. No problem. There's a good one. 32K. Thirty-one K, good, 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 good. Oh, that's a good one. All right, I'm just gonna stack up these right here. Then we're going right back to circlets. Had a little bit of a setback. I ain't too worried about it. I ain't too worried about it. We're gonna recover just fine, just fine from this. Okay, good stuff. That should be plenty. That should be. Joby, did you just? You're in your stash. Huh? Did you just Joby, buy? Yeah. Did you just bin all the fucking amulets? No, you put them in your stash earlier. <laughs> Come on. Tell me you did that, Joby. Please tell me you did that. <laughs> you no, know, I, I didn't take shit. You put them in your stash, no? What the fuck happened? To Joby, you? poofed your shit. I did not take shit. Did he poof your shit, though? He poofed him. Yeah, he poofed him. That's I guess fucking it's... asshole. And you think what I'm an a dick? What an asshole. What an asshole. Yep. Oh, my God. Maddie did it to me, and now Joby did it to Cooley. All I see oh is two Canadians. Oh, my God. What the fuck? Americans. 
Oh, oh, like, can they just do games? Oh my god, you know what? You know what? Don't join my game ever again. You just jerks. We're just gonna do it regardless of the price. Nah, we shouldn't hold on. God damn it! It's just fucking A. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure he didn't intend to do it. It's okay. We can just lower our standards for what price is keepable. That should get us there pretty easily. If we were trying to min-max it before, and we probably shouldn't. We should just keep like 14, 15 Ks. It should be good enough. I keep everything over 20, just because I don't want to. Oh no, sorry, 25. Yeah. Oh my god, yeah, dude, exactly. What the fuck? I just got a rare level 27, one druid, telecharges Amelie. I thought that wasn't possible for under 30. You're probably gambling on a sorceress, Master Otis. So it looks like it's a, a level requirement of under 20, but it's not. It's only for your specific sorceress class uh, that is that it exists at, you know, for those telecharges can be used at under level 30. Yeah, so basically put it on another character and it'll be yeah. 41, I think. 42 or something. Yeah. Yep, you're probably gambling on a sword. Alright. Let's see what we got. How many amulets? Here we got. How many? We were so close to replenishing our amulet gold find supply. Toby had to fuck it up for you. Joby destroyed everything. Destroyed all of our hopes and dreams. All of our progress. That yeah, was so nice to Joby. I gave him a 15% eat. He's probably going to char see it. <laughs> well, supposedly, what's going for 20k right now? 200 plus k? What that that uh that circlet, circlet. from earlier? Oh my god, yeah, yeah, it does not Which surprise me. One? Yeah, I told you boys. I was like, dude, that's that? a, like 150k would be a good deal for that. It was a 220 30 Druid Helm, but with 15 all res and 30 something life. Oh, dang. Yeah. Really Alright, now that I got a full character again, now I can start gambling again. Gamble yeah. Lesser. I might stop with amulets here real soon. I was so close. I've lowered my standards, though. I'm keeping 10k or, or over now. I'm getting a lot of plus three to a tree. I got three shape shifting, three summoning, three offensive auras, trash. three combat, trash, three martial arts, three trash. elemental skills. Trash. Yeah, I know they're all trash, but like I feel like the seed is good. Yes. Yeah. Out of the ten circles that I gambled, I think six of them had three to a tree. Dude, you get you got a two thirty twenty and it rolled sin. That's actually that's not bad. Any two thirty twenty is like good, but yeah, ideally it would be better if it wasn't sin. Yeah, if it's any other class. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Sorry, bro. Oh, hey, it's two two thirty twenty. Welcome to the RNG of fucking Diablo two, man. This is so stupid. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's something. Yeah, theoretically, it's not an obvious exploit. Like, duping something through a glitch is probably an obvious exploit, right? This is, like, intended. This is exactly what they intended. They reduced vendor prices, bros. Y'all mm -hmm. need to stop worrying about it and just accept the holiday blessings that they are giving you. This is the, this is the problem with so many Battle.net players. It's like... They give you a blessing right in front of your face and say it's okay to do it. And you're just like, I don't know, man. I don't trust this. I think they're going to fuck me in the ass for this. Now, while that is currently something Blizzard has been known to do, like, I think there is, there's what's called plausible de de deniability here. Like, even if you believe that this is not how things should work, there's plausible deniability. That, like, 
everybody's doing it, and they allowed us to do it. You think I they mean, couldn't argue, shut argue this down? Do you think they couldn't shut this down immediately if this wasn't what was intended? You think they wouldn't shut this down immediately? No, dude. Working as intended. All of Battle.net is online gambling right now and nothing has changed. Working as intended. Yeah, if their goal was to get people to play the game, bingo, we figured it out. It worked. Yep, it worked. Nice, Nicely done. Nicely done. This is the best thing they've done for this game in 20 years. Right, one more. I need like eight more amulets, I think. Dio, what's up, dude? Oh, shit. They shut down Sunder Charms? Well, yeah, they did. Yeah, they shut it down immediately. They shut it down immediately. Exactly. They're not shutting this down immediately. They could have just turned this off, been like, oops, we're going back to the gold fine. Remember that gold fine thing we did? We're going back to that. They didn't do that. As intended. You could argue this is how they wanted us to play it. Ooh. Oh, sure. that's, a, that's a close one. I just saw my 2020 torch. <laughs> no, you didn't, really? You just sold your 2020 torch? I'm telling you, man, it's risky. No, you gotta, God, you gotta slow Joby. down. I thought you were protecting this shit. I thought you were putting shit down. up to protect it. Joby, Joby, pro tip. Take everything out of your inventory. Everything. Someone in Cooley's chat to roll that. Get oh, everything. Someone did that. Oh, Everything oh, out of your oh, inventory. Brand, that was oh, Brand L. Brand L. Oh my God. Oh my no. God. Oh, we just got a 58 Kira's, boys. Woo! Woo! Good fucking seed, boys. I'm feeling it. It's time. It's whiskey time. That's a big L for Brand. Brand. Dude, I'm so sorry to hear that, man. Holy shit. Sork Torch, too. Oh, oh yeah. My so God, I put bro. I put all this shit out of my inventory in the stash. You don't actually need a Geats. You can just do it with an edge. And if you don't have the decks for an edge, put on a raven. A raven and an edge, and you're good. And then just clear your inventory. Do not sell your items. You could also just be a, You could also just be a pro like Cooley. Yeah, yeah, and don't fuck up. Don't fuck up. No, because Cooley's gamble he's only gambling eight circuits at a time. I'm gambling ten. I'm on the next level. Don't fuck up though. Second, the second you fuck up, it's. I have no items in my inventory to sell to said fuck up. You're still gonna fuck it up. You're gonna be like, dude, I got in the habit of just selling everything in my inventory, and I forgot that I put all my three twenty twenties back in there, and then I fucking sold. You them think all. I have multiple three twenty twenties? I'm gonna be you like, oh, go for geats. I don't that even have a geats, let alone multiple three twenty twenties. Yeah, I was. My geats, trash. I'm safe now. You protected we're it with some trash? That's it, but we're still there. <laughs> I'm just harvesting it and it's not mine, so I don't care, you know? <laughs> Fuck it. You can charge it that, uh, that edge bow, by the way. I don't want it. What a time it is to be alive, boys. I'm so happy to be here with you in this unexpected event right now. All you guys, I'm so happy that we're able to pull this off. I'm so happy that you guys are just here doing this. We expected some DFC I, tonight. I love, DFC would have been dope. I love they want shit. people to play the game and are playing the game is literally just standing in town. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, guys, we got we got terror zones. You can level better. We got all this cool stuff for you guys. We got holiday bonuses. We want you guys to play the game. Everyone stands in town. <laughs> Metadata for D2R is gonna look so awkward tomorrow. I mean, the number of gambles will go through the roof. The number, the amount of time spent in town versus out of town. I guess people idle in town, so that could be that could throw it off. But still, like the number of gambles, like items purchased from the game. Oh my god, dude! They're probably their servers are probably getting pinged so much with, uh, just like because it does ping the server when you uh, when you when.
when you buy something, when you gamble on something. Yeah, my, I just got a pings. big like spike. Yeah, hand. well, that's why everybody's ping right now is like in the hundreds. Let's crash it, boys. Let's fucking blow this server up. Can you imagine all of the GGs that we find? Oh, jeez. My ping just jumped to 547. I'm telling you, bros, is people are blowing this fucking server up. Uh, they might crash here shortly. Most importantly, the number of GG circlets on the market tomorrow is going to be insane. Exactly. Uh, I can't wait. That's really the real win. We're going to be on JSP tomorrow, just like looking for cheap ass circlets. That's right. Those 23020 Necro circlets. Hopefully, hopefully yep, get one of those man. for a couple hundred more tomorrow. <laughs> someone's going to someone's gonna put them up, be like, I just need to get rid of these fast, and we'll be right there. 23022 open socket. 10K for him. Go pin. <laughs> yep. Let me up. What are you talking about 10K? There's four of these out here now. The best I can do is three. <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't even argue. You just, you're just like, yep, bin. I don't know Speak what those sold up. for before. That's kind of that's kind of how I feel about the 2020 Annihilus charms. Like, I almost feel like they've they've complained about how many people are popping D clone, and like, they might change something about that. And if they do, we're gonna be so lucky that we have those. Oh yeah. 2020 I have, that we got. I have six or seven on ladder, and then four on non ladder. Yeah, same. I was Just... I was donoed I was donoed like six on non ladder. I was so pumped. Made my well, day. I it. The same thing happened last ladder was like about two months into it, the price of 2020s dropped down to, I don't know, 400 form gold. So I waited and same thing happened. Clones started spawning. So I just started offering like 400 and people were at first, you know, jerks about it. And then slowly like the prices started meeting what I was offering and then they kept falling and they kept falling. And then oh, yeah. clones oh, are yeah. still spawning. And I don't know what they're going for now, but I got plenty, I got, I got plenty for all my duelers and the majority of the other characters that I have, so yeah, pretty good. Oh, look at this! Uh, three combat skills, twenty casts. Not bad. Level forty-five too. We'll, we'll keep it. Uh, yeah, dude, that's pretty dope. The you need Annie's right now though are worth nothing. Like that's the thing; they're worth absolutely nothing. I would almost ID them and hope to get a uh, twenty twenty ten. At least then it's worth like a thousand for them gold. If it's not twenty twenty, it's not worth shit, really. If it's yeah. not 2020, I mean, that it's was only worth a few hundred. Like a month and a half ago, it was a 2019 not, or like 2019 10. People are like, oh, give me, you know, 500 for it, and no one offers. Literally, no one's offering these things just because there's too many. And it's like, well, you want 500 for a 2019, I can buy a 2020 for less, for 400 or something. Like, there's, there's no point to buy your crappy thing. Yeah. Uh, I haven't tried to reroll magics before. It's just not really worth it, in my opinion. It's always been more efficient to just gold find and then go gamble oh. instead of instead of wasting like gems or searching for gems and trying that. Good it's question. Been... Yeah, yeah. What's up? Um, you tell. I'm gonna send you a screenshot. You tell me. I mean, it feels good, but there's it's also missing a cast. But like, it, it feels really good. That's what she said. <laughs> One moment, please. Because it rolled, I'm pretty sure it rolled perfect on a couple of these mods here. And then it's just, I think it's missing cast, which might be a deal breaker. Deal breaker. That's what she said. Da -da Is it though? Lama says he's got to roll more after dinner. He's taking a dinner break. We're going to catch up. Uh, so it's two barb, 20 strength, 20 dex, 17 all res, eight mana leech. That's actually not horrible for PVM, but it would certainly be ideal if it had something else like cast or whatnot. But it is, it's really good. Um, the only thing it has over, this is what he's talking about. I'll pop it up and show you guys. The, the only, yeah, but gotta, it's like, Ariat is not, it's better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like you're competing against Ariat's, like Ariat's face, and it's just not better than that. Like it has Mana Leech over Ariat's face. It just it's yeah, Ariat's missing... face with Mana Leech and less skills. Yeah. If it had cast, it would be insane. Right. Yeah, it would definitely no question if it had cast, but. 
Or just something else. So close yet so far. Yeah, my ping was fine in this game, and suddenly it's just gone to shit. Spikes, dude. I wonder if they'll stop offering circlets in the gamble screen. Be like, it's people, you guys broke it. You guys broke our servers. No more circlets. Game crashed? Oh my god, really? That makes me worried a little bit. That makes me worried a little bit. Ping's going from 47 to 350. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Battle.net, in recent news, Battle.net servers actually died. They're, they're getting a DOS attack. Oh, uh, yeah, a legitimate. Because of, because of themselves. <laughs> <laughs> cool. The question is, if D-Clone spawns, do you stop to kill him or keep gambling? We keep gambling. You keep gambling. Yeah, one hundred percent. It's not even a question. We keep gambling. Yeah, you. What you get? A, what are you gonna get? A, a twenty twenty? Like, like who cares? Yeah. If you get a perfect, perfect Annie, like who cares? It's a thousand form goal. If you get the GG circle, it, it's fifty. I agree. We need we need a different uh, we need a different song up in this bitch. We've been listening to this for a while, but now, little Mac down. Yeah, no, no, it's, I think it's time to do that. I don't dare do that on YouTube yet, dude. Nintendo's a cunt on YouTube. Like, they, oh, they used to strike, they used to strike everything, dude. They used to strike everything. They've been a little bit better, but they still are cunts. Let's be serious. Like, it's Nintendo. They try to get money wherever they can. Like, oh, like, I remember I did a, I did a Nintendo, I did a speed run of The Legend of Zelda on my personal channel way back in the day, like, before I started making content on, like, this channel and stuff, and it was a speed run. I think it maybe had 50 views, copyright strike, because it had Zelda music in it. I was like, yeah, dumb, playing fucking Zelda, you cunts. Like, you I, know what I mean? Like, uh, I was so pissed. I was like, really? Like, I was like, I'm not even really that cool. Like, why? I was like, I had 50 views. Why are you striking me? Like, it was, ooh, I was so pissed. I was like, well, YouTube sucks. Uh, one of the funniest memes I've seen. 2 p.m. Was, Eastern tomorrow, Brian. Was, uh, the, sub, the subtitle just said, when Nintendo needs money. And the video was the Joker from the movie he like slides down this big pile of money and he goes where's the italian <laughs> <laughs> bam let's go baby we've got some good we've got a good seed here we're getting heroes we're getting a lot of plus twos we're getting a lot of plus three 20 cast helms plus three rep life 10 this could actually be good for an immortal sorceress but it could be perfect for track so are you dipping into your sh into your stash gold, or are you just doing your character gold and then refarming your gold back? Uh, character gold refarming. Gotcha. That takes I that, like such a longer process, though. Oh really? I mean, it's the same process. You're just breaking it up more frequently. You're still getting the same amount. I guess that's true. It's the same thing, right? Yeah. Or is it faster? You don't have to run to your stash. Technically faster, I guess. Yeah, right. You only have to run to your stash when the original stash starts to get a little low, and you have to make sure you don't dip into it. Yeah, or when you leave the game like a noob, or jo or when Joby joins your your game. Right. When Joby fucks everything up for you, you know that's the only time you really have to you get set back. You're welcome. <laughs> and then, what's the best strategy for buying the amulets back? I'm I'm just doing right clicking because like. Left clicks enter yeah, and I'll doesn't show really you. work. So it's uh, you go into trade and I have my left click ready and I'm spamming left click and enter. And I slowly move my mouse down like this and spam left okay. click enter. So like slowly move the mouse down, spam left click enter, just like this. Slowly move the mouse down, bam. If you miss some, whatever. Like bam. Spam, yeah, because that's what I was click. doing. That's how I buy the circlets is left click enter. Um, but do like buying back the amulets. I just wasn't, I guess I wasn't doing it fast enough. Or I was moving my mouse too fast. Yeah, and then obviously control click to sell. Yeah. 
That's it, boys. It's simple. Easy as easy as cake. You clone in 2022. <laughs> LOL. Skip it. <laughs> There's better shit to do. Who needs decloning when you've got What's the point of decloning? Well, since we've got a real good one, we need an insane GG one to keep our spirits up. It's the holiday spirit. It's time so for some the, GGs. What's the latest news on D4? I saw Adam had text tweeted something, but Twitter is. So uh, it is what it is right now. <laughs> so you boys want to know why you want you guys want the real deets on why I talk a lot of shit. I mean, I know why you talk a lot of shit, but go ahead. Reasons. First of all, it gets views because a lot of people agree with it. But also, uh, there's a greater purpose behind it. And the greater purpose is when you get some asshole like me talking shit about something that obviously needs to change, and he, a lot of people agree with it and it gets attention, they suddenly genuinely consider changing stuff about it, right? Like, it's the way that someone like me has realized in life that he has to... I can't make a video like Dabrunsky and have them immediately turn around and change exactly what I'm talking about. Because for whatever reason, they've dissociated themselves with Cooley or anything that I believe or do. They want to do the opposite. They're like, oh, fuck that guy. We're not like that guy. Fuck him. We're going to do exactly the opposite. So when we don't like something, we talk shit about it. And that's the way to, like, get it changed or to get them to reconsider it, which is why I made the video about D4 when I heard about trading being fucking restricted in any way. I'm like, this is going to kill the game and I don't want this game to be killed. I feel like there's so much hype about it, it looks so good. So, at that point, it was really just big rumors and slight con confirmations that trading was restricted from the people who had played the beta were just like, yeah, you can trade crafting materials, but like when you get to legendaries, they can't be traded. I'm like, yep, good enough for me. Like, trash. Like, they need, to, they need to can that. Well, apparently, according to Max Roll now, there's been some post uh, on their site that Maddie showed us that says trading isn't currently restricted. And it's like, wow, really? Okay. Uh, I'm wondering what you're using for that because it's not consistent with what people have reported in the beta, but they, the Max Roll team tends to know more shit than a lot of people far before. Like it's not restricted in the beta, in the beta, but they, 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 they plan on restricting stuff, right? That's to my understanding. Yeah. 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 Uh, like that it was going to be, uh, basically there's certain items like legendaries that can't be traded that are like character bound. And one of the developers said in the recent interview that they did on YouTube, the live stream, that when you find something, you make a choice. Do you want to, uh, you know, use it um, or do you want to extract the legendary energy from it? Like, do you want to do you want to use it, equip it, you know, use the item or extract the legendary energy? That's like so these yeah, so it seems like that's what they're planning on doing with, like, legendary items that you find. Is like, you have to make a choice when you find it. Do you want to keep it or not? Um, but, they very well could uh, make it so that you can trade, which I believe you can trade the legendary energies and those crystals. Apparently, you can trade those. So, you can get, basically all of these things through trading you can get all of the legendary abilities through trading which is very interesting uh because actually, i think uh, i think crafting material wheels are were part of the things that you cannot trade if i recall correctly crafting materials you can't trade i think so let me see what i posted there i thought it was crafting materials only yeah i think it is I'm not sure how to double check. D2R is looking good and clean, simple. D4 is overcomplicated. Yeah, yeah. Like, I think D4 has a lot of potential. If I'm being real with you guys for a minute, like, you want to know my real thoughts? It has a lot of potential. But, like, what is seriously going to kill that game is when you start restricting players' freedom. Like, I know it sounds like, oh, rah, rah, you're an American, rah, rah, American freedom. But it's just true, man. Like, it's just true. Look at, like, any of the games that were, you know, game of the year or, like, borderline. It's, 
look at look at Elden Ring. You get in there and you can basically go do whatever you want. Like, you know what I mean? You can basically do whatever you want. Uh, in a game like Diablo, where you have, you know, a cult following, basically, of people just like us that are playing this game, that have come to expect certain things from Diablo games. You can't cut out trading and be like, yeah, we don't we don't trust you guys to trade because, uh, you know, everybody complains about pay to win. It's like the people that complain about pay to win were never the people that were winning or paying. Uh, you know, and they were also never the people that would win even, even if it wasn't pay to win. They still wouldn't win. They're just that type of person that needs something to complain about. Like, so you shouldn't really cater to those people. Cater to the people that it works for. Like, regardless if people just sit behind this wall and call it pay to win. It's just free trade. Yeah, sure, people are going to pay money for items. Okay, it means you've got a good game. You know, like, they, I think they're just scared of it is what it is. So, yeah, that's why I made that video. But truthfully, I think it has a lot of potential, especially if they open up trading a bit. And by open up, I mean, like, just make it free trade. It's also better for streamers, too, that are competing. Like, I know this sounds weird, and it's going to sound like, oh, how could you say that? This is coming from a streamer who I have never competed in D2R to be first 99 or anything and have no plans to. If you get your community that can get behind a, a streamer and help them out, suddenly you're bringing the community together. They can champion somebody to help them out. They feel like they're contributing in some way. And sure, it's not fair to the, the little guy that doesn't have a community or, or any friends to help him out. But like when you're making a community game that's online multiplayer, what do you expect? It's supposed to be online multiplayer, people working together. That's like what it's supposed to be out, about. And what better way to do that than to allow people to trade their items or give them away or donate them or whatever. Like, sorry it makes some people feel some type of way. It's just, I'm also not sorry and you're also wrong. It's just going to make the game shitty over time. Like, it'll be fair for you on your first playthrough after you quit. After you beat after you beat Lilith and you're like, Oh, man, this game was fun, man. I'm so glad I got there at the same pace as everybody else. And you know what? I can't trade my items now. So uh, uh, there's nothing to do. I beat the game. I'm done. All right, cool. Like, you won, buddy. And now you fucked the game up for years to come. Hard to hear me? Oh, is the music too loud? How's this? Thanks for the heads same. up on that. Sounds sound the same to me. Hmm. Jamming, slamming, Alabama. Yeah, music might have been a little loud. We switched the track, bros. We switched the track. Uh, what, what did we just do? Are we gambling bambulets now? What is going on? What was I doing? I'm losing my <laughs> mind. I'm losing my mind. I'm doing the rings. You are? You switched the rings? Yeah. Is there Blake Talon in the closet? We can shop you, huh? Yeah, Blake Talon is the one you want to buy. I just got a raven. Nice. Is it perfect? It's trash. Right. <laughs> perfect cannot be frozen model, huh? <laughs> trash. Sick roll on the cold absorb? Sick roll on the cold absorb. <laughs> Did that roll perfect? Hey, cool. I got your three martial arts 20 cast to help me here. Three martial arts 20 cast? You found one too? Yeah. Do you want it? According to Max, those are keepable. They're uh, they're actually like best in slot for a certain build. I don't want right. it. I already have one, but. All right, Max. Two and a four and gold is yours. Oh my God. I don't care what they mean actually Max do wants it. It just means we asked him if it was usable in any circumstance, and he assured me that it is usable. He probably doesn't want it. If if Max doesn't want it, in my opinion, probably not usable. Right. So if he doesn't right. want it, then why am I keeping it? Because <laughs> out of all the people that make crazy sin builds, Max is like number one. Still haven't misclicked yet, boys. Haven't even haven't even sold my shit charms that I'm protecting my 2020 and my geeds with. 
Nothing, boys. You just gotta get good. Gotta get good. 220 pallet with all res. I just sold a 220 with, uh, it was a 220 druid with all res, and I figured it just wasn't good enough. You also gotta figure, when everybody on Battle.net is doing this, if anything is even, like, slightly subpar, there's gonna be so many people that kept slightly subpar stuff. Like, yeah. if it's even questionable. I, at this point, I'm like, it's gotta have four mods, or I gotta want to use it on something that I have. Like, some character that I already have. If I don't want to use it on one of my builds, and it's not, like, super GG, I'm just trashing it. That's why I trash that Druid Helm. I'm like, I have way better Druid Helms. Like, why would I keep this? No, nah, Joy, I'm trying to jinx it so that these guys will have something to, like, um, I got to give these guys something to make fun of me about. Otherwise, otherwise it gets boring. Because when you're someone like me is so good at PvP and beats everybody. And, like, you know, and you don't fuck up in the PvM either. Like, it's hard for these guys to relate. You know what I mean? It's like, it, I'm trying to... <laughs> Carly, did you... A night off. We're going to clap Maddie tonight, giving him a break. Yeah, exactly. I was going to... Uh, it felt bad. I'm just like, you know, Maddie, take your time. Do some gambling. Mm -hmm. Use the server like everybody. Use the server blessing. We need to Not find something good. Yeah, hopefully, dude. Found a Druid Helm with 11 stats on it. That's right. I'll Eleven. easy cool it tomorrow. I can't wait. What build are you, what build are you bringing? What should I prepare for? Uh, I'm not sure. Whatever you want me to play. Dude, literally anything. Bring the hardest matchup. Whatever you want. What am I going up against? Uh, murdered in. Murdered in. Yep. The only thing Cooley can play. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. See? See, this is what I mean. I got to give him something. You know what? I just gotta trash everybody with my murder den, and then it's—it's it's the only thing you can play. But what cool, you're trashing everyone. Why is he really so saying? Common? Yeah, what he's really saying is you're the best murder den on East, and I get it. Thank you. I appreciate that. Appreciate it. You're so—you're too kind. You didn't need to say those kind words to me. That was really nice of you. Yeah. We need some good helms, boys. Anyone find anything good? Anything keepable? I haven't found a llama helm yet. Anything to compete with llama? You switch things up. All trash so far. Three poison bone, 20 cast. That's not bad. That's actually a good one. I would socket that, see if you can get two sockets, put a couple bear runes in it, and then you have found yourself. God fucking damn it. I know what you're fucking doing. Get the fuck out of here, Joby. Get the fuck out of here. I fucking uh, see you. Get the fuck out of here. Who is this? It's Who fucking Shirley. This? Oh, is this Shirley? I saw a paladin. Are you, are you guys you are a gambling boys? What a butt, dickhead. What yes, sir. Yeah, we're kind of gambling addicted. Oh, my fucking word. What a dickhead. I'll play I Necro or Druid. I'll play Necro or Druid, Cooley. All right. Are dude. you gamble? No, no, no gamblers. I see. God damn it, Shirley! Don't you know we're trying to run a fucking racket here? What happened, man? No. I thought Shirley and I were friends, but it's fucking hard line. Hard line. Somebody who's on Shirley's friends list. And doesn't want to gamble. Go Bro. ahead, and troll him. Feel gamble, free. gamble nights, boys. Only gamble nights. Yes. All right, we're keeping anything over 10k at this point because we get fucking trolled. 10k. By, oh wow. <laughs> <laughs> we had to lower our standards. We keep getting fucking trolled. Trying to run a racket here, boys. Can't keep getting trolled. We only need eight more. 
funny thing is, I joined your game, left, and rejoined your game, and you didn't even know, because your thing was open. So it doesn't give you the messages that people join your game. Yeah. God damn it, Shirley. <laughs> you said you needed something to be entertained by. There you go. Look what I just found for I sent it to you on uh, Discord. It's trash. You me? No. It's but trash. Don't worry about it. It's trash. Holy trash. <laughs> it's legitimately just trash. Oh, holy shit, boys. You gotta check out this stuff. Joby is such a good dueler. This is the items he uses on his Would necro. You because no, that... I gambled it. Yeah, he's building a necro now, Joby is, and this is what he's gonna use, because he's really good. He builds good characters. That's trash. Yeah, I mean, I'm going from Biggins Bunnet to this, you know? So. <laughs> that's, that's a it's quality, trash. Joby quality item right there. Okay, imagine now a uh, an amulet plus 13 minimum damage and 14 all res, or a ring, <laughs> whatever that was. <laughs> it's all it's all because there was this one time Joby found a uh, superior breastplate and it was 14% and he was and it was th three sockets maybe 14% three sockets and he's like oh that's good people like that right and I was like nah man it's actually trash like People won't pay a premium for it because they're, you can shop better ones from like Act 2 and normal. And then I started trolling him. Like I would find a fucking cracked breastplate and be like, Joby, you want this? It's got uh... <laughs> 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 like jo Joby, you want this? I would like link it in chat <laughs> in game. <laughs> Literally, I can eat trophy room with it. <laughs> I'd be like, Joby, you want me? You want to put this in the trophy room? Oh man. Uh, in tw 2001, in regular D2, that happened for me. Sure, I can't click on Geed anymore. I'm not sexist. I would return the favor. I don't know. I've missed a lot of this conversation, I think, but I'm happy to pick it up where we're at, where we're at right now. What the fuck is going on? This is a serious problem. What, the torch? The torch sale? That's the biggest problem you've had all night, I think. That is... That's huge. That's a big problem. That would suck, but it's like you have to keep going, right? Like, you have to just keep doing it. You can't let that... You can't quit. You always buy another one. Just gotta keep going. Woo! Interesting how plus one to skills sells for 27,000 gold, and plus two to skills sells for 30,000. Busted. I didn't really think that one out too well. No, it just doesn't scale. All right, finally back to doing what we want to do now, because surely serious. Oh, did you need me back in the game? No, we don't need you to come into <laughs> the game for anything. I mean, fucking make I mean, new game. Friends can't join. Friends cannot join. New game. Oh, Joby had a game? 20 faster cast rate jewel we don't we don't know about. Jewel? That'd be yeah, insane. Joby hacks. I think that would be a cool thing that they, they could introduce is like a 5% faster cast rate jewel. No, oh, I think because then that that opens up like you can add so a faster cast rate to your like your Oculus or to your Griffins. So your your Sin Circlet? Yeah, or your 220 Sin Circlet that just yep. allows to be a 225 and it's like that. You know, I don't think insane. that would be broken at all. I actually think that would be great. Forces people to make did, choices. 
Yeah, if they did five or ten. Ten might be overkill, but five would be good. Yep, agreed. Or they could do like a... Like they do with FHR, bad, like seven. Like seven or eight FHR or FCR. Because then, you know, it allows you to hit those druid and sin breakpoints kind of thing. Yep, love it, dude. Love it. And, God and damn it, we got another one. This happened again, dude. Look at this, it happened again, but it didn't spawn on the right base. Artisan's Coronet of Speed. This is the GG's we need. You're 100% right. We need to find a GG. I want to be able to post something that says I beat Llama's GG's. We already know he's got a ton of GG's and we need to find a better one. No messing around, dude. I feel like my 120, 30, pretty good. Cause it's not him farming all his stuff. Yeah, it is dude. He's doing it. He, he literally, he farmed all of that stuff. Well, then we'd be farming gold for you then because they're farming gold for him. He's not doing it solo is what I'm getting at. A paladin circlet with a bunch of strength but no cast. Anyone? Anyone? No. Nope. Bueller? Trash. Trash. We got to get a good one. It doesn't matter that he's got other people doing it. We just need to get luckier than him. The only way we're going to get luckier is if Battle.net decides to stop trolling us. Oh, dude. Four to mana after each kill. There we go. Look at the GG's rolling in now. Yeah, dude. There's going to be a lot of people still gambling for a long time. Yeah, it's just we need to stick it out. He's probably going to sleep and stuff. We ain't. No sleep. Till Brooklyn? Until I die. Or they stop doing this thing. Whatever. Or they stop doing the gambling thing. Can't believe we found those mods that came together again. The Artisans of Speed, but it came on the wrong base. Like, we just need it to spawn on the right base for once. That would have been so good. What are the three? So I get 20 faster run walk? 30 faster Thir run walk? 30 faster run walk, yeah. Oh, it would have been so good. Okay. To that. 24 DR in a circlet with two sockets. Trash. Trash? It's only got two sockets? Yeah. Trash. Trash. It's terrible. It has to have, has to have three for the... It's terrible. The well, thingy. you also got to figure you can take it to Larzuk and get two sockets if it's a magic helm so like it could literally spawn with anything else and still have those two sockets right but this is my budget anti mind blast synthy nah so you I'm would thinking. still you would still almost rather have it roll plus two to a skill class and and 24 25 dr and roll one socket and it would still be better like one socket off larzik that's what i did with the paladin helm that i have it's two paladin 20 or 23 dr rolled one socket i just put a soul rune in it said fuck it it still works hmm. oh well. 62 percent cures no way i have 30 faster run walk three open socket what's the for worth in form gold no idea no idea they're just uh they're just usable there's not a lot of people making zons right now to tell you the complete truth but Zon's super overpowered, though. Yeah, it's I mean, really it's good. Best DVM and the, they're banning like all the PvP things. Yeah, Zon's and Sorceress in general get very little love for PvP. Yeah, yeah well, Zon used to be able to get stuck in dodge lock. It's gone. It used to actually matter when they block something. That's gone. So now they just dodge three quarters of the things and then they block the other three quarters that actually hit them. Also, they can't really stun anymore. Like before, you could get like G8. When you get like get it arrow before, it would like stun you. Now you can just teleport away. Yep. Yeah, so it's like they're pretty broken. Yeah, it's good yeah. for like the PvP show. Like people enjoy watching Zon's duel for sure. Like I'm I'm certainly one of those people. Like I enjoy watching Zon's duel. It's almost yeah, like watching Zons... Barb's duel. Because you feel like their back's against the ropes. Like I don't mind Zon's as much like 1v1, but like in teams, it changes the dynamic a lot. Complete it turns to like a camping team. 
Oh yeah. It like hundred percent turns into a campy team every time. Even if they're like, oh we won't camp. I know some people like that kind of dueling. You know some people like that, but also I don't know. people. I don't have it. I don't have the heart to can that 220 necro helm with 33 fire res. I just don't have it in me yet. I will have it in me later. Nah, I get rid of it. Yeah, it's it's definitely it's gonna get trash. trash. But maybe someone's like, man, nope, I really nope. need that on my non ladder nope. character. Nope, get rid of it. You know, As someone who made a necro for three years, <laughs> just get rid of it. Yeah, I'm down for that, Justin. I'm down for that. Another 220 Paladin, the 6 dex AR, trash. I feel good about trashing that one. As an owner and avid player of the Paladin, I can easily trash it. All right, someone else agrees with me. It's time to trash that Necro Circlet. It's time to give up. Instead, get rid of it. <laughs> I know, but somebody from chat. Oh, do right. I need to type in chat too? You're an elitist. You're an elitist, Shirley. And people are going to call you an elitist. Just but don't call if, me elite and I'm fine. <laughs> yeah, if one, of the, if one of the commoners like me that has it in their heart not to junk the GGs also says it, well, then it's true. You want this that was great. 30 cold grass home. That was Perfect a very rolls. good call, Justin. That was exactly what I needed. I needed the liquid courage to trash that fucking thing. You knew it. You knew it. You saw. Damn, I'm good call. all the paladin skill, like plus two paladin skills with a ton of strength, but no cast. I've gotten four of them with two paladins and over 20 strength, but then they have no cast on them. How are the Canadians doing? Canadians are Just probably chilling. crushing us. No good rings yet. Are you still on the ring gamble? Yeah. I think you lose a lot of gold that way, don't you? That's fine. I miss when I That's had a really good. nice inventory full of fucking $34,000 amulets before Shirley came in and fucked me so that I have to do this twice now every fucking time. No proof. For fuck's sake. Jesus no Christ. I have the, the proof. Guy. It's on fucking YouTube. It's fucking straight proof. I'm what reporting you to Battle.net. I'm, gonna, I'm reporting you to Battle.net. I'm saying, remember that time you wanted us to gamble and break the game? Well, Shirley came in and trolled me. Reported. I'm doing it right now. Fucking report. Shirley. Serious. Okay, just sent that to the server. You know how they feel about that. Reported. If you get if they if it crashed your game, that would have been hilarious. I got a bad bottle of whiskey and a fair amount of gummies. No sleep till GG. Exactly. No sleep till GG. If you get a 230-20 two open socket, I'll sleep. Two paladin, fifteen strength. The funny thing is, there's going to be so many people that gamble their their hearts away and don't get shit. I feel like that's still going to happen. Oh, yeah. It's the nature of gambling. <laughs> the real news piece here is going to be that, like, we check the market and there's, like, really not that much of a change. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the entirety of Battle.net was gambling for 24 hours straight. And the funny thing is, is that there seems to be no surplus of circlets that have popped up. <laughs> I'll be back, boys. I'll take a little break. I'll be right, right back. All right. You hang in there. Quick, we're everyone gonna go to this game and pile his ambulance. What's happening, Wayne? Oh, RNG baby. is RNG, dude. That's 100%. Please, back in cheese. I'm Plus three summoning skills, 98 life. Trash. Nope. Trash it. My name is Rosa Laura. Talking to you? What, who's going on here? 
I was contemplating a T, but... You know, like... I got you. All right. That's like, what the fuck? Bam. Trash. Everything trash. We, we would accept so much stuff. We would accept so much. There's so many, there's literally so many possibilities. We haven't kept anything in a while. Does anyone use three P-Comb 20 cast hats anymore? Uh, I think if it's level 45, there's some use for it in, uh, in LLD or MLD, sorry. Yeah, MLD. I'm still yeah. trying to figure out what level you need to be to gamble a hand scythe. Like a LLD one? Yeah. Because, like, the area at Summit, I looked at it, and it's like, oh, level, it was like 37 or something. And my girl's 45, and she cannot get them to even spawn at the vendor. So, basically, you want to look at the stat that you're hoping to get on it, right? So you're hoping to get plus two to traps. That's basically it. Yeah, two traps, three LS, three mind yep. blast. So that's the big one you want. So look at the uh, the eye level or the C level, whatever it is for a level on that ability. And then uh, whatever level that is, that level plus five will always ensure that you, whatever you gamble, will have that on it. Well, it will be able to spawn that on it. I believe it could be it might be plus three or plus four but plus five certainly guarantees it um okay two zon 30 faster run walk 25 strength 12 dexterity how do we feel about this 37 stats it really uh, needs two sockets because uh the, you need the 30 ias coming from jewels so it like absolutely needs oh, at do? Least two sockets yeah like Damn. on a lot of the different builds that would use, uh, you know, hybrid builds that would use a helm like that. You 100% need IAS. It's the most important thing from those helms. That's why it's already a risk to go like 230s, to use 230 two open socket helms, because you're just trading a socket for plus two to skills, which is good. But when you start talking about trading two sockets, well, now you're cutting into the IAS so much. Well, it would be one socket, because you'd socket it with. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, one socket. No way. 230, 22 open socket, 12 all sin circlet. That's not bad, man. It sucks that that spawns sin, but it's still a 230, 22 open socket. That's actually a phenomenal find, dude. Nice job on that. Yeah, dude, it didn't spawn any other class. It's literally, that's, that's like, oh, cool. That's a nice sin one. If it spawns any other class, that's worth like 10, 20, 30K. Yeah. Depending on the class that it rolls. Yeah. If we got that, I'd be fucking jumping for joy, boys. Let's be serious. I would be... I'd fly out of my seat i find something like that. Yeah, so I couldn't... I can't gamble those uh, hand scythes with my level 45. But I can with a 94 or 93 or something. And they come up as level 30. Weird. Oh, Which well, is really them. weird. Just gamble? But like not not all of them come up as level 30 because some will come up, they'll spawn two skills. And so then you wind up automatically being level 42. I'm like, well, that's not what I want. You can't fly out of your seat. What if I could? What if I could? And I was just waiting for the perfect opportunity to do it. Fucking A. What country are you from? Do they have sarcasm there? They should. It's a. Damn, I just gambled. But I actually can this. fly, so jokes on you. I actually can fly. And you think I'm just gonna show it? You think I'm just gonna show you that I can fly? Fuck no, man. The government would be on on me for that shit. To be like, oh man, how many calls I'd be getting? I don't want that many fucking calls. 
You can see my wings. They're literally on screen right now. You can see them. There's wings on screen. Where's your red bolt? I feel like I was having better luck with my level 45. Jam it. There's also a lot better, cooler stuff to look at at that level, though. That's the thing. There's like. It's just funner to look at the LLD stuff. Okay, so why why is this so high? It's one druid, 20 cast, 51 AR, 8 mana leech, 20 life, 11 all res, level 66. What mana puts leech. it over 30? Is it the 8 mana leech? Yep. Damn. Yeah, because sometimes I'll roll like a really good something. Like, it could be LLD. It's like, can I not just remove one mod? <sighs> All right. I have got to get rid of some of these weak ass amulets because it sucks that I have to do this twice oh. now. I just gambled Naja's puzzling. Yeah, I, have uh, to Naja. I hate that. Sorry, we gotta take a break and do some amulet gambling here. We got hit too hard there. Like this, it takes forever to purchase all of these amulets back. Oh, probably because some of them are like this. We gotta do this right. We actually gotta get 20k or more. Gotta do it right. Shirley came and robbed us blind, and it certainly did set us back substantially. So we're gonna have to fix this. All right. Take a little break, get some more amulets. Cause surely serious. You get any new music for that next few hours? Or, fuck yeah, dude. Hold on, hold on. We'll, we'll get we'll get some shit. Let me actually put it. Let me, let me put some. Let me jam some shit. Oh damn! Oh damn! I just good? got a. Yeah, I, I was gambling amulets just now, and I got a a, a one ten necro with thirty five or thirty two life. It's not, not bad, bad. Man. Not bad Let's at all. Jam this. Is this still is this playlist still good? Does it still jam stuff? Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, I just restarted it. Hold on. Playlist. <laughs> There we go. All right, it should be playing some good stuff, dude. It should just be rolling through a playlist right now because we got, I got you like that. Because I because I got you like that. I can send you a decent playlist if you want. It's like 90s good jams. Well, it's uh, I have to do royalty-free stuff, bro. Never mind. I'm not going to send you that playlist because you'll get <laughs> the instantly. Ban. You would, you would get so slapped. All right, there's some that sell for 29k. That's good. Here, keep those. Oh, there's another one. I saw it right here. The rest of these are trash. Slowly rebuilding. I just hate having to do that whole buy thing twice. Like, I'm to the point where I have to buy all of that stuff twice. It used to just be once I would fill up the inventory. But we set our standards far too low. There's another one. Two cold skills. That's close. Another one. Another one. Close. There's so many close, but no cigars. Oh, there's two bar skills. 28 MF. Now that can roll up to 35 on a magic amulet. What are we talking about? We need to. We need to stop lowering our standards so low. What did I get? I got a uh, two bar. Two bar 58 life. On an amulet. Yeah, those can roll up to oh, 100. Shit. I sold them on the gamble screen instead of the character screen. 
Oh, Oops. Karma. Please don't come in and take these again. I'm trying to. I'm trying to beat. Llama. I was trying to gamble more to bring them back for you. I'm trying to. I'm trying to beat Llama. This is like an hour of setback right here. Fucking building this back up. That's why. That's why I'm gambling ambulance right now. I'm trying to buy them so I can bring them to you. Uh, res gold fine, but gold fine was shit. 22k, level 30 amulet. This is kind of cool. It's not great, but it's kind of cool. It sells for 22k. It gives me time to think about it for later. It gives me time to think about it for later. Yeah, the defensive auras is certainly weird, though. Ah, uh, low-level duels, yep. Yeah, it's kind of a niche community for low-level duels, but dude, if truth be told, some of my HLD friends are gonna hate to hear me say this, but dude, I actually love LLD far more than I do HLD. Like, I find it to be a lot more enjoyable. Like, for for the most part. Like, it's not always, but, like, in general. Like, any average game I will join in LLD will be far more enjoyable than any average LLD game or uh, HLD game that I'll jump into. Yeah, LLD and uh, LOD was a lot more fun than HLD is. Yeah. It just, it feels like the duels are, they're still random to some degree. Like, everything is random in this game. Like, even, even PvP. But, like, it feels like they're a little more forgiving in LLD, I should say. Like, they're a little more forgiving. You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. you can get away with being a little worse sometimes. Granted, you're still going to run into some insane people like facts that are going to punish you with insane skills, you know, but like, you can get away with being a little worse sometimes, like, and just, and fucking up a lot more. You can get away with being braver, trying new strategies, trying new things, like, you can't really get away with that a lot in HLD, like, you'll get smashed, like, you'll get smashed by, like, the tier one builds, but you can bring in, like, weird ass builds in LLD and it's, like, fine. Yeah, like I was playing some LLD when I was permanent with characters a couple weeks ago, and I brought my my paladin in, and I was like, oh, I haven't played this in forever, and like I was fighting against the barb, and man, I was getting just destroyed. Like he was just cleaning, just I wouldn't touch him, and he was just destroying me. Who fast? Hammer? No, just in LLD. I don't know. It's just random dude. Oh yeah. Um, but he was just he was just destroying me. I couldn't couldn't land a hammer to save my life like it was just a mess and then started learning about like what to do just from like experimenting and like i was able to you know start getting into like half life and then like he's in a quarter life and then he's like nearly dead and and so it was just like it was a learning process and i could eventually get there yeah but in hld it's just so much it's like you're like, dead immediately like yeah, yeah oh you fucked up yeah you fucked up you got chain locked and fucking smashed and you don't even know how the person did it yeah like, you're just like oh i i you weren't on my screen you appeared on me and then you did 17 times you like you hit me 17 <laughs> times on my like, yeah what the oh, fuck man. and it's they're like haha like, noob <laughs> yeah i was like i'm back just in time yeah oh we gotta stop talking about him now now speaking of these guys yeah, yeah, yeah. One, uh, so, so one time, anyways. They're one he's... time they showed up in an LLD tournament. <laughs> Just <laughs> destroyed. Yeah. It wasn't like traditional LLD though, right? No, it was. I mean, we were allowed to like bone prison and, you know. Yeah, well, it was, it was a 2v2. So they were like, armor. yeah, everyone, everyone can. I mean, I think that's allowed. Because they're like, everyone should have the ability to teleport. What about recasting bone armor? That's usually frowned upon, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think so. Yep. 
And no, I, was like I, I remember biggest, that. Uh, I remember that in LOD. That was the, yeah. The, but... Did didn't you guys win that, Joby and Maddie? Yeah, yeah, we did. Yeah, that's what I thought. I was so proud of you boys. I was just like. There was, I'm not gonna lie. There was some toxic people in the LLD community at that time, who were talking mad shit, being like, I mean, literally. I don't think they're. They didn't join D2R. I wonder why. Uh, but like, they were talking mad shit, saying stuff about the duelers in the DFC, and just like, ah, oh, well, fucking, just mana pots and all of this stuff. If they actually had to really duel and make decisions, it was all like LLD people saying the shit. Like, well, I shouldn't say all LLD people. It was like literally one or two people. And then, yeah. like, they joined the turn. Uh, no, I don't even. I can't remember if they joined it. Either way, trashed everybody. Like, literally applies all of these HLD skills to LLD, trashes all them motherfuckers. And I was just like, I'm so proud of you, boys. I remember looking at the rule set with Joby, and we're like, okay, so let's just play Trapper and Necro. <laughs> yeah. And we just yeah, destroyed everyone. Trash. It was. It was like. It was so easy because I was watching watching them as they were doing it, and I was like. Why did no one else think to do this? They're playing two basically ranged characters, and one of them just holds insight to regen mana while the other one spans, and then they switch. It's like, what the hell? Yeah, Why did so we not good. think of this? So <laughs> smart. It was so smart. It was so beautifully done, so beautifully executed. Yeah, and they used um, teleport staffs, but they were like the skinny ones, the one by fours. So I think Maddie had two teleport staffs and an insight in his queue that he'd keep yeah. One of my greatest wins ever in the DFC. I still remember it like it was yesterday. Oh, this is actually good. Um, was that guy, the toxic dude. I won't even say his name. I don't want to start any shit, but there was this wicked toxic dude that used to talk mad shit in LLD. Used I don't remember his name, but I know, I know who you're talking about. Yeah, used to that. troll me on JSP, all of this shit. I was still kind of new, still kind of getting into it. He actually would troll me before I started streaming. He was such an asshole. He used to troll me before I started streaming. He used to fucking tell me to delete my shit and all of this stuff. And he fucking joined the DFC at one point, which I thought was a win in and of itself. Because I'm like, here's this asshole. And, and he's joining my event. How bad am I if you're joining my event is what I was thinking. But then and I fought him. And then, I, yeah, and then I fought him. We actually got matched up against each other randomly. I didn't plan it. Randomly. And I fucking trashed him, dude. It wasn't even close. It was a fucking clinic of absolute juck smashery, dude. It was just like... Easy. Yeah, it. Was, I made it look easy, bro. Like, he was on a paladin and I was on a druid. Trashed, dude. It felt good. He's on a paladin? I didn't know he had a paladin. Yeah, he had his paladin was actually really good. We, he used to, like, whenever he wasn't... Uh, none of our duels in, in pubs were ever good mannered. As soon as I would step in, he would just be a cunt. And, like, so we would both camp wells and chuck hammers and charge each other and do all of this shit. It was back and forth. It was, they were never good easy. mannered duels in pubs with this kid. And then, like... It, but he was... I could tell he was a good Dan. I was like, well, he kind of knows what he's doing on a Dan. Well, why? Because I kind of know what I'm doing on it in. Like, but then when we actually dueled, he dueled with his pally. And I had a, I had a druid, and I actually regretted bringing a druid, because I was like, God damn it, I wish I could duel him on a paladin. I don't feel comfortable on a druid. But I fucking telly stomped him and trashed him. I just, I kept playing it safe. I would telly stomp once, and then get back out, recast the wolves, recast everything. Telly stomp again, one nato out. He couldn't do nothing. He couldn't do nothing, dude. Trashed. He's yeah, made dude. it look easy. He then joined your Discord, started becoming my best friend, yeah. and trying to, like, I don't know, get me to... I don't know. Dude, that's literally and... what he would do in the entire LLD community back in the, back in the heyday. He would always, like, I would step into games and shit like this. This was before I was, like, streaming or anything. I would step into games, and, like, he would pretend he didn't know it was me, and he would immediately start trying to get on people's good sides in the game, be like, hey, man, oh, hey, Jimmy, what's up? Like, you could tell he was some, like, dude that was so insecure and needed friends. He was such an asshole. He knew he needed friends. So he's like, would try to drum up all of these friends in game, and he would be like, 
Oh, hey, Jimmy, how you been? How's your wife? I don't know, like, would ask, you know, like, wicked personal, say wicked personal things to people to try to, like, look cool and to, you know, oh, I'm cool. I'm, and then and then immediately you give it time. Just give it, like, ten minutes. And then he'd immediately be like, oh, I didn't even know this prick joined the game, blah, blah, blah. Like, after trying to drum up all these friends, I was like, what a dickhead, dude. And then, flat, like, fast forward maybe two, three years after that when I was, like, streaming and then had some friends, too. And suddenly he couldn't do that to me anymore because we had some good friends too. And then suddenly people realized how much of an actual asshole he was. And I was like, wow, man, this is like, so that being the case, that being said, when I actually dueled him in my own tournament and smashed him, it was like one of the best feelings that you could possibly imagine. It was, it was pretty good, not gonna lie. One of the highlights. Yeah, Karma got him hard, dude. You're lucky the matchmaker gave you that fight. I know, right? What a what a good matchmaker that was. Yeah, and then he joined the Discord, proceeded to become like my best friend or try to, and then he like started PMing me about I don't know about like shitty rule sets or something, and uh, and then started bringing it up in in the chat and started fighting with Dan. Oh um, yeah. And so Dan left on his own accord because he's like, this is too dogs, I don't want to deal with it. And then you banned the other guy and like, that was just not a good situation. Yeah, yeah, it was just crazy. It was just crazy. Right. That, that, that's like, okay. that was literally what he would do every public game. Like that was him in a nutshell in the LOD, LLD community. All right, that I was just what he did. He WWE would, like, King. Oh yeah, it was WWE. He like turned every game into the WWE. It was just like, I mean, it, there was no better way to describe it. He would get really personal, talk about people's shit. He'd be like, yo man, how you doing? Blah, blah, blah. It would, you know, how, how'd the abortion go? Like, you know, it was just, there was so much personal shit that he would say to people and he would act like he knew him, knew those people also that he could like gain their favor and try to manipulate them to be like, you know, to do his dirty work. I'm like, that was, that was him in a nutshell. I sent you a, a circlet. Yeah, Root, you ought to check out the, you ought to check out the bonus for today from those 22 Nights of Terror. You ought to check it out, bro. Yeah, man, that's fucking gambling's insane. Yeah, it's crazy. Everybody's doing it. Like, I don't think there's anybody on Battle.net that isn't gambling right now, honestly. It's crazy. Correct me if I'm wrong, but if there ever was a circlet that, uh, that Life Everlasting could spawn on that had plus two to skills, Necro is the absolute most useless one, right? Oh, yeah. Trash. Luck check, out that, uh, check out that circle I sent you there, Cooley. It's probably no good because the mods are like the wrong. Trash. Way. Trash. Yeah, but did you did you get my joke, Rob? You got my joke, Rob, though. Like you, you, you that was the that was the WWE bullshit from South Park. Actually, it was a South Park episode where they were talking about like that exact topic in the WWE. Like, that was... It's just insane. Yeah, this is... This is trash. Unfortunately, the Paladin Helms, 90% of the time need to have... 95% of the time need to have 20 cast. Really unfortunate, though, because that's a really cool otherwise. Yeah, the 58 res and 25 strength. Yeah, really cool otherwise, dude. That's too bad. Wicked, wicked cool. Oh yeah, with the wrestling, it was, dude. Nothing will beat the South Park joke that existed in South Park uh, Fractured Butthole. <laughs> the "Give me my fucking keys" skit by uh, with with Randy Marsh had me literally in stitches playing the game. I actually was crying when that happened. Did I tell you about that? That part of the game? Dude, it's by far the funniest thing ever. 
Like, it's by far the funniest thing ever. Like, you're playing this game. You One of your missions is to, like, stop Randy Marsh from driving drunk. So you get him in a, in a fight with him. And you take his keys so that he can't drive. And then, if you're doing, like, a playthrough, literally, like, three hours later into the game, you're doing some other quest. Randomly, you're, like, just about to start dueling this other boss. Like, epic fucking moment. And then, boom! Randy Marsh kicks down the door and he's like, Hey, kid! He's like, I told you! Give me my fucking keys! <laughs> fucking lost it. I fucking lost it. I was crying. Like, it's just such a perfect interruption in this game. And such a great callback. I was like... Comedy, this is comedy, boys. Like, this is comedy. That's comedy at its finest. GGM gambled a nearly perfect metal grid. Oh shit. Nice dude. What's the res on it? What's the what's the stats? There's a whole bunch of stuff that rolls on metal grid. It's kind of discouraging. There's a whole bunch of stats on it. AR defense res. Metal Grid is so weird. What if this was your time to, to gamble the uh, that three open socket F, whatever it is. Um, what's it? You can't gamble F items. Oh, that's true. You can't gamble F items, bruh. That'd be sweet. They should seriously change that and make it so you can gamble F items. That would be sweet. Or if there was a way to, like, make them F, I mean, that'd be super broken. <laughs> but been finding your first Griffins ever, and it's ethereal. That happened Soft to me in, uh, that happened to me in LOD. I found a perfect, perfect Griffins. It was ethereal. Gambling? No, uh, no, you can't gamble it, F, but like, uh, I, I found one and it was Ethereal 2015. I was so pissed. I was so pissed. I found, uh, it was like one of the last ladder resets before D2R. Um, I was, was farming fun. and it, I couldn't find like a Shaco or anything really to save my life. And then. I found a Shaco, bro. It, it was like, it was great because I'd farmed for like three days and finally found a Shaco off of Fisto. It was ethereal. <laughs> oh my God. That's I was like, what a troll. <laughs> troll. One out of 10. First Griffins is F. One out of 10. Lucky guys gets one. <laughs> lucky, lucky. Woo! I'm loving this playlist. This is a pretty good one. Whose idea was it to actually listen to different music? What a crazy idea. This is like some kind of some 80s shit. Makes me feel like I'm in Stranger Things. Makes me feel like I'm gonna gamble some outrageous shit. That was so close. I thought that was 20 cast for a second. I was gonna fucking freak, dude. I thought it was 20 cast. Don't don't look at it too long, boys. It's a fail. 20 something. Trash. Yeah, that's gonna get trashed. It's unfortunate, but it's true. This is gonna get trashed. Some would say it's sad, but true. Some would say. That would be a Metallica. Metallica reference. I think uh, they weren't the first person, first people to say that. I think that was actually a saying. Yeah, but they made a song about it. We're waiting on the GG. We're going to get it. We're going to beat Llama is what it is. Llama's sending me all these circlets that are pretty good. So we're going to have to beat him. We're going to have to gamble something better than Llama. Because he's now turned this into a competition. I don't know if he knows it. Don't tell him that. But it certainly is. But he just doesn't know it. And it's better if he doesn't know it. Because then he doesn't expect it. 
You're gonna need a stimulant. Good, good point. Sean, I, I can always count on you for the good reminders. Cheers to you, bud. Let's fucking get it, boys. I didn't know we was gonna be streaming all weekend with this and DFC, but I can't say I I can't say I'm upset about it. Whew, I'm certainly gonna have carpal tunnel after this. I can feel it in my clicker in my click finger. My index finger is fucked. The sacrifices I make for you guys. I've had to piss for two hours. You're gonna Gee. be compromised for a duel tomorrow. Yeah, you're it's lucky. I think you're lucky that that's the case. You're gonna have a shot. Oh man. Oh, another one. Another one, dude. I was about ready to shit. But it's 20 faster run walk. I was about ready to shit on this one. Yeah, I could feel it in my fucking wrist. Like my hand, I might actually be crippled. I might actually, tomorrow might be crippled. I might walk around. Do you get workman's comp for this? Cause it's workplace injury. <laughs> I might. I might. I'll claim it. Take yourself out. We're getting so close. I feel like this is just around the corner, man. This is just around the corner. Some absolute GG. We're getting a lot of rares now. Normally, I'm like, oh, I'll just gamble until I run out of gold. And then... Uh, That's what I'm, I'm doing. And then I was like, oh, I'll call it a night kind of thing. It's like, I'll farm up more gold later. It's like, nah, you just farm up gold now. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to gamble till I run out of gold. You know, I got a method going. It you say that as my character just starts puking gold all over the ground. As I <laughs> say just going to gamble till we run out. You guys doing perfect gems to get your gold? Yeah, just making perfect. What, what, what do you mean, perfect gems? So I'm selling my perfect gems to the vendor and buying them back. Really? That yeah, takes too much time. We do amulets. Yeah. What's the, what's your profit oh. per gem? What's your per profit uh, per gem? Ten k. So it's you know. Well, we are, we got twenty k on the amulets. Whoa. So how how do you do the amulets? Just, uh, any, you just buy a bunch you of farm amulets. A, you farm an amulet that's worth thirty four thousand gold. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. You guys rock. Thanks. I'm going to do yep. that now. You got it, bro. You Don't got it. To... You're welcome. Don't forget You're to welcome. Use your edge. Just your handing edge out good advice. Yep. Yep. Rocking the edge and the 35 geeds for sure. 35 or geeds? 15, sorry. 15. Where did you get a 35 yeah. geeds, bro? Yeah. <laughs> I wish. That'd be sick. <laughs> nice. Dude, this is so fucking cool. Yeah, it is, dude. I'm so pumped. And you have everybody on Battle.net right now just being like, yep, we're never going to get to do this ever again. Like, yeah. I, would, I, I almost feel like I would have this same feeling if I discovered a dupe method. Only I wouldn't stream it. All right. I'd be like, I'd be like I'm going to be doing this all night, boys. You guys need anything? I got you covered. That's exactly this is what I LOD, the last public dupe. I duped non-stop for like eight hours. Yeah. Did you really? Yeah, I did too. Oh, yeah. when, I, when I figured out how to crash LOD servers before D2R launched, I oh, sat there all fucking day. I was yeah, working remotely. It was during the pandemic. I crashed servers all fucking day. Re-rolling rune words, re-rolling charms. Re I rolled so many perfects. Like, people were wondering. I kept getting messages on Discord. There was like, is anybody noticing the servers kind of suck right now? Everybody's shit's crashing. I'm like, yeah, that's me. Like, uh, I, I figured out how to crash servers and was like, yup. I planned on making a video about it, but like, I only rolled a couple of like really GG perfects, like a 100% perfect BOTD, uh, F Berserker Axe, 100% perfect Last Wish, I think. Uh, a few other perfects but like nothing to be like oh look how cool like it was and you can still crash the servers like that they haven't fixed it yeah i remember so. like i was at that point i was like building up separate accounts and like leveling them to give away to people for like people that didn't 
play. We did it! Oh, I wanna... We did it! Woo! Now this is a perfect thing. Y'all y'all wouldn't even notice. Oh, nice. Y'all wouldn't even notice. But this is fucking good. For VLLD or? Yeah, for uh, level 18 duels, boys. We fucking did it. For your charger? This, this is good. Yeah, this is really good. For a zealot charger, this is 100% perfect. We just need to get we just need to get two sockets in this bitch. Oh my god. So this is this is 20% faster run walk, 30% enhanced damage. That's not defense, that's damage in a level 16 helm. This is very, very good. 20% is the max that can spawn for level 18, and 30% it rolls within a range, 20 to 30, 30% is max. So if this if this gets two sockets, I may try to socket this tonight. If this gets two sockets, that's G fucking G. There may actually not be another one like this that exists on Battle.net if that gets two sockets. Because nobody you know I would like. You know I would charge that in a heartbeat? Yeah, you certainly would. I know you would. You would see that shit, you'd be like, hey, trash. Trash. Oh my, I almost did. I almost did, but I, I caught myself. I was like, oh man, yeah, we can't let this happen. Here, I'm going to buy these rings so that when I go to my stash, I don't lose them. You have to fight the right buyer, you know? Yeah, exactly. I'm actually going to be the right buyer. If that gets two sockets, I'm using it. I'm going to make a level 18 and I'm going to grief uh, public games with it. Sounds reasonable. <laughs> yeah, like, I, that. Well, what else would I do? That's exactly... Right. That, that's my whole shtick, dude. I grief pub games. Boom, baby. That's a good find. Are you streaming or did you post it somewhere? Yeah, I'm streaming right now. He's on YouTube. Oh, yep, 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 yep. perfect. I'm gonna watch it. God, that's good. Whew. I feel really good about that. I, w I said I was like, dude, LLD, anything. There's so many things I would accept. And that just happened. I would have accepted that if it was like 29% or even 25 plus, I would have kept it. It just happened to roll 100% perfect. That was so good. That's what it is, duelers. That's what it is. I think that was all you. Cheers to that, brother. All right, let's do it again. Let's do it again. Oh, we jamming now. Getting a lot of plus twos, a lot of rares. It's just around the corner. We so close. We've hit, we've hit the point in the game where it can no longer troll us that hard. The game can no longer troll us. We've gambled too much. We've been in the game for so long. We're, we're far beyond trolling. Now it has to give us real RNG. We've bugged the game. The servers are too overloaded for them to troll Cooley any further. We're getting legitimate RNG. As intended, boys. That's what it is. It was this song too. It was just, it's just so good. This song, I love this. I use this in videos all the time. It's called Go On Going. Oh no, get ready for this one. This is the good playlist. Now this is the Cooley theme. This is Cooley intro music theme. This is really gonna bring us the luck. Oh, this was close. But we can't keep trash, boys. If it ain't perfect, trash. just feels good there's a, just, just a feeling about jamming left click uh left click enter there's just something about it filling up the inventory and not giving a fuck i've never felt so rich in my life i'm so <clears throat> happy they did this on a friday too so like yeah. the entire community can jam this <laughs> like oh man this was close 22 strength 30 ed life 
resistance, AR. Man, if this just would have spawned with like skills, two paladin skills or something, that would have been cool. Two barb skills even. Yeah, this just feels good. You're gambling for Jewelers Monarchs right now? Getting quite a few Monarchs, but not the J-Mod. That's the problem with, like, gambling for Monarchs, though, is I feel like you have one thing you can get. One or two things, really. Like, one or two things that you can get that are good. And uh, everything else is trash. By the way, Joby, Joby I just want to point this out. Still have not erroneously sold a charm. <laughs> Still. Look at the this one I just found. Right. I'm not even looking. Talk. I'm not even fucking lying. I've learned my lesson, okay? I've learned my yeah, lesson. Yeah, you're going to make fun of me. <laughs> I fucking learned my lesson. All right, I got to go. Oh, actually, that's, that's not horrible. That's like... I could see why you would pause and look at that one. That's like not horrible. It's just, if that's even spawned with uh, the Vizzo mod on it, that would actually be keepable. Shame. It's a shame. Crash. Right. All right, yep, you're right. You're right, Sean. We gotta unjinx. I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need some more Jim Beam though for that. I'm gonna have to refill. Pause for Jim Beam, boys. This thing holds like two shots, man. But the thing is, you gotta pace yourself. You can't be like, just because it's Friday night and just because we got infinite money doesn't mean you should act like a f monkey with infinite money and drink infinite amounts of alcohol. You should drink fucking responsibly. Like even gambling, we're sort of doing in moderation here. We're taking frequent breaks. We're making fun of Joby. Like everything in moderation, right? Like you have to balance it. Everything must come with a balance. There you that go. was a good playlist. Dude, can I jam that playlist one more time? I feel like I don't even, I don't want to lose this playlist. Like this brought us so much. Just, we're, we're, we're taking it from the top. We just got so much good shit off this. Y'all don't mind, do you? We'll run through that whole thing again, just because like that, that really got me fired up. All right, Tugs, we'll get ready, bro. Cheers to you. Mm. If you're drinking whiskey, and it's the really the hard biting whiskey, you're gonna wanna let it sit in your bottom gum for a minute. Just soak it up. Soak up every bit of it. Every bit of it. Let it, let it bite you a little bit. Let it bite back and sting your gum line a little bit. Remind you that you're alive. Remind you that as powerful as you are, Alcohol is also powerful. Let it remind you of that. And just accept it. And everything in moderation, boys. Let it remind you how powerful it is. But, um, God, I love it when it bites back, man. That's that's how true whiskey should be. You shouldn't, you shouldn't drink whiskey that doesn't bite you back, dude. One to Amazon skills, 20 cast, faster run walk. Four, oh, nice, dude. That is actually really good, Artem. That's a good find, brother. GG. That is a GG find. Those can also roll with plus two passives on them, which are also pretty sick for LLD. Oh, I should uh, I should clip this on my end. I have a clip somewhere in that last clip of that 3020. I should remind myself because I'm going to put together a compilation of things to beat Llama and that's going to be one of the only ways I can do it if I remember to clip these. 
2030 LLD helm. It's somewhere in there. I'll let my editors take care of that. <sighs> Unfortunately, I do all the editing. Editing is the biggest pain in the ass to any, like, like if you guys ever start think about making YouTube videos and shit, or making videos, would highly suggest find yourself an editor. It's, I, I hate it. I'll record the cool, I'll write the coolest things, record it, and I'm like, oh, I can't wait. And then it's daunting. You have all of these video files that you have to mix and edit. It's like, I've never wanted to quit so much. And then every time when I do a video, I'm just like, I record it, I have all of the pieces, and then I'm like, do I really need to keep making videos? Like, what is the point of all this? Like, I probably don't need to. I, this could get two sockets, but it's just not worth it. It could just be a better helm. Like, I'm just gonna trash it. Gambled Kira's again? Damn! Should just toss someone a bit of forum gold to edit for you. Yeah. Like, I had also considered, I think the best way to do that, instead of paying someone a set amount to do it, is to actually give them a percent cut of, of how well things do. Because then, it encourages them to edit well. Like, and, and actually make the video watchable and do all of the right things. I actually think that's the right way to do it. Because if I ever did that, here's, here's my problem, is I have such a style and a, such a way of doing things that I don't trust anybody else will do it like I want to do it. And will like take my vision and my ideas and do it the way I want to do it. So like, it would have to be like that. It would have to be like a cut. Like, do it well and I'll give you a percent cut because it, it encourages them to do it well. And you have to get someone who knows what they're doing. Have your kid do it? Is that what he does? Oh my god. I need to, alright. I need to get a kid. Objective A, go knock somebody up. Get a kid. I'm, I'm writing that on my goals. You can look at adoption. Yeah, right? Get a kid. It's very esoteric. Theoretically, you could kidnap. You could actually... <laughs> you, <laughs> that's, could that's you could have a, <laughs> you could have a kid. You could have, it doesn't specify. It's like, and acquire a, a kid. kid somehow. <laughs> you know? It, <laughs> it's very, yeah. it's a very esoteric me. goal. <laughs> oh my god, no, you... <laughs> What age are you shopping for? <laughs> <laughs> Probably somebody knowing <laughs> some editing <laughs> skills. Yep. Yeah. I don't know, dude. Theoretically, though, you might actually have some kids that are, like, good. Like, uh, you know, you have, like, the kids that are all jammed up with, like, TikTok and making videos and trying to make a name for themselves and stuff, they might actually understand how to edit. Like, and how to... Like, one of the biggest things is pacing for a video, which a lot of people don't know. They don't have a good concept of that do content. Is pacing is very, very important. Like, you don't... Especially if you do constant videos. Like, people are going to watch YouTube videos for one of two reasons. They're randomly going to search for something. And then boom, oh, there's a video on it. Let me watch this. And they don't care what your, it doesn't matter if it's perfect. It doesn't matter what your pacing is. They have information that they're trying to get out of you, right? So it's like you have an informative style. Or if you put them out constantly, they'll likely, wa they're watching you for entertainment. You know what I mean? So like, you have to keep that in mind. That's how I approach every video is like, even if it's an informative one, I understand that there's a subsect of people out there that, are watching D2 videos for entertainment. So I try to entertain them, inform the people that want to be informed, entertain the ones that want to be entertained, and do it all. And it's like really hard, and pacing is super important with that. A lot of work goes into this shit, boys, just, just for your entertainment. Even the ones I've been putting on Cooley Live have been have taken hours of editing. Like the the PK videos were some of my favorite videos to ever make. And you would think it would be easy because like all the footage is there, it was streamed and all of this stuff, but no. There was actually a lot of PKs that were left out because they didn't match the tone and the pacing or the feel of the video. They were really good, but I was kind of a dickhead. Like, and I'm just like, that's kind of, 
you went a little too far with that. Like, you know what I mean? That was funny, and I find this funny, but it doesn't match the tone of the rest of the video. So you have to, you know what I mean? Like, there's a lot of shit. There's a lot of thought that goes into it. You gotta, you gotta make it watchable. Uh, what do we think this does to JSP? Actually, believe it or not, we've been talking about this for a while, and I don't think anyone really has asked that so directly. Uh, I am not sure. We've never seen anything happen like this before, dude. What What do you guys think this will do to JSP prices? I honestly am staying... I think that there's going to be... JSP is going to be JSP. You're going to have the people that are willing to pay a premium for absolute GG perfect shit that nobody found. And all of the rest of the stuff is going to flood the market. Like the regular 220s with resists or whatnot are just going to be worthless. But still the ones that are super GG, like that's what I think is they're not nothing much is going to happen to them. Like 230 20 two open socket lifers with res, that's still a $200,000 form gold or 2000 you know what I'm fucking saying. That one's still expensive. But all of the mediocre... This is just going to kill all of the mediocre ones. Those are going to be worthless. Yeah, and redistribute some wealth. Hopefully, hopefully the people that are gambling these, finding those GGs, are profiting off of it, man. But I think certainly just kills the worth of the subpar circlets. If your circlet is not at all usable, it's certainly worthless now. Same with your rings and your amulets. If it was ever subpar, it certainly is now. Oh shit, I've learned not to sing along with this playlist because there's certain delays. I actually had to fix my delay for when we listen to YouTube music. I fixed it perfectly so that I could sing along with it. Just in case you guys ever want to hear my singing voice. In case I'm like, you know what, there's too many people watching this fucking stream. Some people need to go do something else. I'll just I'll start singing along with it and people will be like, alright. I've seen enough. Oh, I had to make sure that it's at least synced up. Should I decide that I would like to do that? Dude, I, I actually, I do too. I'm glad you do, Top Secret. I think they're they're wicked fun, but I, I actually was um, sort of discouraged from doing those in the beginning part of D2R because, like, you know, it was a rough time. Like, it was a very interesting time for content creation. I actually made some videos where I PK'd pubs. Uh, they didn't get a lot of, uh, they they got a lot of views, but they didn't get a lot of, uh, like, some people were pretty pissed, and I was like, yeah, I'm not sure if this is what I want to, you know, this is the image I want to portray, but at the end of the day, like, 2022 Cooley going into 2023 is a far different Cooley than the Cooley of, you know, beginning part of 2022. Like, I actually now, I'm just like, just do you. Like, there's a reason I played this game for 20 years, and it has nothing to do with the people that get upset when I kill them in pub games. It has nothing to do with those people. In fact, those are the people that probably kept me playing. Like, those reactions are probably what kept me playing. So I'm like, just do that. Uh, if it makes you happy, do it. I'm glad you liked them, Rod. I, I, they, they, I honestly, this is gonna sound bad, but I, after editing them and putting them together, I actually laughed at them too. I was like, this is fucking great. Like, this is, it reminded me why I used to do that stuff a lot. It's just super fun. Like, I will say though, I'm rather humbled and honored and uh, surprised that it's actually come to find out some people have been saying in my YouTube comments that there's a lot more public PKers on Battle.net now and they're blaming me for it that just pop into pub games and PK people. Well, this is what I say. This is what I wish I could say to all of those people. Uh, just get better at killing uh, PKers. It's actually not hard. Like a lot of PKers, a lot of them, not me, but a lot of them only do pub PK uh, because they're not good 
at regular PK. Not me, I'm the best dueler. But a lot of them only do it because they're trying to they're trying to kill people that have no idea how to fight back. If you have the slightest idea as to what to do or how to duel whoever's coming at you, it's actually going to be a rough time for them because they expect you to be unprepared. But if you're slightly prepared and know kind of what you're doing, you're actually going to be a big problem for them. I mean, you, you might have seen that if you watched the live streams where we were going around uh, PK and people in pubs. It was the people that kind of semi knew what they were doing who were actually like a problem. You know what I mean? Because you've already given up tons of levels on them. Like they might be level 70 or, or 30, you know, or they might be level 70, you're level 30. But if they're just like, oh, okay, but he's a charger. So what I can do is I have my Enigma. I can teleport. I can bone prison him. I can, you know, that's a problem. Like, yep, you certainly are correct. Like you, you certainly know what you're doing. Yeah, exactly. That one was great. The Tesla den that just walks up to the waypoint, walks to the waypoint, gets smashed. That was fun. I actually didn't think we had that one. I thought we were going to die. But you still got to fight. You still just got to try because you could get a good clip. And if you don't expect it, they certainly don't. Oh, shit. We got to do some gold finding. I'm getting a little low. Getting a little low. We got to do some gold finding. Please excuse me, boys. We do some gold finding. All right. Gold find galore. No, we just go to Jamella to do all of our gold finding today. That's the that's the place where we go. Yeah, this is where we do it. It's a great place, dude. It's actually super quick. Very, very fast gold finding here. I mean, we get stashes full of gold very, very quickly. I have a lot of gold find on this barb though, so that could have something to do with it. I think it does anyway. Not sure, but I don't know. I spent a lot of time building this gold find barb, so it kind of makes sense that he's finally met, you know, he's finally reached the point of, you know, being very useful and just stacking up gold faster than anybody can even keep track of. Actually, we should pick this up on the ground. Then stash it. That was my goal. The reason I'm keeping these in the inventory is just in case I step so far away from the vendor, it unloads the amulets. I think that's what happened when Joby joined, to be completely honest. There was so much going on on the server that it, it like unloaded the amulets. It saw them as unimportant and unloaded them. That's what I'm trying to prevent. Yeah, that's what I think too. Like, it, honestly, that's the way I see it. Is like this could be hardcore. Like those PK videos, that could be hardcore. Like this is softcore. You just get your body, lose some gold, and go on your way. Like that's the way I see it. The people get fired up about it. I'm just like, dude, come on now. It's really not that big of a deal. 
Like, that's kind of what the game was designed for, is like, you, you kind of have people every once in a while that just come in and PK you. It's a, it's a Wild West, that's what makes it awesome. That's really what makes it awesome, dude. We're gonna get there with this. Oh yeah, and there's even some people that get super fired up in game. They get like super fired up in game. And it's like, I'm not gonna lie, it used to actually be like that all the time, but now I feel like people are more mature that are playing D2R. They'll get ganked and they'll be like, GG, or they'll kill me and I'll be like, GG, and they'll be like, GG. <laughs> like, it's kind of weird. I'm just like, all right, they knew what I was doing. That was fun. Next game. I never ganked low levels on WoW. I did, however, used to kite Termis, uh, Terramis, the Devourer, to Stormwind Auction House. So he would kill everybody with his life leech breath. Oh my god, and nobody could kill him but Bulbar. <laughs> nice. So a GM told you to stop doing it, huh? Oh, that's too bad. Maybe they should make it so that you can't do it. <laughs> if it's really that much of a problem, they would make it so we can't do it. That's true. Gen gentlemen. We're gentlemen now. That or we just figure out it's not really worth a lot of your emotional energy to get fired up over this shit. Uh, one druid. Uh, yeah, that's not bad. It's it's viable. It's certainly usable. Uh, you you probably want to go for a five NATO helm at that level for a druid, but in certain matchups, it's not bad. Yeah, there's certain matchups where that's okay, but. Five NATO is probably still more desirable. Oh, they did? All right, yeah, there you go. There you go. See, now you know you were doing you were doing some good work. You were doing the real work. You, you were figuring out the glitches of the game. You were figuring out the things for people. Oh, boys, we got nothing. We got nothing in quite some time here. It's time to get something. All right, all right. Now we getting rares. Now we getting some good mods spawning. It's close. We gotta beat Llama. Like I said, it kind of just all depends on a lot, man. There's like a lot of different combinations of things that you could have. There's a lot of things, I can almost promise you, with the people that are jamming uh, like circlets and helms, anything, there's almost certain, almost certainly they're gonna miss something. Like, a lot of people don't understand LLD stuff and what makes it good, like the max rolls that can exist on that. It all depends on like the level rec, the combination of things that are on it. But like I said, a good like general rule of thumb is if you get like a 20 cast or 30 faster run walk, just pause for a minute and look at it. Or two open sockets too. Um, that's a good general rule of thumb. Also, if you find magic helms with 20 exactly 25 uh, damage reduction on them, and they have some other cool stat like skills, they could also be good. Yeah, there's just like, there's a lot of combinations of things that could be very good. 
It's hard to say them all. There we go. Keeping up with the gold find. There we go. No shit, dude. That's crazy. Yeah, I feel like that's just part of any online multiplayer game is sometimes you have people popping in the game that do weird things and troll people. And honestly, in all the games that I've played, well, Diablo 2 has been a big one. Sometimes it's fun to fight back against the trolls. Like, it kind of feels good when someone tries to troll a game and you troll them or you win or they, you know, they hostile and you beat them. Like, that kind of feels good too. It's, it's sort of rewarding on both ends. Dude, that's actually a really good helm done. That's actually really good. Nicely done. GG fine. Where is these fines on our end, man? I hope you guys are submitting the real GG's to Trophy. Hope y'all are submitting the real GG's to Trophy. We might have to do a bonus video. A bonus Trophy Room video. After this little stunt. And I'm certainly going to feature all that stuff. Bonus trophy room video. I mean, hey, it's something new, right? It's something for history. It's got a little bit of history in it. It's got a little bit of news in it. And if it if they have pretty insane trophies to feature in it, well, that'd be pretty good too. Oh wow. This is kinda this is okay, right? Passive and magic, faster run walk, max damage. Uh, I'm going to keep that for LLD. It doesn't look like much, but it's, I don't know, is it good? Nah, because you're trading max damage for two sockets. Yeah, no, it's not good. Trash. I'm going to stop keeping trash. Space is at a premium. We gotta be getting close. We're getting a lot of good mods. Right, that's what we're waiting on away. That's what we're trying to get. That's what we're grinding for. We got some we got some good stuff so far. Uh, I mean, we also have how many hours left? We got like this is going we going all night, boys. Like this is we got plenty of time. I have time on my side right now. I have time on my side, boys. I am not worried the GG's will come. We're gonna get snowed in in the northeast tomorrow too. We're gonna get uh, like a bad snowstorm. Are any of my Canadian friends still in Discord? Are you guys gonna get slammed as well? I'm here for you, Kuli. What up, dude? You're not gonna get fucking slammed. No. Uh, no, I went. <laughs> I just like disappeared for the last 20 minutes. I just went like laid down because my head hurts <laughs> from gambling so much. No, it like I didn't have coffee this morning because I was a dumbass. Yeah, that so, like, was mistake number one. Always didn't have, have coffee. coffee this morning, and then like I've been running around and doing a bunch of shit, and so like haven't been taking care of my eyes, and so my eyes were drying out. 
and like, and then staring at the screen, also not blinking really, and you know, doing gaming shit. Yeah. Um, just like drying out my eyes and staring at screens, and like, so just the headache was compounding, and I was like, uh, I'm just gonna go lay down for a bit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, dude. Yeah, no worries. I actually figured that might happen to me too. Uh, like. I, I feel you, man. Especially with some weird, like when weird shit happens like this, I have learned. Like when some weird thing that makes you feel like when you get, when I got your message and it, I got the feeling like I'm going to abuse this until I can't. <clears throat> when you get that feeling, I shit you not. Best life advice you'll ever hear. Pound coffee. <laughs> Im immediately take Advil. Yeah, that's it. Like, I shit you doing, not. Doing anything, like extra hydrating, drinking coffee, like yeah. doing any preventative thing would have been smart, but like, haven't been drinking coffee, haven't been drinking much water today. So, like, I'm just like all sorts of shitty. Yeah. Well, hey, dude, I hope you feel better after after laying down. There's plenty of gambling to do, bro. Get on it. Oh, yeah. There's, we got we got plenty of items to find. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, I just drank, drank half my. Uh, Half my thing of water, and I grabbed a cookie. I made some cookies last night. Oh, GG, um, dude. Because we were doing we were doing white elephant for work, um, and so I was like, oh, I'll make cookies and then give out cookies and like this other thing that I have. And then I, as I made the cookies and put them on a plate last night, I looked at the plate and went, I can't give people COVID cookies. Like, if someone gave me a batch of homemade cookies right now. I would be like, no, uh, sorry, but I'm just going to throw these right in the trash or re-gift them. Like, I don't know if you have COVID, had COVID when you made these things. Like, I'm not going to. And that like, depends on the type of cookie. Like, if it's chocolate chip cookies or if it's like those peanut butter cookies that have the chocolate chip in the middle of them, uh, it may actually be worth risking getting COVID for them. It just depends on how good the cookie uh, is. Yeah, so those those peanut butter cookies with the with the Hershey kiss in the middle I know exactly which ones you're talking about yeah they're act the there's a real name for them which is peanut butter blossoms that's actually their actual name oh wow it's because they kind of look like a flower um but the best thing is when we were growing up we didn't know what they were called and so we called them nipple cookies because that makes sense <laughs> you that's, know yeah I can see that I don't want to get you demonetized or, or no no I am done I feel like YouTube. that's literally you, there's a lot of shit you could say that's probably not even close to anything. Yeah, I've, I've oh, figured yeah. out, <laughs> I figured out, I've deduced certain things that YouTube doesn't want you to say and looks out for, but I feel like there's such weird things that nobody would say them. I was going to say one of those things, but you can't I, say them. <laughs> yeah, I can't just say them. But, yeah. They're always listening. The government now, and you... Google always listening. Rem remember that because it's true. The government and no. Google, they always listen. Yeah, Holy do shit. you want to know? Okay, do you know You know the soul? The guy that's always here. Dolova, like, the boy. Most oil. Yeah, dude. What, don't you be saying nothing about Dolova. Oh, I'm going to say some shit. All right. Um, go for it. So he's like, he's always hanging around. He's, he's the one that's doing like the promos in the Discord. No one asked him to do it, but he just like, yeah, as a baller, just does it anyway. He's so and dope, dude. Yeah, he just, I like, I always forget that it's a thing and that I should show up and it's just like randomly, he's got this like four paragraph message about the hype for the DFC for the day. I'm like, that's awesome. And then the guy comes in my stream and like first, first day I'm an affiliate, whatever, freaking subs to me. What? what and then do? gives you a sub in my stream. He's such and a I was like, this guy, what what the hell is going on? He's Come to find out, guy. I don't remember what other stream we were hanging out in. Maybe it was CJ's stream. Dude, like, he works. I don't know if, do you know, like, Linus Tech Tips? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, dude works for them. <laughs> really? Yeah, so he does, like, I don't know exactly what he does, but he's like, what? he does some shit with that. And because he, he was like, oh, yeah, I got to go back over to the linus tech tips video thing and i was like, was like ltt <laughs> and i was like i don't know what ltt is he's like oh it's the linus tech tips and i was like oh are you oh in that stream too? And he's like no i'm like producing that stream and i was like what oh shit dude <laughs> i was like you're doing what speaking and, of uh, which uh, w uh speaking of which dude finally set up memberships on the coolie live channel dude i'm pretty pumped oh nice 
Yep, pretty pumped. That's like the equivalent of getting getting it so that people can sub to you on the on the twatch, dude. I I feel pretty good about it. Feeling yeah. feeling good. And in case people were wondering. <laughs> yeah, yeah, in case you guys Twitch, were wondering, you can Twitch do takes that a bunch of money. now. You can Twitch actually takes a bunch do, of money. I hope no one hasn't done it and my notification hasn't gone off or something. That would suck. But it's possible. I'm not saying you have to. There's absolutely no obligation. It just all I'm saying is you can, and that and the support means a lot. Is and here, all I'm here's saying. a here's a teaser. Uh, I may tease this and then it'll never come to fruition, but I'm gonna tease it anyway. Uh, teaser for the people that are in stream right now is Discord subscription slash bonuses. That may or may not come to fruition. <laughs> well, what is it? What what's it again? The Discord thing that I mentioned to you the other day. Oh, I was like, oh hey, yeah. I, no, should, no, I haven't even checked that out yet. Uh, basically, it's it's like it's like uh, um, it's like Twitch where you can you can have subscriptions to your Discord server. Yep. Uh, and then, well, it's not like Twitch. It's like Patreon, where you can subscribe for a certain level every month, and with each level come different uh, rewards that the streamer sets or the yeah. Discord owner sets. So you, you could do, you know, an hour of dueling practice with Cooley or just bullshit time with Cooley or extra video, whatever. Uh, just for everyone, anyone listening in stream, this is me giving him ideas. This is not promising shit. <laughs> yeah, it, it's it's kind of it's tough because that's what the membership perks for like YouTube do as well. They like uh, encourage you to do it that way and to set up membership perks. Oh. Dude, truth be told, it's really cool. But I'll be honest with you guys. I tried to set it up so that there's like a little bit of extra perks for being a member. You know what I mean? But it's not like overwhelming to the point where it's like scary. You know what I mean? Where it's like, oh shit. Because what if I get like 20 members and I'm like, oh, I gotta do, I gotta do all this. I gotta spend 20 yeah, hours. You gotta, like, you gotta have something that's skilling or whatnot. You know what I mean? Like, there's committing time is very scary. Yeah, that's why they recommend like doing a video or like, hey, we give them early access to this or like exclusive content, but not necessarily yeah. like a one on one. But you could do just like a Saturday night bullshit session where you just chill and chat with people, you know, like this. But it's just like, hey, if you get the whatever, if you get the Discord subscription, then from like 7 to 9 p.m. on Saturdays, you can just chill with me, ask any questions you want. But it's like, it's a group thing, so it's almost like a uh, word, yeah. So it's not like a one-on-one -on -one thing where, so like if you if you have one person, it's it works. If you have twenty people, it works. If you have two hundred people, it still works. Yeah, like that's that's the thing too. I also uh, w was I said VIP channel access, so anybody who subs, would they get huh? the VIP channel? Which is kind of cool because it's also like it's Twitch subs, it's YouTube subs, it's, you know, all of this stuff. But the only shitty thing about that is YouTube and Discord don't talk well nowadays. Like they don't, you can't connect them. Like really? I couldn't anyway. Yeah, it's like all fucked up. No, oh, you like, gotta be, there, there was a walkthrough from like two months ago. Yeah, that, it doesn't work. That I, that I linked to you. It, uh, I, I can't do it because it's not my. No, I'd, you like, can't do, do it because you. it doesn't work. Like, no, I can't do it because it's not my YouTube channel. Like, I can't do the integration. <laughs> well, no, the, the uh, it, it also just doesn't work. Like, uh, it, the the button for YouTube doesn't pop up anymore. Like, oh, they they really? completely got rid of it. Yeah. So like, you can't connect. I know exactly what you're talking about, but it's just not there. Like, it won't connect. Interesting. Yep. There's no option to do it. Maybe this one's rolling something new out. Or maybe this is what they were rolling out. Yeah, that or it's yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, like it, it's it's either that or I'm like so stupid and can't figure it out and I'm missing something super obvious. Shirley sent me like a tutorial video for it. I watch it and I even try to figure it out on my own, watch some other sources. And it used to be that you could connect to YouTube pretty easily with Discord so that it could see like subs and all of this stuff. You can't do it anymore. Like it it won't connect easily anymore. Can you? Do you have that link I still? Uh, that, do you still have that link I sent you? Because you might be able to comment. Because it's a Discord.com link from 2022. 
So you might be able to just comment on it if there's comments and be like, yo, this is broken. Yeah, true. And true. just see if, see if Discord even knows that their functionality is broken for a, a walkthrough that they put out there. Right. Because they may not know. You know, it's something true. on the Twitch side might have changed. But I guess you said the button's gone. Fuck but they it, have been dude. patching they have we'll been patching the client a bunch. Did you try it in the web version? No, this is actually what I did. I put as an instruction on the people that, that select that tier. I was like, just let me know in Discord and I'll give you VIP status. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, as soon as you do this and get this message, send me a message with what your YouTube handle is and I'll be able to see that you're a member. And then I'll be like, all right, VIP status. Easy, we got this. I just figured it, that's just easier than trying to figure out what the heck's going on. It's old, old school way. And then if yeah. you sub one, if you do it once, you're a VIP for life. Yep. There's no, there's no checks. It's just like, hey, thanks, man. Appreciate yep, you. There's, there's no longer the follow-up check. <laughs> right, right, exactly. It works for everyone. It's like Amazon Prime, but you just get it forever. Yep. Yeah, that's also something though with YouTube and uh, yeah, who was saying that? So someone was saying in chat about the about the prime subs and stuff like that that's that's certainly something that's a benefit for twitch um do that's they not run ads what? on streams i'm not i'm not 100 percent sure maybe it's just not on my streams because i haven't done it or set it up i'm not 100 percent sure i run it through obs and there's a way to run it through the browser which gives you a bit more options i probably should do that but i guess i didn't care enough I was just like, whatever. We're just gonna jam this. We're just gonna, we're just gonna do it. It's just whatever easier works. to run it this way. I don't like shit when it gets too complicated. Like, I just want to stream. I want to press a button and stream and do this. I don't have to. I, I even have to make a thumbnail for YouTube and all of this shit. It's such a, it's a kind of a pain in the ass. Oh, you I do? Mean, yeah. Yeah. How do you think I, we get these awesome thumbnails every week that that are fucking sweet, that are that are savage? For you boys, Bro, I put in a lot I, of extra work for you boys. I'm not around for your live streams because you start at 2 p.m. on a Thursday, and I work. I have a normal job in, on the West Coast, so you starting at 2 p.m. I was like, sorry, man, can't can't participate. <laughs> so I don't, I don't see your your awesome thumbnails usually. Well, they pop up in the Discord, so you can just check out how awesome they are in the Discord. Okay, they pop up in the. YouTube channel or the streaming channel. And you can be like, holy shit, that looks good. That dude must have spent at least five minutes on that, and you're right. Yo, yo, yo. What up, uh, Oh, I am so glad I didn't oh. say what I was going to say. <laughs> what are you going to say, bro? <laughs> what are you going to say, dude? Nothing. <laughs> what are you going to say, bro? The fuck are you going to say, yeah. Because we were say talking about thumbna thumbnails and stuff. What were you gonna say, bro? The fuck, are you gonna say now? Yeah, I use Photoshop Nothing. redemption. Nothing. Yo, put your money where your mouth is, surely. What were you gonna say, bro? That's right. What I the fuck, Ed's, dude? I love, I love Ed's, uh, Ed's sorcerer's armor. Bro, dude, you fucking blue trolling, dog. Blue dab a dee, bad dab a die. Bro, what are you gonna say, bro? Nothing. Don't back out now, bro. What, what, what is this turned no, into? Is there a fight? Is there gonna out, be a bro. fight breaking out? Fuck right. Fight, dude. fight, fight. We needed, no. we needed some entertainment from the gambling, and here it don't, is, boys. You wanted don't, it. Don't back out, Welcome bro. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. You know what they the say, stream. right? What they say is, don't say something that you don't want, like you know, behind someone's back, bro. That's Fuck right, Shirley. That's Fuck right. Up, and in this corner, we got Shirley. I didn't do serious. nothing to you, bro. I haven't done nothing to you. And you're gonna talk in this shit, corner, bro? we Come got on, Shirley bro. serious. He's gonna, <laughs> he's gonna be busting dude. it out with all of the tech bullshit. And in, the, and in the other corner, we got Ed. He's gonna be busting it out on Photoshop. And these guys are gonna have a war of the words, and they're gonna figure out who has the bigger e penis between these two guys. And here we go. We got some big blows thrown early by Ed. Nothing to say from Shirley. His e penis is shrinking in front of our faces. <laughs> I'll let it. I'll let it shrink. Oh, like someone oh. needs to go to the mall. There's, there's the tap. The Who needs to go to the mall? What? What? It's because that's exactly what it is. Dash. Sometimes it happens. You have to be prepared for anything. 
Why do you think we all do PvP? It's so that any moment we can be prepared for any fucking bullshit that goes on. It's truth. It's truthfully what it is. No, really, there was. I wasn't gonna say anything. I was just keeping. They're lying, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Ed, have you done any gambling? Of course, then of course. Oh my god, you got anything? No. Trash. Oh my god, me neither. Not a, it's been trash. like a, a 20, straight, 20, straight 30 trash. minutes straight of straight trash for me. I'm, 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 I'm refilling up on the, on the, on the gold. Oh my god. Uh, how are you refilling? You doing? You doing the glitch? Glitch gold? Yeah, glitch I'm re yeah. refilling, bro. Gotta refill too. Refill, and then we gotta replaylist it. Dude, we've been blowing through some Dude, playlists. it's like horrible. I've been trying to find a good server. Can't find shit, dude. I'm so mean, happy like, I'm on you. Ping? No, like a, like a good, you know, a good seed, bro. Check out the items and shit, oh, dude. The gosh. fucking conspiracy, you know? Yeah, dude, I'm so happy that you're on board with this conspiracy theory. Uh, dude, yeah, they'll remind your stream, Cooley, about perfect items, okay? That's right. Ed has learned to okay. never doubt my conspiracy theories. Okay, bro, the last okay. time, The last time this happened... We rolled perfect. perfect CTAs, perfect spirits, perfect. Oh, oh my perfect god, it was shit, perfect, bro. dude. Perfect spirits, perfect CTAs, everything, dude. We were rolling perfect room words. I was like, I was like, Ed, this might not make a lot of sense. Like, this might seem really weird, but I have this theory that I think rune words will roll perfectly if you do this. And, and he's the, just like, nah, tick tack, bro. yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's like, nah, bro, that ain't gonna work. That ain't gonna work. And then I was like, well, watch, I'll just do it on this. I'll just do it on this insight. And then just boom, boom. 17 med perfect ED. Yeah. I was just like, see, dude, I think it works. And then like we we spent that whole morning rolling like six six CTAs, fucking perfect yeah, spirits. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, dude, I'm telling you, like, but then I think they patched it or something, like. They had to do something because it gave, didn't work. Yeah, I mean it was working for like ten games straight. Yeah, like, it was, it was lie, probably bro. working. I think it was working. We actually ended up getting a ton of views on that stream too. So I think like we ended up attack like uh, attracting some negative attention to it, and Maybe. people were probably like, "You always have the naysayers." So instead of going and doing it themselves, we're like, "Oh, I'm yeah, we were doing tell. it live. We were doing it live, and it was working." So I don't know. Yeah, we did it live, dude. It was pretty dope. I think I probably still have the clip somewhere. I think I maybe I put it on Facebook, but that means I it still have it saved. It was a Facebook stream. I was there for it. It was a Facebook stream, yeah. Because yeah. I bought, I had an Omeroon and I had you roll a six six, or it was like a six four four. No, yeah, yeah. sorry, a four six four or something. Um, and then you also rolled like two or three spirits for me. Yep. yep. They were all perfect, perfect cast. Yeah, it was dope, dude. It, it was so epic. I I couldn't believe it, honestly. I need a 15% gi, dude. I only have an 11 percenter reduced from the from the vendors. Talk to Joby. He's already sold one to the vendor today. Dude. That's probably why Joby left the chat. He probably at least no one sold the probably char seed the the charm I let him borrow. He's like char seed the charm. Why? Why would like? I guess because you're like uh, when you're when you're when you're doing the circlets, you misclick. I'm assuming, eh? Yeah. Yeah. I do. I do what you do, uh, Cooley. I put things in front of the fuck. In front yeah, of the yeah, God that's what it is. Heed, bro. So these guys want to know that. These guys want to know the trick. These guys want to know what we were doing. So it was. It was super weird. It was very weird, and it didn't make any sense. All right, but this is what we were doing. I'll, I'll uh, right let me buy these rings back, and I'll try to go to the stash and show you. I'll buy these Amies. Like, let me let me stock up so I don't lose these. But I'll actually show you like what we were doing when we rolled the rune words. So like the first trick, the first part of the trick was you would have to restart your client, restart your battle net client, exit out of the client itself, like the launcher, everything, exit out of it, restart it, immediately fire up the game and join a game that your friend has created, right? From there, you go to your stash and you roll everything in the stash except for the last rune. And then you put the item in your stash, walk away from your stash and put the final rune in. I was like, don't ask me why, but I was like, it just works. Like you make most of it here and then just like after freshly firing up the client, like make most of it in the stash, then walk away, slam the last rune and boom, it rolls perfectly. And he was just like, there's no way that works. I was like, I know it sounds weird and doesn't make any sense, but I was like, check this out. 
and then just like we just started slamming perfect rune words with it. Like you got that BOTD o- spear over... war pike for it. Yeah, the, the BOTD war pike, fucking everything. Like the only thing that didn't work oddly was Hodos. They would always roll thirties. They would roll anti perfect always, but everything else but, just boom perfect, perfect, perfect. Like but we also so we're talking weird. about like it wasn't it always wasn't the first stat. It was always one stat was rolling perfect, and so the one or we two, theor- yeah. Yeah, so we theorized that perhaps the charges were rolling perfectly, and that's what was throwing it off because charges. That's true. That's true. Yep. Because uh, always the charges were full. Yeah, yeah, and then you do the hokey pokey. That's exactly what it felt like. Dude, exactly how long you been fucking? Was. How long you been gambling, dude? Okay, ever <laughs> since I don't know. Uh, ever since I've been. Ever since I texted him. You got anything or no? Yeah, it's been six hours, bro. You got nothing? Uh, no, I got some stuff, dude. No, he oh, got that uh, that eighteen circlet. Yeah, we got the level. The best thing so far is the level 18 circlet that rolled 20 faster run walk, 30 ED, perfect 30 ED. Oh, nice. Yeah, so we just got to get two socks. I got something. On I got something, but like, I don't think it's worth a lot, but I got something. Dude, I've actually had to piss for six hours. I got a 13020 LLD Necrohome. Yeah, yeah, it surely yeah, was pretty. killing it with the LLD stuff earlier. Yeah, then I switched to HLD and I've gotten garbage. That's yeah, you might be right, Tugs. You might be right. What? Ooh. Yeah. He says it's time for a drink, and I think he's right. Yeah, I'm having a fucking double double spro right now, dude. Little fucking mm-hmm. little caffeine action. Mm-hmm. I'm yeah, gonna, I'm gonna I'm need something I'm to keep me going. A fucking, I'm pulling a nighter, bro. Dude, same here. Uh, you think I'm, I'm fucking I'm giving deep, up dude. on this? I'm Fuck going no, deep, bro. Yeah. You th- I'll be here all fucking night, bro. I might deep. actually have to brew up some coffee. Yeah, like, I'm, 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 I'm on coffee right now, dude. Like that's the thing. I want to drain it deep though. It's only 10 p.m. right now. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. oh, boys. Oh, oh. I just knew it'd be a matter of time. You just have to wait sometimes, and you just have to, you just have to drink. You just have to have a <laughs> sip every once in a while. You and then what eventually you, you get some shit. Time. You get some shit. 220? 2320? 220 20 with min damage and cold res, boys. Wow, dude. Yeah, yeah. Breaking the loot vendor. Go Gators trash. <laughs> Fuck yeah. That's the open sockets. Trash. No no two sockets, trash. That's, that's pretty good, bro. That's okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, I think I actually am gonna make a, a set up for the main for the main din this is actually really good uh because you want the faster run walk the cast the paladin yeah. skills yeah. and the the cold resist against the cold sorceress you want all of this and the min damage because when you connect with them because you have to charge and you have to charge down a cold sorceress with the, the murdered end so this is like so good this is this is awesome That's yeah sure it would be better with two sockets but whatever dude still that's dope i'm pretty dude. i'm pretty pumped about that yeah, we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna keep it. I was gonna make a Telly Zealer, bro. Is that a thing? Oh, uh, yeah, it is. Yeah, Definitely people have done that. Be, yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah, it's the same. It's similar to a Sorceress. Like a, a Telly Zealer, yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah. Jimmy's Zeals and Teleports. I think I might I think I might make one. I have a 2020, uh, what's it call it? Uh, Paladin Torch. You might as well put it to use. And fuck you BT, have a I can't. 2020 Paladin Torch? Yeah, I can't play BT, bro. Yeah, bro. I got 2020. It's beautiful. Bro, I got loaded up, dude. I sold my grief, bro. Sold my grief for like 27k. Where do I put should, the dollar bills? One? Dude, there should be a button that's called that says join. But if not, dude, if not, there's like you can Streamlabs donate too. That's actually Stream. better, eh? Yeah, I think it's actually the better way to go mm-hmm. about it. Mm-hmm. Like, if you go Streamlabs, I should actually put this in like the. You should the put that in a. Shit. Yeah, you should yeah. put a. Dude, let me, exclamation oh, mark a, donate, bro. Yeah, I gotta get that <laughs> shit set up, dude. I'm giving um, cool, cool stream yeah, well, the plug, I'm fucking, bro. Cat, I'm fucking slacking, <laughs> boys. All right, this is what it is, though. Let me, let me link. I'm actually gonna put it in the description. Nice. Yeah. I don't know how YouTube, like, uh, is it the same as Twitch, Cooley? Like, um, the chat and all that shit, like OBS works the same. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put, nice. I'm gonna post it there. Yeah, there you go. Does that pop up? You guys see, can you guys see that? Yeah, bam. Yeah, I can see that. Cooley cool. tip, yeah. Cool, cool. That's cool. 
Like I, I don't know how YouTube. Uh, like I'm, I've been on Twitch. Like whenever I stream, I just Twitch it up, bro. I have to try it on YouTube. Let me see. Let me see if I can. It probably won't let me. Uh... The uh, clone is dropping at 7 PST. When is that in Eastern Standard? 10 o'clock? It's right now. Yeah, oh, right fuck, now. bro. Uber, Diablo. Is it going? Terror approaches the sanctuary. It's not, Dude, it's we not going. We ain't fighting it. Like, fuck Uber, Diablo. It's probably going to be on ladder anyway. Is yeah, it ladder or non ladder? It's zero is ladder. Rod, Roddy, is it ladder, bro, or what? Yeah. Like 95% or ladder. Oh, fuck, it's fucking like ladder, dude. Yeah. There's no fucking way they're doing that, dude. He's gonna be gambling. They're probably popping D clone purposely because they're like, yeah, because so, all, all the server, the shit. server ticks, bro. Oh my god, man. It looks like it's normal now, though. My ping is actually returned to semi normal. It still bounces to like over 100 every once in a while, but like it was 150, 140, 150 pretty consistently. Yo, if you're, uh, if you're bored of, of circlet dude, gamble claws. Yeah. Or all the, you know, the little, the little yeah. nasty, your, your arch nemesis is, dude, the five. nasty sins, bro. The nasty sinners, the little sin no, boys. Uh, no. But it's just so, you have like that exact claw that you have to get. Otherwise, it's just. Yeah, like, I know, I know, I know, I know. Like, that's what sucks. The, the thing I like about circlets is you have to look at them. There's so many things that could actually that spawn happen. on them. Yeah. Like that can make them good. Granted, it's 99.9% .9 trash, but like you can get some good ones, man. I wonder how much 15% uh, geeps is. It's probably a lot right now because you got people geed. char seeing them. Oh no, dude, here we go, 25. Bin the 21. Dude, are you uh, are you ladder or non-ladder brand? Me? Oh. I, 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 might, I might have one somewhere. Dude, I'm just gonna bin this 21, dude. This guy doesn't know. Give it to me, dog. Three minutes ago. Oh my god, look, people are trying to sell them for 15. 15, 150 FG, dude. What? Oh my yeah. god, dude. Yeah. Are those, I mean, those, that's a smart person, though. That's like, I mean, did you know the in, in game well. gold went up, bro? You know that, right? What did? The ratio of a 10 million in game gold, they used to get 20 FG. Yeah. Now they're selling it for 50 to 100 now. Yep. Yeah, no doubt. Yeah, just for today, I guess. Oh, there's actually real people that are messaging me. <clears throat> Where? For what? Uh, I don't want to be rude. Don't want to be rude. Yeah, I IRL. That's what I meant. IRL peeps messaging me. You guys are also IRL peeps. I should say you want me to know really what I meant to say because I kind of feel bad. Uh, the the. The people on my telephone are messaging me, and I really don't ever pay attention to that. I'm always, like, checking Discord and shit, and, and chat, and YouTube comments, and I'm just like, who, why do I need a phone these days for calls and text messages and the Facebook messenger and shit? Like, I get, I'm so late on, like, all, on answering all of that shit. I feel like I've left, I feel like that's a piece of my life I've left behind. Because you boys are the only fucking ones that I care about. You're the only ones that really understand the important things in life. Like gambling circlets all fucking night because Battle.net fucked up. Do you think my mom understands that? Do you think 
no, female bro. prospects understand that? Nope. Do you think, like, people I work with or worked with IRL understand that? No, they fucking nope. don't. But this is, truthfully, the only place I'd want to be right now. The only place my attention deserves to be. Yeah, dude. You gotta get the fucking, gotta get the juice, bro. Oh, GG. All right, yeah, I got you, bro. Uh, hold, hold on uh, with this, with the Sork Torch. I got you, dude. Let me check what I got. It might not be anything special. I want to use a Sork Torch. Uh, yeah, yeah. He canned his torch accidentally. Oh no, dude! I had a 1916. Yeah. I could have gave for free, but it's gone now. Yeah, it's a 1417, bro. It's like really not anything special, but uh. Yeah, join, uh, dude, send me a message in Discord. I'll send you game name password. No, no need to give gold, bro. We, 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 got, we got plenty. my game name right. oh damn it where's maddie Matthew. he's gone bro maddie's gone you need Matthew. to play starcraft like a noob they're probably asleep bro yeah fucking no he he texted me and said he went to go play starcraft oh yeah oh speaking of which dude uh dirty just started up a starcraft 2 server is that like a new thing nah it's not new but a lot of people have been playing it dog it's like weird i don't know oh, shit. it's like an old game yeah, watch those guys yeah. from the D2R PvP, whatever. They've been playing it. No shit, dude. Word. It's not a new game. It's very old. All right, it's hold on. It's free, though. I'm going to buy up all these amulets until Brand leaves so that they don't poof like they did with Joby. Yeah, I think they, le they poof when someone leaves the game. Yeah. I'll be right back one sec. GG. All right, now we can sell this stuff. And he dropped a circlet. Check this out. It's not oh, much, bro, but it's oh, something to make up for it, you know? It's something to make up for it. Oh, look at that. What a generous donation. It's about as good of a circlet as that was a torch, though, to be fair. So, but it's pretty good. Yeah, no problem, dude. No problem. I got you. Yeah, I feel like the LLB stuff for me is where it's at. It's certainly fun. Whatever you enjoy gambling and get the most, like, joy out of seeing is certainly where you should be. I get the most joy out of this because I'm like, there's so many circlets that I could get. It's also goes for amulets, too. I was thinking I could get a really good gold find amulet when I was gambling those, but then I remembered I have the nastiest gold find amulet on Battle.net, I'm pretty sure, like, or at least one of them, and it's not even barb skills, but it's just probably one of the nastiest gold find. Like, you, you just can't really get much better. It's like 20 cast, 72 gold find, 20 all res, and it, it also doubles as a fire sorceress amulet. <laughs> it's kind of sweet. Like, you can't really get much better than this. Like this is this is pretty solid. So Oh yeah, that's that's nice. Like, I'm not really sure what I'd be aiming for really. Like what's gonna replace that. But circlets on the other hand, you can get sick circlets for gold fine, you can get sick ones for PvP. I'm gonna be walking around town tomorrow and hearing noises thinking someone is selling amulets. Yeah, dude, that's what it is. This shit's gonna haunt you, dude. Like, I'll pr it'll probably be the same thing. I'll, I'll be hearing gold selling sounds and gold dropping sounds whenever I do decide to sleep tomorrow. That's how it's going to be. I'm too fast for the server. I'm getting the, the slowdown. Just got to keep rolling the dice. Just got to keep rolling them dice. Jeez. <laughs> Oh, you did? All right, I'll check it. I'll check it. Hold up. Hold up. Okay, so the great thing about rolling LLD circlets 
is when you sell all this, you know, the 40 amulets, you get way too much gold to hold. You get, oh, yeah. you know, 120,000. So you just, it just all falls to the ground and you gamble all the gold away and then take two steps and you're full again. Yeah, go <laughs> uh, that, that wasn't a mistake. I think it was the matchup. There was, I think there were some people, maybe a couple of duels I switched just because it was like the only person that made sense in the matchup and a druid was an absolute shutout for them. So I like had to switch to people that I knew could play other characters. My bad, dude. I meant to say something about that actually start a stream and then we had like all of this crazy shit happen. Yeah, my bad, dude. There was a there was a couple of people. I was going to say that at the start of the event, but then like all of this shit went down. Hey, this isn't bad. Yeah, then we then we started gambling our nuts off, dude. But yeah, there was like a couple of matchups that I switched because they were the only things that made sense and the opponent either either only dueled on that character and if they dueled a druid it was just like so lopsided so i was like yeah okay my bad dude dude i feel like this is pretty cool yeah like this is pretty dope i'm keeping that i'm not sure what it's worth but it's probably worth something yeah, that's actually really okay. Yeah, so on a Zon, that's like uh, that's basically one percent enhanced damage on a Zon. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Easy. Yeah, that's really good. <clears throat> okay, whoo! All right, we got it. We got something. Got something keep keep worthy, and that's perfect too. Thirty thirty uh, thirty dex is perfect on that. Perfect roll. Which is good, because otherwise, it would have been trash. We gotta clip that, because we gotta beat Llama somehow. And that we're gonna beat him with helms like that, that actually have value in the community, that aren't, that aren't subpar. 3 OS, 30 dex helm. Yup. Like, I feel like... I was wondering if I was going to have enough material to make a Christmas special, but this might push us over the top. This might actually just be bonus material. Like, this might be like, hey, remember that time Battle.net fucked up? We abused it. Okay, it's not Battle.net, though. It's dev It's the devs. Yeah, remember that time the devs? Well, I don't know, dude. It's like they're, they're doing stuff like this for all of the Diablo games, so it could... It could be. Yeah, who knows? But either way, some, you remember that time somebody fucked up? Is this keepable? Three to lightning skills, 31 MF. No. Are you sure? Yeah. Because if that gets two sockets, that's like G, F, and G, right? For Could be 35. Build? Could be 35. Trash. MF is trash. Oh, for what build? MF is trash. We're going to put two, two Togazes in there? trash we've already trashed it you talked me into it we trashed it i'm not done talking trash about it charcy shaco better yep agreed you sold that fuck yeah i did dude it's trash it was trash it was only Trash good. Resounded. It only looked good because we haven't found shit in forever. I should. I take that back. We found a three socket thirty dex helm, which is pretty sick. Now that I think about it, now that it's confirmed that that is indeed enhanced damage, I thought it might be, but I wasn't sure. Now that that's confirmed, that's probably the sickest find so far. Not gonna lie. Put a couple. 40 15s the three three 40 15s up in that bitch she'd be hitting like a truck on your bow is on but theoretically rares can get 30 decks too so you could have like 230 30 two open socket right is that possible yeah two's on hold on we got to figure out it, what is dex? Is it a prefix or is it a suffix? 30 dex. Is it? Uh, well, look at your thing. What is it? It's a suffix. 
Artisans, yeah, so it's a suffix. Yep, okay. Um, so you have prefix. No, uh, yeah, that could happen. Because you could have 30, the 30 faster run walk is a suffix. The cast is a suffix. No, you couldn't do it. Because two, yeah, you could. Because uh, artisans, or no, mechanics is a prefix. Two Zon skills is a prefix. Yeah, you certainly could do it. It could, it could certainly happen. Wow, that's kind of cool. So yeah, I mean, it's good. So you're saying 230, 30, 30? Yeah, yeah, 230, 20, 30. Oh, you still want the cast in there? Yeah. Why not? Because yeah, actually, that was that was that was the remember that fake helm that was like that they they there was this fake helm that they said sold for like oh, I don't know five thousand dollars or I don't know it, it, there was some fake Zon helm that was that I, it was on one of the trophy room videos as like an almost like hey but we figured out this was fake it that actually could have been real. It was 230, 20, 2 open socket, 30 decks. Yeah, gotcha. so it's, it's certainly possible. Right, we need to gold find a little bit. I'm glad we did that with the amulets because they certainly did poof. The extra amulets that were in there poofed. Glad we grabbed those. Oh, when he left the game? Yep. Not sure why, but they did. Uh, yeah, so now I'm curious. If someone leaves the game and someone else has the trade window open, does it refresh right then or does it wait? Does it not refresh at all? Not sure. There's, there's, if that's there's, if there's a steel reference thing that happens when someone's leaving the game. <laughs> I wonder if there are any D2R players who are psychiatrists for a living who are gonna write a paper on the day people clicked on pixels for 24 hours to get better pixels. I feel like you might have just smoked your lunch, but that is a very deep thought. Is his, is his name Jack Handy? That's, that's like a, hey, I just smoked my dinner type fucking intellectual thought. <laughs> but very true. Deep thoughts with Jack Handy. Uh, yeah, it has to be level 30 for, uh, for LLD. If it's 31, it's MLD, and now you're competing with some savage shit. Yeah, you can have skillers at that point. Yep. Because those are all 42. Rares can only get 20 decks, really? You sure, Max? Oh, oh, yeah, you might be right, actually. I might be going fucking crazy. I think I'm going, I think I'm legit going crazy. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. So that's actually a really good helm, then. I can't even talk shit about it anymore. There's like no exceptions. That's just a really good helm in a lot of ways. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You sent it in Discord? Hold on, what's, what's your username on there? Oh, sick. Someone sent me a... Uh, I'll check this one out. This one's kind of... Oh, it's basically a 220 Paladin circlet with 28 enhanced damage. That's kind of cool. Oh, nice. I don't know, dude. I don't know. He lost. I don't know. I guess it was a fair matchup. He went up against Elite on a Necro Go Gators, and it was 5-4. Uh, he won against Elite, but uh, but also the rules have changed since that duel, so he has to be the aggressor. So I honestly think you still have it. Like, you have a good shot. It's, like, actually a fair duel. Uh, the LLD Emmy, the one with... Uh, 
is that the Dreadwing? Is that the one you're talking about? Yeah, that's not bad actually. If that's if you're Hellboy, that's not bad. It would ideally be two P and B. You talking about this one? No. Let, me, let me try to bring it over. You talking about you talking about this one? Yeah, this this could be plus two P and B, but otherwise this is really good. Ten replenish life is perfect. Sixty life is perfect. Um, 40 cold reds is perfect, but cold reds is really desirable at LLD, and 10 casts is almost necessary on all necros. So yeah, this is this is really good. Certainly worth something. Don't get don't get lowballed for it. But uh, hard telling exactly what it's worth because LLD is a you know it's weird when it comes to that stuff. But yeah, that's really good. Did you just gamble that? No, anybody can join. Um, there should be a link on the main page of Cooley Live and the, the the main page of Cooley. But I haven't set it up with the commands yet. I think I got confused or something. I might need Shirley Sirius' help. What? With, with uh, YouTube chat. Otherwise, I would have it so you could hit exclamation Discord and it pops up with a Discord invite. But as of right now, it's on the it's just, it's just on the main page. Yeah, anybody can join. No, it's definitely not trash. If people are telling you it's trash, it's just because they're trying to lowball you. They're trying to they know you don't know anything about LLD, and they're just trying to get you to go down on the price or something or give it up for cheap. But that that's actually really good. To all the people that are talking trash about it, I would accept no less than like 2K. Fuck them. Oh, thanks, Maddie. What a guy. Who needs who needs commands when we've got Maddie? Maddie, what a good guy. Thanks, man. I appreciate you. That was really nice of you. Maddie left us though. What a good dude. Oh, I gotta do some more gold finding. I gotta take a piss, dude. I've had to piss, but I don't wanna I don't wanna take a break. Yeah, my ping is up four hundred again. Is it really? Yeah, mine's getting high. Seven fifty. Holy shit. Dude, everybody's hitting it, man. Everybody's doing it right now. All right, BRB boys. I, oh, I have, I've had to piss for six, seven no. fucking hours. What? Did you get DC'd? You get DC'd? You just got banned. I did. did you get banned? No, no I got DC'd. account banned. No, I got DC'd, but I lost all my amulets because oh, they were yeah. all in the trade trade window, so they were all oh, gone. Oh shit! Fuck. Oh shit! Oh damn! Oh my god! I have to piss, dude. Alright, BRB boys. Alright, should I go steal all Cooley's amulets now? <laughs> <laughs> Do it. I already did it once and now I feel bad. <laughs> I should like, gamble my own again. A good troll is always fun. Find anything, GG? Oh my god. Oh my god. Good barb circlet.
so I think I hit a record, Cooley. What? You hear what? I think I hit a record. For what? What do you mean? The highest ping. Uh, yeah. I got I got 750. I thought that was a lot. I took a screenshot, posted it in your Discord. I was like, wow, I feel like this is a record. Not three seconds later, I got 1,093. <laughs> That's impressive, dude. I'm very And then impressed. I got DC'd. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, when you're lagging over one second between transactions, the server doesn't like you and thinks yeah. you're doing bad things and so disconnected me. <laughs> it says, you know what? Why don't you try again later? That's what yeah, it says. Like, hey, you're why, not don't you, so why don't you take a little bit of a break? Oh, wait. Did my... Oh, yeah. My Zon got kicked out again. <laughs> wow, dude. Hello. What the hell's going on? Yeah, it's not good. Why do you sell and buy amulet? Uh, it farms gold. So, I got a pretty sweet circlet gambling. No way, what'd you get? Plus two paladin skills, 20 faster cast rate, 10 faster hit recovery, 90% bonus attack rating based on character level, adds 23 to 46 fire damage, damage reduced by four. Ain't not bad, dude. It's an, it's an odd one because Usually the Vizzo mod, you'd like want to see that on either a stats or like a like a two socket like melee style helm. But the good thing about Paladin helms is there's probably a use for it somewhere. Like that's, that's insane. That's cool, man. And the faster hit recovery too. GG. Good find, man. And then the other highlight of my thing is. It, it could have been better, but I'm only keeping it because it's my first ever rare circlet. Um, plus one shadow discipline, six two minimum damage, plus 102 attack rating, 19 strength, magic reduce or magic damage reduced by three, and socket uh, two open socket. Nice dude. Yeah, the uh, druid summon uh, 20 faster cast. To tell you the truth, I don't think there's a lot of people building like summon druids like they're not really that great so it's very interesting but otherwise is it otherwise is really cool it's probably not worth shit but it's a cert it's like a cool it's a cool circlet i used to raid on wow eu during firelands heroic progress while i was in australia thank goodness for playing a healer in tunneling software because else my ping would have been unplayable there's certain builds that kind of allow you to get away with like a certain playstyle. That is, high ping is more forgiving for the playstyle. Oh, and I joined, I, I joined Joby. I accidentally sold my 20, 15, 10 Annie charm. Dude, everybody's doing it, man. Everybody's misclicking. It's crazy. It's crazy. Except Cooley. Y'all want some lessons on how to not misclick? Watch this stream, bro. Just watch this. I'm I, I actually, fucking I exhausted. Follow. I'm fucking exhausted over here. My eyes are like kind of closing, but you know what I'm not doing? Misclicking. I, I actually followed suit with uh, Shirley. Uh, I'm doing the whole uh, not have anything in my thing and just fell up my thing with circlets. Makes sense. So, Cooley, I. I I feel Sick, like there's I'm... more testing that's needed, um, but the potential for oh, interesting. Um, there's a potential for uh, some sort of um, stale buffer, stale stale reference in this game. Uh, so, is it with selling certain items that don't no. sell? No. Um, so if you like, let's say it, nobody's gonna know how to. And if somebody from this chat figures out how to abuse a stale reference, I count that as a win. I don't know how to do it yet, but like if yeah. if you open a trade window with Jamela, she's got amulets in there. If yep. you leave the game, those will poof. If you have that open and someone else leaves the game, they're still there. But as soon as you close the, tr close the trade window, they will poof again. Yeah, that's what I noticed. Yep. 
So I'm curious if you have that open, I join your game, then leave, then rejoin your game. Those are like barely existing. And as soon as you close that window, they will poof. What if I sell something to her then? What happens to that item? Can I then like buy it back and just buy multiples of it? Cause it's like not really existing. I feel like that's not necessarily a stale reference. It's just, it could just be that after you close the window, it just wipes. Like it's there and then just wipes. I feel like it's not necessarily a stale reference. There's not really much that you could do with it, I wouldn't think. It's probably just a, like it works the same way as to whether or not like, you know how you can't identify shit sometimes? Like it takes like a million attempts to do it. It's because the player count has changed in the game. So it just like before you ID it, it checks is player count the same for whatever reason. If not, then don't identify. Like okay, when you exit out, is player count the same? Nope. Wipe the, you know, reset the, reset everything. That's just probably what it does. It probably works the same way. Yeah, there's like some weird shit going on with player counts and games that like fucks shit up. Did anybody else kill the D clone that spawned while you guys were doing this? <laughs> LOL. <laughs> LOL. Negative D clone. Hey, 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 I had to go kill mine because I sold my anti charm. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. I ended up getting like an 1876 out of it. 181776 ain't no bad, dude. That's pretty good. Quantum mechanics coming into play here, where existence is based on chance. That's exactly what it is. Hey guys, we found a godly helm. Look at this, look at this fucker. Think we should stash that or? Hmm. It's got MDR on it. 200 ED. Shit. I gotta I, I totally forgot. I gotta keep a constant supply of electricity to this electronic cigarette. After today the D2 economy is the same, but every single noob will have a 22032 open socket res on top of whatever normal gear they had. Here's the thing, man, there's nothing more simple in this life than separating a fool from his good items in D2R. So like when you have a <laughs> fool right and they find they find one of those items and they gamble themselves a 23022 open socket they're just like fuck yeah man i'm rich now like pretty soon they'll give it up for cheap Be like, oh i can't sell this thing everybody's got one now i guess i'll just chuck it on the ground i guess i'll just sell it for 1k some guy said something to me once that pissed me off and said that my gear sucks, so I'm going to just... You know what? Fuck it. I'll sell it for 500 There's going to be a lot of that shit going on. You just have to be patient. Man, you, you know, if that was the case, I would have given up on Origins a long time ago. <laughs> Man, I need to find something good. It's been too long. I just got a 1375 ping spike. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing, hacking? Uh, yeah, it, it's, it's pretty sad when my FPS is almost as high as my ping. Wait, no, other way around. They're, they're gonna, you guys are hacking. Yeah, I need to do gold finding. Found. I've noticed I, I'm falling behind on my gold finding here, boys. I gotta, and with all these shit circlets we're getting, it's time to, it's time to find some cool. Working hard. Yeah, I hit 1375 and I dropped my character from the game. Now I can't rejoin a game. Damn, dude, that's fucking crazy. I wonder yeah, what's I going know. on. If it's just like server server lag or something out there, or what the hell's up? Like, just too many people doing this. <laughs> Fuck it. Probably. Too many people well, what gambling? time is it now? Yeah, it's 7:30. This servers. is like normally the time that. The internet gets pretty bad out this, out this way. Yeah, I was gonna say, that's probably everybody's out of work. It's Friday night, they're all watching Netflix and chilling. 
they're gaming, they're ga probably, I'm gonna guess 90% of the people out that way are actually on Battle.net right now gambling amulets. Um, yeah, it's that's probably close. It doesn't seem like it is, but I would guess it's close. It's closer to Silicon Valley than I am anyway. So everybody's all tech savvy, and they know that this is the abuse case of a lifetime right here. They're gonna get uh, on that. Well, people around here are farmers and shit. I'm not yeah, any I, I didn't. I, I, did, I didn't even know about that. Yeah, I'm getting a steady like, 30, 40 ping, no problems. So it might just be the server you're on. Yeah, it's at 1200 again. Yeah, I have 125 ping pretty consistently in this game, so it could have connected to a bad server. Uh, and believe it or not, this stream hasn't really dropped a lot of frames. It hasn't said that it's dropped a lot of frames. This is like the best stream I've had in a fucking week. Like, so, and this is like a terrible connection to the server. So it tells me that like, yeah, it's probably, we're just on a bad server or something. I'm not exactly sure well, what's like, going on, but. I was fine and then suddenly my ping got absolutely horrendous and then now, like what I'm you guys playing EverQuest? <laughs> yeah, we're on the a never-ending quest to find GG circlets. That's yes, basic. dude. Yes, thank you. What's Double up, boys? Team. What are we doing? Gamble, bro. What? What? Uh, how do? Is that even a question? Why are you not gambling, dude? I love gambling, dude. It's a problem. You should be gambling right now. I am gambling. My wife doesn't know. Shh, don't tell her, please. There you go. We're not, we need, you come to the right place. You shut the fuck up and find some good shit and post it in trophy. That's all we, that's all we're trying to do right now. We need to beat Llama. You think we're going to beat Llama if we're all jerking our fucking dicks and talking about shit? We got to be oh, gambling. Yes, dude, always yes. ABG, ABG, yes, dude. always be gambling. You're a fucking legend, dude. What we gotta God do? Damn. Fucking legend. Like tonight, if the wife says anything, if she wakes up and she's like, "I told you not to get on that fucking game," you need to tell her. You need to say. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna fucking to tell say. Her. I'm gonna tell her no. I'm gonna say fucking my boy Cooley wants to fucking talk to you. And she's like, "What are you talking about?" I said, "Put her get on the, the goddamn phone and I'll, I'll tell her what's up, dude. You put her on the you put her on the horn and I'll tell I'm her." I'm gonna what's say. Up. I'm gonna say this motherfucker has over 50k of subs on fucking YouTube. All right, he's a fucking D2 legend. All right, I'm going. None of that matters me. though. It, I don't care. Look yeah, on whatever. this channel, we got 1,300 subs, and I'm I feel just as good about it because I would tell her the same thing. You tell her tonight is a gambling night. Say like, babe, Ooh. I don't have time to explain it to you. It wouldn't make sense if I did, and Ooh. even if it did make sense and I told it to you, you wouldn't agree with it. But you Ooh. just have to trust me. Marriage is all about give and take, and tonight Damn. you're gonna have to give, and you're gonna have to <laughs> give a lot. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. And you're just gonna have to trust. That's why you're gonna oh. have to just say it like that, man. Just and if you don't make a big deal out of it, they won't. Just feel like it's not a big deal, it just has to happen and, and we've gotta trust. I'll mow the lawn uh. tomorrow or something. Just that. Or I'll, I'll, if you're up if you live up this way, just be like, I'll plow the driveway tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> yes, dude. Yes. What a right. fucking that was, that was a legendary fucking. Hope you uh, hope this is like recording or some shit. Like, like post it on a, the Go next stuff. Go get it. Says, come talk to my wife. <laughs> Cooling gives some marriage advice. <laughs> I don't know if you want to take any advice from this channel. Oh, uh, dude. So, I somehow. Know. Somehow, like earlier, we were talking about uh, finding editors, and before you know it, we were talking about acquiring kids. Uh, like it was, oh yeah, <laughs> it was just like right, doesn't dude. you know? It's just it doesn't sound right. Yeah, yeah. This is what I mean. Like, careful where you go with that. You know what I mean, like, cause if you told if you told your you wife like, nah, man, like you, you got to be careful. That's fine. Cause if you told your wife, you're like, nah, man, I was listening to what Cooley said. You know what I mean? He's got good advice. And then she like tunes in and she finds this part of the stream. That's just like, well, the goal says acquire children. And like, it oh didn't exclude kidnapping from it. And she's going to be like, don't ever fucking mm. listen. I don't want good you point. talking to good this point. guy again. Mm. 
Like, you know what I mean? So you just gotta just take just take it. Don't take anything out of context. Just tonight. Um I'm not a retard, the, bro. Come yeah, on. tell the wife. Tell the wife it's not tonight. Yeah, yeah that's, bro. That's like we're fucking that's gambling cold. tonight, dog. Us. We're we're fucking gambling, dude. Always right. gambling in here. Always. Right. ABG. ABG. Oh, we're fucking gamble. llamas. Llamas and a fucking little pussy. Always I mean, he's have a game open. Oh my god. Great. We're gonna we're gonna have to collectively crush llama. He already sent me a ton of circlets that he has found, and they're fucking insane. They're like godly. Llama's so, a fucking pussy. He, he, we're gonna make him look bad, dude. We're gonna find this community is gonna find a ton of shit. It, he's off to he's probably off to a good start. He sent me that shit like. I don't know, four hours ago. Oh, he's it's... a pussy. We got nah, this. dude, you say that, but like, you see the circlets he fucking gambled. Your e penis is gonna shrink four inches immediately. You're gonna be Bro. like, you're gonna be like, shit, dude. I spent how many hours and I haven't even touched that. My e my e penis shrunk. It's I'm fucking, I'm fucking wasted. I don't give a fuck. I'm fucking, I'm a fucking grower. I'm not a fucking shower. Like, fucking read about it's fun. Fuck, fuck Llama, dude. He's yeah, he's a I legend. He's an absolute fucking legend. But fuck that motherfucker. We're fucking fucking dabbing tonight, dog. Like, let's fucking get it, dude. We got the fucking energy in here, dude. We got the fucking marriage advice. I'm I'm fucking in it, dude. Like let's fucking grow. No, I appreciate you, Amir. That was something nice to say, man. Yeah, the the thing is, you gotta. I've always said this. The boys know. The boys know what I'm talking about when I say. I've always been the, the little guy, dude. I always got to try hard, right? But that was how it started out. And some would say that I've come, I've come a long way since when I started, right? Some would say that. But the day uh, you start, the day you start believing that, and I'm not, I'm not gonna mention names. I'm not gonna mention names because they ain't the type of guy that I am, all right? But there's mama. some people out there that make D2 content. Sure, sure, sure. And other content. Sure, that they, sure, that sure. they start believing that they are the fucking shit and that they you know sure, they, sure. they start they start believing that they're just like oh man i'm just i'm just really good and i can just put out shit and people hey, will watch it because i'm you know really what? good i, I, I respect I, 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 the fuck out of you for actually coming into your own fucking discord and actually talking to the fucking community i respect the fuck out of you for that because you know what i fucking go all of these different discords bro when I'm fucking drunk, I fucking love to go fucking, you know, say what's up, like... I feel like this is a daily Discord. occurrence. You're like, do you come home from work and you're like, all right, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to... It's, it's a weekend blasted. occurrence. Oh, okay. Yeah, well, that's that's kind of cool still. Like, you're like, oh. all right, this weekend, I'm going to get blasted. <laughs> and I'm going to so, go into a Discord. Yeah, dude, and, that's literally that's what, what I do on the weekend. That's actually kind of cool. Love it. Don't let anybody love... tell you that's bad. There's people out there fucking blowing lines of coke and shit on the corner, letting people do weird shit to them just so that they can get their fix and shit. You know, like, bro, think of I, it this I told way. you that's fucking like, confident. You don't gotta yeah. go tell everybody. Yeah, okay. Well, oh, I mean, that's oh just, my. that's Shirley. That's, a, that's what Shirley <laughs> does. But there was times were tough. Like, you know, I totally understand it. But all I'm saying is, all I'm saying is, there's a lot worse shit you could do, man. Like, you, I'm you, saying, you, dog. You know, like, truth, bro. Uh, dude, uh, that's what I'm saying, dude, but I will... Charcy, I Natalie, uh, Natalie. Oh, is that... I know who that is. Charcy that, Bilbo. Charcy it. Charcy that motherfucker. It's just fucking trash. Um, so I, I noticed that you and Dabrunsky have, like, a little thing going on. Uh, not really. I just made a video, and he responded to it, and then on this channel, I responded to his response to it, uh, which I thought was fun. But yeah, that, that shit was man. fucking awesome, dude. And this is fucking great content. Fucking, we need that shit. I mean, basically, when you, like, I mean, I'm always studying stuff and always learning, right? Like, so when you realize that what you got to do on YouTube is you have to review stuff that other people have done, and that is what gets, like, you look at all the big streamers and stuff, you look at all, like, the big, the big content creators. I'm talking about, uh, I'm talking about, like, Asmin Gold and Penguinzo or whatever. Uh, and and like those guys they just review a bunch of shit and I'm like this is the perfect opportunity I can review somebody who is reviewing my shit and then if they see it and then they review that That is basically the formula for success So it's like yeah. not only 
doing something that's good, but I'm setting them up for the, the success. The review to my review to their review of my review. Tell me that's not fucking gold. Well, the thing is, is that you made the video first and he had to do the review of you. So that's right. that's saying something. That means... And then he had to do it with sunglasses, too. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome, well, actually. Uh, it was here, awesome. No, it's not, it's it too was low. fucking awesome. Roll too low, and it's say. probably... The level requirement's probably over 18, so it's probably not good. The only reason that other helm was good is because the level requirement was 18. Or was 16. That's the only reason it was good. So, like, what, what, like where are you guys, like, rolling on? Is this, like, a fucking, like, a four-hour... Like, what, is this, like, a private league or something like that you guys are trying to do like what is this uh this was uh we've got an announcement from uh we got an announcement for the message of the day and then we decided to break battle net that's what that's what happened um so it was kind of an impromptu thing we were actually supposed to be doing dfc tonight um and i was looking forward to it i was pumped i actually went out and bought a chalice which i totally forgot to even bring into this room because Dolova pumps me up so much. Every time I see his messages in Discord, he fucking pumps me up so much. Every time, yeah. I'm just like, fuck yeah, this is gonna be a good night, dude. And like, oh, so yeah. I went out and got a chalice, I was ready to go. And then right before, I, it was probably like two hours before I was supposed to go on stream, Shirley Sirius sent me the message just like, yo dude, did you see this? They're actually, uh, I think they broke it. And he sent me this message about gambling and vendor prices or whatnot. And I was like, yep, they broke it, dude. So I was just going to go on and do a little bit of gambling before the DFC. And then I noticed it was completely broken and you can infinite gamble. And I was like, yeah, okay, so we're just going to do this, right? Because this will never <laughs> happen again. <laughs> this ever. will never, <laughs> ever happen again. So uh, uh, while the jury's still out, uh, it very well could be uh, a 24-hour stream. You don't know. It just depends on when my it depends on when my all my endorphins and my serotonin runs out. And right now, when you even though I haven't got a fucking Zoloft, let's go. I haven't found shit in like the last thirty minutes. It might have actually been longer than that. Dude, but can you like you catch me up? Like, what's what, like? What do you what? What is this gambling glitch you're talking about? Like this infinite gambling? Like, I'm yeah, just so I haven't so they're played doing this. Did like you hear about the? Did you hear about the uh, Twenty Two Nights of Terror that they're doing? No, 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 dude. What fuck. the fuck? Okay, dude, pause. Get out of this chat for a minute. And I need you to go God, watch. God. I need you to go watch the video that I put out that's called uh, Update Game Awards. It's talking about the Game Awards, and it's called 22 Nights of Terror. Just pause. Go watch it. I'll, fuck, I'll be right here I when you get so, back, okay? You got to so, know that piece of evidence. You got to know dude, that I feel so of... bad, man. I've been fucking... Dark Age Camelot came out with a new fucking private server, and I've been off my D2 game, and it's and it's fucking sad. It really is sad. I literally watch almost all your videos, but I'm going to fucking cry whatever. <laughs> no, dude. I, I'm I, actually I, not going to cry, that. dude. I but... appreciate it. No, dude. So basically, they're doing 22 Nights of Terror. They're doing something different every day for 24 hours straight. Right? That's what they're doing to, you know, D2. D2 holiday time, right? Yep. Well, yesterday, yesterday they did, oh, everybody gets 50% extra gold fine, which was stupid. I actually didn't play the game at all, I don't believe, yesterday. 50% uh, extra gold fine. I didn't yeah, I, actually play the game. Playing, I was like, that's kind of stupid. Playing, I yeah, that's 50%? Wow, Jesus yeah, Christ. Like, it's so Throwing bad. a fucking gold drop, Jesus so Christ. So I was like, uh, I was like, all right, that's, that's kind of stupid. Well, today, the message of the day was... Uh, the vendors are having a Black Friday sale, 50% off all items at vendors. So, you wouldn't believe it, but that also includes gambling. But it it also allows you to do this stupid shit, what I'm doing right now to farm gold. I can yep. sell items to the vendor, and I can get 34,000 gold for them, and then I can yep. buy them back for 11,000 gold. <laughs> 11 to fucking 14. farm oh, shit tons you, of gold <laughs> right from the vendor. So they actually broke D2R with this, which I was like, I will certainly be there for that. Uh, and yeah, this will dude. probably never happen again in our lifetimes. So like knowing that, I was like, well, shit, this might be the thing to do today is to, you know, just gamble 
uh, and and absolutely cave to the addiction tonight. Fuck yeah, dude. We gotta be fucking llama. I mean, I'm not on detour right now, but like, I'm fucking here for the hype, dog. Like, I'm fucking in this shit. Like, let's fucking grow. Yeah, well, what you gotta do if you wanna be in is you gotta just start gambling. It's pretty easy. All you need to do is just uh, gamble. All you need is an edge, a geet, and that's it. Yeah. Yeah. I, I play fucking. I play hardcore because I'm not a fucking pussy. Oh shit! Oh shit! Well, fucking. I don't care where it comes from, okay? Uh, hardcore or not, you best be Dude, finding cool. You you better be playing hardcore. I'm actually gonna fucking end the it hardcore. Here. I I would, dude, but uh, hardcore is is for uh, babies. It's for babies because there's no dueling, dude. Yeah, that's yeah. it. That's what it is. It's for the. I miss the dueling. Yeah, it sucks. I yeah, love otherwise hardcore. I would though, dude. But uh, you know, the, uh, that's the only thing I miss because I've been a fucking hardcore maxi for fucking years now. Yeah. And, but I do miss the fucking dueling. Like when I was growing up, I was fuck. I'm playing fucking D two for fucking twenty something years. I was playing fucking D two when I was in the fucking second grade, my dude. And I, and I grew up with the fucking PVP, best PVP ever. Dude, is really the Terra Zone uh, World Stone right now? No, it's not. It's uh. It's fucking, uh, no, Flare, du Flare Jungle, Flare Dungeon. Uh, we good. I had to check no, for a minute. It rolled, no, it was Terra Zone at like 10 a.m. this morning. So it's, well, 10 a.m. my time, so it's not going to roll again today. Oh, yeah. Well, no, you never know that. When they were doing the 15 minute, you remember? Oh, okay, so one of the things that they did for this uh, 22 nights is they, they switched the Terra Zone every 15 minutes. And, like, one of them spawned at, like, not back to back, but like right after another. So it was like pit and then something else and something else and then pit. So like it can happen. Like they, it can happen multiple times. Someone else had confirmed before they even did that, that something can roll multiple times in a day. It's just all like random. It just rolls to another one that was not, that was not the previous one. That's how they roll it randomly. Just roll to one that was not the previous one that they were just on. Like that's all. That's the only requirements for the randomness. I sense another D clone happening. Oh, probably. Yeah, and I can't be the number nine dueler on hardcore. First of all, I would be the number one dueler because there wouldn't be any other duelers. I would kill them all. But uh, like, actually, second I, of all, I ran into this uh, hardcore uh, dueler that he was on softcore practicing. Yeah. It's kind of an interesting experience. He's um, he was a Hammerton, but like, he would just save an exit on anything. Like I put one trap on him, he saved an exit. You know, it's like, I mind blast him, he saved an exit. But like, he's just like, yeah, I don't want to break the habit, this is how I do. But like, his aim, when he was coming in at me, was actually pretty decent. Like, I can see him killing people. Wow. That's interesting. So if anybody even lands anything on him, or it seems like the second he gets that yeah. feeling, like, yeah, yeah, exactly. you, yeah. you've lost, you've lost control of this, he'll yeah. save an exit. That's actually kind of cool. So yeah. he's the type of dude where you have to PK him quick. Like, before he even notices what's wrong. I mean, I tried. Dead. Blades usually catch people off guard, but he was pretty fast. I was impressed. Now, were you on a Sin? Yeah, I was on my Blades. You're side. asking Max if he was on the Sin. Are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? That was, uh, that what's was wrong with you, Stupid dude? question. Stupid question. Stupid, <laughs> dumb, stupid, dumb question. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm surprised with the Blades Sin you couldn't... It's kind of nice for BM because, like, it kills people instantly, you know? They don't get the chance to juke or exit usually. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, is, like, you could immediately just gank him, dude. Yeah, but he was pretty fast at, like, uh, just leaving if there's any kind of danger, so... Dude, that's crazy. I feel like you gotta... I feel like you have to have some so some form of ballsiness when you're doing that, though, like... In hardcore. That, or you're just a complete pussy. Like, if you're leaving as soon as you feel like, Oh, yep, this, uh, I don't like this, he's got a trap on me. Like, come on. Like, if you want to get good kills against good people, they're gonna get a, a leg up on you. You just gotta, you just gotta fight it for a little bit. By the way, is this good? Three shape shifting skills for the druid, twenty cast. Probably dumb, right? No, no. Sorry about that. I'm back. My fucking, I was. I guess I was talking too loud. My fucking wife came in. Fucking, I said, get on the fucking mic. I'm Nobody missed you, dude. It's completely fine. <sighs> Nobody except for you, brother. It's fine. <laughs> got it. Right, but I like. I'm, I'm telling you, it need, you need the 30 IAS. You're, you're probably right. 
but I'm still I, not gonna sell it. I have a telly bow. I'm telling you, you need a two socket one. Well, one socket doesn't yeah. cut it. Yeah. I'm still not gonna sell it. Maybe I want to do it on a telly Java. Now what? You still need the IAS. He's not no, lying. I'm not gonna let you ruin my highlight video. <laughs> Yeah, bro. Come on, Bullshit. dude. Like with your fucking logic, with your, you think you can, you think you can sway me from keeping questionable I'm items 20? just because of PVP? Just because you like to PVP? Did you know that there, a lot of people out there they'll see that and be like, I don't really understand it, but I'd keep it too. Don't let the truth interrupt the, truth. the good story. The truth I, you didn't you get it right. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hey. Dude, Cooley, what are you sipping on right now, fam? Uh, Jim Beam, dude. Hell yeah. Fuck yeah. My boy. Give me some oatmeal stout and I'll be young and I'll be happy. Oatmeal stout? Cooley is like a junk wrong with you? and I like it uh, a lot. Uh, what's it's the stupid. hell wrong with you? Uh, I can't stand, I can't do hard A. So I got Diablo has invaded Sanctuary again. No nice. doubt. Yeah, dude, you're on uh, fucking softcore because you're a fucking pussy, dude. What? Uh, Look, the yes. only pussies are yes. the ones that play hardcore because they can't duel. <clears throat> I am what I eat. Cooley, that's the only oh, thing you got against me, fam. So, oh shit, no, I don't. No, no, man, he just started a rap battle with you. You got to drop some bars, bro. Dude, gotta, I, Cooley, bars. I will say you're 100% right on the dueling thing, but you're a fucking pussy if you're not dueling. No, if you're dude, no, playing, no, no, no. Yeah, no, Hold you're up. a pussy. You're a uh, pussy. But, if, if you're but, playing softcore and you're not I, fucking dueling, I, and you're just I am doing... A, I am what I eat. Oh, dude, shut the fuck up. Of course. Oh, oh shit, really I'm nice. just taking them bars and dropping them. Just, a, you know, I just made up that joke. Never heard it anywhere. What did you think of that? Yeah, nah, that was original as fuck. Original. That was original as fuck. Never heard that yeah, shit in my life. Yeah, you never heard it anywhere. Don't lie. I will say this. I will say this to all you fucking softcore fucking pussies. If you're not fucking dueling, then you're a fucking pussy and you should be playing hardcore. That's it. But if you're playing softcore and you're doing, you get a pass. That's it. If you're not, if you're not doing, you should play hardcore so someone can PK you. I just don't understand your logic. And then they'll, and then they'll probably go back and they'll be like, maybe I should learn. And you know what, dude? PVPing on hardcore there's nothing more fucking satisfying than loading up a fucking uh, 29 druid going to a fucking hell game or a nightmare game with a fucking fully torqued. Dude, no way. Trevor, did you seriously just get that? Did you seriously just get a two pally, 20 cast, 30 damage, 27 strength, 18 dex? Hold There's on, no way you shit. just got that. Is that real? Two times. Link it. Link it. Send it to me. Send it to me. Post it in trophy room with a timestamp for Battle.net on it. I want Battle.net timestamps on that shit. Because that's probably the best one I've seen, if that is true. Two, 20, 30. Oh yeah, that shit's fucking hot, bro. You should post that in trophy, bro. Post it. Battle that time. Spot. Battle that time stamps and everything. Let them know. Let them know how trash everybody else's finds are. Yeah, it would be so much more cooler if you found that on fucking hardcore. Damn. Sorry, I'm ruining the moment. I'm sorry. Yeah, shit's shut the fucking fuck up, dude. Like you talk too much. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Jesus. Dude, I was just waiting for someone to tell me that. Jesus. God damn. Go gamble. Go get go get some highlights for shit. Go get to, go get us some highlights so we can compete with Llama. Dude, we just got the best highlight in the fucking game, dog. What do you mean? <laughs> we need more. You think that's gonna be enough? It's never enough. You don't just win. You win dominantly. You win without question. Hey, Dark Lee. Who's in the background, by the way? No idea. That's my wife. Tell your wife to get on this fucking Discord or I'm fucking in. Like, in a fucking banner or something. How can she? You can't ban shit. Shut up. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry. <laughs> my wife is playing 5M. I'm not going to tell her to get on Diablo 2. 5M? What is 5M? Is that like some fucking like... It's Grand one more Theft than 4M. Auto. Come on, man. Get with it. It should be gambling. It's, it, it's Grand Theft Auto. Jesus Christ, what the fuck? Yep. That's what I said. 
It's all right. My wife only likes to fucking play League of Legends. Whoa, bro! I gambled a twenty-eight Mara. <laughs> did, you, did you really? Nice. Yeah. 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 Gambled amulets. I, nice. I gotta rebuild the ones that all poofed because I got dropped from the server. Oh nice. shit! Oh, uh, that's I awesome, I, dog. I, I, I Post that shit up, yeah. dude. You got that, Go Gators? Oh my god, dude! Everybody's getting some nasty shit. Y'all need to post that. God damn! I need to catch up. I've got a LLD circlet. I did get a Artisan's 30 Dex uh, helm. That was pretty sweet. I need to catch up though. I need to catch up. All right, no more, no more fucking around. It's time to win, Cooley. Hey, Cooley, can you hear me? What up? All right, this is Frank Phoenix. Yo, what up, Frank? Yeah, congrats on the Ethan Gamble. Thanks, pretty dude. Yeah, everybody can do it. It's not really like an achievement. Like, I know. I mean, uh, who figured it out though? Oh, it was probably like everybody. As soon as uh, it's like as, as yeah, soon I just, as they, yeah, I just logged in. It's it, like one of those things. That's like saying to... that's like saying uh, you know, like let's say let's say like... for example, they they posted something and they were just like, uh, yeah, so uh, you know, by the way. Um, we're just gonna make it so that uh, the high rune drop rate is a million times better. Like, you know, I'm actually kind of expecting that any day now. Yeah, like, like it, it's like, like not seriously. something you really have to figure out. Like, they probably like someone what I mean, on Kalei, that team. That, would, I, I like, thought they would up. just like make the the cell value. Good if they made the fucking on. high rune drop rate fucking any more than what it is, I'm fucking ending it, dude. Nah, Wes, that that sucks, Wes. I would char see that shit. Yep. <laughs> Hold on, let me see this. Look, Wes post. Yeah, I would char see it. It's just not better than it's not better than Ariat's. Like Ariat's face. I, I only is gamble coordinates. I only I only gamble coordinates. Yeah, that's what I'm doing, Theo. Just coordinates, because the thing is, I feel like it gives you a better chance, and then you might even get a. I might get a Griffins. You know exactly. Dog decided oh, to stay up all night with me. Oh, like, Upside yeah, like, of walking the dog at 5 a.m. is you can nice. see Mars really clearly. No shit, dude. Is that is it like you can see Mars this time of year? Shit. Oh, yeah, that's a good drill. That's a dude. That's if a I really actually got outside, home. if I got outside on the on par with the normal human being, I might know that. It's also fucking cold though. So like, being up fucking early and cold. outside early is like being up and outside late. Bro, are you on the East Coast or something? Yeah. Hell yeah, me too, fam. Let's go. Yep. Yeah, it's just cold as shit, man. We're about to get slammed with snow, by the way. I hope you're ready. Like, if it's gonna snow for I think like uh, 700 days straight, I think is what they you're say. Get, you're, oh, you're getting, you're getting, you're getting our uh, our snow uh, snowfall coolie. It's coming down from uh, Quebec, Montreal, down to your uh, your area. Yeah, 700 uh, days straight, I think is what they say. Yeah, you guys get some shit. fucking snow. <laughs> Yo, cool. hey Cooley, I got a ton of shit the other day. I posted, I fucking, I found a J mod, okay, on a helmet, and on a fuck, you found a J mod on a helmet? Yeah. So, so does that sound retarded? Yeah. 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 Considering the the M fucking mod. like this is this is <laughs> this is a public channel. Anybody can join. That explains everything. It, bro, like, bro, I was gonna. Hey, I was like, "How the fuck did this guy get here for a second? But that was, I get it. I wait, know. hold on. Now, but dog, it's yeah. a jeweler's mod, dog. Like, no, 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 <laughs> it's jeweler's monarch. Yes, dude. I know. I didn't know M that. Okay. Monarch. Yes, dude. Okay. Yeah. Some fucking retard on fucking the the form. Oh shit, dude. I don't know what happened to him. I think somebody must have pressed the mute button or something. I think. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what. <laughs> was like, was Maybe that was a glitch. Maybe that was glit. Maybe that was Battle.net. I think Battle. Someone at Battle.net was like, "You that dude." I think I'm not sure what happened, but oops. Yeah, well, maybe. People? Hopefully, if we just keep gambling, they'll figure it out. It's, it'll all sort itself out. It's time to get these highlights. Yeah. Yeah, one of the devs. That's that's probably what it was. God, they're just blessing us today. Doing a whole bunch of they're blessing us. Two oh, sword, plus. thirty faster Romok, ten FCR, fifteen life, fifteen all res, two open socket. Is this good or does it need? Oh, that's like, yeah, I would keep that, dude. 
Uh, it's got the two sockets. It's got the faster run walk. It, sure, cast could be better, but that's certainly a key. Okay, okay, that's good. Good. Yeah, that's certainly yeah, a key. Nah, I'll keep it anyways. I will keep it too. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, I would be like no. super happy about that. The best one that Llama <laughs> showed, Llama showed a sick one, dude. It was, it was uh, two Necro, 10 cast, like 60 life just about, and two open sockets. It was really yeah. good. So Llama showed us that how many hours ago? Uh, that, was, that was like at the start of this. He sent me yeah, at it, maybe like six. Like that was that was a while ago. Um, I have uh, two to Druid skills, twenty faster cast rate, all res twelve. Hold on, I'm gonna I'm gonna message Llama. I feel like I need to take a screenshot of that and message him to let him know, kind of fairly, that we're sort of competing in some way but i'm not gonna say i'm not gonna say that to him i'm just gonna show him some stuff and he's gonna uh, uh, you know he's gonna be like oh that's cool you got some magic helms maybe he won't know that they're good well, we'll, we'll necro we'll 20 faster cast rate 11 strength six energy fire is 33 circular dude i got a uh, what's up dude i'll post it in i got another diablo uh this uh diablo spawned again did it really? Sure. Yeah. So I went and killed it real quick. Were you guys posting everything just in the trophy room? Yeah, if you find something dope, like really good, post it in trophy. Trophy room, trophy room, trophy room. I posted it for you, Cooley. I believe my so 28, 28 Mars is going to get shit on, but whatever. Well, yeah, like really GG's. Like the 28 Mars is like, man, okay. But like super GGs. Like my 30 decks, three open socket is certainly a that's that's a trophy room, I think. Cause it's a story. It's something new, people haven't seen it. Like it's insane. It's fucking wild. Like we're looking for the wild shit. The shit that like when you think about Llama's helm with the necro skills to cast, the two sockets and the light, that it, it like makes it look like that's a turd. Like that's the that you kinda want that stuff. Like Mars, I don't know if it'll cut it. See, I'm already shitting on your Mars. You were right, I'm sorry. You told me to post it. No, I didn't. He you 100% did. did. Ah, you did, you did. Whatever. I uh, See, I this, this is what happens. Way I find you. something, he says post it. And then, I only wanted you to post it so I could make fun of you. Like, what the it's fuck fine. is this trash in the trophy room? Who posts this? Who did? <clears throat> Whose idea was this? It's horrible. Wait, that didn't work. <laughs> Like my 52 year old neighbor is competing with Messi, Messi in football. LOL. Never forget that that is a command you can do in the Discord. What? Look at the trophy room, bruh. Oh my god, these trophies are gonna go like, off the rocker. <laughs> it's crazy. Oh my god. This is just crazy. <laughs> oh shit, yeah, there's the cool year. Shit. Oh That's a God. command I put in months and months so, ago. So you're telling, so basically, so hold on, so now that if, if, let's say, okay, man, this is insane. So I could just like literally make more gold just through gambling. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. This is a bit silly. Okay, let's, let's yeah, do this. Pretty easy. Yep, so you just I'm get actually, gold. And then I'm actually just... positive gold on circlets at yeah. uh, level 45. Like there's yeah, gold just insane. around my feet yeah, and I'm funny. like max gold. I can't should gamble we do, away. Should we do LLD circlet gambling? I feel like I'm not getting shit with this, dude. I'm I feel like really I good it up. sorceress one while ago, but I, I didn't think anything was going on in LLD, so I just fucking sold it. I don't know where they went because I've been on a bunch of different characters, but I got the good uh, couple good LLD ones. Oh, what cool they are. Yeah. Dude, Steve like nailed it. It was Jim Beam who said posted. It was not Cooley. Whoever Jim Beam is, he did it. He said it. Oh, Jim. Good old yeah, Jim. yeah, yeah. Yeah, we know him. Jim. Uh, three socket high decks was a good roll. So I had Charcy one a few weeks ago. Oh, shit. Yeah, dude. I actually, I knew it was like there was something about it. I actually just didn't know that it was actually pretty sought after. Like, whether it was actually desirable. It's desirable for Zon damage. I kind of learned that as, after I found it. Yeah, it's like, it's usable for sure. 
And it's a perfect roll, so like that's kind of cool. Okay, look at the trophy room, Kobe Cooley. Those are the LLD ones that I found. It's so, like they're not they're not the greatest, but they're definitely usable. Yeah. You, you put them in trophy? Yeah. So that fax will shit on them for me. Yeah, yeah fax will be like, or... yeah, I don't know about this, man. Like, He's going to be like, stop posting LLDs garbage in here. LLDs are going to be looking for... Like, I, I know Fax doesn't sound like this, but every time he criticizes something, I picture this this voice. He's just like, uh, uh, well, LLDs are actually looking for this mod. Otherwise, it's trash. <laughs> like, it's not bad, but that shit, I sent him that shield after I found it, and he's like, yeah, it would be better with combat skill. I'm like, shut the fuck up. This thing, <laughs> this thing is sick. This thing is sick, okay? Thing is nasty. All right, it's time to switch it up. Y'all want to, let's do, let's do, uh, hold on. Let's make, let's do this right. No, you can't do LLD shit, because that's what I'm doing, and I don't need you competing with me. No, I'm just, I'm just switching it up. I'm just switching it up for a little bit. It's not going to be forever. It's just going to be until I get tired of winning against you. So I will long. come... I will come poof all your amulets, you little fucker. Don't do that, dude. No, <laughs> I'm probably not going to get shit. I'm just switching it up. See how quickly you moved to defensive? No, 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 no. I'm not <laughs> No, no, it. seriously. I worked so hard <laughs> to get these amulets. Like, it takes so fucking long. It took like an hour to get these amulets. Oh, I know. I, I had to redo it because the blizzard, the server fucked me. Oh, <laughs> like my I God. Get it. Oh, my God. All right, hold on. We're, we're going we're gonna to do some LLD gambling. And just so you guys up. know, all, all you got to do to piss somebody off is just join their game and leave. And their their amulets will poof out of the stash or out of the vendor screen. Uh, and it fucks them lucky. Like oh shit! I think I actually muled a bunch of shit over to her. God damn it! I need to like I need to actually mule this to something else. Look at this. This is a stash full of shit. Yeah, I got a stash full of shit. Oh my god, this is horrible. Ooh, two twenty thirty ed. Nice. I'm gonna this is trash. It's it's time to revisit how good some of this shit is. This is this trash. This trash. This I suppose we gotta keep it. Max said it was okay. This uh if this would have rolled with cast rate, it's got twenty trash. strength, eighteen decks, all res plus fifteen, poison res fifty-four, <laughs> one of druid skills, eight mana stolen per hit, and it's a tiara. Damn. 2018, 20 to strength, 18 decks, 15 all res, 54 res. It's just fucking useless though. I think this I is trash too. This is like. Oh, do you have a socket quest on that? I want to see you socket this thing. This is kind of cool. I want to see you socket that 3020 helm. What, 30, this one? The 20, or the 30 ED. I want to see you socket that. Do I have a socket? I don't know. That's what I'm asking. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, we do. We have it, boys. Do it. Oh shit. This is this is what separates the men from the boys. Men from the boys. Let's fucking go. We do have a socket quest on this check. It's time to use it. Because if you get two, it's boys. Take a sip with me because we could fucking lose it all right here. This helm could go from good to trash real quick. We're gonna do it. It has to roll good because if we brick it, that's right. It's not a trophy. I gotta get fired up, boys. Hold on, hold on. Let me take a bong hit for you. All right, do it. I'm gonna take a. I'm gonna smoke this up real good. You just gotta do it. You just gotta fucking go and not look. Oh shit! Yeah, fuck it. It was never not there. Never not the fucking trophy, boys. It was never not there. The video is still delayed. I still haven't seen it happen. Never <laughs> not there, boys. Okay, Woo! there you go. Sockets. You gotta Woo! post it. Dude, okay. Post it nice. Shit, yeah. <laughs> Best we'll one on battle net boys. Oh, I'm selling this right now. I'll take uh, I'll take 20k. I'll take 20k. So I can see what you're at. Yeah, that's uh it's all the seed in the game, you know? It's just uh sorry about that, boys. Uh yeah, it's just that simple. It's just the seed. You just gotta look for the seed. It's uh it's pretty easy. It's pretty easy. 
much is that worth? Uh, a lot. <laughs> this. I said start. I what said is that fucking game. useful for? Uh, it's it, level 18 what door. Oh, and so it's okay. like, yeah, it's so like okay, level 18. Like, it's like perfect on a charger. What about, bro? Yeah, so, so it's like it, it rolled perfect 30 ED as well. Like it can roll from 20 to 30. It rolled a perfect 30. Yeah. Like, oh, it's so good. I didn't check the defense. What's perfect defense on this? If this rolled perfect defense, that's certainly like 20k. Seems like high defense for a circuit. Yeah, what, hold on. Looking this up right now. Because if that is like 100% perfect. I think it might be. Aria Summit. high defense for a circuit. Dude. It's, Ar Ar Aria it's Summit. Close. Normal items. What is it? Normal helm? <laughs> uh, circlets. Right here. Oh my god, boys. You want to know what the you want to know what perfect defense is on a circlet, boys? Do you want to know? Thirty. It's thirty. Oh. <laughs> it's thirty. Oh man, I'm so happy about this, dudes. Post it, trophy room it. Do it. That do is it, do that's it. some trophy room shit. Oh send my that to god. Send that, send that to Llama. Oh yeah. my god, he's gonna he's gonna look at it and be like, well, that's dumb. Well, that's because he doesn't understand. That's right. He doesn't understand. That's not going to stop me. And, and you know what? That's coming from somebody who mostly PVMs most of his life in E2R and LOD. This is actually good. Okay, I'm going to preface it with that. Oh, my God. I'm so fucking happy about that. I didn't even notice that was 100% perfect. There's your thumbnail. Oh, my God. That's good. Oh, someone got an artisan's TRS bead. Oh shit! Oh my god, bro. That now I'm gonna actually, now, now I'm gonna actually gonna keep a close eye on my sockets blues now from now on. Oh my god, dude, that's like. I don't think there's another one like that on Battlenet. Prove me wrong. Somebody prove me wrong. I think that's the only 100% perfect deadly of haste. Two socket on Battle.net. Prove me wrong. Bot sites don't keep that shit. The, the the people that run bots don't look for that shit. The LLD players are the only ones looking for that shit. And I promise you, nobody has found a 100% perfect one. So you that's, can probably so, ask like a hundred for that. Wow, that's insane. I don't know who, do, who, who do clicked on the it's, A. It's gonna <laughs> hold value after today. Like, it's gonna be oh, a yeah. while goes up yeah. Yeah. yeah because nobody will keep those like nobody even knew why that was good oh you're right yeah. you know what i mean it was like nobody keeps them yeah but oh, like for the, the actual high level uh, gg circles they're just gonna drop like rocks and yeah yeah like, yeah that's what see that's what people months, are gonna yeah. focus on they're gonna be like oh man i got this 230 20 oh. you know but really it's all about that. It's all about those ones, like the ones that people aren't thinking about. Yeah, th this letter, uh, high high end circles are dead after after today. I, I wouldn't like, be. You surprised. cannot you cannot sell one after today. It's gonna be all cheap as fuck. Well, what's uh, good? The good, yeah, it's better to buy them. Yeah, yeah, better to buy it's them. Then at some I, point, uh, on no ladder, it's market. gonna go back up. Yeah. Yeah, it'll Dude. be a buyer's market, and I am all about it. Oh my God, yeah, same here. All right, it's time to trash some circlets that we don't like. This one is kind of good. I feel like all of this stuff is kind of good. These are 100% perfect. Dude, I need some room in this stash. This is not a perfect mage plate. Should that be trashed, boys? Yes, gone. I don't know. <sighs> it's my only superior mage plate, though, bros. I can't do that. All right, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do this. I'm not gonna think about it too much. I'm just gonna put that stuff there, and we'll gamble. We're just gonna do it. We're gonna gamble. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do it right. You can always wow, do what some of, some other people do: dual box it and put give it to your ult. Yeah, that's true. We'll get there. I gotta See, I gotta I mule it bring, over. I can bring another character in if you need me to ult stuff. Yeah, I'll keep you posted. By the way, Shirley, thank you for showing me that. Yep. I don't I don't think I'm ever gonna not play this game with two accounts ever again. 
Dude, I think I'm gonna go for the, I think I'm gonna gamble amulets because gambling LLD amulets has always been something I've wanted to do, but it's extremely hard to do because gold. So now we have infinite gold. This is where I'm gonna beat you, Shirley. I'm gonna, no, I'm I'm gonna, gonna no. gamble like this. I'm gonna have the nastiest LLD amulets ever. What are you gambling? Tear. Uh, the level 45. Oh yeah, me too. Oh my god, dude, I'm so pumped about that fucking helm. I had no idea that was perfect defense too, man. Oh my god. I sent I sent it I sent it to Llama with a message that said this is actually good. Joy, seriously, how many shined rocks will it take to convince you we are meant to be? <laughs> what the fuck? I was wondering why everyone was like not dueling and everyone's like, I'm like, what are you guys doing? We're gambling, we're gambling. What I'm would, like, what are you talking about? <laughs> what would be perfect level 18 duels to go in it? Probably 20 Is maxers, 20 maxers, or or if you had uh, level 18 jewels that were like 20 ED with like stats on them, strength or something like that would also be very good. Like all of that stuff is real good. Did you like my comment on your uh, on your post there, Cooley? No, I didn't even look, dude. You think I give a shit what you say about my awesome helm? Because it's just gonna you're just gonna troll me. You're just gonna be like, yeah, that's trash, but the real LLDs are gonna be looking for this. That that's nice, but it would be better if. Like prophecy, that's what you said. Tell me I'm wrong. You're wrong. Oh fuck it. Hold on, I'll look. I'll look in a second. I said something. I'm busy finding the GG amulets. You can also find really good gold find amulets at this level too, by the way, though. Yeah, I think that's certainly a good time for that away. Wow, that was a phenomenal, phenomenal helm. I'm so I'm so pumped about that though. Woo. Thirty defense, perfect. Oh my god, man! Like so much about that is so good. It's all right, baby. You don't have to carry everything. I got you. I think we're still gonna run into a problem with gambling amulets, though. We might only be able to do like 20, 20 at a time or something. Uh, infinite gold, cool. Infinite gold. Well, yeah, yeah I mean, technically, but, like, in order to fill up, if I want to fill up my entire inventory with this stuff, right? Like, you notice how it takes from my stash at this point? Yeah, but just have, have armors. Armors are the best because they give you the most gold back, right? No. No, technically it's amulets. Is it? Oh, yeah, yeah or the high, yeah, the high, level, yeah. If you want to find amulets that sell for exactly, like, 34k. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, wands that have plus to skills also sells pretty high, too. Yeah, that's you, true. Well, you want it. You want it to sell for exactly 34k, or literally, you want it to technically sell for exactly 35k, no more, because that's the most that you can possibly profit, and the buyback oh. price is based on what the actual Who price is. Amazon's all 16 so, like, you technically the best price for it would be would be 35k. Yeah, see, this I love how I can start with like, I can start with like 10k gold, and then just fill make, my character. Make it all back. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty. Just buy one amulet, sell it. Buy two amulets, sell them. Buy three amulets. And now I just got a pile of gold at my feet. Great. Yeah, that's one thing that we won't get is Amara's at this level though. We should theoretically only get LLD amulets, or amulets that are very close to LLD. They could technically be a little bit over, but this is this is theoretically the best level to gamble LLD amulets at, is 45. Um, so God. now we're gonna farm gold. Oh, what? I'm stuck. What do you mean you're stuck? 
I'm, I can't do my infinite gold loop. Why not? What are you talking about? I don't know. I can't do my oh. infinite gold loop. It's the, I'm st stuck at three ambulance. What the fuck is this? I quit. I quit LLD gambling. Wait, the, no, I should just go happened? for the. We should go for the circlets, I guess. No, no, no. Well, go have... back. What was going on? How were you not selling them for more than you were buying them? Uh, cause I don't. I can't use geeds on this. On this chick. It doesn't matter. I'm on my 45 as well, doing the same thing. It was really weird. Like I ran out of gold. It was really weird. <laughs> I run out of gold and then I can't get to the like I got I stopped right here right so that that's what stopped me. Wait 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 hold on hold it. Okay so buy that, buy any amulet and then what's what's, what's the sell price? Look, just look just at go the buy, sell. Go price. buy where we get stopped. No but look at the sell price of a single amulet. Yeah I know but it, that, none of that matters dude watch. So do you remember where I got stopped? I got stopped right here at this amulet. I'm gonna do it again. If, like, if what you're saying I is true, if what you're saying is true, I should be able to sell this stuff and go further the second time. But I can't. Uh, I get stopped at, the, sell, at that amulet. We'll sell, sell just like a couple, like ten or something at a time instead of all of them. It, no, it's none of that. What I'm saying, what I'm saying is that logic. I'm fucking right, is what I'm saying. Uh, I'm at no, an I, infinite I, loop. I'm at an infinite loop where I'll just get stuck at that amulet all the time. Oh. I understand so, like, what you're saying. I'm not making any more or less by selling this. My gold is staying the same. Pick different amulets. Is there like a bad amulet in there that's like has a high uh, rebuy pro uh, buying price? No, because it would still oh. be. What's going on with this bow? It's just. Right oh here. god damn it! I didn't have edge out. That's what it was. Oh. Back to it, boys! Back to it! We back in fucking business now, boys! We was wondering what was going on. Don't worry about it. That was the Jim Beam, boys. That was the Jim Beam talking. That was the Jim Beam. We got this. Uh, Did y'all think this is, was fucking... Uh, Don't, not... worry Don't worry about it. Mean, Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Jaime is not doing What well was I saying? Here. We had a problem. Really? We don't have no problems. You can buy amulets with right click. We ain't got no fucking problem. Yeah, it's faster to buy them with left click, though. Is it? Yeah. yeah. You spam left click enter, it's faster than, than right clicking. Because there's no server delay. <laughs> oh, you're right. I just tried it. Shut up, baby. I know it. <laughs> Alright, cool. We back in this game now. We back We back in this bitch. Alright, let's get it. Let's get the circlet time. Amulets are hard. Maybe they're only hard because I was getting fucked, though, and I wasn't doing it right. I should go back and do it right with not without harmony. I should actually just do it right. You can still only buy 20 of them. I'm doing it right now. You can only buy 20 uh, with 45,000 gold. Which is fine because you should be able to chain some after that with with this. And then we'll chain. Yeah, or you just sell a bunch. Um, oh, I wasn't like, even looking. Those could have been good. I wasn't. I was. God, this is fucking Jim Beam. We need to slow it down. Oh. That's right. We need to slow Why? it down. We're in fucking panic mode. We're trying to beat Llama. Why couldn't this tiara not have been better? Be Two Amazon skills, 30 faster, run rock, 18 strength. Crash. Yeah. All right. Let's slow it down, boys. Let's look. Pay attention. Pay attention, for noobs. We got this. We got. We had saw a little bit of a, a little bit of a hiccup. Not paying attention. Hey, now we're talking. Let you sell your your torch right, and you, your aim. You don't need to. You just need to feel it. It's all in, in the, the hips. Field. It's all in the hits. <laughs> uh, Cooley, I just got a couple little decent LLD Emmys. 110 Druid and a 110 Paladin. Right. No no other mods, but they're, they're there. Right. You keep saying this word. I don't think it means what you think it means. Right? Nope, nope. I want to be looking at those. I just found the two to fire skills. 
two to minimum damage, 15 max stamina, lightning res, chance to cast five charge bolt when struck, amulet, level 30. What was the skills on it? Was it fire? Two, two to fire skills. No, no cast rate though. What are the rest of the stats? Uh, 14% chance to cast five charge bolt when struck, two to minimum damage, two to strength, 15 max stamina, and lightning res plus nine. So. God, this is kind of a pain in the ass doing the amulets. I knew this would happen. The LLD gambling is fucking trash, bro. On, you know, on this amulets actually, in particular. This is not bad for a low level of magic fighting item. 29 better chance to open sockets. Too bad it's sold. Trash. I, did, I actually didn't even hear that. There's so much stuff going through my brain right now. That Do open stock, it's magic like fight. Yeah, probably true. That, yeah, it, it was tragic. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's do this. We got some we got some gold. We're going to slow it down. We're actually going to look at these amulets. We're not just going to sell them willy-nilly. I hope nobody goes back and clips and sees that I sold, like, the nastiest LLD amulet that has ever been seen, and I just, like, char it. It's probably like, going to happen just, while you're I talking. Was so, so pissed, dude. Like, 100% pissed would have been. Uh, there's there's some sort of use for that, but it's, it's pretty much trash. Really? Okay, so Macro Bio Boy crunched the math on this seed thing that I'm talking about, Dash? Is that... You're you're not fucking with me? You're not fucking with me, dude? Macro Bio Boy crunched the math on seeds? And there's some merit to this? Yeah. Is that what you're saying? Am I reading this right? Yeah. I agreed with you three hours ago. Wait, what's going on? How many shops into that? Nope, Jim check his vid. Cool? Okay, I'll check his vid. Uh, he, he said no. He's, he said no. We're wrong. And we need to check this vid. And then we need to go tell him, look, I know you like to crunch math and stuff, but you need to stop thinking with your head and think with your heart. And you gotta, okay. you gotta feel. Just God feel. Damn it. It. Macro Bio Boy thinks uh. too much with his head. You have to think with your with heart. With your other head. That's that's what it's there for. <laughs> or you think with your heart. We are men. Right. right. There's no Yeah. It's it's just like how does it feel though? Like, oh, this is technically wrong. Well how does it feel? Feels good? Right. <laughs> then it's probably most not all time, wrong, is it? Most of the time when it's wrong, it definitely feels good. Right. Are we so talking like, about the game here? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know what this channel is anymore. To tell you the truth. I don't know. I don't know Come what we on, do. Guys. Well, welcome to it. I don't know what we do anymore. This is. Fuck you all. <laughs> <laughs> oh my fucking god! Jesus. <laughs> really? Yeah, Merry Christmas. Level, guys. level thirty amulet, two defensive auras, ten faster trash. 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 Defensive auras is garbage always. Unfortunate, but it's true. What about two cold skills, thirty-seven to life? Trick. If there's no cast on it, it's trash. And some of this information that they're telling you, dude, because what you told me. I know, man, but I got really fucking stoned right now. <laughs> Away says I agreed with you three hours ago. He, he right? He knows what's up, dude. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that just based on my feelings. Macro's probably wrong. Like, you don't have much faith in that guy, do you? No, no, he's really smart. He's actually really good. He, he's one of my favorite uh, content creators for D two. But, but, he, I mean, Come. just in this in this instance, he's probably wrong. And how do I know? What's my evidence? My heart. 
I, I can feel it. I can feel it in my heart. It's all about the seed in the heart. Yeah. Son of a plums. Right. I can feel it in my heart. Son of a plums. Damn it. Bomb. Oh, no, it's cool. He's talking about a seed. <laughs> <laughs> 2.1 <laughs> This is kind of good for level 18, right? It's got the masteries and the max damage. Now, that's probably trash, right? Maybe. I don't know. It's got max damage and masteries, though. We'll keep it. It can't be that bad. It's got masteries on it. Oh, she's overburdened. She needs to buy some amulets. I'd rather do the hot key poke, hokey pokey ritual and get perfect rolls based on feelings. Yeah, right. Dash fucking knows what's up. Exactly. Like, it, it really doesn't matter to some degree. Like, if you could do all the math and the testing, but honestly, if you would have taken the time to have done the math when we were all doing the hokey pokey rolling perfect rune words, if you would have taken the time to do the math and to figure it out, they would have patched it. They like patched it pretty much that day. So instead, you just have to go with your feeling. Like, you know, you just have to be like, look, dude, I know this doesn't make any fucking sense, but like, I I, I noticed something the last couple of times I rolled perfect rune words. I did exactly this. And uh, guess what? It still works. Uh, maybe there's something to this. Sometimes you just got to do the hokey pokey, dude. And it works. I'll tell you what, that was one of my favorite days ever playing D2. Whether or not that was just stupid luck, or whether it actually there was something to it, it worked. And it's sort of the same here. Like, whether or not this works or not, right? The reason we picked this game is because we had it, it had a good seed, and I said, when things roll, they will have a propensity to roll perfect. Well, what have, what have been the things that we kept? Two perfectly rolled items, right? One is 100% perfect and may actually be the only perfect LLD helm of its kind on Battle.net. The other one was a perfect 30 dex roll on a three socket tiara, like, because it has the propensity to roll perfect as we knew it did from the seed. Like, I don't have science, but I do have a heart, and I can tell that that's probably true. That's all I need. Good enough for me, dude. Preach, Jimmy. There it is. <laughs> yeah, game seeds, man. Exactly. Exactly. You got to say that as you take a puff. Did you yeah. see Joey's contribution to the trophy room? It's all about that. All right, I'm gonna put these in the stash. I feel like these, I'll, I'll, I'm gonna stash them and I'll, I'll sort it out later. Boom, boom, stash. That could be stash or trash. That could be a series on YouTube. Look at this. Jim Beam does some great, has some great ideas. When you really break it down, stash or trash. New YouTube series on Cooley Live. What LOD cert? What, what uh, was that LOD so socketed yet? Yeah, it was, Jacob. We socketed it. We got two sockets, and then we actually figured out after we socketed it. I'm actually glad I didn't know this first, but we figured out after we socketed it that it's actually 100% perfect, like defense and everything. Uh, and it, it did. It got two sockets. Yeah. Yeah, cause, uh, because highlights. <laughs> it was... Yeah, it was so sick, dude. I didn't even notice. I didn't even notice the defense was 100% perfect at first. Like I said, I'm glad I didn't because I probably would have chickened out. I'd have bitched out and not socketed it. I'd have been like, maybe I could just try to sell it. Yeah, but we did it. We did it. Uh, I'm so pumped. It's like my favorite find of the night so far. Gambling is so fun. You got gold find sin now. 
Nearly 6 a.m. here. I can start taking my Ritalin again. Woohoo! Hyper focus. Here I come. <laughs> I love that we're all just staying up maniacally smashing. <laughs> maniacally alcohol. smashing the gamble button here. We're all going to get banned for this. They're going to look at the records and see that. You know, they should be I like think... Merry Christmas. You know, <laughs> technically, we, technically, we ran more than seven thousand pendle runs. I mean, yeah, yeah. No, we <laughs> only ran one. The, the the funny thing is, if if fucking. If regular schmuck would have just waited a day, he would have had all of the material that he needed. <laughs> He's been like, he could have been like, oh, I've been gambling. I was gambling seven million amulets or whatever. You know what I mean? It's really a shame that he was banned for this. I hope he bought a whole new account. That's what he should have done. He actually got unbanned, I think. Again? For the after the second time? Oh, he got banned again? Yeah, he got banned again. He just posted a video. He just posted a video last night. Yeah, he got banned again. Seriously? Yeah, dude. Yep. <coughs> dude, yeah, I was... I honestly was saying the same thing to start a stream. I was like, okay, so at some point... Well, like... At some do you point, not just say, lying. okay, what the fuck are you really doing? <laughs> at some point, somebody's fucking lying. <laughs> Okay. Right, like, All right. This is this has kind of got my head tilted a little bit. Level twenty-seven. Yeah. Level twenty-seven. One to necro skills. Twenty faster cast rate. Four maximum damage. Fifteen to life. Right. Why is it trash? It's level twenty-seven. Just trust me, bro. Level. I don't have time to explain this. Right. All right. Fine. <laughs> No, reason it's trash is because you don't really have any good mods that rolled well. You have life on there, but it rolled really low. Uh, and if you're going to have a low life roll mod, then you might as well roll plus two P and B instead of plus one Necro. And so it doesn't have any good mods on it as far as I'm concerned for like a Necro. Like no one's like it's it. Uh, the helm that's called Peasant Crown is eons better than that. Okay. He's still on it. No, 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 that's perfectly well explained. I thought it was decent because of the one to all skills and 20 faster cast rate. Yeah, it was 10k Pindle runs first, and then he was trying to do a thousand bail runs and got banned at run 650 or something like that, somewhere around 650. Oh, this is cool. Oh, if only this had strength, that would be insane. Or if, slanders, or if the life actually rolled something decent. Zon's kill is something to destroy 34 to life. Mmm, shit. Like, I love doing this and all, but, like, I feel like Llama is gonna crush us if we keep up this LLD gambling shit. But I don't want to stop, dude. I feel like this is where the real money is at, bros. I feel like this is really where it's at, is the LLD amulets. This is actually putting fucks to the man right now. This is actually the way to put the fucks to the man right now. LLD amulets is the way to go. And you, know, and you know Fax is doing this. You know Fax, like, there's a reason he's not in chat. It's because he's sitting there doing this for LLD amulets. Just has uh, RNGesus on his side. God damn it. Dude, does he really? Is he like crushing it right now? Yeah, that's true, Steve. Like, we're never gonna have a shot to LLD gamble like this again. Like, I I've tried gambling on LLD circlets before, or uh, amulets before, but it's just too expensive. Like, it's so hard to do. It's way too expensive. You piss through your gold so quick. What level is considered low level? Level 30 or below. Punch muffins. You find a good one, but it was level 31. Level 39. Two to poison bone, 20 faster cast, adds one to 112 lightning. Lightning resist Trash. 27, magic tw damage reduced Trash. by three. Trash, trash, trash. <laughs> oh, that probably was the trash. <laughs> You told me it was level 39, and then I was like, oh, okay, so it doesn't have plus two to skills. I just you could have been like. 20 pally circle, but it's a bunch of bullshit, mom, mom. 
yeah, dude. That's the thing. I just actually canned a whole bunch of pally circlets that I had that were actual, like, questionable. I was like, maybe I'll use this on a certain build. After today, there will be none of that shit. Like, it's gonna be all GG's only. And fuck, I want something good. Get it, Dio. Fuck. <laughs> Jesus. The best I got hey, was two traps. Character on PTR, so there could be kind of all kinds of things. Yeah, dude. I'm telling you, that was kind of cool. Like, good for Llama at the same time. But like, yeah, it just tells you, man. I, I honestly think there is there's the potential for some juck fuckery. Like, with everything that Blizzard does. Like, let's be serious. Like, you think they give him a little little boost to his MF? <laughs> no. I, it wouldn't surprise me. I, do, I think they, do I think they did? No. But, like, no, I don't think so. if, if they like if they were like, yeah, you know what? Uh, we like Llama. We want him to do good shit on stream. Here's 50 extra MF. Put it this way. If they tried to help Llama out, uh, I don't think they could do anything significant because obviously when they do things like this and they're like oh by the way man reduce black friday sales on the vendors and then they fuck the game up like this or like yesterday when they were oh. like oh by the maybe way 50 maybe extra maybe gold fine. fine that's gonna be huge that's yeah. gonna be a benefit right there like i don't even think they would know what to do they'd give him more mf so that he finds better stuff but they wouldn't like adjust his seed so that, like he always gets a good oh. one. you know what i mean oh. like they wouldn't know what to do I just gambled the fucking circle with two druid skills, 17 strength, 7 dex, 58 life, and it doesn't have any FCR. Ah! Fucking son of a bitch. It happened to us all night, bro. Welcome to welcome to the club. Fuck we all that, we've that, been here all night doing this. No that's doubt, bro. That's technically not stash. That is technically trash. Fuck, man. Uh, does it have any skills on it, Brosif? Does it have like any like any skills, uh, like skill Simples. tabs or anything? Or does it have faster run walk or two sockets? If it has two to a skill tab, faster run walk or two sockets, it's good. Otherwise, trash. All right, one more one more round of LLD amulets, and then I'm 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 getting tired of just kicking too much ass with these things. We're kicking too much ass. We're gonna go back to the circlets. into employment <laughs> maybe they are maybe that's what they're doing they're just like look best thing we can do for this kid just ban him get him working a, get him working a real job that's what we're gonna do no that's who are they to decide fuck them for that shit they need to update their anti-cheat is what they need to do no, nah, they need to not have anti-cheat in my opinion i actually like what they're doing i like that they're looking at behavior um, I like that that's the approach that they take on top of other things. I'm actually not a big fan of anti-cheat software in a game like Diablo. Um, really? Why not? Yeah. Yeah, because uh, anti-cheat software is very uh, invasive and actually leaves your computer very vulnerable to malicious shit from not Blizzard, but like from other people. Just leaves a back door open wide on your computer. Um, and so it's in my opinion for a game like diablo where the pvp is is uh not there's not really a huge focus on it oh. like they oh. they shouldn't really compromise uh the the security of their users with anti-cheat software for a game like diablo but uh i just found a pair of boots called so soul shanks oh no shit it's so funny hey, oh hey. shit <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's talking about the soul shanks that used to exist way back in the day, back in LOD, man. They used to be a, 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 a 07 item or 08 item. 08, yeah. Yeah. Oh my gosh, those things were dope. But they, those were definitely not as good as soul shanks. No, nah, man. Those had like strength. They're dexed on them or something like that. They were insane. Yeah, they Dude, those were so good. Fun. Remember, uh, G's birds were my favorite. Yup. Okay, Cam, stop crap. Stop giving me crap. Do Necro 20 FCR. Okay, not bad. 
Warden Ooh. anti cheat is outdated. People have exploited it for years on D2. Yeah, uh, put it this way I botted for years through anti cheat, Warden anti cheat. Uh, the, the way that Warden, uh, Warden anti cheat worked is I actually liked Warden anti cheat because it was not anti cheat software that backdoored your computer. It actually only looked for behavior and sniffed packets being sent to the server. So yes, it's a little less accurate uh, as to whether or not people are running programs behind the scenes. Like it doesn't know that, but all it knows is if you give me any information that's fucking weird that I don't agree with, that doesn't seem right on my end, I'm gonna flag it. Uh, and if you, uh, you know, if your behavior is odd, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you a realm down. I actually like that. I think that's appropriate and should probably be in place for D2R. Um, it, it just makes sense, uh, you know, in a game that's not entirely focused on PvP. It, it, it makes total sense. Uh, I should buy these amulets back, right? Yeah, buy these amulets back. Good thing we didn't miss that. Mm. Mm. Oh, this would have rolled something better. God damn it, I got two Necro, 20 FCR, three Dex. And it's like, I wish I could have rolled some more stats. Fucking shit. I got a couple of plain 220. Yeah, so I mean... Know, you roll enough of them, eventually you'll hit one with another mod, right? I've been getting like some crazy, like... like I was just hoping gambled, to get better stats. I've gambled you know? like 75 220s. Yeah, first, exactly. In the first hour of Crazy, bro. Yeah, it's, I found it's insane, dude. That's a lot more than me. I don't know how you're gambling so far. Is it? Uh, is it? Is this worth anything uh, for Sin uh, Max, or is it even worth keeping two to traps, 97 lightning damage, 8% life stolen, 16 strength, 16 dex, probably 20 all res? No, probably not. If it's not, it doesn't have faster cast rates. No, no, I see this right. Okay. Mod wise, it would have been amazing. If I, I noticed. Had... I noticed that's like a key yeah. ingredient. That yeah, 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 yeah. Just because. The... Yeah, Joy. Not not a lot of people think about the security of the users with uh, with anti cheat software. Like it makes sense in first person shooter. That's that's about it. Like it makes sense in first person shooter because it's all PvP and it's fucking tilting when someone's cheating. It doesn't make sense at all in in a game like this. But it leaves your ports open. You are right though. Yeah, it like but leaves it's... them wide open. Yeah, and yeah, it's, completely it's open. So stupid. <clears throat> Yeah, and and then when someone wants to like attack you or try to like steal your information, someone hit my wife in the in her game. Yeah, it's not it's not uh, it's not the best of ideas. Yeah, and I think for, it's for D two is just like look at the behavior. I think what they're doing is great. Just like look yeah. at the behavior. I think they're also limited by law about what they can do in certain areas too, because not, it's not all countries that will allow you to install certain uh, software on other on uh, on your on people's computers, unless you. Uh, they can get around most right? laws by waivers. Uh, well, waivers, I, I shouldn't yeah. say that they can. They can't get around a law, but like if there's, if there's causes of action is like probably what I assume you're talking about is like causes yes. of action. Where like, right. oh, this person, you know, opened up a vulnerability on my computer and I got attacked for exactly. it. Like, exactly. Like you can you can waive your right to sue through waivers. Uh, like. Yeah, you know, I so guess, that's... I guess, I guess. Yeah, you're right. But I mean, well, did they actually do that? Is my is, is my question? Was they actually? Oh yeah, do that for sure, part? for sure. You yeah. don't think their legal team's gonna be looking at that yeah. and being like, yup. So. <laughs> yeah, guaranteed, guaranteed. Yeah. Blizzard, so. No doubt. Bro. So what kind of behavior is he doing to get himself banned? I have no idea, oh, dude. Probably just bot? looking like, like a bot. Or using a bot. Quick question. The anti-cheat system doesn't flag you on game creation. It flags you for repeated char steps and telly start stomp locations. Um, I don't believe that's the case. In LOD, what it flagged you for was game creation. And uh, it's, it flagged you on game creation and packets being sent to the server. So what that means is like each packet would mean something. It would mean an action in game. And like you could actually send packets to the server that it would accept. And then later on the server could go back and be like, that wasn't right. Like there was something about that. That's why, that's why people could send packets they could bot and then get banned a few days later or like a few months later because when they do the audit and they're just like that packet was not okay 
like you know basically so one for example one packet that you could uh that you could send was to enter the world stone from mount aria uh but that packet doesn't make any sense if your character doesn't have the uh ancients quest done right but it theoretically would accept it and that was actually a backdoor thing that people could do through a program. They could enter the World Stone without having done Ancients. And it was just a packet. It was just a simple packet to be sent. Where you stand close to the door, send the packet, boom, you enter the door. Like, then when it goes and gets audited, like whenever they, whenever the, the server would audit and look for weird packets, that would be flagged and it would be like, I'm not sure what that was, but that certainly was a third party program. So we're gonna temp ban this guy for three weeks. And if you do it again, we're gonna temp ban you for, uh, you know, a couple months or whatever. And if you do it again, we're gonna ban your entire computer account and IP. Like, I actually like it. I think that was kind of cool. Yep, yeah, kind of a fan of it, honestly. Why could this not have faster cast rate? Oh wait, never mind. That's two to curses. Trash. Oh shit! Did I sell these in the right place? Yeah, I did. Whoo! I was a little worried there for a minute. I gotta get back in high level gambling mode. I'm. Not, I should be gambling on circlets, right? Yeah, we shouldn't be doing this stupid, this stupid shit. Stupid amulet stuff. I suppose while I'm here, though, I could keep the good ones that sell for a lot. That that's probably something we could do. Oh, look at this! And then I find then I find an LLD amulet when I switch to my HLD boy, my HLD boy. Then I find one that's actually better than most of my chargers. And this is probably going on God, boys. I'm not gonna lie. This is actually really good. Uh, is a 20 fast run walk adds uh, 7 through 30 cold damage. Uh, level 18 circlet ain't good. So cold damage and it's 30 fat 30 faster run walk. Uh, 20 faster run walk level 18. How much cold damage? Uh, 7 through 30. Probably not, but it's. I don't know. That would be a good facts question to tell you the truth. Because yeah. uh, I mean, I, I would I would probably well, I mean, I definitely would sell it to except for that. You, you know, you were talking about uh, your godlike sort, but I'm like, what is this? You know? Yeah, like it, it's probably a facts question, because to be completely honest, the cold damage is actually not dead at level 18 because it's so hard to get cannot be frozen. Um, like you, you have practically one option in, in, in at that level. And if you force people to give up, like, any good belt to use Death's belt, which is stupid, if you have any cold damage. So, it's probably not a bad idea. It's, it's probably not oh. horrible. But, but wouldn't anyone wanting cold damage just use a spell charm, or is that not available at level 18? It is, but the damage isn't significant enough to actually carry through for PvP. In most, in oh. most, uh, you know what I mean? Like, it's, it doesn't do Oh, so it wouldn't even kill? Enough. What's that? It wouldn't even chill at all. I'm not. A, I'm not a hundred percent, honestly. Okay. I'm not a hundred percent. But I do or, know for like for example, you remember 08 Azurath or 07 or 08, 09 Azurath, with that when it was a crystal sword. Mhm. Mm like the the one of the reasons why that was so good is because it had cold damage on it. Like that was that was a big thing. So yeah, I mean. I'm not sure though. I'm not sure how contemporarily good it is. Put it this way: even if it's usable, it's very niche, and I I I can almost promise you it's not super usable. What about a twenty to dex three open socket tier? Yeah, I got one with thirty dex, and it was actually it's actually good. So yeah, twenty, I, you that's a keeper. I would probably keep it. It's probably not worth too much because now, especially people are going to be looking for perfects. But like, it's certainly not trash. Cause the dexterity equates to one percent enhanced damage on a Zon. Right. Fifty percent off vendor prices. I'm not sure actually, Corey. There was a debate as to whether or not it was actually working in single player. I'm not sure if it does. But yeah, that's exactly what they did. They totally fucked it, dude. You can like, it's in, infinite gambling, dude. I'm, I'm sure like everybody in their mother right now is like gambling on D2R. In, infinite gamble. Yeah, I switched over from WoW for this shit. 
yeah, that's how important this shit is. That's how, like, once in a lifetime. Like, if you're just chilling tonight, you should probably gamble. Yeah, yeah, probably some people don't. Probably some people gave up. They were like, oh, yeah, all right. Like, especially after yesterday when they gave, they their big perk for the day was 50% extra gold fine. I'm sure some people were like, all right, fuck these guys. Like, they have no idea what they're doing. <laughs> this fucking holiday spirit. Yeah, I'll... Probably trash for a level 27, one to shape-shifting skills, nine to 25, cold damage, 100% enhanced defense. Magic damage reduced by three. Trash. That's what I thought. It's the 100% uh, uh, enhanced damage defense is why I was like, eh, maybe. Defense really doesn't matter. The only the only time your 100% enhanced defense is gonna matter is on something that's e rep and has inherently high defense anyway. So like on an e rep ornate plate LLD. Those can get up to like 11, 1200 defense if you have E-Rap and like 100 enhanced defense. But if it doesn't have naturally high enhanced defense, like a like a circlet has pretty low defense in, in general, it's not really going to matter that much. First, you know, level 20, 22, 28% uh, enhanced damage, 47 life. Uh, they can go up to 60 life at that level and 30 ED. Uh, not trash. I wouldn't char see it. It's it's probably not worth a ton, but it's it's certainly useful. Two combat skills, twenty faster cast rate, level thirty circular. Does it have any other mods? That's it. Trash. Wait, 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 what was it again? Two to combat skills, P comb two twenty. Yeah. Is that worth socketing at least to make it better no. or no? Trash. Okay. I think it probably roll, roll one socket anyways. Well, it could potentially roll two, but the best thing that you would do in LLD is put two perfect skulls in it. Yeah. Uh, and and you could, like, because you can't put bear runes in it and stuff like that at that level. So basically, uh, you know, you're, you'd are you rather have a rare that has 220 and, like, mana life resistances or something like two. that and then just go one socket. Two to combat skills, Barbarian, 73 attack rating, all resistance 15 for a level 30. I'm so sorry, but there's so much information coming at me right now. It's um, it's like difficult for my brain to process it all. If it's just, if it's good, just hold on to it. If you think like, oh man, this could be good. Just hold on to it. <laughs> Who am I well, to say? I, I, I'm not, I don't really look for LLD items. That's why I was asking. That's an LLD item. Yeah. Just hold on to it and we can like debrief later. Like if, right, just, cool. if it's like questionable and you're like, I don't know. Put it this way though. I will say this in general about LLD items is I feel like a lot of people underestimate LLD items and what they can possibly be. Like LLD items can be absolutely savage. Like they can be like, you can get five NATO helms, five trap claws at LLD. Like, you can actually get savage shit. Like, that is probably good for most high level duelers. No, we we'll sleep. We can sleep when we die, dude. Sleep when you run out of gold. That's right. I'll sleep. Yes. Sean, I'll fucking sleep when I run out of gold. How's that sound? When I run out of gold in this game, then we can take a break. Then we can sleep. But until then, we're going strong, bro. I will sleep when I run out of gold. You know, I, it's I good I purchased 24 Mountain Dew Purple Thunders. Oh shit, I got a ton of Mountain Dew in the fridge. I should probably drink that. That's what got caffeine in it and shit. I should probably switch to, I should actually, it's, it's now midnight, past midnight. So it's probably okay to brew coffee. Dude, I, I am like fired up. I feel like I've been streaming coffee, five coffee minutes and it's been fucking good. eight and a half hours, dude. I, 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 I'm fucking ready to go, dude. I'll do this all night. Like, I'm so fired up about this. Oh my god. It feels like it's been five minutes. I feel like I just started this. I feel like, I feel like, oh man, I'm just getting my groove on now. You know what I mean? Oh, it's, it's, time is a construct made up by man, boys. Can't give it too much credit. It's like, yeah, so what? It's 
so what we'll be probably doing this till like 2 p.m tomorrow and then we get a huge experience boost for the next day it's like well we're staying up another 24 hours yeah exactly like it, time is a construct made up by man technically if you want to break it you guys like science you like that macro bio oh boy science here's some science for you you can stay up for 11 How? you can stay up for 11 days straight before you die so as far as i'm concerned we've got 10 days left right and like that's a long fucking time they really got to be cool. trying hard uh, you know cool to kill me. I'm, I'm kind of expecting a, a something big tomorrow cuz you know it's how many of us are going to get banned <laughs> Well, no, no, I'm, I'm saying the whatever theme of the day is, you know, I, I would figure that the Saturday and Sunday, they would have some kind of, you know, nice thing, maybe experience or a room drop rates, you know, something that they would think is good, you know, not, not like today's, you know, yeah. simple Black Friday uh, the vendors, you know, it's like, <laughs> yeah. This was so, so they yeah. probably didn't have a backup plan. Somebody at corporate was like, they thought of this and they thought they were so cute. They were like, they were. <laughs> They were like, oh, God, this is kind of cool. They were like, uh, you know, it's going to be Friday, so we'll call it a Black Friday event. And, they, ev like, everybody at the table at that meeting was like, God damn it, Jimmy, you're so smart. That was That's such a good call. And they didn't even think of a backup plan. Like, what if that was busted and we actually – they didn't think it through. They were like, yep, Black Friday, sales, vendors, makes sense. Jimmy, sign us up, put it on the agenda. We're done here. We're done here. We're all going home. We're all going Somebody home. Spend some time with your families. Raise. Yeah, <laughs> that was exactly. Yeah, give Jimmy that person a raise. raise. Putting him in so... charge of future development for patches no, and shit. Yeah. <laughs> he did us right. <laughs> I want yeah. to believe they knew. It's a nice gift. It certainly is a very nice gift. He did us right and then said, let's get yeah, it. Fucking house, be ready man. to be yeah. up for uh, 48 hours because but, we don't but know what's coming tomorrow. If you think about it. It's yeah. still kind of like, I mean, it is a nice gift, but if you think about the amount of time you have to still spend gambling to get something, yeah. it's not like they're not doing it for like an infinite amount of time. It's limited. So, I mean, even then it's, but the chances of us getting something that's super godly is still not as high as you think it would be. Right. Right. But it's like, uh, it, think of it this way, Dio. Like, Dio. think of it this way. Yeah, think, I know. Think of I'm like, imagine, imagine your wife came home one day and was just like, I usually don't allow this, but I will allow you to do anything you want to my body for the next 24 hours. You would suddenly sure consider that, whether or not your crazy. sleep patterns were like appropriate <laughs> for the situation you've just figured out, right? Like you would be like, perhaps I could get away maybe with not sleeping today. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Because this this opportunity may never present itself I, I, again I, I in think, the future. I, I think that offer would get me off of the elbow too right like that's what i'm saying like you just have to yeah. kind of think of it in context like okay yeah sure theoretically i could break this up over time and in the future i could do it for like an hour a day or something you know but this is a very unique opportunity uh that i feel as though i should not pass up you know what i mean what's what's the uh skill that you want for uh skill tree for uh sins we should go for it good assassin uh, skills 20 fcr uh from uh, uh, so it has to be assassin it can't be a specific tree uh i mean i almost, just, I mean, like, I almost just i almost just control click sold this it was like luckily i mean i'm probably traps. still gonna do it but like i'm so glad i looked at this a second time Holy shit, I saw enhanced something in, in 20 cast. Oh my god, but it has max damage on it, so it's trash, unfortunately. There's a glitch. There's a glitch, boys. Well, I went to sleep several hours ago. Cooley was buying amulets. I'm awake now. Cooley is still here. Uh, Mihail, welcome. Welcome to the stream. We'll be here. You want to, if, if you probably go to sleep again for like another eight hours and wake up, I'll probably still be doing this, bro. Like, this is. I'm going to be here a while. Because we got a good Christmas gift. All right, I don't think I'm ever gonna see that one again. Yeah, uh, I, I, you think it's unfortunate Blizzard hasn't implemented anything for single player yet, dude. This is here's the thing: is like, 
Dude, I actually can't sell it. This is why I didn't control click it. Because look, I can't sell it. It won't let me control click. Control click, boys, won't let me do it. Good thing. This uh, just wants me to keep this little item right here. Isn't that something? Can't even oh, get rid of it if I wanted sell. to. If I could control sell, I fucking wouldn't even be doing this. <laughs> oh my like, god, dude. It wouldn't I'd let me do like, it. I'd be like, fuck this shit. You gotta fucking hover over every time. Fuck maybe this maybe this enhanced damage max damage glitch just like carries through and it's like uh by the way it glitches the entire server now now surely this is how to create a stale reference i think when you told me that it was a possibility for a stale reference i was assuming you meant this when you try to sell something like this but it won't do it because right there there's a stale reference it's like there's an attempt to do something to remove it it's still there there's still a remove request active and it may or may not have been closed. So like you might be able to overwhelm the server if you just keep doing this and opening up removal requests that like don't ever get closed. So like you send a packet, remove this from my inventory and sell it. It rejects it and like I hope it closes it because we're not getting any messages. There's no return, there's no return anything. There's nothing returned for a packet, just boom open no return no response there's some sort of packet floating out there that might be a stale reference duplicate your gg circlet yeah let's do it let's figure it out let's figure out how to break this what's the trapper whirlwind sin called uh there's a couple of names for it spider hype sin it, it just depends on what you're doing Spider or, or hybrid. Probably a spider is the best name for it, though. If you call it a spider, people will know what you mean. Most GG circlet found so far was mine. I haven't seen anybody find anything more hype than my circlet. You want, you want to see it? Hold on. I, I actually kind of miss it. I actually want to take a look at it in my stash. Uh, if it's still there. If I didn't move it. Did I move it somewhere? Did I? Oh no, I did. It's right here. This is this is the best circlet found on Americas right here. This is it. You're gonna look at it and you're gonna be like, "Wow, that seems stupid. That's really dumb, Cooley. That's a stupid circlet." And to which I will remind you, uh, a lot of things happened with this. We rolled a perfect 30% enhanced damage on this level 18, level 16 required helm. It rolled perfect defense, and we took it to Larzuk and got two sockets. Show me anybody, show me somebody. Show me somebody that did that somewhere on Battle.net. No one, no one did. That's the best one on Battle.net. No one has anything close. Sell it for 100K, do it. It's probably not worth 100K, but I would say, put it this way. If I was patient enough, I could probably sell that for at least 20. Like, if I was patient, it's probably 20 to 30 because it's 100% perfect in every way. It's like not only a collector's item, but very desirable at that level for people a certain build, for a very LOD popular build. D2R? What's that? The people even out uh, low level duel in D2R? Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Yep, yeah, they do. Good. Oh, this was close too. But it's not perfect, so we gotta trash it. Or do we? We could put this on the... No, we're not putting this on that guy. Stash or trash, a, remember? Stash or trash, that's right. It's trash. I have rares that are better than that thing. You have five have of those? Any. Do you have any that are 100% perfect, though, with the two sockets? Because if you do, then you duped them, or you're lying, or, you, or you're cheating. It's a screenshot. That's all. Yeah, screenshots, or you duped them all. Yeah, mine is actually the best. It's not possible to have one better than mine. That is a fact. It's 100% fact. Mine is Somewhere. the best one on Battlemate. There is none better than mine like that on Battlemate. You probably have it similar, but that's about it. Right, exactly. Yeah, that, it's actually better on... I, I might make an entirely new low-level dueler on that. Like, I might actually make a level 18 dueler on that. Like, that's, that's a really good helm, dude. It's just, it's really, really good. Uh, the heck, why is my, I mean, my playlist fucking pausing now? What the, what the hell is going on?
we done stream so long, the playlists are fucking up. It's just like we uh, we got nothing for you, bro. We got nothing for you. We're running out. Of, we're running out. We don't know what to do. Play them all. Here we go. Check the mic and make sure it sounds Cheer. Right, uh. Yup. Y'all know what's up. Hmm. Now this is the kind of music that we listen to when we find the absolute godly. So do you think we were done because we found a perfect level 18 helm? Nah. Gross. There's so much there's so many more things to be found. Did the dishes already go down? What? Papa Cooley, you're going to be you're going to be live for a while. I work nights. I just got up a little bit ago. Dude, jam it. We're, yeah. We'll be We'll be here a bit. We'll, we'll be here. This is only this is, this is only phase one. Yeah, this is. We'll be here a little bit. In fact, if you want to, come on in, pop into the Discord on the join the stream. You know, we almost did it again there with life. You see that? You see? Ooh. Almost did it again, but we're gonna have to trash that. It's not perfect. At this point, we've got high standards. Yeah, it might actually happen. It, it might actually happen. Oh my god. See, I like this dude. This seed is still having a propensity to roll perfects. Like, so many times. Like, we've seen perfect strength rolls, dex rolls, the, the uh, skill tabs when they pop up. Telling you, there's something about this seed, bro. And and when we were doing it, granted, we were only doing it for like an hour before, you know, but we weren't seeing anything perfect. Nothing was popping up perfect. It, it wasn't good at all. And we switched the seed, we farmed a good seed, and here we go. Now we're rolling the best items on Battlenet. Wonder how many griffins have been gabled for? God damn, there's probably a lot, dude. There's probably people that have certainly found griffins at this point. Multiple people. Price of griffins is probably going down the shitter. <laughs> like, not even lying, dude. That, sure. Griffins, sure. now is the time to buy. Perf, perf Griffins, all over the place. Oh yeah, Perf Griffins. Well, sort of like what happened with Annihilus Charms, right? Like, when if you if you remember when D2R launched, Annihilus Charms were like, I don't know, you could probably buy an unidentified Annihilus Charm for like eight thousand forum gold. Mm -hmm. And uh, now, uh, to put it in perspective, 8,000 form gold would get you about eight perfect annies, like 100% perfect annies. And and at the start of D2R, it would get you a, an unidentified one. Uh, and that's just because there's so much more bots playing. There's so many more things that have happened. Uh, you know, there's less total people that are online. But uh, that same thing is about to happen with, with Griffins. Like yep, this event, sure. this event is gonna make it so that there's very likely far. Yeah, I mean there won't be like perfect griffins out there, but yeah. this event alone, you can already tell just based on like the server. There's yeah. there's so many more. people doing this. So I don't like think it's gonna be significant. Yeah, you know, we'll see. Was, it was more of that it became server wide. That's why the, the price tanks before it was everyone was controlling the market by keeping it in private games. That's true. That's true, actually. Yeah, we'll see, man. We will see. Let's see what the price of this does. By the way, someone, someone, next time you see Joby, make sure to harass him and tell him Cooley literally was streaming for eight and a half hours and still didn't misclick uh, his his inventory and sell his charms. <laughs> <laughs> you I think Joby fucking didn't. knock on some wood. <laughs> <laughs> no, fuck. I I hope I do. I just want to know how long I could go at this point. So I'd be like, oh, Joby, you yeah. Know I, I know you you, you misclicked like these. three times in the first thirty minutes. It's been at least I made it nine hours before I did it once. Let's say I, it actually won't happen. I'm actually not gonna misclick. Uh, you know, I'll say that dominantly because I'm a Christian and I don't believe in all this dark magic jinx bullshit. Uh, but uh, it just won't happen. 
If you fucking misclick, bro. It won't happen, dude. It won't happen, dude. It's not gonna. It's not gonna. Y'all sitting around waiting for it. It's not gonna happen, man. I can promise you that. It's just zero chance. Zero chance of misclick. Never say never, Cooley. Never say never. There's yeah, something weird we'll happening with Ewoks too. I can't believe they are all legit. Oh yeah, like there's certainly people like duping SOJs or something, because uh, there's been so many clone walks. It's been absolutely ridiculous. That or there's I'm an astronomical amount of bots. Neither would there's surprise of, me. I know. I know there's a lot of like there's a couple there's a bot that, are, that a lot of these people are using that are uh, they don't take up a lot of uh, let's say this processing speed on your PC, so you could run like two three at a time. Yep. Uh, while running the game in uh, G mode, basically. Yep. Uh, in legacy mode, and you could run like maybe like two, three bots at once. So it, it wouldn't surprise me that, like, let's say these uh, website companies that sell items are, are doing it in a massive scale, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, for sure. This one's really cool. This rolled, uh, like, look, I love the propensity on this C, dude. Perfect 100 life, but unfortunately, three curses. But yeah, dude, uh, that's just, that's just how it is. Like the thing is with the current dupe method that I know about, which which uh, when I made that guess video is that when I was guessing how the dupe method would work, I was actually extremely close. By the way, it was very very close as to how that actually works. Um, so I do now know exactly how it works. But I will say this: it's weird that walks have been happening on ladder because the method that actually works that I know about works on non ladder. It doesn't work on ladder. Like you couldn't and, just willy nilly do it on ladder. Like, and will those items poof as well, or, or are they perm? That's the question. Uh, that I don't know. I haven't found any solid confirmation as to whether or not things like jewels don't poof after you put them in items. Some mm. people have said that they do. Some people say that they don't. Um, mm. But like, it used to be back in the days of LOD, if you would socket a duped jewel into an item, you were you were fine. It would just perm. It would become part of the item. It's not entirely clear if that's the case in D2R. Okay. That would fucking suck. Yeah. Put it this way. It's not something like it's something that you needed to have active knowledge on before the ladder reset or you needed to accidentally do before the ladder reset. It's impossible to set it up right now, but it is certainly possible to set it up for next ladder season. And I don't I don't want to say it mainly because I don't dare do it. And because it's certainly an exploit. And that's certainly something that can get you banned, so I wouldn't dare do it. And I don't want the information to be out there. Mm -hmm. Actually, fuck it. You know what? You guys want to know how to do you guys want to know how to do it? Fuck it, dude. Let them fucking patch it. The more people that do it, maybe... Fuck it. Don't you guys want to know? You guys want to know how to do it? it? Okay. All right. This is how to do it. I'll tell you how to do it right now. So, in your ladder season, you got to do something. That's what I want you guys to do right now, right? This is kind of cool. I'm actually going to keep that. Start crafting rings and amulets. Craft a shitload of them. Craft an absolute metric ass ton of rings and amulets. Okay? That was correct in the video. Yeah, I would agree. This is gonna be a cheers moment. This is, I'm, I'm, I'm not fucking trolling you. I'm gonna tell you guys how to do right now. Like, the, I'm not even lying. I know the tone that I'm taking right now, you're probably like, he's just setting up a joke. He's gonna fucking troll us. No, I'm gonna tell you exactly how to do it trolling us because he's telling us yeah like so this is it currently still works like on non-ladder and if they don't change anything when the ladder resets it will certainly work on next season on non-ladder so you make a whole bunch of amulets like crafted rings amulets all this stuff and you put them in your ladder shared stash. Fill your ladder shared stash. Literally just about every tab. So like, I'll, I'll, I actually gotta make a trip to the stash. I'll show you what I mean. Like, I'll show you what I mean because this is gonna get very specific, right? You do this. You go over to your, your shared stash 
and you craft a shit ton of amulets and you fill up this tab, all of it, every single square of this tab right here, you're gonna fill that up with one by one, like amulets and rings, nothing else, all rings and amulets. Like fill all of this thing up. This tab, fill it all up. Fill this tab up, all rings, amulets, boom, boom, boom. Fill it all up. This tab, fill it all the way up to like, fill up 60% of it. That's a good way to put it. Fill up 60% of this. So pick six rows, fill it up, right? Uh, if you really wanna make sure it works, you can fill more. Right, but you have a very small area on this tab where when you fill all of this shit up, right, with all one by ones, rings, amulets, fill it all up, right? And then let's just assume it's this area right here, right? What I would do is you then on lat on non-ladder, when the season resets, boom, you'll have two stashes that you can switch back and forth between. Switch to your old ladder stash. So look at like your previous ladder stash and then try to overload the game with shit. You see how we're, we're selling amulets to this vendor right here? Do that. Go buy a whole bunch of amulets, right? Like you go into the trade, you fill this vendor up with amulets, go fill another one up with amulets, overload the, the vendors, overload everything, right? Then once you've done that, you fill the vendors up, you overload them, and you've essentially overloaded the game. Then just go take items out of that area. Take them out, save and exit, go make another game. Open it up, they'll still be there and they'll also be in your inventory. Like, and then what you can do is if you've duped jewels or whatnot, you can put them in something and try it out. You know, you could do it that way. There's a lot of things you could do, uh, but that's basically how it works. And I tell you that because I honestly want people to break it so they have to do something about it. Like, that's how to do. And they, they apparently have not fixed it. Like it's still so have you duped anything? Let's like say a bird ruin and socketed it into anything. Uh, so here's the thing too, is from what I understand, runes don't work because they're so like, there's such low memory that even if you do that, it's such low memory that it will remember that you've done that. Okay, you need an item. Then, you need like, like an item that has a lot of stats on it. So like you need to take, Oh yeah, that's another piece of the dude. It, it has to work on items that have a lot of stats on them. So like a jewel that has four abilities will work, right? Because there's four lines of code there for this item. Like rune words will work. That's why an enigma got duped. And that's why the runes for the enigma didn't get duped. But a, an enigma is a lot of abilities. So it got duped. People kept pulling it out of their stash like that. And it would just reappear there. It would just keep being there every time they'd go back in. Uh, but jewels will work, uh, certain helms will work, like maybe this would work because it has a lot of abilities on it, like, but that's sort of an unknown. Like, it, you don't exactly know which items will work or not, but it tends to be rune words with a lot of abilities or items with a lot of abilities, such as jewels, such as rings or whatnot, those will do. Yeah, it's, but it, the item has to have a lot of abilities on it. It's, it is not speculative, it 100% works, but it only works on certain items like that have a lot of abilities on them, basically. It can't be a rune. Like, it just doesn't have enough abilities on it to, to like not allow the server to save. The reason why it works is because the server tries to save one by one every single amulet that's in your shared stash, every single thing. Oh yeah, overload your non-ladder stash too. It tries to save everything that's in your non-ladder stash. It tries to look at, ev it tries to wipe everything from the vendors when you leave the game and it can't do it. Like it can't do it in time before you join another game and then that item's there. But what it does do is it takes the path of least resistance. So when you save, and exit the game, it will say, okay, what's the easiest thing to do right now? And it will say, okay, this rune was removed from the stash that has a one by one with this source of code. Let's start there, boom. So it will save that that rune was gone and it will try to work its way down so that it quickly gets everything. But if that item that you've taken out takes up more space than all of the rest of the shit in the stash, then it will be done last. So it will say, okay, like it's better to just wipe the vendors and then go and save all of this stuff. It literally tries to prioritize on the server. And like, then it can't do it. It gets to it last. You join another game. It's still in your shared stash. You can take it out again. 
Interesting. Yeah, like, so it's, that's currently how it works. But like, have you tried socketing like a jewel or anything that you've duped in any, into an item? I, I haven't duped anything. Like I, I, I haven't, like, I didn't know about this before it started. Otherwise I probably would have tried, but from the people that know about it, like they say that jewels have been the way to go. Like right. they certainly were, but I don't know if they perm. It's unclear if they, if they perm. That would be crazy. Yeah. Can you do best for Jays? Good question. I don't know. Because it's like theoretically, I mean, it would be a lot of work, but if you get uh, 120 accounts set up with that, that's infinite declones. Well, the, you got you have to also figure that the items will poof. Like, so they yeah, do have well, unique item IDs. Well, so yeah, let's, um, let's, let's say you do like 20 SOJs, yeah. you would have to immediately sell them on the server. Yeah. Well, that's yeah. why I said that if you if you have it set up with that many individual SOJs. Well, actually, wouldn't even need that many accounts. You just need an individual, like maybe a handful of SOJs per account. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's it's it's true. Like you, you could theoretically do it. Even if you could only do one, you could just keep taking it out, selling it, save an exit, take it out, sell it, save an exit, take it out, sell it, save an exit. Like, yeah, no doubt. Level or er, one to assassin skills, 10 fast recast rate, four minimum damage, 26 life, fire resist, 20 percent, level 29. Amulet. Too much stuff in my brain, bro. Just, just house it. How's it. Just house it. God I'm, I think it. my brain is like taking a break from even just looking at my own circuits. <laughs> like I'm just going off feeling at this point. I'm just seeing them and I'm like trash. Like I, I don't even think it's just a feeling. How does this circlet make me feel when I see it? As a, yeah. I'm just gonna go ahead and call that trash because it's not plus two skills. <laughs> Although it is part of the items that sell for 35000 so it will go to that guy. Yeah, maybe I'll clip that and put it on Cooley Live so people know. Because it's like not something that you can actively do anymore. Like you can't set it up and start duping on non ladder But you could set it up for next season. If you know about it. it and, and assuming they don't do anything about it. It seems like a lot of work for a bunch of if. Yeah, it's certainly a lot of work to certainly do specific items. That items that will certainly poof, and that's like the other thing. Right. Is and then it, the chance that that if you do like say jewels, and you use them, and then yeah. they still might have the chance to say bye bye. Right. Like, well, that that's the thing too is like if they the answer to it on Blizzard's end, the simple answer without doing much work. And this is this is the scary part because the simple answer is to just make it so that when people socket things it keeps its unique item id and the game always looks into the sockets to see what the item is and if it's a dupe it poofs it right. that it's a very simple answer that actually fixes the problem and it's very little work because that would be the only real advantage that duping like this would give like you would just have a bunch of people scamming on jsp and shit like, but that's about it. You just have a whole bunch of people getting could, scammed. Can, I think it would be fucking having, uh, if in. you could do brewings and shit, that way the market would just fucking crash on runes. <laughs> yeah, it, it, from what I understand, runes, if you try to dupe a rune, it will recognize that that is, it's just too easy to save a rune. So it starts there and like I suddenly- I just missed the days of going to JSP like, and being like, I need a 4015 and buying right. it for like 15 form gold. Right, well that's the thing. Technically you could do that. Like if you had yeah. a 4015 jewel, let's say, or even just a really good rare jewel, theoretically yeah. jewels are the best. Like they, they transfer pretty well. So like theoretically that can happen on non ladder right now. If someone knew about the glitch and they just stacked up 4015s or even let's say someone found a 3069 they could just keep printing those fucking things. Like just boom, take it out of the shared stash. <laughs> there you go, sell it. This is unperm, socket it in something right away. That could that could certainly like happen. The, the problem with the, all with items pooping is that like the common Joe gets fucked. You know, it's like the people right. that don't know about it that trade for it are like, oh, cheap enigma for trade, and then it poops on them. Right. You know, they're not happy with it, and they had no part in the actual duping, or you know, so. Fuck that yeah. guy. This is Diablo too. 
I mean, it's uh, that's kind of well, shitty, you know. If you pay for items that poof because you didn't know that they were duped. I, I think that's a. I think that's honestly a common fallacy, Rod. That the that the sites like the sites that are selling items are duping. Uh, I actually think they have the biggest incentive to not sell unfirm items, like without saying that they're unfirm. And like all, most of the sites out there are are selling perm items, like so they're not like they're not duped uh, for the most part. Uh, sure, if there is a way that I don't know about that they're that they're duping, sure, maybe. But like, from in my experience, the item websites have the biggest incentive to not sell shit items because it goes far beyond some JSP shit when a site does it, right? Like, and I know this personally. How? Because I bought from sites before who couldn't carry out my order, and they gave me all they gave me all of the items and all of my money back. Why? Because. I am Jimmy McGill, boys, and I can put the fucks to the man when someone fucks with me. Like, it goes far beyond, it goes far beyond, like, just some JSP scamming. It goes to, like, Better Business Bureau scamming, and that shit shuts businesses down, boys. Like, so they have every incentive to, like, not fuck you on trades on those sites. So, like, every incentive not to do it. So... I, I don't think the sites like that are necessarily behind it as much as people think they are. It's what really what Max says. It's like the shysty people who know that yep, they can get yep. away with scamming on JSP that are doing it. Or the people that are willing to sell unperms on JSP stating that they're unperms that are doing it, that are making the most out of it. Most of the time, though, when people do that on JSP, they get put on blast pretty, pretty hard. Yeah, yeah. Like they'll get put on blast, but even the even the people back in LOD, they would at least say that they're you know treat as unperm. Like they would let people right, know right, this is right. very likely not a perm item. Like, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, like, and that's I think that's a fair way to do it. Like, yeah, you let yeah. people know what they're getting into. Like, I don't know if this is perm. I don't know the history. It's probably duped. Like, don't buy it with any confidence. I think that's fair. It, it got to the point where JSP went from banning the sale of unperms to allowing it but putting the actual price up as basically nothing so you could buy like a, a duped duped bugged last wish for their their price check was 15 forum gold and it's like obviously people are paying way more for that you know what i mean like they're, they're gonna pay a lot but that was their stated price they just knew they were like okay well People are gonna do this regardless. We're sick of dealing with it in scammer accusations. We're only gonna call you a scammer if you actually tried to scam the person and they didn't know what they were getting. You know, it just saved people from bullshit so that they couldn't be like, oh, this guy sold me an unperm and that's against the rules. So it's like, well, you bought it. You know what you're getting into. Like, you know, so that's just kind of how it is. I think that's where they landed. Yeah, I think botting keeps D2 alive too. It's the unpopular opinion, but I agree. Like, it, you can tell it's a bot that meets you in the game, says my friend. Nah, actually, the way that they're doing it now is, um, it's actually not a bot, it's a real person. Most of the sites, they do it with a real person. Uh, because it's hard to actually... You need to pay for multiple accounts to store stuff. So what they'll do is they'll actually just pay people to store stuff and collect stuff for them to rummage through accounts and to, you know, look at spreadsheets, go gather items for orders and sell them. Uh, yeah, it's actually can confirm real people to do it. But back in LOD days, it was certainly like they didn't even meet you in game. They, they just gave you an account because you could make an account for free. Yeah. It was just like make some trash account, put all of your items on it with a bot. Here you go. That was, that was it. Crazy ass long password. Yeah, exactly. Some stupid ass long password you had to copy and paste. Yep. Duelers, I appreciate you, man. Thank you. If you can sit there and then the instant your char moves, they try and trade, it's a bot. Yeah, I've seen both. Oh, no shit. My friend has. Wink. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah. It, it could also... You, you could be right because it could also depend on the site. Like, I only know it from one or two sites, maybe, 
that I have it, that I don't have some that I have direct experience with, one that I have direct experience with, one that I, people have just told me about. But I, I, I don't actually like, I don't trust all the sites out there, so I, I, I figure if you're going to do it, pick one and pick and stick. Find the best one, do your research, pick and stick. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Good thing we didn't control click that. That would have been a big misclick. Yeah, and technically it's not uh, its not against terms of service to buy items. It's only against terms of service to sell them. Uh, interesting loophole, boys. It, it's an interesting loophole, but it's true. You say all you want, but it, its you can buy items. You just can't sell them. That's the only thing that's against terms of service. Yeah, it's odd, but it's true. It's good. Cool. It, it, boys, Jimmy McGill, boys. Jimmy McGill. I've been putting the fucks to the man for a very long time. You, and you, wait, before you put the fucks to the man, you have to know the rules. You have to know how to put the fucks. You have to know where to put the fucks. You have to know who to put the fucks. You have to also know what the risks are. The risks are this. I, you know, you gotta, I, I gotta remind you boys of this. That everybody thinks that, you know, even with the rules and being what they are and things being what they are, it boils down to this. Battle.net can ban you for whatever the fuck they want, whenever. It, it doesn't matter. They don't need a reason. So like that's that's also a thing. Like you can we can talk about rules and do all of this stuff, and people can rally and uh, root for the people that get banned and to unban them and all of this stuff. But the truth of it remains that they can ban you for whatever they want, whenever. You have no you have no uh, entitlement to bla the battle net servers. Like just because you bought the game, they don't actually owe you the right to play on their servers. So so there's also that. Life is unfair. It's like a box of chocolates. That's right. Box of chocolates are unfair. You never know what you're gonna get, man. But you never know when they could absolutely, you know, morph and fuck you two. The chocolates do that every once in a while. And they'll, you know, you just never know. Then they'll kick you out and they'll, they'll uh, degrade you on your way out. They'll, you know, it's just, yeah. You've had a horrible experience with chocolate, haven't you? Yeah. <laughs> we'll say that. He said, he said yeah. <laughs> the chocolate. He this said, funny boy, yeah. it was a mom. I've been doing Fuck this chocolate. my whole chocolate life. <laughs> trust. If you thought you would be being trust. Yeah. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, exactly. That's what, that's what it is. That's... It's honestly true. You're at the mercy of Blizzard and their decision. It's just very true. If they decide one day, like if someone behind the scenes, if like good old Bobby Kodak someday saw one of Cooley's YouTube videos and was just like, you know what? I don't like the fucking jokes he makes. Let's ban him. Send him the automated email. You could technically do that. Well, literally, this is this is how the corporate world works. So you want to talk about fucking the men, like fucking the man, and knowing how to how to put the fucks to people. This is how companies do it. This is how like big entities do it. Is say less, like less is more. If if a company wants to be racist, like they they can do it and get away with it if they just say less. The less they say, the better it looks. Right? Or the less that people have to go off from. Like, so, if, let's say they, they wanted to make some racist decision. They just make it, and they don't say anything about it. They're technically more protected than if they gave a reason. Now, follow that reasoning and that logic down to every single decision that they make. It's better for them to not open themselves up to criticism or, like, any sort of rebuttal, be it a moral or spiritual one or a, a one that is uh, holistically correct, they What's can dodge guys? all of that if they just don't say anything. If they're just like, yep, yeah, we're going to do this and we actually have the right to do it, so we're going to do it and see what happens. And then if too much shit happens, we can always take it back. Like, that's, that's entirely... That, that's really how a lot of them work. 
Yeah. Which which one is it, dude? Which server is it? Uh, Elon Musk will buy Blizzard and delete WoW and Overwatch because he don't want his kids to play. <laughs> oh God. Pa Papa Musk, Daddy Daddy Elon, save us, take us to Mars. By the way, we just found right another sweet one. Numbers, by God. We I just found another sweet one. I gotta clip. I gotta I gotta clip that. So what is the shit that we're doing here? I just now got home. We fucking went and saw Christmas lights and stuff. Oh shit! Well, you should have told the wife. Uh, you should have told the wife, Doom. You should have said, uh, "Look, uh, there's some weird shit happening on Battle.net, and uh, we gotta." Get I can't to do that. Yeah, we gotta get to this. Yeah, infinite dude, there's, gamble, just, there's a bro. whole bunch of shit going on. Infinite gold. Yeah, infinite gold tonight, bro. We're all gambling, trying to find the best circuits around. That's what we're oh, doing. Shit, what's up? Is it going to end in 13 minutes or is it Pacific time? It's going to end at specifically 2 p.m. tomorrow, and uh, some of us will likely be gambling that entire time. I may or may not be one of those. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm going to do some, gonna do some gonna blow. What's up? No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. It's, 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 cocaine. So what uh, do you need? Right? Edge bow? And a geeds. And a geeds. Technically, you don't have to have the geeds. What's the uh, edge bow? What do you, what's the runes for that shit? Tear tower. Tower. Say what? This, this on my screen right now. Are you watching the stream, Doom? Oh, no, I didn't even know you was it's still in the oh, yeah. stream. I just thought y'all were oh, just chilling. Fuck yeah. Welcome to the stream, bro. We're in the join the stream channel on Discord. What the oh, fuck man. did you think we were doing? Yeah, we, dude, when join the stream. Dude. Join the stream. <laughs> Read the fucking channel you go into. For Christ's sake. <laughs> oh my God. What? How have you made it this far? Some people, how, how did they make it this far? Oh, God. Holy shit. Oh, please don't, don't mind him. Oh my god. <laughs> Does anybody have tear to how I am? <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> my game. I don't have it, any of those. I probably do somewhere. I'd have to I switch have my account, though. I have my game, bro. Well, I'm I on ladder, to, though. Switch. So. What game? Uh, Duke 420 password 1. Is this of good? Course. Is this I'm good? on ladder. I'm not on non ladder. Someone oh my god, you, you sound like those Facebook motherfuckers now. Is this good? Is this GG? Is this off? No, I'm this sorry. that's a legitimate question because like this could be good for like some melee build or something. Like look, this got 25% two barb skills, 25% enhanced damage, 23 strength, dex and life. Like too uh, low dex. Too low what's dex. The, what's the pass, Joe? Tell your nosy relatives and employer you are doing this to make money, uh, which will benefit them if they leave you alone. Very well said. That, and actually, we should, we should put that shit. We ought to put that like in the description or something. When people log on, if they're like, because some people might join the stream and be like, Cooley, my wife is pissed. Uh, she's saying it's fucking 2 a.m. here and I uh, she doesn't want me playing this goddamn game and we could just post that we could be like just tell them uh you're doing this to make money which will benefit them they just need to leave you alone you tell that bro to sit the fuck down <laughs> Old Hank Hill's making some rune words it needs to be an alabama man action figure with that with that uh, pull string saying ready to go did you ever see that on south park the alabama man Never no, have I what? never have I actually shit myself watching a TV show before until I saw that clip on South Park. I would highly suggest YouTube it and look Alabama Man South Park. You can oh my God. If, in case anybody in chat hasn't seen it, do it. You can thank me later. I'll also let you know that we now have memberships available on the channel afterwards for when you also shit yourself. You can say thanks, Cooley. That was I never shit myself before either. Such a nice poop. Yeah, I appreciate it. Right, I, I almost shot myself. Up I almost shot myself like uh, gambling, but then I had to go to. Then I went to the toilet. Yeah. That sounds like such a inviting group. 
This also this reminds me of Grandma's boy when he's like, "This is called the Brown Bomber." He's like, "Why is it called that? Because you get so high, you shit your pants." He's like, "No, nah, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> I already like shit my pants today." She, she can hear you. Oh shit, Brandy was that she can hear you. When I grow up, I want to be just like Alabama man. Oh my god, I can't even. I don't even feel right saying or repeating some of the shit that Alabama man said. Like. Because someone's just going to clip it, and they're going to be like, see, this is what Cooley thinks of women. Oh, God. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's fucking bad, no, dude. Anything. You got to check it out. It's bad, but it's, like, so good at the same time. Like, you'll see it, and you'll be like, oh, I get it. That's kind of funny. It's, it's so bad, it's funny. Yeah, That's dude, funny. It's good. It's good. Oh, my. <laughs> don't, don't ask. That. Joey, Joey he's, he's saying... We're taking a we're taking a whole different turn here now, Joy. You know you can't be telling them to say that you want you want these oh boys my, to stay married. Oh it's my. a very lucky I thing. Found, I just found a level thirty circulate, two to fire skills, thirty faster run walk, twenty faster cast rate, fifty one ED poison length reduced by seventy five percent, four men after each kill. Oh, oh. G G G bro, that's a good one. That's a really good one, actually. That is insanely good on a LLD Fire Sorceress, ES Fire Sorceress. That's so good. Especially with all the cheesy poison builds in LLD. That is so good. That would go forward. Good 75 fun. is max, too, I think, in LLD. Yep. Yep. Well, it's max on a that can even spawn and on a helm like that. 30 faster run walk, 20 faster cast rate. Yeah, 230, 20 Fuck. with literally anything else usable is so good oh That's socking really in that bitch and it'd be fucking ggs yeah there was dude there was so many from that episode joy that was like one of the best episodes of south park i've ever seen in my life it was so good i just hope i got a gg amir i'm so happy you joined me thanks dude pure tell am right Tier am tall. No, tier tall am. We're gonna let me have some fun. Dude. We could have gone long with that one. He'd been like, I put it in and it didn't work. I'd be like, oh shit, maybe it was like, I didn't think it was ladder only. Are you sure? We could have gone. We we could have we could have fucked it in for at least an hour. You would have never known. Like, I don't know, Cooley. I'm gonna look this up on Ari at Summit. Why is yeah. slow mode enabled on Trophy Room? Because people because are trolls. Yeah. People like to put a bunch of dog shit in there. Yeah. They're like, look at yeah, all this my dog new shit low I level found. Dueling circular is not dog shit, okay? And I still have 25 minutes. What's the What's the cooldown on it, by the way? Mine was two hours. Oh shit! Okay, we might want to fix that. That was like fucking super long time. You got the art. You got the art one like that too. It's like I post one picture and I get to post another. It's like no, you can't post for eighteen hours or something. Hold on, hold on. I'll fix that, dude. Fix <laughs> it's that. like Lord forbid I drew two pictures a week. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, wig. Drawing too fast, man. Deadly Cirque is 100. What's the fastest way to get a three open socket bow? I guess I could go to normal and go act one geeds. I'll act be right back. One. Act one geeds always has open socket, three open socket bows. I gotta walk my tactical assault pig. I'll be right back. Your tactical assault pig? Damn right, son. <laughs> now, now, MF doesn't affect, pig. MF doesn't affect gambling, right? Hold on, trophy room. Uh, no, it doesn't. No. I was thinking. I, I was going to think. Didn't. I was going to think of a creative way to troll you on that, but I couldn't. Was, no, I mean, I knew it didn't before, but I, yeah. you know, I, I, I making, haven't got I into. I was making a joke earlier this stream. I was like, look at all this gold find I got, and then I would, I would just like <laughs> farm gold from the vendor. You're like, see, it's really paying off. It's really good such great gold find that I'd just be like bin all of these amulets by the way do you know how to do this Doom? do you know what you're doing uh, no I do not know what I'm doing okay watch my stream real quick because I'm doing it I'm farming gold this is okay. what you got to do you get yourself a geeds 15% is ideal right 
And then find all of these amulets when you gamble that sell for like 28, 29, 30, 30,000 gold. You see that? They're all selling for that. Yeah. And then like basically that's the key to it, dude. That's the key right there. You just boom, sell all of these and buy them back and sell them again. Like because you're selling them for 28, 30k, something like that, right? And when you buy them back, they're all like 12k, 11k, 11k. So you just keep buying them back. Boom, farm that gold, baby. Farm that gold. Simply, simple as that. I have a gate in my inventory right now, and I'm just filling up all the stuff that I just sold back so I can get all my money back. Yep. And then so. Eventually, you're just cranking it out just like this, bro. Boom. Just make it rain. That's what <laughs> I'm surprised. Yeah, my geese. My geese is only a fucking twelve percent, but I'll have to do, I guess. Oh, you you misclicked an ohm through the gamble window. That sucks. Hey, do you make a game, and I'll give you an edge bow and fifteen geese. Oh, cool. Okay, creating game wig. Four twenty. Uh, Password one. Uh, I s did you ever get that necro rush? By the way. No, nah, man, we had to go. All right. Uh, what are your What's your schedule looking like for tomorrow? Um, open, cause the wife's going to go do Nutcracker shit, and I don't do ballerina dog shit. All right. Uh, did you tell it to her like that? Were you, was she like hundred oh, percent? Hundred percent. Watch this stuff with me, and you're like, I don't do that. No ballerina dog shit. What'd she say? She literally asked me like this. She said, <laughs> she like starts giggling. She was like, You want to come see the Nutcracker with us? Oh and I was like, shit! Fuck no. <laughs> There's lines in the sand, Cooley. Oh All right. Oh <laughs> We've been married 11 years. She knows what I won't That's do. That's fucking sweet, dude. I mean, never mind on the deeds. You're not mutter. Oh, okay. Well, it's okay. I appreciate the offer. Wait, are you on my ladder or non ladder right now? I'm on non ladder. I think I could hook you up with a geese on non ladder. Just have to let me finish transferring all this gold on the ground. Make sure no. to buy your amulets back, dude, before you leave. <laughs> They're in my inventory right now. GG, boys. We've done. We've made that mistake so many times tonight. You go and switch games or mule something, and you forget your amulets on the vendor, and then you have to go buy them again. It's like a pain in the ass. Hold on to all your geeds, by the way, because a lot of people have accidentally vendored theirs. Geed prices are going to skyrocket. Yeah, for sure. For but sure. At least you haven't jobied your torch or Annie. Yep, yep. There was somebody, uh, who was it? Brand L fucking Jobied his 2020 sword course. Brand, Brand L did, just Jobied it. That's horrible. Uh, I Jobied my 2015 10 Annie, or like, not too long ago. Oh, that's all right, dude. There's been so many clone walks, dude. Literally, we were, I was talking on stream the other day that I don't even. I donate Annie's if they're not a combined 36 stats or greater. Like, that's the bar minimum at this point. I have so many Annihilus Charms from all the walks and shit. Like, so it's luckily, dude, not a huge... Like, if I char this torch, it would suck, but it, I'm like, it's not perfect. You know, that's how I would feel about a 2015 Annie, bro. We got you. We got you. No problem. Ain't, ain't no thang. Isn't Geed supposed to be in Act 5? Uh, I thought what? he was there. Isn't Geed supposed to be in Act 5 too? Maybe I'm just confused. Nah, bro. He's, I swore. he's, in, he's in the Caravan Act, man. The Act 1. I could have swore he comes back. Okay, never mind. Cheers. Yeah, that's, that's Neela talking and Anya in Act 5. That's right. Yeah, I know, but I thought there was a little, there's like a little market in the bottom left corner of Act 5, and I always thought he was there, but I guess it's just an abandoned little market shack. Chase Chase is looking for a tier and an am. Uh, not sure, but if you do Nightmare Countess runs, you should be able to gank one up pretty quick, dude. 
Like, if no one has one. Oh, look, somebody joined. Maybe he has a bow. This is another one that, like, it's so close. Two to Druid skills here would be really good. Tell that dude, tell that dude to join Duke420 password one. I got a tier to aim for. All right, Duke420 Duke, Duke 420 password one, Chase. Duke has got uh, you. Duke, you're the man, dude. Thank you. The hell game. Oh, on hell, game. Last hell game. Oh, you already got it? Did you get it? By the way, by the way, we figured out a little glitch, Duke. Before he leaves yep. that game, make sure to buy all your amulets back and have him in your inventory. You just need a geeds. You just need a geeds? Yeah. There you go. <clears throat> I don't have to have a geeds on all of my characters. So yeah, you Duke, just gamble? Duke 420 password one, non-ladder. Oh, I'm a, oh no, I'm, I'm on a ladder game. Oh never shit, mind. sorry, no, never mind, he's ladder. So pretty much I just buy amulets and sell them back and buy them back. Yeah, yeah, but they have to be, try to sell amulets that are like close to 30k. 30k worth of in-game gold. I got a 2020 Sin Torch and a 2020 10 Annihilus in stash with my Geeds going hard because it's healthy to stimulate your adrenaline. Exactly. Like, no better reason. It's like, I can't tell you how good a perfect Annihilus charm looks. You know how long it took me in LOD to have a 100% perfect Annihilus charm? It took me my entire time of playing before someone finally was like, hey, uh, I appreciate your videos and I'm quitting. So here's my account. And then it had multiple perfect Annihilus charms. That was what it took. I never legitimately got one. They were always like too expensive. I, get, like, I never found one off D clone. I was an avid D clone hunter. Closest one I got from D clone is a 2015 uh, 10. Yeah. That he just fucking sold a while ago. Yep. <laughs> it's, it's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> but we found an 18 something 10 right after that. So it was like. The game was like, here, we'll just replace that shit for you. It's just going to be a little shittier. Yeah, that's kind of cool. So that was like you you what you went and got the declone walk that they did right after? Yeah. Oh, nice, dude. You got so lucky. Well, it literally, like, we were both buying amulets to get our gold back up. And all of a sudden, my game all, like, wigged out and you're shaking all over the place. And I was like, what the hell's going on here? And I was oh, like, oh, shit. <laughs> So I, oh, I'm not gambling any that are worth 30k. Jesus. Yeah, it takes a while, but like you'll eventually get it. Like it'll, so, it'll technically work at any price range, but to make the most of your time, you want to get the most expensive ones closest to 35k without being 35k or going over. That's what you want. And, and then you want to break it, right? Like you don't want to stay in the the chat or the the trade the gamble screen. You want to go to like yeah. your, where you can buy it back. Right, yeah, you want to go to the trade screen, right? Okay, so I might not need to trade this one. Listen to the stats on this. Two to barb skills, 10% faster cast rate, three to max damage, cold res 26, nine res all, damage reduced by three. Yeah, I'd keep it. <laughs> yeah, some of the amulets are fucking awesome. Yeah. It'd be nice if I get, like, some badass shit. Dude, prices Price have dropped. Are you talking about, what, what are you talking about, Brand? Are you talking about uh, prices have dropped for like on circlets of, and stuff, or like prices just in general? I can imagine everyone's attacking circlets right now, but listen to this bullshit circlet. Three to elemental skills, one to life. <laughs> what? Uh, that's what so troll, good, dude. dude. Keep it. <laughs> I gotta keep it. I got one to life on this motherfucker. Keep. Hilarious, bro. Ben, one form gold. It's like when you're doing terror zones, and you constantly find those two to strength grand charms. And I'm like, how does this happen to you? <laughs> Joe has the worst look. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, yet I witnessed him horking up a bar rune not too long ago. Oh, he did. And I got a sure rune right after. Lucky bastard. Oh shit, there. Switch did it. Switch just fucking Joe beat his geeds. <laughs> 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 shit. That's alright, man. It's like a, it's like a badge of honor, Swish. It's a badge of honor. Everyone's doing it. It's the popular thing to do these days.
if, you don't, if, you don't, if you don't Joby, you're not good. <laughs> yeah, right. I mean, nah, you, you Joby at the end of the day, but just know it's okay. It's not okay. It's not. It, okay. <laughs> it's okay to. It's okay to suck sometimes. It's happened. It hasn't happened to Cooley because I told you boys I'm not gonna misclick. I could be up for 24 hours straight, zero misclicks. I wish I could do that in PvP, but people move around and shit. Nothing moves here. My inventory doesn't move, so I don't have to think hard. Cooley's like, I'm the best name locker ever when my target is stationary. Right. Like if, if when my target is stationary, best name locks in the game. When they start moving around and walking slightly, south walk, you know, get the fuck out of here with that cheesy shit. I'm Teleporting. Did you get a Griffins? I'm due for one. Oh, I'm so, due for one? You know what I'm saying? I've been gambling for four so hours, is, bro. Is, I don't know. Yeah, if I guess only it's that's how good. it worked. I'm gonna rate. I just found out one is Zon. Rep life 6, 65 to mana, all res 5, level 29. I'm not gonna lie, there's so, like, I think my brain is burnt out, honestly, Doom. Like, <laughs> yeah, literally, I was talking earlier, someone was, uh, someone was feeding me stats on items, and I'm like, I'm not gonna lie, dude, my brain is so burnt out looking at items. Like, yeah, that's I've been telling people, just shelf shit if you're, like, unsure, and you're like, oh, this could be worth something, just, like, put it in the stash and talk to me later. Like, oh my god. It's like there's so much stuff. It's like I literally, I'm not even reading the items anymore. I'm just looking for key things to like stop my, to tell my brain like, alright, you should look at this. Let me like, guess, it's faster cast rate that you're looking for. Oh, there's so many things. There's enhanced damage, faster cast rate, faster run walk, skills, Why? like sockets. Like, there's so many things that make me pause. Like. But, but that's yeah there's a lot a lot of it doesn't have pass rate it's you know the rest of it is just a tease oh yeah 100 percent he found a uh d found a fucking visionary cast rate paladin died in one real i think what really yeah it's the one it's the one i uh said in chat but i didn't post it because oh. i got locked out due to the freaking trophy room lag bullshit oh is it it's set to 30 minutes now i still set it to 30 minutes because i feel like people are just gonna like 30 minutes is plenty if you're if you're finding a trophy more than once every 30 minutes for this shit you're probably not finding trophies like just good well, what, rule of what thumb if, what if you just don't post and then you decide to post everything all at once Good. Perfect. It's only one post I have to look at instead of six trillion. Just hit my third 220 doo-doo. It, was it is a magic or is it... Did you get a rare one? The fuck? Who, who got this? Who's, I hear some feedback. Who the fuck is this? What's going on here? Dio, what the fuck is going on in the background? It's that weird Canadian shit he's listening to. Yeah, what the fuck? What do you fucking Canadians do up there? Probably eat ketchup chips and shit. Yeah, that's probably what it is. We can we can hear you. You know what's funny? I actually have a lot of Canadian friends. Dude, like, believe I'll it or not, I, I don't think I knew a single person from Canada. But ever since we started this discord yeah. server i feel like most of my friends are canadian <laughs> canadians like some diablo dude there's there's apparently they're just born with the, the pvp bug in their brains dude they're just savages literally some of the some of the best duelers man toshank elite joby maddie dio all canadians Canadians are friendly people, A. Eh? They, they sure are, dude. They're pretty good. Day I. No, I'm hold on. Is that Dio? Is that what? I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna fucking mute somebody here in a minute. Someone went AFK and now they're fucking making ketchup chips in the background. That's all we fucking hear. Just sniff them out. Just sniff them out. Who is it? 
think it's Dio. I'm waiting for his little thing to light up. <laughs> Bang, Dio. Watch, watch Dio. it be. Watch it be his, uh, side trick. <laughs> Wait, what's that, Max? <laughs> Are you talking about that, like, whoever's le left their TV oh, on or whatever? Dude, 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 I don't know. I don't know if it's music or it's music. Chips. That's, what I, that's what we think it is. <clears throat> Goddamn, put that damn ketchup chick bag away, Bobby. Ooh, I just found a visionary circlet for an Amazon for low-level dueling. Yeah, visionary, visionary <clears throat> LLD is a little different. It doesn't necessarily matter as much in LLD. But so if like all the of, other stats are good, it's a one nice little Amazon bonus. skills, five minimum damage, the visionary mod, and then six to thirty cold damage, three mana stolen per hit, and damage reduced by three. Does it have sockets or faster run walk? Trash. Fuck. I thought there was some potential on that one. Unfortunate. Yeah, those Zon Helms pretty much need to be 130 to open socket at that level, basically. I still can't put a shit, and it's been 30 minutes. It's probably because you got banned. You probably posted so much trash that it was just like the whole server figured it out. It's like, we don't want to see this shit. Save it for tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> that visionary. You know what? You know what? You know what? I got the next best horrible thing I could do here. Are you gonna spam fucking general chat and get yourself a warm? No, send it straight to freaking Cooley. <laughs> you said oh, okay. it. I'm gonna feed yeah, you wanna yeah, put a cooldown on the fucking trophy room? Here, send it right to your inbox. Fuck the Cooley, get, get some AI to watch all your videos where you give appraisals so you can be left alone, right? Yeah, exactly. Then the AI figures it out. That's a good idea. I should actually just get, I should make a bot that just answers that shit. So like people just message the bot and it actually just tells them something random. I feel like it's almost just as good. Cause I actually question whether or not people sell it or whether or not they just want to know what their shits were. Like, cause if I, if you have a good item and I tell you, yeah, trash. If you still think it's a good item, you're probably not throwing it out. You just won't sell it. Then there's the other people that are just like, oh man, this is a good item. And then, they, you know, you tell them it's worth something and they probably still don't sell it or they ask too much for it or what have you. And they just end up keeping it anyway. So like, maybe you just make a bot that's just like random response to a price check. It's just like, hey, Cooley, I found this 230, 20, two open socket, 60 life, 20 all res druid helm, man. Is this good? like sorry but your item has a few things that are wrong with it uh so unfortunately it won't fetch the maximum amount of forum gold but you might still get something and then just they're like what the fuck this is okay and then they just the accept it just trash. <laughs> yeah and then you gotta obviously have one that says trash right now. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, i found this uh or just make it plain and simple, stash or trash, that's it. Max, if you've been da gambling claws, I'm guessing he's gambling claws. No, uh, circlets and... Really? Yeah. I mean, you can't gamble at claws, so that kind of limits what... Uh, right. Someone told me to gamble claws earlier, and I'm like, why? You're literally just hunting for five traps, and, like, you can literally get nothing else. I mean, you could get, like... You know, 300 ED pools, non S, with like other good stuff on it. But it's like a lot of very specific mods to line up, and there's like nothing else that you need, you know? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, it's just the, the range of what can actually be good is so slim. Yeah, with a circle that I feel like if I strike gold, it doesn't have to be an assassin circlet. You know, I can strike gold on a class I don't play and sell it. Right. So. Find. There's a bot for rune words, which says what runes you need to make a rune word. That's pretty sweet. I think I think we had something like that in the Discord at one point. Well, I'm not sure. I don't think we ever had it on stream, but yeah, I think we had something like that in the Discord. 
Oh yeah, my dude, god. Am I the only person that still just like Ari at Summit's everything? I'm just like, how do I make this rumored? And I just immediately Google Ari at Summit. Or I'm just like, what's the maximum that can roll on this? And it's Ari at Summit. Like, You're not alone. Just... Google the item. Yeah. Google. I Personally, I hate all the new items. Yeah, right? the it's like, would, they all yeah, have just way too much advertisement. It's yeah. like, I go to Ari at Summit just because I know that I'm not going to be bothered with pop up ads or other things, you know, just yeah. the information I need. Yep. Diablo Wiki's pretty alright. Yeah, that's a pretty good one, Brand. 220, 28 strength, 17 all res, Drew and Helm, best so far, sick. Cool, you have a claw gambling video. I haven't seen it in a while, but still agree with it. Also, yeah, Ari at Summit, or it could be false data. Uh, yeah, I still agree with it. Uh, the only thing that might have changed is how much those claws are worth. Uh, some of them are worth more. Um, but yeah, I still believe that if you want to find five trap claws, gambling them is certainly the best way to do it. If you if you're out to MF them or find them, that's certainly the best way to go. It's just it might be a very long experience for you. Like it might, but if you're looking for them, people. I, I think we made that because someone asked on stream how they would go about tracking down stuff for an assassin. They're like, I can't get the claws, and I don't want a JSP, and I don't want to do this. And I'm like, ooh, nice. And I'm like, all right, well, technically, this is how to do it. Like, if you if you want to do it, this is how to do it. Hey, this is pretty good. This is pretty good. I'll take this. I'm gonna put this. I'm gonna put some shit in this, and I'm just gonna use this against assassins. Got one, I think. Can you get what a wizard this? claws? Okay. I think I just got two good ones, guys. One of them I know is good. It's fucking baller. All right, y'all ready to hear these two? I don't know, dude. Hold on. I'm putting these in my fast. All right, what There's is it? Tell me. All right. The first one is two to barb skills, 20 cast rate, 20 run walk, 97 attack rating, 39 in mana. The next one is two to source skills, 20 cast rate, rep nine, 20 all res, level two twister. That's not bad. Oh, I tried so actively to like absorb all of that, but I caught about zero. I'm not gonna okay. like it. I'm, I, I'm literally, I'm trying, I'm not even trying to be rude. I'm like trying to actively listen. I'm like this, gonna listen. Two to sorcery skills. In one ear, out the other. <laughs> two, to, like... two to sorcery skills, 20 cash rate, replenish life plus nine, all res 20. Not bad. And then a two to barb, 20 cash rate, 20 run walk, 97 to attack rating, 39 a minute. Um, Not bad. Low level dueling circlet for assassins, one to shadow disciplines. Trash. Trash. Okay. <laughs> I don't need to hear this. <laughs> that could have actually been good. Like, <laughs> could have been like, he, he, the next things he could have said was like, 30 faster run walk, 30 ED, two sockets. <laughs> and that's actually really good. <laughs> actually, like, what, it, uh, what, it, what it does have is it has 90% bonus to attack rating based on character level. Trash. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's like the uh, the what other that's why I asked about it. Yeah, so but that's, needs... that's for a high level. So for a low level, that wouldn't be a large bonus. Yeah, it's like yeah, it's it's not a bad thing to have on a low level item. It's just not a make or yeah. break. Like oh, this is so awesome. It's just like oh, it's nice bonus to have on yeah. there. It doesn't matter as much. Gambled so many thirty faster run walk circulates with no sockets. It drives me crazy. Dude, I just want to see more two socket helms in this whole gambling. Like literally, yeah. if I could just if I could just I see two socket rares, I'd be happy. Yeah. They get me so fucking excited. It just I can feel my stomach like just doing flips as soon as i see one a rare with two sockets it's just like yes yes tell me more like i'm immediately so attentive to the screen i'm like tell me everything give me everything you got and i read every friggin line of it just wanting it praying for it to be good like <laughs> it's oh i love it <laughs> take it all you dirty girl <laughs> Give me everything you got. Give me everything you got. Oh my God, who is this dude? Does anybody know him? Yeah. I don't know why it came to my mind, Lee, but that monkey joke came to my mind. Oh shit! <laughs> Holy fuck, dude! Oh shit!
I hear little John in the background. Damn right you do. <laughs> don't give me D hey, don't give me DMC8 on YouTube, goddammit. If yeah. I can hear that shit, it'll be like, we we saw that you were committing copyright infringement because... Yeah, their algorithms definitely don't give a fuck. <laughs> no, they don't, dude. They don't give a shit. YouTube's all about that shit. They'll get you. Hmm. <clears throat> Yeah, dude, I think I think it's true. Steve brings up a great point. Like, I think at the at the end of this, people are really going to have an appreciation for how rare items actually are. Like, hey, I by the way, you had infinite oh, no. gold. You had infinite gold and infinite attempts to get anything you wanted. And how much did you actually get? Like, did you get what you were aiming for? Thing. Yeah, like, it's people are going to really realize how rare items are after this. Like, they're going to have an appreciation for it. Posted That's actually, actually a great view all together. See, there it is. My stomach did a little bit of turn in. It was like two druid skills, two sockets. And I was like, oh, just give it to me straight. Oh, man. Oh, no, dude. I was so fired up. I was so fired up. It's a shame. It's a damn shame. We got we to gotta trash it. Yeah. We got to trash it. Yep, two socket half chub lasted, lasted maybe a half second. Oh my god. And That's what we gamble for. Semis. Yep. You know, I, I wanted to play a video game, but I didn't expect to gamble on it all night long. <laughs> you are playing a video game, and this is the funnest thing that could happen. What are you talking about? Oh, shit. Hey, what are you talking about? Like, what, what I expected you to say was, I knew I wanted to play a video game today, but I didn't know that the Blizzard, that the Blizz devs would completely put the fucks to this game and allow me to do what my what I've wanted to do for years. To which case, I would have said, cheers. That's why I made an Orden. <sighs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> He's not wrong though, dude. I actually made a I made an origin too. It's so good. It's so good, man. It's so it's so cheap. It's like easy MF. You just walk around. Yeah, nothing like some Diablo slots. Like literally, this feels like I'm at the. That's a that's a very good comparison from Jake. I feel like I'm at the. I'm I'm just sitting at the Hollywood slots and I'm like, all right, boys, I got I got a million dollars. Let's see I what we can a, get. I just found a GG low level dueling druid circuit. Oh shit! What is it? A uh, chance to cast four Nova with stroke, one of druid skills, thirty faster run rock, twenty faster cast rate, eight to twenty one cold damage, thirty eight cold rays. You're not gonna like what I have to say. I don't care. I'll keep it. That sucks, ball sack. That's what he's gonna say. <laughs> yeah, it's trash. No, it's, it's a just fucking a, it's a, piece of shit. Well, not here's here's why, dude. Here's why. Here's why. I'll tell you why. I don't want to give no context to my boy Duke, dude. It's it's basically because five NATO helms are a thing in LLD. So you can have five NATO helms, and the only reason you ever switch to a 20 cast helm, uh, you certainly do need the 30 faster run walk, uh, you know, because it's usually against something that you, you need to cast, you need to escape, you don't want them stomping you. It's usually like anti, you know, you, in the Druid matchup, or uh, maybe a Barb. I don't know. Like, the LLD's so fucked up. But main, main point is, you're rarely ever switching to that helm, and when you do... The biggest problem you run into is your damage being fucked. So you need the plus two LE skills. Like unfortunate, but other otherwise, uh, because of that, like peasant crown is probably better in most cases. Like, but you know, if you need the cast, it's very weird because you're probably swapping out your. I don't actually don't even know what you're swapping out. I had an LLD druid on on LOD and I never swapped from my uh from my five NATO helm. Never ever. There was like no instances. But some people told me that I should for some matchups. And I was like, oh, okay. But so basically, long story short, it has to be super fucking GG. Like for it to even be remotely worth it. It's crazy. But Dude, freaking yeah. circlet coronets are not GG. 
I've got the perfect gambling setup right now, and I still haven't found a good one yet. And I've gambled like one point something million. Like I know that's not shit, but I've got two circlets in the gambles screen, so I can sit here and keep procking cornets like all day because it's got two. But hasn't happened for me yet. You know, run out. You're gonna. Damn, that is a massive gold find for a, a freaking Amazon circlet. Do, you, do we keep this for a max block sort setup? I feel like Doom is the perfect person to ask. If if this got two sockets, let's say, this magic circlet, two to sork skills, 30 decks. That's a perfect roll on decks. If that got that two sockets. Be, that wouldn't be terrible, and it would be even better if it was the decks with three to cold or whatever you had to fire, because you get to get, the, but two allows you to get higher ES. So it would be not, I, I would say, yeah, if you try to want to get, try to get two to sockets, cause I mean, you could use that on like a fireball so, ES or, or something to try to get max block on top of that. I feel like There's at a that lot point of though, here's, here's the counter argument to a helm like that, to doing that with a helm like this, right? Is why not at that point, just put more points, put, 10 more points into dexterity and use a rare helm yeah. that has 60 yeah. life like you know what i mean that would yeah, be my yeah i don't think i don't think it. it's i mean if you've got a bunch of socket quests though why the fuck not because you could probably could sell it but yeah i mean blue helm two moot to skills point. moot point somebody sold it somebody char seed it i'm oh, gonna like 17 of those yeah someone char seed i char seed all of them Come on, god damn it. I haven't even seen two. Oh, of course you're gonna give me another fucking barb one. Damn. Yeah, you'll see that you're gonna see those all day. I'm <laughs> gonna give you this circlet for a barb that's gonna use ariots. Yeah, dude, that's the thing with like, with all of the barb helms, people have asked a lot about barb helms, and it boils down to this, like, is Ariot's face better than what you're talking about? Because if it is, people are just gonna use that. Like, Ariot's face is a really good helm. Like it is barb but, circlets I mean, need to be but really good. It doesn't have cast rate. And that's kind of big for barbs. Oh which is my! True, but there's there's also other ways to get oh. it. So like barbs will still use ariots in a lot of uh, circumstances, I believe, it's like yeah. because it's all they need is like thirty eight cast. Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah, but then it's like, like I feel like if you get the cast from circlet and rings, then now you can use uh, T gods. You can have full rends, which would give more damage. So it's like, Drew. Is this Joe. worth throwing okay, sockets on? Okay, I'll let you go first. Is this worth throwing sockets on? Three to combat skills plus 99 to life? No. No. Uh, <laughs> I, found a, I found a plus 398 earlier in Char did. Okay. So, two to Druid, 20% faster cast rate, enhanced defense, seven to dexterity, 34 to mana. Useless? Rare Helm. <laughs> Pretty much useless. All right. This was so close, boys. No. I, don't, I don't even have the heart. I, I just, no, I got to char see it. Oh, God damn it. 30 faster run rock. This could have been 30 ED, but then it spawned with max damage to like completely yeah. hose us. But I guess it needs so much more too. I wonder if that bug is ever going to be fixed. I don't know how it's still a thing. Like it has something to do with like the way damage is calculated and apparently it carried over to D2R that like it's definitely bugged. What are y'all talking about? The the ED max damage bug. Max or min damage bug. Oh yeah. yeah. Mm. Like this right here uh, is like immediately in, bugged. In, in. This game needs to stop teasing me with crap. I still, I'm still feeling good about my game seed that I got on. I, I feel good about this. Like it's been very good to me. Like, you know, when you consider, like, I know you, you might be like, oh, cool, you've gone like uh, an hour without finding something sometimes, but it's like, truthfully, it's so rare to actually find anything good. Like, so the fact that this game is giving me max rolls on things that even aren't good. I, I count that as a win. Like I'm, I'm a pretty big fan of the seed theory. I, I, I like the seed that I'm on. 
So anything with druid, you want it to have plus to elemental skills, at least three or higher, and stuff to turn uh, to NATO, right? But are we talking LLD or are we talking HLD? HLD. By HLD, high level dueling. So, like, high level dueling, yeah, it's just druid circlets look like all the other circlets, like 230, 22 open socket is like really GG. But, like, LLD, you almost certainly want two to elemental skills. Like, one to druid skills is fine for some builds, but you almost certainly want two to elemental. Okay, because that's literally where the damage is at yeah it, in unless by chance the other five stats it rolled one druid and all the other five stats are outrageously good that's like the only time where it might be forgiven but like more often than not two to elemental skills oh my god i just got the same thing that you got essentially Except for it adds 8 to 19 cold damage, plus 72 enhanced defense, and lightning resist 10%. Yeah. Like, couldn't, couldn't, agree, couldn't agree more with Jacob, by the way. He says, no matter what, that LLD helm you found makes the entire night worth it. Completely agree. Like 100% agree. Dude, it's like I said. I mean, if I'm patient enough, that's probably, that's probably a 20k helm if I'm patient enough. When someone really realizes this is 100% perfect, then I can't find a better one than this. Like, this is actually the best I can get. Like, and it's perfect for this build. It's exactly what you're going for. Like, for a very common build, very devastating build, a build that you can PK people in pubs with too if you'd like. Like, it's very good. So... But that's exactly, I think Max was talking about this earlier. Like, if you gamble on claws, you pigeonhole yourself into finding those exact things. I didn't plan on getting an LLD circlet with my high-level gambler here. But we got one, and it was 100% perfect. And it's like, that's just like a nice little addition. You know, that's why I think gambling circlets is just the way to go. There's such a good range of anything that can be good. This Not to mention, a, uh, most people want to go for crafted amulets. They get that 20% cast rate. Yeah. You can actually get that at LLD, too. Did you know that? You can get 20 cast on an LLD amulet. Oh, I didn't know that. It's very rare. You can't get any skills on it, but you oh, can get yeah, 20 well. cast. Yeah. Well, I know one thing. It would be awesome as fuck if they were like, bring back the old days, patch whatever and say we're gonna put the armageddon fletch and shit back into the rotation boy you'd have some people mfing their face off the problem the problem is that if they did that crafted it cast your amulets there would be no point to them like if if 20 cast was a thing that you could find on rare amulets that's in fact the only reason why crafted amulets even have value a lot of people don't know that like rare amulets if you it, let's let's assume for a minute craft, crafted caster amulets could only spawn with 10 cast no one would craft them it's the only reason why crafted amulets are worth what they are like yeah sure, but i mean it would only be like a couple so it's Rare You'd amulets can spawn with far more abilities on them. Like they they can spawn with six abilities versus four. Like you know what I mean. So it's their rare amulets are insane. Can you imagine if twenty casts could spawn instead of just like just ten? Oh my god, you have a six point twenty cast amulet. Jesus Christ, dude. I mean, I'm all for it, <laughs> but I'm sure some people would be a little upset. I mean, it certainly makes sense. Like, it completely hoses, completely hoses caster, caster amulet. I wonder if a bunch of griffs are gonna pop up after this. I would so bet they are, dude. I, I was so yet, bet. Dude, I've been gambling for hours. Is but three to traps, twelve to minimum damage good? No. Okay. 
I didn't know if it was worth keeping for anything. Oh, I've already found one. One and a half. I just started. Dude, this is so dope. Oh, you fucking bitch. Three to poison and bone skills. Where's my cast rate? <laughs> what, 10% cast rate? No, it had none. I was like, where is my cast rate, you dirty, oh. dirty dog? Dude, yeah, the... Dude, three poison and bone skills with 20 cast, uh -huh. I actually think is really good, man. What do, you, what do you think an Amazon would use at a low-level duel for, like, a, a helmet? Peasant crown? Uh, 132 open socket is ideal with uh, with a bunch of other good mods, but peasant crown is also good because it rivals that. So like any rare that you find would have to rival peasant crown. Okay, how does this sound? One to Amazon skills, 20 FCR, lightning resist plus 40%, damage reduce one. Trash. It's kind of what I was thinking. 100% trash. I've never been more sure of anything in my life, actually. Jesus Christ, you, you sound like the dude on Billy Madison when he gives that long ass speech about the puppy who lost his way and he goes, that was uh, the most excruciating. We are all now dumber for having listened to it. No, we are now fucking, my life is actually like, worse. Like I actually, I, I take that back, Ord Chair, uh, my life, my brain is actually damaged from listening to that, processing it. All right, you've caused me irreparable damage in what will likely be a very, very long stream of me gambling. You get Good no morning, points. Gator Boone. Good morning. Yeah, we've been gambling, holy shit, for uh, for a, a, about nine hours now. It's crazy. It felt uh, like probably 20 minutes. I feel like I've only been doing this about 20 minutes. Uh, I think Llama, update from Llama. Llama hasn't really found much other GG stuff. So... That being the case, if that's all he's resting his laurels on, he might actually have a better. And I think he went to sleep. I haven't. I messaged him. But I ain't heard from him, dude. I think he. I think he quit. I think he quit. I think he done gave up. We might crush him, dude. We might. We I mean, might that done sort, crush him. That source cell my found was pretty fucking gnarly. I'm gonna use it. <laughs> like, it's yeah. Nine rep, twenty two, twenty helm with stats yeah i'll i'll take that all day dude i put it this way i will i will only sleep if one of two things happen i die or i get <laughs> so far ahead of anything llama could find that it, it's just like you know we gamble like three four or five absolute ggs that is there uh, that rival that uh that lld helm that we found like it could happen immediately. Like these all these eight right here could be it. It just could be over right now. Like it could happen yeah. at any minute. Like, but if it just gets to the point where like it's just it's impossible to catch up. It's just like good luck. You'll be gambling for years. It, it could happen. I could also die. So one of those two things very likely. Keep drinking happen. Jim Bean, you might fucking die. You need to slow down. I've been pacing myself, dude. I always say drink responsibly. I've been pacing myself. I'm a. I get. Y'all think I'm tipsy? I've been fucking straight this whole stream, dude. I've been fucking straight this whole stream. <laughs> I've been straight annihilated. <laughs> I've been straight fuck, <laughs> Tonight yeah. we're and getting I, fucked yeah, up. Yeah. See, look at that. Listen to Sean. Listen to Sean. Seems like he sobered up at this point, boys. You want, if you want some, you want to take Stop some. Stop kissing notes, ass, Sean. Nobody no, likes to kiss no, ass, Sean. No, he ain't kissing ass. He's <laughs> fucking it. telling it straight, dude. He got no reason to fucking kiss ass. Like, what am I gonna do? Be like, oh my god, GG. Uh, what? If, he's nothing in it for him. He's telling it straight, dude. He's just telling it like he sees it, calling it like it is. Because you know what? You attract your tribe, all right? That's what I do. I call it like it is. And Sean is here because he's part of the tribe, dude. He, he appreciates that. He just calls shit like it is. That's what it is. Don't fucking hate on Sean, dude. Just talking suck about bitch. the, the ECPK, Sean, or are we talking about different things? He's telling it like this, dude. Straight through. Which Sean know. is it? Is it just a random Sean we don't know, or is that it's Sean, the Sean like... from chat, bro? <laughs> VTPK? <laughs> I don't know, actually. Maybe. Okay. All right. Yeah. Like yeah, Templar. VTPK. He, he's talking about Templar. Okay. Cool. Go, Sean. Yeah. Yeah. 
No, don't fuck with him. See, he was, he was down him. He's the Sean from VTPK. And you didn't Sean, even... You didn't, you're you didn't, noob, Sean. I said that just See, because now, it was now, Sean. Now it's changed the whole direction. I haven't heard from him in forever. Yeah, where the fuck now, you going, Now they believe you, but... Yes, yeah, that's what it is. I mean, he's Don't get mad because Sean kicked killer. you guys' ass multiple times oh, and made you salty and shit. He knows who the man at VTPK is, and it's Duke. Oh my god. <laughs> Three to cold skills, ref life 15, blue helm. <clears throat> hmm. That could possibly be useful. You don't always need cast rate. I'm gonna hang on to it just because it rolled perfect on both. Don't get in that habit, dude. That stash will fill up so quick. <laughs> like, trust me, to the point now, I could find like a 230 22 open socket. And I'd be like, well, doesn't really have life. <laughs> I don't know what I could get rid of in my stash for it. It's literally to that point. Nah, I, I think I could probably make room for something like that. Uh -huh. Hey, give me some circlets to gamble, you fat fuck. Thank you. Are you gambling from Gide? Yeah. Dude, go dude, to Dude, that's Jamela. your first mistake. Gide is a chump, dude. You gotta gamble from Jamela, bro. Yeah, I mean, he just cheats. gave me... So far, I've already gotten two decent ones, but sure, I'll go to uh, Jamela. Richard, Richard, you should probably... I, I say no no lower than 93 if you're going for, like, HLD circlets. Like, you probably want to be 93 at least. That's what this dude is. Uh, and I actually like 93 as a good target level because uh, you... When you sell things back, uh, or when you gamble things, sorry, the price is the cheapest for for what you get. So technically, 93 is the best for circuit. Yeah, I'm, I'm forced to do this at 90. 90 isn't horrible. Like, you're not hosed. 220 pal, nice. Trash. I mean, trash, <laughs> unless it has some other shit. <laughs> trash. We've only found 700 of those, so unless it's got mods, bro. Yeah, I th I think we've outlasted most people too, honestly. Like, it, it, I got it some. Seems like, it seems like this is one of those things where people are like, "Oh, this is so great," and then they burn themselves out, not knowing that the true warriors. Well, I'm fixing. To, I'm fixing to get my Terry Moonshine and make me a Tiger's Blood. Wick, you're gonna be passed out on the keyboard. You're gonna be like, I'm gonna do this all night. And we're gonna hear some snoring and shit. And no. Like, fuck, we lost. Not we when lost I get it. drinking. That ain't me. Oh, That's Joe. We that lost ain't me it. when I'm drinking, dude. <laughs> Holy, what's your thoughts on this? Uh, Rose Branded tier of Life Everlasting. Uh, three combat skills, uh, 24 damage reduced. Love it. Love it. Keep it for me if you uh, got nothing to do with it. Just send it to your boy. I'll try socking in that one. IDR shit for my druid, but I have a time in it. Send it to your boy. It wouldn't happen to be level 45 requirement, would it? Um, level 52. Uh, good. Yeah, you know, I mean, if you got nothing and you're just like, you know what, Cooley, good dude, I appreciate him. <laughs> <laughs> How much form gold do you have, Cooley? I don't know. Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Not much. Uh -huh. Like, I, all I know is, I, is I, uh, you all I know is the last thing Thanks. that I wanted on JSP. I posted on the dude's forum. He had this really nice VT, and I was like, I don't even really need a VT, but I was like, I'm, I'm a bid on it, and I bid every ounce of forum gold I had, and I was like, let me know, Ben, and then he's like, yeah, Ben is four times everything you have, and I was like, shit. All right. <laughs> Never mind. Yeah, okay. Thanks. Thanks for thanks for letting me know, bro. I'll keep you posted. I don't want to smile that bad, dude. People leaving for work here in the Netherlands, they're fucking weak. Weak. Who works on a Saturday? That's mistake number one. They got a job where they have to work on a Saturday. That's mistake number one. Mistake number two is they're weak. When this shit happens, you call out of work. You say, like, if I still had a real person job, I'd be like, uh... I'm sick. Hey, Wig. Two, what? Sor two to sorceress skills, 20 faster cast rate, six mana, stolen per hit, cold res 19, <laughs> light res 41, fire res 19, poison res 19, damage reduced by three. 
That's actually pretty good. How many good Nodges circlet so far? Yo, yo so, how many Nodges circlets have you guys gambled on so far? I've personally found one. three. That's I've actually a great more. question. I've got three. I've gotten zero. What? Two. I'm at three and one Kiris. Uh, Max. Uh, yeah, three and one Kiris, same here. Ooh, that's the coolest looking circlet I've ever gambled. And it sucks. Max. Max, Look, no one you, cares how it looks, okay? It only looks good if the abilities are good, all right? They all sort of look the same to some degree. Yeah, I'm actually if, here. If you're really stretching here. I feel like you need to you need to be broken by this gambling thing, Wade. You need to, like, you need to go hours without finding anything. Uh, like, level 30 requirement, two to traps, try res, including poison, light, uh, 15, 15, 15, lightning resist is at 44. So the only thing is traps, no cast. Yeah, none, just traps, no Trash. cast. So what I was thinking, the only reason why I was thinking it was decent was because of the resistances. That's it. Trash. It is trashed. I don't play assassins, that's why I was asking. Yeah, I don't actually play him much either. I was looking at all the characters on my account. I am rather proud of my progress on this account, dude. Literally just about every character I've ever played is at least level 93, like by the lowest. But then there's those goddamn assassins. And I never really noticed how much I don't play assassins until I see how, what the level of my other characters are. And I'm like, I must truly hate assassins to my fucking core. Like, I don't even MF on them. I'm so traumatized by them from PvP, apparently. Like, it's crazy, dude. Like, I'm so far behind on my sins. I need to level one up, dude. I think my assassin's, like, level three. <laughs> level three? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, sin fuck sins. I don't sins. even have an assassin. I found a J mod and then gambled a Griff last Thursday and Friday. Probably used up all my RNG luck for a while. Damn. Cowboy in Discord calls out every single piece of trash. <laughs> That's hey, the uh, who's, Max. Who's Cowboy facts. Yeah, Are assassin <laughs> circlet shit if they don't have cast rate on them? Like, no matter what? Uh, X goes much. out unless of his it's way. Like, unless it's the most godlike circlet ever for a Fortitude build, it sucks. Like, that's the uh, only time that, you know, like if it has like ridiculous stats on it, then maybe you can overlook you no know, cast rate and it's kind of niche. But um, any Enigma wearing assassin will want cast straight in the helm. Swish has got it right. You guys should have been getting your farming your Geeds charms. That's where it's at. How much how much have you made off of Geeds charms, bro? That's what we all want to know. So, Why did Geats just jump up in price? <laughs> oh, dude, everybody's fucking charcing them by accident. Cause not, Ow. it's hard to have the absolute aim skills that Cooley has. We're going on, we're going on fucking ten hours, over ten hours, boys, of no misclicks. Like, you would figure most that people can't even stay awake for ten misclick. hours, right? Most people can't. That's estimation and probably an exaggeration. But at the same time, you get what I'm saying. Oh, my no bad place. ass. If I hit the couch right now, dude, or the chair, done. I'd be done. 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 Out. Yep. I just gambled a nausea circulate. That's my second one. Oh, shit. I got one here. Mine was 58. I trashed it. I got a, I got a jeweler's coronet. Trash. The, those, that's only what? Two, uh, two sockets? That's it. That, that's that's it. happened to me. That's happened to me twice. Two times I've got... The artisans or the jewelers mod with 30% faster run walk on a helm that cannot get uh, three sockets. I was so pissed. Dude, like two times it's happened. I've, I've gambled that about 75 times, man. Oh my god, dude, it, it's so demoralizing. Sucks, bro. Yeah, because when you mouse over, you're like two sockets. Well, I see, I see artisans or jewelers of speed, and I'm like, oh, and then it's two sockets. It's like shit. Or no sockets. Yeah, yeah. And then you're like, fuck this well, game, well, bro. Well, no, if it's jewelers, it's at least two. But, like, because right. those, it's the helm that can spawn with, uh, it's the helm that can spawn with three sockets, 30 faster run walk. So it's like, you, you see that magic helm and you're like, oh, yes. 
but then you notice like the helm itself can't have three sockets so you, your hose it's oh like getting God. a circulate with a hunter to life no sockets god damn it boys god damn Why this could have been it. Have, why could that have not had sockets? This could have been it, dude. Yeah, it really does. Dash, you fucking tell him, dude. It takes a real man. Those, not my words. His. Real man. To, ten, to go 10 hour stream on straight Jim Beam with no misclicks. Straight gambling. 100% focused. And that's, that's, don't forget answering people's trash questions about their trash items that I have to listen to every single fucking ability on the item and process that in my brain. Y'all won't give me enough credit, okay? Oh, hey, Cooley, listen to this item right now. Oh, quick. shut the fuck up. I'm not listening to shit. <laughs> Jesus. Speaking listen of that, let me shit. Know. <laughs> I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait till I find one of those shitty ones that's got like 13 things on it and be like, hey, Cooley, listen to these. Right, songs. right, right. Yeah, don't forget. Yeah, Dad says it. Dad says, yeah. <laughs> For Cowboys, it's Oh, shit. It's true. There's a lot of shit going on, man. It's a miracle. No misclicks. I'm keeping this just because I don't have the heart to throw it out. As a Paladin oh. player, I'm like, maybe I can make it work. I wonder how many people found uh some badass shit yesterday when everything was rolling a crazy amount of uh different uh fixes on it and stuff like we were I'm talking wondering how many people found some really good stuff when they gave that amazing ability of 50 extra gold fine yesterday there had to been so oh, yeah. much gg shit that people found. i wasn't talking about that i, I was noticing that like <laughs> I was finding like just base items and like r all my rares were dropping with six mods. Word. Yeah, that's dope. Yeah, but, that's what I we mean, need. We need a. I think we could we could actually set that up. Honestly, Joe, we could get like a random number generator. I can make a Google ex uh, spreadsheet with a random number generator that selects a response that we pre-programmed, and then like. I don't have to listen to anything anyone's saying. Like, they're just like, Cooley, what do you think of this? I click the button and it's just like pops up a response. No matter what it is, just say trash. There's like a 30% chance. There's just, no, there's like a 66% chance. It just says trash. And then the other 1%, it's like, yeah, that's not bad. And there's like a 0.001% chance. It's like, wow, dude, that's GG. You ought to JSP that shit. And that could happen on literally anything. Someone sends us like, oh, Cooley, I found this regular plus two paladin skill levels magic helm, but it can get two socks. You ought to JSP that, dude. That's so good. That's how it's going to be. I wonder how long it'll take people to know it's randomly bot generated answers. <laughs> it's... <laughs> Yeah, yeah, dude. I didn't know that. The, I didn't know that that video would would turn trash into like a new into a new keyword for my streams and everything. Literally, when Joby started saying it, I knew something was gonna be something was up. My French Canadian bro was just like, "Oh my god!" He was trolling people hard in Discord afterwards. Like, I, I, I don't even know what it was. Oh, it was Ed. Uh, Ed made this this super cool cold sorceress that was like all blue. It was like decked out blue uh, because he was trying to like stunt with it and make it all blue. You know, like it looks blue and it's a cold sorceress and shit. And he was showing off his gear in Discord and his, his shield was a 1514 superior four socket monarch. And Joby goes, oh, oh, he's like, he's like, Oh, it's 1514, bro. He's like, that's no good. It's trash. <laughs> because if it's 1514, I was like, oh, man, this is going to be something. These, these boys aren't never going to live it down. This is night. I don't know, dude. I haven't looked outside in 10 hours. It could be daylight. I don't know. I don't know, bro. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out when the gambling stops, I guess. Go be impersonation on point. I've been practicing it for years, six in. How is Joby gonna talk shit when he gambled his torch? Yeah, he's got nothing. He quit after that. He I, should uh, probably I just, just not. <laughs> yeah, he, he couldn't say anything. 
he couldn't say anything. He, he actually just walked his away. Shit talk, his shit talking was over at that point. <laughs> well, of course not. You got to remember, he lived, he's got his brother right there next to him, just like riding his ass. Oh my god, Tom yeah, those boys, I think those boys, those boys never course. let the, the other one live anything down. They never I mean, let Joe. Joe you down. fucking suck, Joe. You gamble your torch. It's a miracle. What are you joking me about, bro? Oh, I was just like, you know, imagine if I was there, like, right beside you. being like, dude, dude, you gambled your door. You'd be like, fuck this game. I don't want to hear your shit. I'm it, going it's outside like, it's like borderline. I've seen some of the things those boys say to each other. It's like borderline abusive. I'm like, holy shit. Those guys, like, live with each other and shit. So I kind of feel bad. I feel bad for Maddie and actually for Joby some days, too. I'm like, holy shit. Mainly for Maddie. Joby is a bully, dude. Joby is a fucking bully. Like it's, you feel bad. It's like Joe, Maddie, can I, Maddie can gets I bullied in D two and in real life. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh. Dude, yeah. Joby told me they 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 swap licks sometimes over this game. He said he said sometimes they they hit on each other. Oh what? So, no shit, dude. No shit. Yeah, he's like he's like yeah. It gets pretty serious sometimes what when we get think, pissed what off. What do we think that. about gambling javelins for five forty? I think it's the same thing with the claws, right? Like you're just going for that basically that one thing. There's nothing else that can possibly spawn on them that make them good. So like you're looking for very very specific yeah. mods, whereas I gambling mean, if, for if, circlets allows you some range of what you could find. Yeah, on one hand, if you're committed, this is your best chance ever, but, you know, right. it's, um, you're not going to find anything else along the way, so it's, you know, just that one thing or bust. Right. Well put. Well said. Like, one thing or bust. Like, and then otherwise, you, if you don't find it, you've essentially wasted the entire time looking for those jabs. Or you could just gamble on circlets and then like, oh, I wasn't hoping for this one, but this is pretty cool. Or like same with amulets and rings even. I guess I've, yeah. I guess what, I've changed my opinion a little bit on rings. I guess it's kind of worth it. Like you could get Damn a good it. ring. The thing about circlets is if you find one that's like super godly, it like can expi inspire you to build a new character, a new, you know, right. a new team. You know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. Like, like oh, that, fuck, the, the, the one that I got today, around this th sure. that one that I got today, I'm like, I'm immediately going to build a level 18. I know my next griefing video idea immediately. Like it's 100% on point, dude. Like I, I, I said the second I got that helm, I'm like, I love this thing. I'm going to make a whole character around this. Oh, this bar build right here, dude. I should take a break from this for a sec. I'll, I'll show it off actually. It, it's really the. It, it's not actually about the bar build, but all you really need for what we're doing is is a is a edge and a geeds. But this is actually my gold fine barb though. He's pretty cool. He's got a my sweet amulet. Look at this six amulet. Six this amulet is sick. It's like a gold find amulet, but it also doubles as like if I get sick of gold finding and I could just go make a fire sorceress and it's also cool. Like there's a lot of good things about this. What class for the level uh, 18 helm? Paladin. Uh, Charger Zealot. You're right, Steve. Fucking A. What am I doing? No breaks. You're so right. We grind all night. We go. I'm so, I'm so happy you're here to keep me on point for this shit. You get kicked in the ass every once in a while. Ooh, There's no time for this. this once in a lifetime shit. Yeah, I'm I'm sorry that I missed it. It sucks. I missed a third of it. I was wondering, you said we're doing Christmas lights and shit. I was like, these motherfuckers must be doing Christmas lights down the whole fucking block, bro. They've been doing <laughs> Yeah, it. <laughs> two hour drive, bro. And it was Dang, cold bro. as fuck. It was cold as hell. GG. I was like, oh my god, so close with this one. Three fire skills, damage reduced by thirteen. That could have been twenty-five, and we it wouldn't be trash. But it's not perfect. So it's trash. I'm gonna refill the stash in gold. Oh my god. Got that little John going. I got so excited. I saw the two sockets, the 30 strength. 
just not there, man. Just not there. How much extra gold do you have on this build? I don't know, quite a bit, dude. Let me check. Let me, let me swap uh, weapons real quick. I can check. It, it's it's a lot. It's enough. Uh, it, this one is actually kind of a hybrid. It's like balanced with gold find and magic find. 405 magic find, 2,000 gold find. When the merc kills stuff, it's, it's over 2,000. 400 magic find, about 2,000 gold find. He does all right. But right now, the best way to find gold is just to sell, just to sell amulets to vendors. Go, go. Yeah, it. dude. <laughs> it's the best best gold find build in the game right now. <laughs> go, go figure. It's one of the easiest rumors in game to make. Yeah, it's so good. Two sort twenty five dr blue worth a worth it for yes 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 that's good. Socket that, get two sockets. It's good on an immortal sorceress. How much do Istrunes sell for? It, it almost doesn't matter the item that you have as long as it sells for close to or exactly 35k. It like literally doesn't matter the item. It's just like what what is the sell price on it? If it's 35k or very, very close to it, it can't be over. Like it has to be it has to be exactly 35k or just under. Oh my god, this game trolled me so hard. This would have been the most GG sword circuit ever if I had cast rate on it. Two don't to sword. My brain hurts. Oh. Don't just don't even just char see it. And let's let's collectively move oh, on. Oh no. <laughs> <Let's> just, <laughs> dude, my brain it. hurts. My brain hurts. Oh my god, I've never seen so many perfect stats on a fucking <laughs> That sucks so bad. You like this Perfect right here? I could, I could easily say the same thing about this, but I'm just gonna trash it and I'm just gonna move on. Just gonna Perfect trash. life, res, and mana with two to skills. Just gonna trash. Move right on. He wants to read his stats so bad. Six. He's like, he oh, wants no, to read his stats so bad. <laughs> oh my god. Fucking damn shame oh, is what it was. I done fucked my leg up. I've been sitting here with my one leg crossed. I'm gonna cross the other leg. This is this is high level streaming 101. You gotta remember, fuck, cross the correct leg every once in a while. God so damn it, you need to focus in, and you're focusing in so much, and you're just, yeah, just getting just the GGs, and, and you're beating llama. You gotta remember to shift properly. Why are you beating llama? That's so weird. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna trash them. We're gonna I'm gonna make a whole video about it. We're gonna be like, you wanna be you wanna be better than Llama? This is what you gotta do. You gotta hey, Cooley, you better. said there's no use for a uh, two pally ten cast rate uh, helm, right? Needs twenty cast. I said that, but then I commenced to keep one earlier. <laughs> so, okay, because so. I have one here that has uh, twenty dexterity on it and twenty three enhanced damage. I don't know. It's two pally ten cast. Yeah, <laughs> like looking uh, at it. Oh god, damn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a that I would keep it. If it was me that found that, I would keep it. You know, Doom knows a dude that can train monkeys. What the fuck is this stream turned into? <laughs> this is the point of the night where it's just like what did you say? Nothing that can fucking surprise me. Nothing anybody. Nothing anybody monkeys. says. Did you say train monkeys? Yeah, man. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. That dude that trains monkeys to suck his dick. You, oh, you're talking about that Dave Chappelle skit. Oh my yeah. god. Like, where, where, where have we gone? You don't know how hard it is to train a monkey to suck your dick without it trying to peel it. <laughs> oh my, oh my you god. That question on YouTube, right? Remember, remember how? Remember how I said I was like. There's one of two things that could happen tonight. I could find all of the GGs or I could die. Yeah. I actually thought there would be literal no chance of either one happening. But now that I've been in a Discord channel with YouTube for a while, I might actually kill myself. <laughs> like, that's, that's just that's a very real possibility. It's got to be hard. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's gotta be God. tough to train that motherfucker. God, God damn it. Look at this home too. It's another so close one. Oh my God. <laughs>
We don't even want to hear it. Just charge that bitch. Yeah, no, I, I just did. I just did. All right. I say I I know. I know. Defensive orders. Trash. God damn. A defensive orders with the most godly stats you've ever seen. Yep, it was close. Then it then it also rolled level thirty one. There was so much junk fuckery about it. I think it's I think it's funny when you get one of those Diablo one rolls where it's like of the ages. God damn, is somebody driving down the yeah. road. Yeah, fuck man. A, a mutant tempest. I hear a whole bunch of wind. Like someone, he's might be skydiving or something. He's like he's jumping off a bridge. He's calling he's himself like skydiving and he's bored. He's just like, oh fuck it, man. Do you mind if I? He's talking to the dude. He's like, you mind if I dive into the coolie stream real quick while I skydive? His fucking <laughs> oh, RG in this game. Oh, him, <laughs> fucking idea with it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's a little boring up here, falling from you know, ten thousand feet. I think. Check out this stream. That or he's like driving with the window down. Either way, completely inappropriate. Oh, either way. I just had to way. sell an item for four thousand two hundred dollars. So I'm gonna take a bomb hit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You should, dude. You should. You should. Well, that, and that was certainly he was he was certainly not ripping the bomb. Like you can definitely hear it if they're if they're doing it. You can hear it, and we would we would hear that, and we'd be like, welcome to the stream. Dude. Chill vibes. So what did you like sell? I was definitely skydiving. There was no other explanation, like no other reasonable one anyway. That's right. That's right. Did you sell your Annie or your Geeds or your Torch? Which no, one? zero misclicks in the last uh, 10 no, I hours. Talk, I was talking to uh, D. Uh -oh. No, 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 no. Uh-uh. No. What'd you sell? Uh, I haven't sold anything since the Annie. Okay. You don't We're know that for fact, Cooley. He might be trying to fucking light his fucking blunt with a damn T-700 aircraft engine. True, <laughs> <laughs> Maybe his lighter died and he sees a blowtorch, you know? <laughs> <laughs> we'll just heat up a butter knife on the eye of my stove. But I'm old school. Dude. I haven't found shit, and I'm getting a little tilted. I, this, oh, wait, no. At this uh, rate, I like, did, literally, I if I have to explain, if I have to explain my one LLD helm and why it's better than anything Llama found, it's not going to feel good. I want to find something that closes the door. It's time to tap off another little drinky there, Jim Lee. You got to become the liquor. You know what? I'm going to train you guys for a drink. You grab a cup. Up, I'm Max? Go get one up, Max? I still, I still Wait, haven't moved on to the You don't get that reference? Yet. Cooley, you're from Maine. You're up there with the Canadians and shit. Or sort of. Close you you probably reference? drink the same water and shit, yeah. Yeah, Jim Leahy is from Trailer Park Boys. He's the fucking drunk-ass cop. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's that guy, yeah. At the He's almost park, like, dude. you got to be the liquor. <laughs> He's hey, dude. The dude, dude. I don't care. What's up? He's like my favorite uh, character other than Bubbles. Low, low, low level druid, two elemental, 36 life. Oh, god damn. damn. Fire resist, seven magic damage reduced, two. I love that we literally did no DFC tonight. Like, we figured this out and we were, we were like, yeah, fuck that. We're just gonna gamble. <laughs> Gambling's fun. Right. Yeah, too bad it's lightning. Fucking got derailed. <laughs> right. This might be the only time where so many d PvP players would actually be cool that you were like, yeah, by the way, uh, I know you've been looking forward to this PvP event, but uh, we're going to cancel it so we can all do some, like, EVM shit. So, like, in-game. We're all just going to play the game. In the way that Blizzard intended. Everybody was like, fuck DSC, we're gambling. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Like, Maddie, Maddie messaged me that right off the bat. Like, I hadn't even said anything to him. I go, I, I come on, I see a message from Maddie. He's like, uh, cool, cool to duel whenever, but he's like, I'm also cool with gambling. And I was like, yep, <laughs> yep, that's my boy. That's my boy. Um, actually, I did sell something that I shouldn't have in the uh, gambling menu. I emptied my um, 
amulet. It's on accident, so I have to get my amulets back. Yeah, so. Yeah, it sucks, but I get a chance to get brain. Boom damage. fucking who? They're unlimited. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm very I curious to see, a, honestly. Like, I'm very I'm curious to see what's sure. going on. Like, I mean, obviously, like, if something was wrong, this is, how long has this been going on? 12 hours now? There's no fucking way. Like, I, I'm surprised people are still talking about that, honestly. Like, if they were gonna fix it, they would've fixed it. It's so easy to just undo this. It's not like a glitch like they had with the... You know, like when ladder launched and people were horking Sunder Charms. Like, you actually have to go in and reprogram something. This, they just have to, like, shut it off. They're like, oh, fuck, yeah, we didn't mean to do that. All right. Like, if they no, wanted to shut it down, it's so easy. They, 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 they intentionally did it. Yeah. Like, they, they want people at this point to do this. Like, this is exactly what they did. Probably the most players they've had in, like, months. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, my yeah. ping is fantastic at 46. Oh man, so close, but so far. It does still take a while. Yeah, I honestly think that uh, some of this, believe it or not, is was actually a test. Like, they, they wanted to test permanent changes in this game. It, the, rogue idea, rogue opinion, right? But they actually wanted to test uh, permanent changes in the game, and that's why they did the Terror Zone change every 15 minutes to see if, like, people stayed on and played longer or what happened. Like, you know, uh, to see, to monitor player behavior when they did that. Uh, or, like, with this right here, when they lower vendor prices, they probably knew people were going to gamble their fucking faces off. But they were, they were probably curious to be like, what will that actually do? Like, will people like that or will they complain about it? Or like, what will the actual effect be? Will people enjoy it? Will people play longer? Will they stay in one game longer? Like, will they, you know what I mean? Like, that's easier on the servers. They, pro they certainly knew what they were doing. I wonder if it's like a big test. By the way, Leroy Sunset, I just gotta say, we pause for a minute. Pause for a minute. Leroy Sunset. I gotta give you a special cheers, man. You have just, you have done something that I must thank you for. Because this is actually a legendary moment. This is a legendary moment. You are not only the first legend tier member, but you were the first member on the Cooley Live channel. My dude. I just set this up today, and I want to say this means a ton to me. And it is, yeah, yeah, we just got this set up today, bro. So this is huge. Uh, bro, cheers to you, man. Uh, dude, thank you so much. Big cheers. Big cheers, big shout out to Leroy Sunset. Dude, that means a lot. That support is huge. Uh, dude, thank you, thank you, thank you. If anybody's sipping on anything, take a break from your gambling, okay? You've been gambling too fucking long. Take a break. And thank this guy, because this is huge. Dude, thank you from the bottom of my why, heart, dude. That's why awesome. Why are we thanking this dude? Dude, he's the, he's the, first, he's the first member of Cooley Live. I just set up channel memberships today. I was finally approved for it, for this channel. Oh, oh another and one. And followed going. up by Looney. Looney. Oh, my God. A new legend as part of the team looney dude thank you so much man this support is huge uh two oh, legends yeah. coming yeah. on board at the same time thank you both looney you're the man big shout out to you both wow guys cheers 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 that is amazing that is amazing oh man that's huge that's huge you have no idea you just made my day man just made my day that's nuts that's nuts. Yeah, it's it's certainly a cheers. That's that's the new cheers. New members, new cheers. Now I've been pacing myself good. I've been pacing myself good. Oh shit! I just found a three to cold fifty-eight to life uh, magic helm. That's not too bad. That's, that's not trash. trash. Not trash. You can spawn up to one hundred life. It's still not I've, trash. It's I've just never not. been more like. Wick, I've never been more sure of anything we are in the last all five minutes. Now dumber 
from having it with you. <laughs> may, may God have mercy on your soul. Uh, my God. brain yeah, is cooked. So... I'm far more stupider now for listening uh, to what uh, you just said. You've got to play. You've got to play the mind game with the game. Right. You got to pretend that you're happy so That's that right. when you least expect it, it gives you something good. God damn it! Yeah, Leroy, Leroy Sunset says, "See, this is this is what it is." This is what it is. Leroy Sunset is now legend tier member of this channel. All right, dude. I don't want to hear another goddamn bullshit item from you because I have. I'm gonna give my priority to Leroy Sunset, who is the first member of the channel. So, Leroy, if you have items that you have found, you've gambled on in this absolute juck fuckery that everybody is completely <laughs> abusing right now. Feel free to ask me, bro, because I appreciate you, all right? And Cooley, this item I just got. Oh, um, my fucking word. I don't want to hear it. I don't want it. There's not a word. I'm not listening to anything. It's all going in, in one, out the other, dude. It's a not, not anything. Processing zero. All trash. Every single thing. I'm actually finding some pretty sweet level 30 amulets. You gambling on amulets now? Are you gambling yeah, with a high I, level? Are you like with your 93 or you go, did you go back to the I don't have, I, I don't, I don't have a 93, I have a 90. Oh, word, 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 yeah. You're getting some good ones, huh? Be, uh, decent. I'm not going to say they're good. He's right. afraid Cooley then made him feel bad. <laughs> no, Cooley will tell him the truth. I, no, I don't no, lie no. to you, boys. Uh, let, let, let's just say that I'm not going to ever mention anything about the offensive auras ever again. <laughs> it's smart. Oh, yes. Three to cold skills, 20 FCR. It happened. Nice, Three to nice. cold, 20 FCR. It'll Sog be my fourth bitch, one. Bro. Yeah, it. I, got, I got one as well. Nice. I got a fire 20. A... I got a three fire, 20 FCR. I got a... Two, three martial arts, 20 FCR, and three combat, P combat, 20 FCR so far. I'll pay some people once this is over if they've got some sockets quests. Quest, I'll uh, yeah. see if I can get see if I can get that double socket. Uh, I do it for like 1K forum gold, no problem. Please. No. <laughs> oh, you said it pay what? Okay. What was what price were you thinking? Maybe we can meet in the middle. They're like, I think a socket is like 54 on gold. <laughs> Something like that. Uh, when you have the ability to self rush. So oh my God. That trash emoji is so perfect. You gotta find a, you gotta find a trash bin though. That is like full because it, that thing is gonna, that thing is filled up Leroy. <laughs> 10 FCR, five bonus attack rating, 113 attack rating, mana leech, 38 cold res, all eight res rank. That's pretty good. I would keep that. That's actually, that's actually really good. I would hold on to that. Really, really good. What is that? Like a borderline six point PVM ring right there. Because you've got one for the FCR, mana leech in PVM will count it as one. Uh, bonus to attack rating, attack rating itself, all res eight. And yeah, 30 cold res, that's really good. That's extremely good, dude. That's a very good find. Definite key. I guess it was a good find too, huh? <clears throat> Definite. Would keep. I'm the only one that could do it. Oh. We're hearing background conversations. That's all right. We're about to get some real deep knowledge about somebody. You know. The orange chairs. You can listen to everything. He's getting in trouble. That's either his wife or his mom. That's my wait. Wait, are you talking about me? Yeah, yeah. That's my wife. She's playing uh, five. We were, we were gonna. Yeah, we were gonna. We were hoping you were AFK. We were gonna come back. We were gonna be like, look, we heard. Oh. I'm, I'm sitting here smoking weed and freaking selling amulet right now. How's it gonna... As if I don't fucking find these enough... I'll just gamble to Catherine's amulet. Dude, I would... I feel like, Mitch, like, like a, a socket quest on a 320 cold circ is different. Because those, those actually have a use. Like, if you're going for, like, a max damage cold build... Amen. Like you sunder your opponent's resistances away in PvP. That's actually it's actually really good. It's actually best in slot. Oh shit, yeah, boys. Now this 
Now this right here is going on the BM Immortal Sorceress. Now this right here is something we're gonna we're gonna waste the cold uh, uh, socket quest on, boys, because this is gonna be what we grief pubs with someday. I was passively hoping I would find this in all of our junk fuckery. Dr. Twenty could have been twenty-five, but this is very good and plus three to cold skills. Ooh, nice. I got my own 320 helm wig. Nice. A little different, a little different, but a lot better is all I'm saying. Because I, I'm going to troll you Her so bugs. hard with that. You're going to make your cold sorceress, and I'm going to make mine, and you're going to be like, ooh, I hit you a million times. How come you're not dying? And gonna be oh, like, you I die. I don't know. I don't know, dude. Yeah, yeah, that's so dope. I'm actually pretty happy about that. We're gonna stash that. I, I have to keep my Zon circlets because my Zon has a shitty circlet right now. Oh shit, what, what did I throw on the ground? Oh, this was that helm I was talking about. Good thing I picked that up. That probably almost pooped. That was that 210. This is the two, this is the 210 helm I kept, Max. My reason why I have FTR on it on that is for the charge strike. I think. Ah, oh, okay. 320 light circlet. Any yeah, good it's been since a while. the cold one is a keeper? 320 is a little different for lightning because like lightning is now competing with uh with griffins, which is probably eons better. But the, the cold one only competes with Nightwing at which cannot possibly sunder away as many resistances, which is super important in PvP. So, like, the, the cold one is instantly at an advantage when the lightning one is competing with griffins, which it loses to. So, yeah, unfortunately, no, not as good. But fire is also pretty good, though. 320 fire isn't bad. It's kind of like middle of the road. It's not really competing with anything. It doesn't really have any other best in slot helms, like besides another 220 or a Shaco. So like it's pretty good. It's very, very good for max damage. Like, I kept mine. Max. Uh, skills for amulets and circlets for assassins. What should I look for? For have fun with that one. <laughs> yeah. I mean, <laughs> I mean am amulets. You generally want crafted amulets, so um, you're okay. Unless you f find something that's like godlike stats, like you know, like high strength, high dexterity, high everything, like really good on all stats. Um, nice, dude. Good yeah, find. Not... Um, and circlets, you're looking for twenty cast and uh, two skills. <laughs> oh, well, trash, trash. Right. I have the 25, yeah, I have the I two sword 25 DR, but now I'm thinking it's not as good as the plus three. Yeah, theoretically, for cold skills only, that plus three, if you're gonna have a magic helm, cold skills only, it's like best in slot for cold skills. Like fire skills, not bad, lightning skills, see ya. But for, I guess for an immortal sorceress, god damn it, here's another one with 10 cast. Like for an immortal sorceress, yeah, I guess so. It's really not bad. Pretty two, cold. Well, two two sorceress. Actually, Amy's that's too. really good. Actually, that's really good. Uh, Steve, the two sorceress twenty five dr for an immortal sorceress is actually really good because you can make. It helps your es too. Actually, the more I think about it, that's actually probably the better way to go. Yep. Yeah. That's it, that's true. Three to I, skill, I was uh, talking about a BM Immortal Sorceress. I'm actually in the process of making a bad-mannered Immortal Sorceress where I troll the shit out of people and I do stash buffing. Like, I completely stash buff my ES and I have a legitimate hard-hitting Sorceress that's also just Immortal. So, like, in that sense, the helm that I found is really good. But if you're doing it in, like, an actual GM sense, 2 to sort 25 DR is probably best. Uh, just be like Terry and uh, pretend that stash buffing is GM. Right, exactly, exactly. That was so funny, dude. I see him, we see him in LOD, rip an entire stash of lightning charms. He actually inspired me. Like that's that's who inspired me to make this BM Immortal Sorceress. Like that was exactly the person. Like, 
<laughs> I was like, dude, I can. Anyway, you know, he's been on D2R recently. He got yeah. Peter to run it now. Yeah, he, I saw him asking for donations and stuff. Like, he was like, if anybody's quitting and wants to get rid of their stuff, I need stuff. I'm starting from scratch. Uh, Amazon Helm is two socket or bust, right? Yep. Yeah, two socket or bust. Two socket or bust. Yeah, it makes it weird for like rares because they almost certainly need to have like two to skills on them as well. So it's like two to skills, two socket or bust. And then like depending on your build, faster cast or faster run walk. Preferably both, but. I'm actually surprised I haven't found a plus two barb skills 80 gold finds magic circlet. I actually figured I would find multiples of those. I've actually been passively in search of one of those. Surprised I haven't found any. That's RNG for you. Like, Seven even GG three, stats, three, 220, three 30, Zonhelm needs two sockets for IAS. Yeah, like, even, unfortunately, with, like, the most G-est of G stats, the best builds are gonna need that 30 IAS that's gonna have to come from jewels. Like, you're gonna what's have the, to slam two jewels. What's perfect life lead, Sean, is there, but... Seven? Okay, I found six, a seven. six, maybe? Because I found a seven life leech, uh, three socket uh, circle. I don't know. If, I don't know if that would be of any use to any kind of build. I mean, seems. Very oh no, niche. Leroy says Leroy says it's eight. He actually might be right. He actually might be right. Now that I think about it. I don't know if there would be any kind of use for this kind of uh, socket circle. But... I feel like mana leech is probably the better thing in pvm but i don't know actually pvp you life leech off of druids what other stats does it have three sockets so three sockets oh, are cool. oh yeah. yeah yeah probably trash probably yeah you gambling caps yeah kind of we almost got it right here two to barb skills 26 ml Oh, oh, I see what you're talking about. Uh, Haiti, do you need to be level 93 for Gamble Shaco? <laughs> Why are you... Yeah, it all makes sense. Sorry, I'm tired. Why are you gambling... Why are you gambling caps? Yeah, it is 8 Life Leech, by the way. I just gambled a Coronet with 8 Life Leech. By the way, is it level 93 that unlocks uh, two skills for ga gambling on circlets, or do you need to be 95 for that? It's, uh, it's level 90, I believe. But what happens in gambling is uh, it will always go plus... What is it? Plus five or minus three? I think, level? yeah. Plus five, yeah. minus four, I think. 90, but, 92, but that, 93 is like the perfect range, I think. Yeah, but that means that like if you're 93, you could technically get a level 89 circlet, which might not get plus two skills. So I, I think it's supposed to be level 95 for guaranteed. Yeah, yeah. definitely at level 95 for, for amulets. Or oh, no, I'm sorry. I'm pretty sure, no, I'm pretty sure 93 gets it all. There's some sort of calculation. Mm -hmm. I remember that 90, you might 92 be, you might for be right. circlets, 92 for circlets. So obviously the plus two to skills is a lower requirement on circlets and it's 93 on amulets. Hmm. We broke it down on a Facebook stream once. Yeah. Because I remember yeah. it was like so deep. Someone literally put a clinic on for me and it was like, oh, okay, 92 for circlets, 93 for amulets. And I just, I don't think that I might've bought all the good shit from Jamal Miller. Nah, dude, you just gotta believe. I got, we, we both got one of those earlier. <laughs> yeah, I got two of those. I don't know what to do with them though. It's like, what do you do with plain 220 barbed circlets? Oh my God. Charcy them. Charcy them, right, exactly. These rings are trash. <laughs> you throw them in there next to Cooley's curses circlet. <laughs> That's right, there's a bin for all that. Leroy has a, has started a bin. It's a <laughs> an empty trash bin. We need to we need to fill it up. Oh, mm. I'm sure we've all filled it up. Oh this. yeah. Oh yeah. 
Especially when you start buying rings. Holy crap. Yeah, there, it's all trash. I gave up on those real quick. And it was just like, after seeing so many circlets and all of the stuff that can spawn on it, I'm just like, I'm so done looking at trash. Like, yeah. it's, yeah, I saw so many rings, they were just straight trash. Like, oh, uh, I can't do uh, it. I, I'm actually doing it to see how, to see if anything's going to get any higher than these amulets, because if so... What? You're going to feel like a dipstick when you get a unique and you're like, fuck, that could have been a fucking griffin sound. Dude, Joy's, Joy's found two Maras so far. That's insane. Hecomb 20 cast, boys. That's my second one of those. What a fucking troll. <laughs> uh. Closing in on... Yeah, dude, we closing in on 11 hours. Woo! Only... Oh, what? Only 11 more to... We halfway done, boys. We halfway there. Cheers. Cheers to oh, that. Cheers. It's more Jim Beam. Did I just hear someone say they're tired? Get some coffee. Yeah, right? I haven't even moved on to coffee yet. <laughs> Do I even look like I'm close to being done? I haven't even decided it's a good idea to go brew it yet. Like, you know what I mean? I'm like, nah, we could do Jim Beam for like another six hours. Like, that's you probably... Gotta, you gotta, gotta do it. You gotta make your... Everybody's gotta go for their longest stream, man. Dude, I mean, dude, I, I've if, never done one. I've never done a 24-hour stream. I've always been like, that's the stupidest thing. Why would somebody ever do that? I see a Morinth can lick ears for like 17 hours. You can do it, Cooley. Especially when it benefits your Diablo characters. He's not wrong. What, remember what we were talking about? Like sometimes when you talk, I feel dumber. <laughs> <laughs> what? Remember? You don't know what I'm talking. About. I know you know what I'm talking about. I feel like I lost brain cells. That was one of those times. No, it wasn't. <laughs> they completely no, no, but in all, in all seriousness, in all seriousness, oh, I heard something about licking ears. Yeah, right. Yeah, licking ears. I said, I said, oh, you gotta go for ears. your. I said I you can go I, for we, your. Look, we, no one gives a shit. I'm like you don't have to clarify it, right? Look, I'll just say this. I'll say this. I thought it was dumb to ever think about streaming for 24 hours straight. But then Battle.net was like Black Friday sales. And here we are. And, and wait till you see what they have for you tomorrow. You're up for yeah. 48 hours. Yeah, yeah, dude. <laughs> Bet you nobody's got a worse <laughs> yeah. circlet. Nobody has rolled a worse circlet yet than the, what I just Ooh. got. Watch the next the next one be like magic find is like times a thousand. I don't know, we you wanna really take that bet? <laughs> magic I, find I times a thousand would be insane. The only mod Listen Joe, the only mod one to life. <laughs> I swear to Christ. I got one in circlet of the jackal, it's plus two to life. One to life, bro. Better by oh, one life. <laughs> that is horrible. <laughs> Tafuk. Man. I so feel many, so bad there about that. So one. many right. abilities on that. I almost shit. There's like literally nine lines of text on this thing. I thought there would be something that was good, but I hate that every time I, 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 sort of I, I think I got a Griffins in my fucking inventory. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I've just turns got to a diadem. Oh, it just gets your heart racing, dude. Oh, well, even even if it doesn't, you know that like a diadem is so good because you immediately know it can get three sockets if it rolls the jeweler's mod. There's so many good things about it rolling to a diadem that oh, like you just immediately get excited. Another feeling. Rolling up on 11 hours, still zero misclicks, boys. Just wanted to let you know in case you were wondering. In case anyone wants to call Joby at such an hour, we should call him. We should actually call him. Is that him. Hey, look, dickhead, we didn't sell our torch yet. It's like three and in the morning up. where he's at. <laughs> just be like, yo, yo, Still got uh, my torch, click. Yeah, right. Oh, were you guys trying to sleep? Oh, shit, no problem. Do you, is this a good time? All right, wake up for a second, dude. This shit is important. And just be like, I went 11 fucking hours and ain't made one single misclick, bitch. Hang up. <laughs> 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 boom, boom, what's up? Uh, built different. Cool. You know it, brother. You know it. Not a single one. Just, just figured you should know. Or say it like wicked soothing and quiet. Just be like, Joby, I just wanted to let you know and ask your opinion on this. Um, I've gone 11 hours and still haven't made a misclick. Uh, how do you feel about trashing two Geech charms in the course of 30 minutes? <laughs> Click. Click. <laughs> Mm -hmm. You suck. Oh man. 
You gotta call him with that Texan voice, man. All right, all right, all right. Oh, oh my God. Trash. Oh my God. Come on now. Come on now. Come on I was now. gambling. Playing the slot machines. This is like playing the slot machines where you just can't lose them. That's kind of cool. Like you just kind of walk away from the slots when you feel as though you've won enough. Like how often? How often do we actually have that? This might actually fucking work. never if you're talking about this, real song like, machine. When you think about it, when you think about like what retirement might feel like for old people, this that's is this right here. It. Yeah, this is like probably it. You just you sit around and you're just like, I got all this money that I worked so hard to get, and I, I'm, I'm just gonna go play the slot. Can't really lose at this point. It would take me my entire life. I would try to train a monkey. When I retire. Oh my god, shut up. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a good idea. I heard No 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 I, I would train a monkey. I would train a monkey to I would train a monkey to do what I'm doing right now so I can go AFK. <laughs> yeah. You might get banned for that though. They might consider a, a monkey like a third party program or something like that. I bet Bullshit. <laughs> They might. It's they could technically do it. Dude, we're all playing like as if we're a bot right now. Oh yeah. You yep. click too many times. Blizz seriously last... knows what they're doing. Playing slots with endless money. You watch Diablo Immortal. I wonder what they're doing for that for the holidays. Motherfudge. Oh my god. <laughs> you can buy some gems. <laughs> <laughs> You can buy infinite gems, but then there's going to be a minute where it rolls out. And if you, then the gems are going to be five times the price. I hope you don't misclick. I like being able to. I like being able to. Right before I go to bed on my phone and play it more. Because it's still fun. Yeah, it's actually I, not bad, dude. I, I don't I, I talk shit all the time. It. It's actually I don't not. I don't buy nothing on it, but the game in itself, like the story and shit, is actually fun. Yeah, it's a, it's actually not bad, dude. I, I played it up until I never PvP'd or anything because I don't think I ever right. got that far. But it was actually like it was actually kind of enjoyable. Oh, like the battlegrounds! Battlegrounds are fucking great. I mean, you don't play, not... you don't pay anything and you play in the battlegrounds of Diablo. Uh, and I get kills too. No shit, dude. Because oh, it, you're, it's like fucking. There's like ten people on your team, and you're fighting ten other people. So it's like, ten, it's like a fucking battle. You can get kills, bro. Ladies and gentlemen, I have an announcement to make. I Joby to Geets. No surprise, me. Nicely I remember, done. I remember my first time playing Diablo 2. <laughs> Nicely done. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, don't feel bad. My wife, uh, Joby, two fifteen presents. No, <laughs> oh, no, your wife plays Diablo too. Yeah, no, she was a farming vendor for gold while I was gambling. You gotta keep that one, dude. I think it's funny how everybody's saying, "I Joby this and I Joby that." <laughs> and that's after so, respects on the keys. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it happens, man. Thirty faster run walk, eighteen all resumes. Damn it! I'm a little pissed off about that. Put the that, Elon right? neutral link implant in a monkey. Get it to run Pindle. This is actually probably the smartest thing I've heard. Like, there's this brain implant that Elon Musk is working on. Like, he's talking about doing this brain implant shit. Can you imagine? That's actually genius. Oh, like, done, instead, bro. you just put it in a monkey and make them all smart and shit and teach them how to play Diablo 2. And then they just... The, the problem is that yeah. that monkey does like 600 runs and then they get banned. That's true. It can still get banned. But can you imagine oh. like appealing that and being like, "Look, I promise that wasn't a bot, dude." Elon Musk <laughs> put a chip in a monkey's brain. I don't. And then want... I fucking sh I showed them well, you'd, how to play You'd have Diablo to uh, stream the monkey playing it as proof, you know. Yes. I, don't and, uh, know. I got the camera on him this whole time. We're actually still live. You can see him kind of freaking out and not knowing what the fuck to do because he can't get into his account anymore. Like, you know what I mean? He's kind of killing <laughs> this monkey. I'm just gonna be honest with you, man. I don't want a fucking four-foot monkey that's got the IQ of a computer 
with right. recharge strength running around my house. We're talking about like this is cutting this, edge this space age technology shit right here. What are you gonna do, Blizzard? You're just gonna ban it? Like what the fuck is wrong with you, man? This shit is cutting edge. You could be a, you could this could be headline news. Monkey monkey beats Diablo too. But you're, you just wanna ban us. You just wanna you you're monkey ist. Your species is you don't want that kind of lawsuit, do you? You should unban this monkey. We're really on to something, boys. It's amazing that isn't it great ideas that we come up with. This <laughs> monkey, I just want to say that this whole monkey thing came up with, uh, you know, trying to teach it to suck a dick without peeling. So. <laughs> Fuck, God damn it. I almost forgot it. So I'm so glad you said that to remind me where all of this came from. It's all pissed tip from of a that. I almost forgot there for a minute. It's the a... stupidest comment of the night. We're still talking on it. I'm all <laughs> We did say that your IQ was going to lower the more times you've heard it. So That's actually at this true, point, this everybody's fucking 12 got, IQ I right now. I got more stupider. Dude. That's what happened. <laughs> Yeah, we're like all getting to the point. God damn it. How bad does like... it get? <laughs> Speaking of South Park and getting more stupider, you ever see the one where Cartman's trying to get stupid so he can drive NASCAR? <laughs> oh yeah, have you seen the one where he does have you seen the one where he joins the, the uh, Special Olympics? Oh Jesus, yeah. <laughs> oh my god, that's great. That one's awesome too. I'm and he gets beat. Even sure. <laughs> like the, the political statements behind that show are unmatched by anything. Like it literally, it go, it makes this big ass joke about like Hartman joining the Special Olympics, and like it, it's funny. But then the joke and the the truthful joke behind it is that like the Special Olympics are no joke, and there's actual fucking athletes in that shit that are like nasty. And fucking that's the point behind it. But it shows that in like the craziest way. South Park is a genius show. It is pretty good. Scott Tinnerman must die. That was a 12, great one. 12 hours into the stream, we're getting a, a little chippy, boys, but no misclicks. Exactly. That's that's how you truly gauge how good, we, how good we're doing and where we're at. Zero misclicks. No, I, no fuck you guys. Zero misclicks. Come approaching 12 hours. Zaro misclicks. If you think of the hours that you've saved yourself, though, in these shitty drops, yeah. like, think of how many gold bar run Travancore run, uh, right. runs this was, dude. It's like, kind of a blessing. Might have closed the chapter of my life, honestly. I don't know if I'll ever go back to doing this the right way. It's like, nope, if I was gonna get it, I would have got it last night. Fuck it, nope. Not gambling ever again. Right. right. <laughs> it's, it's really, it's kinda true though. Yeah. Like, why it's not we... meant to be, boys. <laughs> Gambling's just not for me. Right. Cooley's gonna be fucking MFing and see a rare circle and be like, fuck that shit, I ain't even picking it up. Yeah. Yeah, we've got like the best the best GG thing I've got so far is the is the LLD helm, the 100% perfect level 18 LLD helm. Like that we took the Larzik and we got two sockets as well. That's like I don't think I can top that. That's just like it feels good, is good, is actually worth something. Like That's the best one on, that I got. Like if you're planning on going to a casino, get on Diablo 2 right now. Do some gambling first before you make that trip. Right, it's probably gonna feel the same. You're gonna waste like 24 hours of your life, and you're gonna be like, "Well, that sucked." No, but hold on a minute. <laughs> Don't at compare least... them to the same. You got cocktail waitresses, nice drinks. They're free as long as you're playing. No, they're yeah. free as long as you're. Well, wait, we got drinks like, here. I don't know what you're talking you lose, about. You lose, you lose the table. You have to go somewhere else, and then, and then you. Winning is contagious, but unfortunately, so is losing. Write that one down. Put that in your pipe and smoke it. God damn straight. God damn right. That's my best Walter White. That's all I got. That's my best. Walter White. Just 
guy on a buffalo. Oh my god. Trash is also contagious. It's very true. You guys, take your fucking trash gambling out of here because it's spreading. It's spreading, and I now get trash. I gotta change my angle. I gotta change my angle. Need a change of angle. Wait, this and I get two circles. The effect is exactly the same biochemically in the end, but you feel kind of good. Nah, dude, I think the seed is actually good. The seed's been really good. We actually farmed a seed. Uh, we, we took some time and farmed a good seed in the beginning. We actually did take like 10 minutes and farm a good seed. What we believed to be a good seed. I don't but really want to... We could also test that and go find items and be like, is it still a good seed? Or does the seed like change over time? Oh, I don't know. I feel like gambling though has been really, really I don't good understand about seeds is like, if, like, I understand about like, if you have a set seed, when the game starts, there's a certain like, the RNG is kind of set. So you can kind of control things as long as there aren't like random factors like going to different areas. But mm -hmm. if you have a certain seed and you're just advancing the seed by uh, advancing the RNG by gambling and doing different actions, doesn't the seed like no longer matter at that point? Like, I don't know. I'm not sure that it, it gives like a global bonus to everything in the game, but I might be wrong because I don't really know. Well, how I would figure it is that like you, how many of you just determine certain things so like uh so when rng is determined it usually is based on something either static or changing or it bases its calculations somewhere in programming on something that's uh something it can look at right that may change or may not change however uh the seed could control that and could dictate where things land like if they tend yeah, to but, land well, on as I, as I understand, a seed provides kind of a starting point. Yeah, yeah. So, so the thing is, like, like if on single player, when they were trying to do experiments to get a chest to drop the same rune every single time, um, the way they did that was using the same seed and using the same exact action. So it's like if they did an action such as going to a different vendor or refreshing town or spawning a different group of monsters, those actions could advance the RNG so that chest will no longer drop what it would have dropped before. But if they did the same exact things every single time, it dropped the same rune every every single time. So I think it might just be a starting point. I'm not sure if it actually has influence. We want to change the seed? I'm down for that. I don't know down if it would do anything. It might not do anything either way. Yeah. I'm it down. could be all placebo. <laughs> Yeah, it, like at this point, I've gambled trash for like the last hour plus. So I mean, I'm down for it. I'll just switch games. I'm down. Let's go. Let's fo let's fucking go. I'm down, boys. I love this going by field. No science. Let's just feel it. Yeah, it's just, it literally is all about feel. No zero science involved. Sometimes you stumble yeah. upon things that way. The the RNG in that game was preset. If they took a different route, still limited. Yeah, I feel like that's kind of where I was going with it, Steve. Is just like the starting point either limits how far or short it will go. Like in any instance, it starts at that seed. But even so, we we determined that this seed was not godly. It just wasn't bad. That's what we determined about this seed when we picked this game. We were like, ah, this isn't a bad seed. So, yeah, new game, let's do it. Let's do it, I'm down. The first ever member says, new game. Which means, we gotta do it. Cheers to you, Leroy. Cheers. Alright. We even brought our amulets this time. <laughs> I just stick mine in my cube. Whenever I'm... Um. Let's do it. Gamble. Don't forget to pick up your amulets when you leave your seed. I did. We done got smashed by that quite a bit today, but not this time. 
Yeah, I'm done losing my geeds and fucking torches and shit. It's time to turn over a new leaf. This, this shit literally looks no You know good. what you should do? You should name your game after your favorite casino. Since we're all gambling. You can't name your geese, though. Your you game. You know what? You're right. I oh, can't name, name the game. Oh, the game? I, thought I, just name name my, I just named my game Caesar's Palace. Let's see what happens. <laughs> 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 All right, I'll I'll gold find after this. I'm gonna, I'll buy the amulets back and then I'll gold find. Oh no, actually, gold finding doesn't do it. We have to we have to go find the way that we determine seeds is we look at base item. That's how we've been doing it. And there's a very good chance, based on what I know, that any random game is a bad seed. It's just a very good chance. Like, these already feel different. Okay, from someone that has just been gambling these for the last 11 hours, like, the the stats that are spawning on these feel different. In a good way or in a bad way? Bad way. Like, they just feel different. Like, I'm feeling the same way I swapped games than you did, and now I feel like I'm getting shittier shit. Yeah, like, the rolls aren't as good. They're not rolling as high. They're rolling plus two to skills. Mid-rolls on fucking... <laughs> Yeah, like, it's just weird. <laughs> but I don't know. Joe. We'll see. We'll try it out. Uh, we'll try it out. <laughs> just what you said. I'm getting shittier shit. <laughs> see, bro. Oh, I'm yeah, going yeah, to 18, yeah, 15, yeah, we could search again with bases. We could search again with bases. We'll try it out. We'll, I'm going to give this a little bit. We'll, like, give this, like, five minutes or so. And just see if, like, something pops up. See, like, 10 faster run walk. We saw none of those. Literally no 10% faster run walk items in that entire last game. I think we just saw two in that same run right there. Just bought a fucking scimitar for some reason. Dude, it happens. I've been. Uh, I, I, if you count those misclicks that aren't very damaging, I've done a few of those mm -hmm. where you like buy the wrong item. Yeah. I accidentally sold my high alerts, but I could buy it back, so that's cool. I gambled the high lords. Yeah, I was gonna just say he got it, high lords. Nice. I just yeah. hit an eighteen fifteen Griffins. You did? You got a Griffins? Yep. GG. One ninety seven defense. Damn, uh, bro, GG uh, first uh, Griffins. Put it in the trailer. Damn, bro. That is sick. Okay, so I'm certainly feeling it with this. Uh, there's like certainly something different. I, I'm getting some better rolls this time, but still trash. You just got it. Didn't you? Were you the same? Did I hear the right voice? Did you just get a Griffins? No, I didn't get a Griffins. Oh, that wasn't you. Okay. Sorry, I wasn't looking at who said it. But, gotta keep going, man. Can't have no in your heart. Why is the guard dig? I do wonder if there's something about the game, like if just like I've been doing it like kind of like just gambling, and if I feel like my gambles are shitty, I'll just make a new game. I don't know if it actually changes anything. Yep, but. that's actually kind of a good way to do it. That way you don't have to. Yep. Yeah. See, like this plus one to skills. Rarely saw any of that shit in the last game. Now we get two, back to back. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm just. I think that's good. By the way, have you guys been getting like, like I, I noticed this one game, I was getting a lot of um, circlets with uh, a poison dagger charges on them. And I just gambled four. Quite, quite often. Was that like, does that I happen? Think, I think it's just because you also look for poison dagger charges. And it, it might, it might it be that. It might be that. I, like I noticed it when it happens. Yeah. But, yeah. yeah. All right, I'm gonna try to farm a game with a good seed. Yeah. Hello, there were a number I just, of I just fucked that, that seed. I had a good one. I fully trust my logic now. I am fully convinced that seeds certainly matter and that we had a really good seed in that last game. So I now I'm gonna take five, 10 minutes and farm another good seed game. We're gonna do this one. Right How now. do you determine if a game's got a good seed or not? The coolie logic that I've been using 
is you go and look for superior or base items that can spawn with skills and gauge how well they roll. That's that's basically how we've been doing it. Is like look for base items. Oh, could they spawn with skills? They could. Did they spawn well? Awesome. Were they shitty? Bad. Oh, hello. Too bad that's a barbarian item. You had me hope up there for a second. Well, if if the other item is Aria's face, this is not good. No <laughs> like, superior item so far. If this was like two to something else, because it's got all resist eight, 25 strength, two, 21 poison damage, 20 faster cast rate, and then two to barbarian skills. If it didn't have the two to barbarian skills and like two to insert class here, other than barbarian, that would probably be a decent help. How legit just got poison dagger charges? That's so weird. Speaking it into reality, bro. No superiors, no skill items, nothing to gauge this seed off of. I gambled three to passive skills, circulates, the same circulate in the same eight that I gambled. It was four of them. The exact same circulate. Okay, so here's a base item that spawned Fuck plus one to, to a skill. Protector shield with a mid roll on the resistances. Uh, superior falchion with one of them rolled perfect, one of them didn't, but it, it still rolled shitty on ED. Give it a little bit. Get a hell in. More poison dagger charges. God damn you, Max. <laughs> I mean, maybe you'll find me a good one. Into reality, maybe you'll find me a good one. Maybe I will. Finding the assassin circle with that could actually be useful. This rolled 13 enhanced defense. It's not horrible. It could have just been a fluke on the on the one item. I'm not actually giving up totally on this game yet. We're gonna give it a little bit. Actually, kind of like what I saw. Two superior mods. We'll we'll, we'll check. Haven't given up yet. It's a today, Junior. We gotta be we gotta be deliberate. We can't be all random. We gotta be deliberate. Yeah, and then we're getting nothing that gives us skills for this seed. Nothing to gauge this off. This is actually really difficult to gauge. What's another place that just automatically pops shit like the new Oh yeah, the sewers. Maybe we need to reseed the music. Here you could be right. But this is a good jam. This is my jam. I decided to gamble some claws just to break the monotony. And um damn, I wish this this is a cute claw, but I wish it had some use. It's like three martial arts, 40 attack speed, three claws of thunder. <laughs> it's like it's cute, yeah. but it's just not useful in any which way, you know? Magic damage reduced by four, three open sockets. His dog shit. Thanks for sharing it. We are all now dumber. <laughs> May God have mercy on your soul. <laughs> three to offensive auras, ten castro. What a dick game. Fuck this game, bro. No, I'm, this one, you, man. I'm pretty sure this one's got a good seed because every time I gamble eight circlets at a time, three to five of them have plus two or plus three to skills on them. Like the last three sets I've done, I just haven't found anything GG yet. Act one is better to determine seed. How do we know? Okay. This? This is, I don't believe this. <laughs> My I don't believe this. Good. A hogwash. Sounds off, but I mean. Whatever, what we, it, it theoretically could work. I mean, it doesn't really matter where we get to. You imagine, like, the top end part of the game, like the higher end parts of the game, would be the better judge of the seed. He said he's looking for seed. It's really <laughs> like any, it's really like any place, honestly. Like, anything where you just drop superiors. Like, drop superiors or class items that spawn with skills. That's literally all that matters. That's a good sign. So 
So it, it spawned with a good mod on the jewel, but it, like almost 40 ED. So that's, that's kind of good. That's like a higher level mod that it's spawning with. Which is exactly what you would be gauging the seed for. Alright, there's a skill item. Yeah, I like going to Trav every now and then to determine my seed. It's a quick one. No skills on that. I feel like Act 1 is horrible to, <laughs> to determine this seed. We're gonna go to Act 4. Yeah, chaos. Trap. Yeah, chaos is like you just pop so many monsters at once. It's just totally worth it. I suppose if you used a cow level in Act 1, it might be good. Yeah. It's not bad, but. But yeah, if chaos you have is just. It pops so many monsters without you having to really do anything. Yeah. Yeah. Got a for it. Yeah, we're just getting the leg. So why is the skill item? The skill item that got, went one one two. That's not a good sign. Oh, by the way, I have two keys of destruction. By the way, uh, Duke. Yep. Been farming the crap out of him. Or it didn't make us quick work of that guy. Oh, plot mixed up is. Yep. I'm just glad that they don't put Iron Maiden in the cast anywhere anymore. Right? Dear God. Uh, talk about I've seen enough from this game. Player. That seed is terrible. Hey, things kind of fun, right? And what a king! A... I'm impressed. Big Nov, what's up, my dude? Cheers to you. Yeah, of course I've done all fucking eleven hours with the sunglasses, bro. We shine so bright up in this bitch. Finding, finding, you don't find shit like this. It would blind most people. This shit, some of this shit would blind most people, bro. Like no, this right here, that would blind most people. It, no, it's it's on, you, bro. Just be honest, so you can take those quick power naps to get those bursts. Nah, dude, it's not even that. I'm not even tired yet, really. I'm Josh. I'm uh, Josh. This I, is I haven't even right? uh, like. I, I will say, I will say, I'm considering putting on coffee. But it more more like you would consider putting a potato in the oven in case you're hungry tomorrow. Like, you, you know, know what I mean? It's sort of the same thing. You know, Cooley, I actually found it hilarious that the Brunsky tried to put on the sunglasses in this video. I did too. I laughed so hard. I was like, yeah. dude, I am so flattered. But by like, this. like, but it's like he totally didn't pull it off. Like, you look at him in sunglasses and it's like, that's an arc. You know? <laughs> you know? <laughs> I think he looked all right. I was like, this is a good, that's a good look, man. You should keep those yeah. on. He's oh, selling like this. Nah, 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 nah. I don't, I don't know. He, he needs some more sunglasses. Yeah, he gave you the shout out. That was cool. Oh, the brusky. Dude, it feels kind of surreal, man. I remember, like, watching these guys who stream Debrunsky and Llama and shit, and I would say yeah. shit, and they wouldn't. They wouldn't hear me. They wouldn't acknowledge what I said. We're keeping the seed, boys. We're keeping this fuck seed. We're there keeping this one down. Nice. Was that a 15? Yeah, it was a 15, yeah. bro. Oh, nice, dude. This one rolled plus one to volcano, though. Hold on. Oh. We gotta, we gotta be, be intelligent eight? about this before we commit another was, 10 was that fucking a hours to it. Life, a 38 life. Hold on. We gotta, we gotta be intelli, intelligente, as they say. Dude, I just gave him four circulates with twenty-three to shrink at the same, the, like. Yeah, dude, that what seed. What the fuck, bro? That seed, man, it's not random. What well, fuck? well, no. It, 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 here's the thing about RNG. If you notice a pattern or something really weird, it's because your mind notices. It. If you gamble a hundred circles in a row and they're all different, you're not gonna notice the difference. As soon as there's four circles in a row that share one mod, your brain is right. just gonna zoom I in mean, on that, that one mod. Time. Oh my God, Big Nov, my dude. Cheers to you. Just donated a ten spot for eleven hours with sunglasses. 
level oh, yeah. king stuff Turned my dude cheers to you bro for 11 hours is next level king stuff you damn straight bro i, I, I also appreciate kind of, that uh, funny i appreciate when, that it cheers to you i find it funny coolly that time that you had glasses on and you couldn't tell the difference between unique and uh, rare it's part of the struggle dude i like <laughs> to consider it as like this game is so fucking easy i need another challenge mm. you know what i mean and like that just makes it so that i get that challenge i get the you know it's getting mm. deep i need to get my boots man <laughs> <laughs> all right oh, cool. uh we found one 15 percent superior item there the rest if i only saw those rest i would i would can this game so uh but I hate to walk out on a 15 find. Let's do one more. Let's do one more. Let's go. Let's go do a shank real quick. Go ahead, gamble with you too. Feel it out. I'm actually getting a, a number of like almost claws. Like nothing really good, but I'm like getting at least like one or two of the desirable mods. It's just a matter of getting them all together. Actually, seeing a lot of lights on tree. Oh wait, never mind. I think I just answered this phone, this question by itself. As right. somebody trash. If Can we do a few gambles in this game? Yeah, I feel like I've gambled so long, I could probably figure it out. I could probably tell you right away. Let's do it. Yeah. Let's just do a couple of gambles, and I'll be able to tell right away. I'll be like, yep, it's not the same. Or, yep. Cooey, I, I just made a drink that I think you would like. Okay. It's called a tiger's blood. You put a shot of cognac, a shot of uh, coconut rum, Malibu, whatever your brand yep. is, yep. and then two shots of cherry moonshine okay. with about three to four of the cherries from the moonshine in there. You put about half a solo cup worth of ice, and you put about a half a solo cup worth of uh, pina colada mix or okay. coconut cream, and you blend it till it's slushy, then you pour in half a Code Red Mountain Dew. Boom, tastes like a Tiger's Blood snow cone, dude. That sounds awesome, but I have another drink. It's called Straight Whiskey. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what we on, bro. Yeah, Damn, uh, I don't like this game. Bourbon. I don't like the seed. I can tell right away. I don't like it. it doesn't feel right. No, but that drink actually sounds OD. <laughs> like, I, like yeah, I was trying to make like fun of it, but it, it does sound OD. Yeah. Six, and appreciate you, bro, as always. Appreciate you, dude. How many of you guys found a M Mavina's uh, true sight? What is the highest single resist you can have? Gamble the rare ring with 53 cold. A Ooh, rare ring with 53 cold? It can There's go no up way. to, um, it's like 59 or 60. Are you sure it was a rare yeah, a ring? ring? Because no. 41 oh, is the most ring. you can a have ring. A on ring. a ring. 41 I, is the I, most. My bad on a ring. I want bad. Uh, so 35 cold reds added on to the 18, I think. If it's on an amulet, it's 60. It makes me think you probably gambled an amulet because it's 60 on an amulet. It's all pretty good. You know, you, you need cold reds. Never know when you're going to face a blizzard sword. I need to stack that res. Exactly, dude. You just, you never know. All right, I'm going in with the H and going in with the H dude, boys. yeah okay yeah that's what it was it, uh, the drink recipe was missing plus two curses oh my god I'm so glad you were thinking the same thing I was <laughs> I was having like PTSD when he's raiding off these ingredients like all I could hear when he's like saying these ingredients is plus 15 all res 90 mana plus two curses and cognac I'm like oh okay yeah that's, uh, that sounds great never even had cognac before. That was really? a I, good drink. It's like a rich person drink. Yeah, it's like a nice brandy, right? Great. Yeah, it's, it's, it's pretty great. good. I mean, it better fucking be. It's expensive. <laughs> <laughs> you know All what right, I'm saying? Let's do it. Shit better be good. Shit My wife be drinks that shit. Age, bro. My wife drinks that shit. And her mom. <laughs> Her mom brought me some shit from fucking Ecuador, dude. It's pretty good. Oh, yeah. They love whiskey in Ecuador, dude. 
My buddy old Jim Bob brought me some shit from down the road. It's buddy old oh, Jim Bob. I just heard Jim Bob and nearly shit myself. I'm like, this is the kind of, this is the crew. I couldn't think of a better crew. <laughs> no, I mean, like, doing admit, this with. his name's not Jim Bob, but I can go down the road and get some straight up. Yeah, I know moonshine. fucking Jim Bob's got this moonshine and shit. Yeah, dude, these are my you, boys. Ha- you, you gotta get this you is the game I want to be in. This is the game I want to be in if I'm going to be gambling. I'm in Alabama. I'm in Alabama, and there is a fucking tactical assault pig sleeping right next to me. With a spiked collar. Trying her to sniff out mines. South Park's version of Alexa was called Jim Bob. (laughs) Cognac was a drink. What? What? I got drunk as sick on now I can't even smell it dude that was me with Jim Beam believe it or not and I'm um, just now after like I think probably 12 15 years maybe being able to sip it again and that's only because uh, I was like I've kind of eased myself into whiskey recently all right so this rolled mid on the class skill there I actually like that that's not a horrible sign poison daggers level 5 poison dagger charges on a con- two combat skills Oh. You need it for that uh, poison dagger paladin. Yeah, that oh, badass poison dagger paladin, sir. An action, though. See, now I've got a huge shooter. Oh, no fucking wonder I've been using it. Alright, we're gonna get some looks here. We got a couple of superiors that drop. We're gonna know right away. Uh, this is, believe it or not, actually a good sign. I actually like this. It's only 10 ED, uh, but believe it or not, I've seen them roll like that in good seeds. Oh shit, just got my Griffin's eye. Let's fucking go. You got another, you got a Griffin's? Yeah. We have another you... Griffin's in this group that was found? Holy shit. Someone Trying was saying, game, I don't know, man. man. Nobody's found any of those Griffin's. I don't what know. Maybe the price the... will stay the same. Uh, I'm waiting to oh, gamble my bar trips. Buy yeah, those Griffins, cause those prices are tanking. Are going, dude. Yeah, those are going, bros. Trash. Griffins, trash. Not perfect. Trash. trash. That's what it's gonna get to be. Oh shit! I shouldn't have hit that. Wow. I wonder what the chance to get a Griffins and gambling is. For like point zero zero some shit. Yeah, hey, it's uh, it's pretty bad. Below five was like five or ten percent chance to gamble the elite version, and coronas don't always hit or coronets. So you gamble the coronet has a percent chance to hit that, and then it has the percent chance to hit the unique. It's gonna be tough finding a good seed, boys. This thing you need to, 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 to get a Griffin's seed. Call me, hit, I'll come uh, and get you. Yeah, get a diet in chance and then uh, hit the unique on that. Cool, you can come in my game. I just gambled this Griffin's in. <laughs> that must be a good seed, right? Yeah. It's gotta be. Uh, how, well, I don't know. It, it no, doesn't. No, it, like, it, went, it wouldn't matter at all. Yeah, and what <laughs> it was it? 18, what was the stats on it? Yeah, 1910. Yeah, terrible. Trash. 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 If hey, at least you if fucking fu- if gambled. If fucking one. Dazer wouldn't buy it, trash. <laughs> if Dazer wouldn't give it a second look and make an offer on it, trash. Yeah, honestly, there's a low stats. Gotta get those superior items. This guy Dazer had like every single one of his griffins perfect. And yeah. it's just like and it's all vanity because it doesn't matter for an assassin. So right. it's like I noticed that too. I was like, that's just stunned. Yeah, it's just vanity. Like, that's just stunned. But I mean, hey, if that's your thing, you know, more power to you. Yeah. I was like, dude, that's awesome, man. I actually like the the uh, reverse swag when you have a griffins like being the absolute lowest on an assassin. Oh, yeah. All right, plus three to Blizzard, Meteor. Those are both good skills. One spawn, plus three. Superior, Synquatus, 
two stats, but none of them are good. Uh, max damage, you can't tell anything off from. 90, I gotta give you that's props terrible. on that word you said, Synquatus. That was well said. Okay. I just been pronouncing shit properly since 1986, boys. You know, say something to me about that bear rune. Sure. Say something to me. Sure. Your boy knows. Your boy knows. I've always called them bear runes too. Uh, this is actually a good sign too because the 11 to 27 cold damage is the highest tier. The hibernal oh, is really good. Good seed. Yep, this might be a good seed. Yeah, Jai. Yeah. I feel like after today, everyone's going to be looking for socket quests. <laughs> <laughs> Sell your socket quests, boys. I had some good seeds one time. I put them in an aquarium. <laughs> they got me kicked out of my apartment. Yeah, they sure <laughs> shit did. What the fuck? I don't even, even want to know. Oh, Dr. Green? I don't know. I don't even elaborate. This rolled plus three energy shield with three total stats. Yeah, this is a good seed. So like, yeah, this may be one we stay in. We'll, we'll just give it a we'll give it a good once over right here. Yeah, if you're gonna be doing that for hours, it's way to do it. Right, gotta really make sure, dude. We gotta really we, be we got sure about it. PM, right? Not finding shit. Me actual attempts you think we've made. Epic fucks on to know that. Oh my god, I was made wondering how long it would take somebody to make that joke about seeds and sperm. I thought that I th honestly thought that's where that's where Wig was going. I was like, oh my god, here it is. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was expecting it. Yeah, I was like, here we go. I mean, I am in the army. We like to fucking yeah. see what the boundaries yeah. are. I was like, someone's <laughs> going there. But no, we leave it to Joy. Joy was the one to go there. You know your tiredness disappears after you stay up for long enough? I am at that stage now. I don't feel tired anymore. All right, who sold more in their charms than worth they than worth in what they gambled? Oh, my God. That's a good question. Joby, if he sold Joby it, more charms. It would be kind of Joby interesting. More like, charms it's, than it's a little made. too late for it now, but, like, if somebody had a counter of how many times they gambled today, you know? That would be sick. That'd be yeah. sick. But I'm pretty sure said counter would probably get you banned. Mm -hmm. yeah, uh, I'm totally comfortable good. enough to start gambling in this seed, but I'm willing to give it up if it's shit. Like, if I can realize that it's shit very quickly, I'm willing My to give it up. My wife told me the same shit when she got with me. Yep, she's just like, I'm willing to take a chance on him, but the second he fucks up, I'm gone. And you know what the bad part about it is, is she's just country sensitive. That was pretty close to an Alabamian accent, actually. <laughs> oh, I'm telling you, man, I used good. to live down in the south. I could tell, I used to be able to tell you the different accents. You've been hanging out with me and Wig too long, bro. <laughs> it was, uh, yeah, yeah, now it's just I'm talking to Wig, and it just all comes out. But like there used to be, I used to be able to tell you the difference between like an Atlanta one, like a Georgia and an Alabama and a Tennessee and like a New Orleans and stuff. I used to be able to pick them all out. Now it's a little different. I'm like, I've, well, been, I mean, out you of, know, I've been out of the South too long. The worst one? New is Orleans fucking... is easy because they just sound like they're retarded. Yeah, yeah, right, right, exactly. Like it's just, <laughs> it, it's just Dude. hard to, it's like, Hold are you on okay? Now, get that line, like, the worst is my, like where my cousins are from down in fucking like, uh, Arkansas, because they got that high pitch ass shit. The dang old guy, my four wheel man. I tell you what, is it Joe B or Joe B? It's bad. Joe B or Joe B? Joe B, man. I, all of that shit sounds the same to me. I don't know what it is. But what shit? Know, every single piece of that, every pronunciation. This is how I know I'm not getting it. Yeah, I like this seat. I absolutely love this seat. This is a great seat. Like, yeah, see right there it is. Plus three to skills. Yep. This is great. Let's go. This is great. Yep. We like. We on. We on to something. 
We finally got something. Yeah, it feels like the Cito was gambling on. It feels like the Cito was gambling on. Very similar. You're on the way to some trash. I mean, it's probably going to be a lot of trash. Oh, we got a Mavs diadem, boys. We got a fucking Mavs that we ain't found one of those yet tonight. Oh, it's going to be a night. I have oh. one of those. <laughs> I have oh, one of those. Oh, we got it, boys. That could have been a Griffins. Yeah, a bunch more hours. Oh, yeah. We got plenty of time, but now we're getting plus twos. We're getting Mavs. We're getting... Ooh. I should have checked the defense on that to make sure it wasn't 100% perfect or something. But, you know, it's fucking late. It's late and we got time for trash. Trash. We got time for, for no trash. It's GG's only at this point. We got a bunch of trash. It's time for some good shit. See, two paladins you see that's what I'm talking about. This is the type of shit we want to see. Okay, it's not good, but that's the good shit we want to see roll on the seat. 20 all res, two skills. Now we get in there. We've seen tons of plus two skills. Meaning there's probably a high propensity that we're going to land on that shit when we roll a rare. This is where we wanted to be all along. Hope so, because you spent an hour trying to find a game with a seed you like. Whose yeah, fucking been fault been was that fucking, now? You fucking spent an hour tell me all oh, y'all need to switch these fucking seeds. You didn't, your seed logic, it was Max's fault. I'm blaming it on Max. He started, he planted the seed of doubt. Speaking of seeds, he planted the seed <laughs> oh of doubt. Oh my god, you said seed mind. more times in the last hour. <laughs> he planted the I'm seed actually, of doubt. He's just like, I wonder actually, Cooley, how right you are. And then yeah, we went I mean, like I mean, I do wonder about this. And like, I was like, Cooley's right. Don't ever doubt it. He said max points. I mean, but the thing is that last game, okay, so I was like switching games every once in a while. Last game, I was getting a lot of 4D uh, attack speed claws, but like only plus one to skills. So I switched seeds. Now I'm getting like 20 attack speed claws. So hey, can we just say switch fucking games instead of seeds? Nah, because... seeds, dude. We, we, maybe we can say sperm. Switch, let's say sperm. We switched, yeah, uh, say we sperm. switched seed. Yeah. <laughs> we switched sperms. <laughs> and then, and now, now it's like everything's it's different. Okay, I'm going to a different game. Okay, does that make you happy? Plot twist: The doctor no, stands behind some, different some glass, max. looking into a room lined with cushions on the floor <laughs> and walls, and there's a bunch of old greasy men in straight jackets going trash. Joby is a bully. They probably. <laughs> is a bully. Yeah. Dude, that would actually be cool. Like if someday Joby's nice as fuck, dude. No, Joby's a bully, dude. Joby. I guess. Oh, uh, it's that it kind of was hot the way you whispered in my ear like that. I'm not gonna lie. This guy never <laughs> thought I would hear those words come out of your mouth, dude. But holy shit, <laughs> I'm I'm actually impressed. Like, I'm not even mad. I'm not even. Like, for most people to say that, I'd be like, that was some awkward shit. But, like, for you, I'm like... Pretty normal, right? Yeah. Like, that's why I would... I'm actually kind of honored. Hey, Joe. A lot of people take me so wrong while I'm talking in chat. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to take. Fuck you, emoji. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of people take me so wrong. Hey, Cooley, <laughs> fuck you. Fuck. And, like, last conversation I had with dude. Hey, Cooley, fuck you. That's a stupid place to have this fucking shit go on. This is, is fucking dumb. You know dumb. what? You're stupid. A lot of people take me wrong when I type. I don't know why. <laughs> like the things that I say, they just kind of, they don't really understand where I'm coming from or what I'm saying. I don't know. I think I'm on that. I'm on that level with Duke. Though. I understand what he's saying. Like he fucking, he's like me. He just like exaggerates a lot. Like he'll get pissed at something. It's like me sitting there and saying I gambled on 7 trillion circlets in like 30 minutes. It's because I was frustrated about something and I was like, fuck this. And I just, seven trillion sounded good in the moment. No, sometimes when I say fuck that or fuck you, I mean it. Oh, no, I know you mean it, but it's like, <laughs> no. I get it. Like, you, by saying fuck you and fuck this, it's like, there's some sort of deeper thing that's at hand. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's just like, okay, what he means by this is, it's like, uh, it's like the rage interpreter. You remember the, you remember that? Uh, what was that the Key and Peel, the yeah. Obama interpreter? Duke needs his own interpreter. 
but like the reverse. Like he's yeah. already got the rage. It just needs someone to be like, all right, mm. this is what he really needs. Like Duke says, fuck this. This is so dumb. I just want yeah, to one of those. Means, Duke my, means, my, perhaps we my, should he has adjust. One of those. His name is Doombringer. <laughs> Duke, yeah, Duke means, perhaps we should consider a different area or maybe an adjustment to cold stack rules. But it comes out as like, oh, fuck you guys, y'all are stupid. Learn how to fucking All right, I, I get, get you. All right, man, yeah. Get better at doing it. Right. <laughs> Stop being bitch. God damn. Makes sense to me. I, I'm speaking on that level. Hey, Joe. What? How long it been since you heard the word C? <laughs> I want to hear it again. We're not at that point in the stream. We're now at that point in the stream where most people in it is to that point in the night for them where everything is funny. You know what I mean? Like, I need to see more drinks for that. Yeah, oh, for sure. I just, I just dumped the whole fucking picture already, dude. So I'm catching up quick. Oh, I'm going to myself up. <clears throat> I don't care what you what you say. Bill Clinton saying the word seed is always good. Dude, how about that kid, the Bill Clinton kid from the from that, was the was so that was so random. I wanna donate to the Bill Clinton. <laughs> I, I, was, I actually remember watching that live. I was doing something else and I remember thinking before he said anything. I remember sitting there thinking and I was like, this event was kind of fucking random. Like, I, rem I remember thinking that right before. Like, I, I just remember I was like, because I was trying to think about working it into the news update and stuff like that. I knew I was going to do like a news update. But then I was like, this event was so fucking random. Like, everything was just random. Random fucking trailer. Random shit happened. And then literally in the background, I hear like, I like to, my turn. I like to dedicate this to Bill Clinton. I was like, see what I mean? Like, everything is fucking random at this. I was Bill. Like, what a, but yeah. It was, and then at that point, so many people had covered it, and I don't like to do shit that other people do. So I'm like, I gotta add something to this. So I actually like dug into that kid to like figure like who the fuck is this? Like, yeah, hey, you gave some like, additional information. I learned stuff from watching that video of yours. You know, I didn't know about that follow-up interview that kid had. Thanks, man. Yeah, do you think? Uh, do you think Bill Clinton was sitting there and maybe caught that? You know, do you think he's sitting there with, with his wife and said, "Look at that, Hillary. I got one more fan than you." <laughs> <laughs> holy shit holy <laughs> shit honey we made it we famous now we going on them game awards coolly too hip to follow the crowd well honestly like i just don't want people to get in the habit of feeling like they're wasting time watching anything i do like that's that's what i don't want them to feel like and i feel like whenever there's news and shit I, you have to like if you're Look, moving, it's it's the news we didn't know we needed okay exactly it's the and I, that's why i say that i'm just like it's the news that you didn't know you needed but you and that you certainly didn't ask for like it was all about that kid i literally watched that entire interview with with matan and uh and uh and sp watched the entire thing because I was just like, is this kid going to keep up this accent this whole time? And I was immediately, like, when I he when I heard him talk at the Game Awards, I was like, you have a fake fucking accent, you prick. But I was like, I didn't want to say that. Like, you know what I mean? Because that can be very divisive if you don't know what you're saying. I didn't want to make fun of this kid and his accent if I was wrong. And, like, perhaps he was, like, actually Middle Eastern or something. But no, he knows he's trolling. He actually said it in the interview. It was that he was actually kind of funny. And the more I learned about him, I'm like, oh, this kid is like a professional troll and he's already like he's so good at it. Like, and, you know, he said in the interview, he's like, yeah, I've been working on this accent for about the last 48 hours. That's how long I've been working on it. And I was like, oh, this guy is like good at what he did. Like, he's literally trying to tell people through this accent that he's trolling them. And they're just like still talking about Bill Clinton and still asking him how serious he is. I was like, I get it. I, 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 I feel for this kid. So I was like, I'm, I'm gonna go easy on this kid. I kind of like him. Yeah, I saw that video about like, uh, about him like Rick, Rick rolling that shit at the at the a baseball game or the basketball game. I was like, this kid is so smart. Like he's he's good. He's good at what he does. Yeah, when you put the side by side clips in your YouTube video, I was like, oh man, so good because it was his accent faked. And I was like, oh, totally faked. Yeah, and he admits it too. 
but like also it, the other thing where like I, I was you know you know how you have those those moments where you're like I shouldn't judge people like this I'm not I shouldn't judge well one of the first judgments that I made about him is that he was Canadian I was like I think he's Canadian because well, I think he's Canadian accent right yeah I was like well I I thought that he was trying to do a Middle Eastern accent but I was like I can hear like a like a Canadian accent in here like with you trying to do this and i the more you listen to it the more he's like he literally says he's trying to do a middle eastern accent in that interview and then he also there's something that comes up that he's from canada but he's from if you listen to his other videos he sounds like dio like uh like if you listen to dio talk dio's from a different part of canada uh, toronto i believe and you hear his accent and it's different than like joby's accent who, who those guys are like uh, maddie and joby are french canadian so Maddie and Joby will sound like GSP when they talk. So they'll be like, I am not impressed by your performance. Like, you know, that's the sort of French Canadian accent. But like Dio sounds more like XQC with his accent. Um, so I heard the XQC style accent in his regular videos. And then the accent that he's trying to pull off is French Canadian. So I'm like, he's literally hearing other Canadian people in his country who talk differently, mimicking that accent and trying to be like Middle Eastern. I was like, it all makes sense. Yeah, so I, it's fair to say this. He completely admits it's fake and he's definitely Canadian. I was like, all of my judgments about this kid were correct. Like, <laughs> it's fair to go, but I actually liked the kid by the end of it. Like, I thought I was just gonna tool on him, but I'm like, no, nah, he's actually kind of cool. Like, he's a good kid. Like, he's a good dude. It was just, just where we landed, man. Just where we landed. Yeah, Qu Quebec. Montreal, Quebec, Canada. I'd like to donate this seed to Cooley Clinton as Cooley is doing a 24-hour gambling stream. Level 35 amulet, one pallet, trash. Trash. I didn't even need to... I just saw 35, one pallet, trash. All right, what have we got? What have we got next? What we got next? There's got to be some chill shit. There's got to be some chill. Shit. I just want that really good two open socket fucking rare source helm. Oh, I yeah. I would love to have one, dude. Yeah, that'd be good, dude. And well, I, also, I, I left that other game. I think that was a good seed. Yeah, I'm telling you, dude. Just, uh, that just one go was to the so chaos close. and start looking for the, the skiller items that spawn with base skills. And just jam it, bro. Like, when you find a good one, you'll know. You'll know. When you find it, you'll know. On an okay neck neck cert, but oh yeah, nothing oh, overly godly yet. Trash. Other than that source circular, that's I mean that was worth worth the time. I'm still waiting on my griffins. I want to find a griffins, bro. That would be such a good highlight. I would so beat llama if I gambled the griffins. Like, yeah, you, know. you got it. You got the Mavinas. You had multiple Najas. Oh, I team. didn't even clip the Mavinas. Mavinas is trash. You can't go up against what Llama put out with a Mavs helm. Come on. Oh, right. Griffins, it's coming, bro. Griffins or bust. And that's that's just like with the soft shit. We, we already oh, technically, in my mind, I've technically beat him with the LLD helm. But it needs to be a sure thing. It so that's fucking like two verses, man. Average D2 player could look at these drops and be like, yeah, Cooley fucking slaughtered.